Today, we're taking a look back at our original Super Mario Odyssey adventure to celebrate the fifth anniversary of the game. Mario teams up with his new friend Cappy to take on Bowser and save Princess Peach yet again. And along the way, we'll be exploring new kingdoms, taking on crazy boss fights, and collecting dozens and dozens of moons. So let's get started with Super Mario Odyssey. The skies above Peach's castle. Oh, we're getting started pretty cool. Oh, hey, hold on, what, is this the final boss? The game's five minutes long, guys. <laughs> wait, 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 did I miss something? They're just, I guess they just want to skip the semantics, you know? Oh. <laughs> what? Okay, so yeah, we are above Princess Peach's castle. Bowser up to no good. I mean, he's already got like the wedding outfit on and everything. Like we're middle, middle of the battle right now. This is the end. Oh, for you! Oh, the hat. No, catch it, Mario. Or not. I mean, I guess there is something more important than a hat happening here. Oh boy, watch out! Oh, and he's out of here! Mario! Oh, what is on her head? She's got like a little tiara with eyes. Oh no, and all that remains of Mario is just a hat, and now that's gone too. Jeez, they don't pull any punches. Time for my wedding with Peach. Jealous Mario! I, I, I don't think he can hear you. He's at least like five miles away from here. All right, see you, Bowser. Oh no, the hat, it's okay. You'd think he'd be able to dismantle it with one little you know, squish, but uh, seems to be fine with me. Oh, oh, oh I spoke too soon. <laughs> it's both funny and horrible. It's just, that happened so quick. Oh, who are you? Are you a boo? Wait, are you? Oh, okay. I know a little bit about the game. I try not to spoil myself too much, but. Oof, Mario is out cold. Is that just a boo taunting him like, ha ha? Oh no, that's the character that got her hat. Is that who I think it is? Can I move? Oh, look around. Ooh, fancy little photo on the bottom right. Oh, hello. You okay, Mario? Can I can I jump? No, I'm still just looking around. Wow, this place is beautiful. Uh, jump, oh, hey, what's up? Um, oh, hello. Oh, no, come back, come back. Wow, look at this place, this is insane. Oh, I don't wanna jump off of here. And wow, this place, everything has a hat, even the buildings. Oh, this feels amazing. Oh my gosh, I love how he moves. He puts his little hands out and everything. This place is like super spooky, hello. Oh, no, come back, come back. Can I slide? Oh, I can't slide down the mountain. That's fine, I'll figure it out. This is so amazing. Oh, hello frogs. Oh, the frogs have hats too, hello. Hey, oh, oh. <laughs> Sorry, sorry, I don't mean to be mean to you. I was just trying to say hello. All right, well, they don't seem to be the uh, chatterbox type. But where are you going? Who are you? Hey, it's another one of you, but you don't look as fancy. You're not one of them, are you? Uh, if you mean Italian plumbers, unfortunately, yes. Uh, Hello? It's okay, little guy, I just want my hat piece back. Oh, his hat was all like thrilled because he was scared. So, so sorry for running away like that. You startled me and I do startle easily. I saw what happened earlier. You've been through quite a, quite the ringer. You've landed in the Cap Kingdom. We've been under attack by the same monster that gave you such a trouncing. So he's been here too, huh? And to make matters worse, the fiend who has kidnapped my little sister. Oh, that's awful. Oh, poor. Little sister, and I don't know her name. I'd hope to have give, I hope to give that chase or give chase to that monster in a ship of my own. You have a ship? Unfortunately, all of our airships were wrecked in the attack. Wow. Okay. Sophisticated hat society. Although now that I think on it, I'm fairly certain there's a, a functioning ship in the next kingdom over. And, I could get us there if only I could reach the top of that, uh, t of Top Hat Tower, uh, which is being guarded by m the monster's henchmen. Oh my. A Koopaling, maybe? You know, it seems we're after the same thing. Perhaps we should team up. Let's see if we can help those two. Okay, yeah. Oh, oh no, our hat. Oh, what do you, oh. Well, not exactly Mario's style. Not your style, yeah, that's what I said. Not your style? How about this? Oh, I like him. 
I guess, yeah, he's Cappy. Oop! Oh. Hey! <laughs> Beautiful. I love it. Perfect. Oh! That's awesome. So we got ourselves a boomerang hand. Cappy is now your companion. Hooray! So how do we do that? Try throwing me with wide. Okay. Whoa. So we can throw the cap, or we can also shake the Joy-Con. Whoa, okay, that works too. Whoa, how'd I do that? I don't know, but I did like a little... Hmm. But you can also, yeah, that's, that's really weird. If I shake the Joy-Con, that does a different kind of throw. Is there any way to do that kind of throw normally? Because I don't really like shaking the Joy-Cons around too much. Uh, either way, wow, this place is beautiful. Let me break a crate. There's nothing inside. Where is there? Ooh, what's down here? Am I adventuring? Am I going the wrong way? I have a feeling I'm going the wrong way, but there are posters. Like what, to the wedding? Looks like it. What's that say? Bowser and Peach, a royal wedding. Yeah, that's what it is, okay. He's making it seem like it's a movie. Jeez, Bowser's a jerk, but I think we already knew that. Oh my gosh. Okay, so what is going on around here? Um, Maybe I could uh, butt stomp this? Oh, I can. Hello, Yoon. My airship, my beautiful, beautiful airship ruined. Oh, oh maybe I could help. Uh, there was a little arrow pointing this. Maybe I could like, um, maybe Hattie can help. Whoa! Oh, well, I just broke it some more, didn't I? <laughs> oh, sorry, buddy. Um, there's no way I can help you out here. I guess not. Try jumping and tossing me onto that post. Which post? This post? Oh, whoa! Oh, okay. Look at that. <laughs> He's more than just a hat. More than just a boomerang. He does so much more. That's awesome. Can he, yep, you can break that one too. Whoa, that one had a bunch of coins. Now I know that coins are, whoa, 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 very important in this game. I don't know for what purpose, but, oh wait, wait. I see you back there. Ooh. Oh, there was 10 more coins, awesome, I love that. Are you headed to the, for Top Hat Tower? The entrance is up ahead. I will be, soon enough. Aw, we can even uh, grow the little plants. I like that, this is so cool. There's like little things to do everywhere. And we get some extra health if we needed it. Hello, Yoon. Um, I can see that monster's minions from up here, but all I can do is float helplessly and watch. So there's nearly not too much we can do around here, it seems. Uh, be beyond just, you know, pick up some coins here and there, which I'm sure will be helpful. Can I break this stuff? I can't. There's clearly something under there, though. Maybe I could come back. Ooh, maybe this is like one of those things where I can just come back and get more stuff. Hello, Yoon. Welcome to Bonneton, pride of the Cap Kingdom. Do you know about the action guide? Show me. What is, oh, whoa, whoa, okay, what's happening? Oh, is this like, an, ooh, okay, so I can learn all bunch of stuff here. I won't do this here, of course, if you guys have any tips for me, you can let me know. Uh, you can see it any time, just open the menu and then, okay, action guide, cool, cool, cool. Thanks for letting me know, sir. Ow. <laughs> Looks like I really need that action guide, don't I? Uh, let me just quickly break these crates. I mean, I know these kind of games, of course, are all about the collectibles, so if I can collect whatever I can, I'll gladly do it. I mean, and I've, I love 3D Mario platformers. I'm no stranger to them. I've played through Galaxy on the channel. I've played through a bit of Galaxy, too. <laughs> well, I said I was no stranger to them. I did not say I was good. Oh no, you do lose coins. Oh, that ain't no good. Oh gosh, we definitely wanna earn up a bunch of coins. Luckily, it seems like all the coins come back once we do that. So at least, like, I mean, honestly, that might be a good way to grind for coins. You just die, and then you come back, and oh wait. It definitely seems like I miss some stuff. I know I'm dilly-dallying a little bit, so I'll go ahead and check out this one last thing. There's like a little something something going on over here. And then after that, I will skedaddle. We will go and go up to the top of Top Hat Tower. And, wow, that was a lot, okay, that was definitely worth uh, dying if I'm gonna find new stuff for it. Okay, get these 10 coins right here, and we are good. We can go to the Top Hat Tower. And, what is this saying? Travel tip. Cap, throw, and hold. Want to break a whole stack of boxes or hit a question block a bunch of times? Just press and hold the Y button to do a cap, throw, and hold. Your cap will hover for a bit and keep spinning. Oh look, and they give us a little thing to practice on. Very interesting, I like that. Ooh, let's break up this stuff as well. Whoa, we can really move quick too. I like it. I like how there's a little compass as well. I don't know what the compass will be used for. I mean, I guess to keep our direction. Even the little birds have hats, that's amazing. Ooh. So you might know that we've been playing other 3D platformers this month, or is a another 3D platformer this month, and that is uh, A Hat in Time, and that's actually pretty similar in some kind of feel to this game. I 100% of that one as well was a lot of fun, and no! This is the worst time to have a low battery. 
Oh no, what odd little fellows. They seem to know you and not like you. Yeah, they're Goombas, but they're golden. Why do we got go golden Goombas? Maybe because they drop coins? Weird. I'm not sure, maybe it's just the lighting. It's so dark and gloomy here. Normal colored Goombas look a little golden. Well, we got our health back. Hmm. Oh, I can get rid of them. Down with your graffiti posters. Propaganda, n none such in the Cap Kingdom. Uh, try throwing me at that door. Ah, okay. Throw a hat at a hat door and it opens in a hat-like fashion. Inside top hat tower, and wow. This looks a lot bigger than it did on the outside. Um, oh, this is so cool. Oh, this is so cool. Let's uh, yeah, get some extra coins. I don't know what the coins will be used for. Maybe, I think they, you get like more outfits and stuff for them. Maybe more hats? Well, no, I think you only need one hat. Or maybe at least, you know. I know there are outfits. I don't know if they're cosmetic or if they do anything. Hello. Uh, oh, wait, oh yeah, I forgot. I forgot that, that this happens. <laughs> what? Oh my gosh, that is so weird. Oh jeez! Oh, I hope you can swim, Mario. Ooh, you're going into a frog's brain. This actually takes longer than I thought it would. Oh, okay. Uh. Oh. Hello. Huh? Oh. <laughs> Ribbit. <laughs> huh? Uh oh. Ah! <laughs> or a little froggy. You captured a frog. Okay, so, whoa, look at this. So do we have our own moves? I can, it says I can dash, but I'm pressing dash. I guess we just run a little bit faster and then we can jump. Whoa, look at how high we can jump. That's awesome. So up. whoa, that is so cool. We're a little froggy frog, hippity hoppity. Oh gosh, there we go. Oh yeah, and we can hop out of the water, no problem. Hello, little Goombas. How do I leave being a frog? I guess I can't, or maybe if I get hit, Oh, oh, no, I hit you, no problem. Oh, wait, there we go. Uh, boop, 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 ha <laughs> easy. Yeah, but how do I stop being a frog? There has to be a button for that, right? Nope, oh, um, that's the map. Okay, I mean, I, I mean, I love being a frog, don't get me wrong. I just wanna see, can I become a Goomba? Like, really, what are my limits here on what I can become? I can imagine just about anything, huh? Up, uh, boop, oh no, wait, oh, they give me coins? Okay, frog brethren, I'm so sorry, but I must, <laughs> Rent you for your money. All right, uh, whoop, wait, there we go, there we go. This is so crazy. We can get way over here, and I'm gonna ignore that Goomba for now, because I wanna get all the way over to here. And you can just hop out of the water like it's it's just like it's ground. It's crazy. We're getting so many coins. Whoa, the Goombas came back. Good to know that they do come back at some point. Like, really, just when you turn your back on them. Those darn Goombas always waiting to attack you from behind. All right, let's see, up, whoop, 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 the platforming skills are starting to come into play. Not really, but I'm trying. Oh gosh, this game is beautiful so far. Like it's really what I wanted. It's just, you know, a 3D Mario that just has a lot of depth to it and it's just something that is like Galaxy or 64, but I guess just more. And I like it so far, that's really seems to be what it is. Um, Press the L to return, oh, there we go, thank you. Thank you, my froggy friend. You know, your, your, your help was appreciated. So I wonder, can I become a, a Goomba? I, I hope. Um, oh, hey, look at that! We got an extra bit of life. Is that permanent? I can only assume not, because that'd be a lot of life for this early in the game. Um, Let's go in here. Are we at the top of the tower? Uh, ooh, almost. Ooh, a checkpoint, huh? Top hat tower. Right. That monster has ruined everything. Bad days do happen, but you've got to keep a stiff upper lip. Or a stiff upper brim. <laughs> Can't you do something to help us? I'm trying. Wait, can I be you? Oh, I can't, because you already have a hat. Who could be responsible for this? I'm so scared I can hardly move. All right, well, don't worry. I'll take care of that monster. These long-eared henchmen are still at the top at, oh, long-eared henchmen. Well, that ain't gonna be the Kooplings. I do say be careful. What is over here? Something again, like little, bits of debris that I can't get by just yet. Maybe our hat can get stronger. I'll have my darling in the plaza. I do hope she's all right. Maybe we should run away. Maybe we should hide somewhere. I mean, you guys already are hiding. Okay, well, we've gone this way. Not much I can do at the moment, so let's go back. Whoop, yep, whoop. All right, 
So let's go up here. Ooh, bunches of coins. We have over 200 of them already. The coins are definitely gonna be for something because there's no lives in this game. We've already died once, we didn't lose any. Oh, hello? Oh, you guys are definitely not the Gooplings. You're bunnies. Oh, you're adorable, but also sort of creepy. <laughs> the boss warned me there'd be a fellow with a mustache coming along. Guess we ought to introduce ourselves. We're the wedding planners for the happy couple. They call us the Brutals. The Brutals? I guess like the Bridals? We got that treasure we needed, so we ain't got no more business in these parts. Of course, roughing up a goody two-shoes medalist was in the contract, so I guess we still got a little work to do. Oh boy. You gonna kick my butt? I don't think so. Whoa, he's got three hats. Oh gosh, he's out hiding us. Beat him up, Hattie. Oh gosh, oh, maybe that was a mistake. Um. Oh, whoa, okay. Hold on, can I become him? I cannot, but I can land on his head, so some guys you just can't, you know, transform into. Maybe they're too strong. Oh, hey, 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 be careful. Okay, we got it. And then, oh, 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 uh, is he in this hat? Oh, yes, he is. Okay, whoa. So we gotta get rid of all of his hats and then land all on his head. Was that it? Wow, he only took two hits? Pathetic. He can't even take the normal three hits most Mario enemies take. Well, there we go. What is, oh, it's a zip line. To the city. Most impressive, now let's use this wire to make our way onward. Okay, look at us go. <laughs> That's amazing. Oh, can I just stop? Can I just stop and turn on Super Mario Odyssey? Wow, what an opening. That is so exciting. <laughs> I'm having so much fun. Even if I'm really bad at this game, which I, I probably will. I'll probably be really bad. I'm having so much fun and I, I want to keep having fun. So I'm going to keep on. Whoa, Cascade Kingdom, Fossil Falls. I thought we were going to Donk City. That's the only one I know besides, you know, the, the starting area now. Whoa, we're going quick. <laughs> I wonder if this hurts. Like, he looks like he's in pain. Poor Mario. Bah. Oh, got a mouthful of grass. Our first power moon. Ooh, that is so cool. Ooh, yeah, what a ride. And we made it to the Cascade Kingdom. Sorry, still a bit amped from capturing a power line. Must collect myself. There should be an old airship somewhere around here. Let's see if we can find, we can't find it. Okay. Wow, this place is beautiful. And we get to collect donuts on the top left. That looks like a donut to me. <laughs> donut Kingdom, <gasps> donut. Give it. Wow, okay, whoa, three out of 50. Oh. So I think those are coins that are exclusive to this area. And I'll pick up this waterfall basin. Oh, can I become a bird? Oh, you ran away. That would have been awesome. Um, hello. Whoa. Oh, helpful. I like it. Oh, there's more donuts. I need the donuts. Come on. Ready? Whoop. Yeah. Boom. Six out of 50. Okay, so let's see if we can't find all 50 of those coins. I'm sure it'll be helpful for something. And, you know, I'm going to just collect the holic. You know, I just love to collect it all, so. Oh, geez. Oh, hello, Yoon. Oh, we can't. I want to just, like, become things now. Like, I don't even want to fight enemies. Oh. Oh, look at me finding all the secrets right away. Oh, wait. Oh. Yeah. Okay, cool. So let's hit that. Hit that. Hit that. Yeah. We're doing good. We're doing good. Oh, geez. There's a chain chomp. He's not looking nice. So, obviously, things seem to be a little bit different from, you know, Super Mario Galaxy, Sunshine, 64, in the way that you don't get to, like, hop into a level and then sort of choose what you want to do. Like, you know, you choose your star and that's how the level is going to be. It all seems to be, like, sort of consistent. Can I do anything new? Can I be... I can become you! Oh, this is amazing! So, I can wind up and then fly the other way! Oh, that is so cool! So, let me go ahead and try to break some of these blocks and maybe we can find more donuts in them. I know, of course, we could just break in and get our first moon piece, but I could always do that. You know, let me get some other stuff. Oh, get some easy coins as well. There we go. Ooh, okay, there's only one left, and I think that this one probably won't have it, but it's worth trying. Oh, no, I didn't get that other one. I have to get them on, because we must get the donuts. Oh, there we go. Okay, that one didn't have too much. So, I think we're gonna go and get our first ever moon. Or whatever, yeah, they're called moons, right? I mean, nothing Mario games is just give you three one-ups. So, Interesting, and we got it. Oh, that is so cool. You got a moon, our first power moon. Hooray. Whoa, so the hell little thing in the top left there. I guess there's five power moons to get in this area. 
Ooh. See how now the area just continues. It just grows from here. Multi moon atop the falls. Whoa. Oh, that's the other bunny lady. She looks way bigger than she did on the ship. Uh, oh, we found a power moon. What a lucky break. This will come in handy to power the airship. Have you ever seen anything like it? I guess, I don't know. So we're at Cascade Falls right now. Is this the place where you said the airship was gonna be? I'm not really sure. Whoa, we did the triple jump. Oh. Oh. Little hat building. Ah, there it is. This is what we're looking for. It's looking a bit more rough than I'd expected. Ah, uh, no. It's just an older model. I'm certain it can still fly. This thing? Let's give it a shot, shall we? Just throw me on that globe over there. Okay. Whoa. So using our little power moon here. Ooh. This big old hunk of junk's gonna be able to get us anywhere? Oh, not quite yet. Huh, nothing's happening. That power moon must not have given the ship enough energy. I wonder if we can find more around here. I sure hope so, so it looks like our job's not quite done. Oh wait, there's another one here, whoa. What was that? Oh, it's a bunch of coins. Give me it, where are you going? Come back, come back, don't don't you get away from me. Yeah, I got it, okay, cool. Oh geez, I love how the little water sprinkles happen on the screen there. So which way are we supposed to be going now? I mean, I guess there is no supposed to be. I could hop up here and then maybe get up there. I'm not really sure. I'm just going to have so much fun exploring now. That's what I'm excited about. Can I like climb up walls just a little bit? Nope. Trying to, you know, get a little used to platforming. We can do a bit of a slide jump, or not slide jump, but a, uh, whatever they call it. A side jump? Yeah, not slide jump. <laughs> Uh, I wanna make sure, ooh, we get all the donut coins we can. I mean, I don't really know what kind of flavor they are, if they're purple. Is there something down there? No, I think it's just foliage. All right, had to make sure, whoop! Oh, I really wanna become a bird. Face the pole and we can grab it, ooh, what's up here? It is a little hard to see, camera's not really letting me. Oh, there's a coin, better than nothing. Oh, but we do get a really great view of everything. You can see there's more coins over there, but how am I gonna get over there? Whoop. Whoa, oh, that's scary. I'm sure that there is fall damage at some point or another, but I did see some purple coins up here. And, ooh, look at me. Oh, look at this little chain chomp family. Adorable. So we got 15 out of 50 of these coins. Could I make this jump maybe? Ah, oh. oh, that hurt. How am I getting up here then? Hey, there's a little bullet bill on it. <laughs> is that like a fossil? A bullet bill fossil? That's pretty cool. Interesting. I don't know if I'm doing something correctly, incorrectly there. I wonder if we could take one of these chain jumps while I'm off the chain. That'd be interesting as well. Oh, oh my gosh, the dinosaur. Goodness, take a look at the size, look at the size of that thing. Oh, oh, oh. oh you messed with the wrong T-Rex, let's go. Okay, you know, I enjoy being a zebra, but obviously the next best thing would be a T-Rex. Oh gosh, can we take on the chain chomps? This is insane. If there's just a normal to scale T-Rex that exists in the Mario world, can we um, attack? Ooh. Oh, look at that, there's another moon in there. Look at we found. Oh, get you, see ya buddy. I just disrupted this chain chomp family and I sort of feel awful. So we can run, we can be a bit quicker than we are right now. Um, And I could go down here and I just don't know if it's really worthwhile. Uh, I don't know if that was a good idea. I don't know, can we not get up there anymore now? Uh-oh, I might have just made a mistake. I mean, hmm, okay, hold on. Wait, there you go. <laughs> this is so cool. I thought there might have been a bit of a buildup before we were a T-Rex, but no, we're just like first 30 minutes of game, we're T-Rexing it up. Oh, the back. All right, sorry, about to disrupt this family again. Let's go ahead and get our second power moon here. Oh, the T-Rex takes a little nap, he's adorable. And grab it. Hooray, you got a moon, jump through the rocks. I like how it gives you a little date too. Of course, it's the same date as the release date of this game. All right, so let's get up here. Um. Oh, okay, so there's plenty to find around here. Now, I did want to pull up the map and take a little look-see at this. This area isn't very big, but it looks like I can warp to any uh, flagpole I have found. That's not just a checkpoint. That's also a, a warp state, which is really cool. And now, blocks like this have me curious. I wonder, once again, like there was debris in the previous, you know, dark and spooky first area, and maybe there is ways we can clear this debris as well. Oh! Okay, so I can throw my cap and collect things that way as well. So that's a good strategy to keep in mind. Hmm. 
I feel like I probably have missed everything, or not, not everything, but I've missed some things. Hmm, how do I do this? Uh, seems as like if I could, oh. Oh man, I almost got it. Can I turn on all these flowers or make them all bloom? Maybe I'm not doing that correctly. Oh, how about we read the sign? Uh, nope, not what I wanted. Oh man, the view though. The view is amazing. Travel tip, spin thrown. When you're surrounded by enemies and just wish you could hit them all at once. Snap the Joy-Con to the side to do a spin thrown. Your hat will spin all around you. Okay, I will try it. I'm not a big fan of the motion controls. Ow, I just hit my desk, and that's really why. Not only that, but I have arthritis, and it ends up hurting my wrist after a while. Anyways, I won't complain about it. We will just get this flagpole. Whoa, we're already finding more purple coins. I definitely have to explore this. Um, Wait, can I? Oh, oh, there we go. Okay, um, but yeah, we definitely have to explore this waterfall more, but I'll be doing my best to stay as spoiler-free as possible, and of course, to um, play through blind, and 100% as much as I can. What is over here? Um. Why is there an empty picture frame here? I'm asking the same thing. Weird. But a lot of you were also asking if I can make the episodes longer. Uh, I don't know if I'll be able to right away, but I definitely will be at some point or another. Probably gradually over time, the episodes will be getting longer and longer, so no sweat about that. Okay, Saren, please leave me alone. Um, and what I mean by that is that, um, right now our focus is today's episode. What button do I need to press? This one is to try to 100% Cascade Falls. I'm hoping that'll take about 45 minutes. Uh, we'll have to find out, but a lot of you were also saying I should check out the brochure here, because you can find out tons, and I mean tons of information about the game, about the lore and everything. I don't want to read every ounce of this on screen right now, but I'm gonna you know, come through it just in case maybe you don't have the game. If you want to pause it, you can go ahead and check out some of this stuff. I'm just trying to look to see if maybe there are some Keys, oh, to the kingdom. Experience the glory of nature with the eye-opening, eye-popping great falls. See dinosaur prehistoric rulers of the of a bygone age. Find treasures of the past tucked away everywhere you look. Okay, so I definitely want to try to find how to get up here, and I think one of you left a really good tip for that that I'm gonna try this time, is that when I throw my hat out like that, I can, whoa, I can jump off it. Okay, that might actually be really helpful. So what if I did that, and then I, could I, whoa, 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 how'd I do that? Wait, wait, wait. How'd I do that? Oh, look at this. Oh, hey, that's really helpful. Okay, so I'm gonna try to get across to here. Unfortunately, I broke this little piece, but I still, wait. Ah, oh, darn, I almost made it. Could I throw it and then like long jump? Ah, oh, that's really tough, I don't think so. Um, I don't know, I'm trying to see, oh, out. <laughs> I'm trying to see if I can't. Um. No, that's not gonna be far enough. I definitely need to be out here. Oh, oh man. I don't know how I get across it there then. Maybe if I had the little block that I destroyed, it would have been easier. Oh gosh, and the chain challenge are back. This is not a good combo. So for right now, let me explore some other spots. Maybe I can find at least some more donut coins. I'm always definitely like, I I'm definitely gonna be out to all of the guy or all of your guys' tips. So if you have any, feel free to let me know. I will be trying to record a little bit ahead, just so that if anyone does try to spoil me, hopefully I will be, of course, able to avoid it. Um, let's go ahead and get you. Oh, there you go. I definitely need to check behind here because I really haven't looked around this angle too much. Um, okay, it doesn't look like there's any purple coins around here. So basically, we can just charge through this way because we already took this normal route around the side. So let's get rid of you and destroy as much of this as I possibly can. Oh, this is so much fun. Okay, I've been having a blast with this game, by the way. It is just so much fun. <laughs> you guys messed with the wrong T-Rex for sure. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I could just keep going here. The problem is that, um, oh, you know what I could have done? I could have done a little move we learned last time, this right here. Oh no, dinosaur disappeared. Oh, these guys keep popping up though. I don't like that. Is there any way to get rid of all of them for good? I guess not. Oh, there's a little cat peach. Oh, oh, oh okay. Interesting. But what about over here? Once again, there's certainly something over there. I don't really know what that is. But there's little sprites on the wall. Like, what about these Goombas, huh? Like these Goomba fossils. Can we hit these and will they do anything? Doesn't look like it. So they have to be not in one of these breakable blocks. They have to be like colored. Now that didn't seem to give me anything mandatory. It just seemed to be a little bit of extra health, but maybe that won't always be the case. Oh my, what is going on over here? Something, that's for sure. 
Okay. Now over here I just see a couple more purple coins. Ready? Whoop! There! Okay. We're at 30, so we're more than halfway. There is fantastic. So my guess is that I want to get the chain chomp here. Oh no, no, don't do it! No, no! Okay, okay. And maybe I could break this. Ready? Set? Whoa! Hey, okay, awesome. Whoa, what is this thing? It's like a little old Mario level. Wait, is this the. Oh! Purple coins. <laughs> I can't wait to check this out. Because this was like in the trailer for like a second, or at least the trailer I watched. And it's so cool. It's like a 2D Mario and a 3D Mario. Who needs Sonic Generations? Oh my, we've gone flat and rather blocky at that. Oh, you're rhyming too. <laughs> so we get some easy coins this way as well, it looks like. Oh, this is so cool, I love it. Okay, get that. Oh no, but I might have messed this up. Well, it plays just like an old Mario game, uh, except that I can't use the D-pad. I mean, I guess it's not much of a D-pad, but still. Oh, there you go, good. Oh, 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 that was bad. I love how sparkly it is. Okay, um, might have messed up a little bit there. Okay, I got them. So which way am I supposed to go? Like, if I go over and here and, whoa, look at that! Finding, ooh, we found a pixelated moon behind the waterfall. That is so cool. So we definitely wanna explore every little angle. Oh, I am so happy right now. That is just the coolest thing. Okay, let's uh, get over here and, and there's a cat using the litter box. All right, let's get up here. I closed the door so that the litter box sound shouldn't be too loud. That was so cool. Now I'm guessing I can't plop down that way. I, I bet if you there's a spectacular view from the top of that pole. Okay. Well, before we worry about that, I'm gonna run around for a little bit. Could I maybe like destroy some of this other stuff that's around here, or maybe I could destroy a fellow chain jump up? Ah, boom. Oh wow. Okay, that didn't actually work. Hmm. Like this stuff over here. Like we have these like sort of stick stickosaurus stuff. Yeah. We can actually damage it. But on the top left, it seems as if it's trying to tell me that um, there is an, um, oh gosh, uh, five, or no, four moons to find. So I'm gonna be trying my best to make sure that we can get as close as we can to 100% in Cascade Kingdom in today's episode. Now I know we can't 100% every kingdom in an episode because I know some of the kingdoms apparently are gigantic. They have like up to nearly 100 moons to find, which is insane and really exciting. Can we get up here? We can. Oh my. Look at this. Now it sort of loops around, so I definitely don't want to fall off here. But it is cool now I can get up here. So how do I do that little, um, uh, I'm trying to find out how I did the, um, maybe I, how did I do the little rolling? Oh, like that. Okay, I pressed the hat button. Anyways, we got Big Mean Bunny Lady here. How you doing, Big Mean Bunny? Oh, you got a golden chain chomp. How lavish. Oh. oh, and she has three of them? Yikes. What's this? You say you need to repair some silly old airship? Why, I could never part with any of my precious power moons. It sounds to me like someone wants to be a snack for my adorable chain chompakins. Chompakins? Oh, chain chompakins. I always said chompakinis. Okay, what do we do against this? Can I become you? No, because you have a hat. Oh, now I can. <laughs> okay, so we're basically um, applying the thing we already learned, which is how to use these chain chomps effectively. Now I could uh, pick up this heart and get some free coins for it. Whoa, boy. Okay, now I'm guessing that when you're spinning like a crazy person. Hold on. No, no. There, no, okay, I got hit there. That's stinky. That's fine. Come on, come on. She's huge. Like, once again, she is way bigger than what she was in the opening cutscene, or at least the first boss cutscene, you know, when she was in the airship, way huge than that. It's a little, you know, scary. Oh boy. Oh, she's getting mad, she's getting red. Oh boy. It's bad for your complexion. Bad for your heart rate, too. Come on, come on. She is really not liking this right now. Oh, she's getting tired. Boom. Oh, and we got her, no problem. <laughs> Bleh. And you're out of here. So these are bunnies, but they ain't rabbits. You know, I just sort of noticed that. <laughs> Mario and rabbits ended at Mario and rabbits. I mean, maybe they're sort of supposed to be a slight reference, but either way, more importantly, we get... Oh-ho-ho! -ho! Wow, so three of them, huh? They're so fancy. Oh yeah, we never went on top of that pole. Okay, so, we got a multi-moon. Multi-moon atop the falls. Wow, fantastic. Oh, where are we going? Um, 
Somewhere. Right back here. Perfect. Okay. You've done it. And now we've got a multi-moon. It's as strong as three power moons combined. It should get the ship moving in no time. All right, cool. Let's see if we can't make this work. Throw me on that globe. Okie doke. I love how he can go back to being Cappy, like normal Cappy. Also, I have to apologize, I kept calling him Hattie in the first episode. But we have five, can one, two, three, four, five power moons to give to this thingamajig. Let's see, is that enough? It is plenty. We have six in total now. How many can we find in this area? That might be it. I was like, oh, it's gonna take me like 45 minutes. I thought it was gonna be a little bit bigger. But as you can see, there is still stuff we can do around here that I would love to go do before we move on to the next area. Um, oh my. The Odyssey is restored. This thing is beautiful. A lot less rusty now. It's red, it's colorful, whoa. So there we are right now. Oh wow, I like how Cap Kingdom is literally just a cap. We've enough fuel to reach the Sand Kingdom. Let's sa go save those two. Why don't you take the helm? Just to like the can Sand Kingdom and press A and we'll be off. Um, I would love to, but not yet. That's where we're now. I need you to choose where we're going. Can I quit? Okay, I can't quit. Um, I will, but I once again, I wanna find everything we can in here. Unless there's like stuff I can't quite do yet. Let me see. Oh yeah, okay, there's more we can, you know, we can look around the map here, I can teleport around, but also I can pull up lists. Oh. There's really this much in this little area? This is what I was a little afraid of. I think that maybe we can't get everything right now. I think that some of it, maybe we'll find more of this area later. Capture list. Oh wow, okay, we missed something. Interesting. Oh wow, that is so cool. Oh, I think that's really awesome. So, um, we'll still adventure around a little bit for now. Um, where am I going? I'm going way up here. Okie doke. I kind of have a little loading screen for that. I feel like, yeah, I'm not entirely sure. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What is about this? This was, this was blocked off before. Why is it not blocked off now? Oh my. This area is quite expansive, and this is where I just was. Whoop, yep, no wait, no, no, I wanted to try to, the camera angle doesn't really like that idea. Whoop, come on, Marion. Come on, Marion. Ah, okay, can you not get up there, buddy? Uh, wait, wait, if I could do that. I don't know if I need to get up here at all, but I'm sure as heck curious. Ooh, coins, definitely worth it. Oh, this place is so beautiful. I love this game so far. Can I become a Goomba? Oh, I can. Maybe that's why they're golden. Maybe there's like normal Goombas that can become, because you know, in the art of the game, it shows uh, you becoming normal Goombas. Either way, I'd wanted to tear it up more as a T-Rex as well, but I mean, I don't know if there's too much more we can do. Oh, hey, hold on. Up, yep, up, hey. <laughs> okay, hold on, get over here. All right, we're doing okay. I'm all, almost curious about what's down here. I mean, probably a whole bunch of nothing, but I gotta make sure. Okay, that was a little scary. I don't think there's anything in, under there then. Oh, but you never know. So I could go to the right here. Let me, well, like, what would happen if I just let this bring me up? Okay, okay, that's what I wanted to know. Now I found out. Okay, so it didn't seem like there's too much secrets there. That's fine with me. You know, you can only, oh, oh geez, oh geez, oh geez. I pressed the wrong button. Huh. Yeah, that's what I wanted to do. Okay, so now we're up here. We can go through here. Oh my. I probably should have took a better look at everything when I had the chance, to be honest with you. So I could either go across to there and, and get, oh boy, look, a power moon, it seems. Oh wow, more than one. So let's go ahead and get this one. Alley-oop. Yeah, we get a moon past the chasm lifts. So I don't know what triggers these doors to open, but this does mean that we could probably go back to the Cap Kingdom and get stuff done there. Okay, well, interesting that it let me take a leave there. I, I wasn't, okay. So that's where that, that pipe was just an exit pipe. Good to know, but I'm not finished. So we're gonna keep going this way. These Goombas are so cute. Because if we went down, I think the other way, we could have gotten just another one. So let's try to figure that out. Now I'm tempted to long jump, but I know it's not gonna work. Um, Instead it's a little push you. Oh boy, oh, oh boy. Oh boy. I do like how Mario has like more modern colors though. He doesn't have the brown and red that he has in the original Mario Bros. Instead he is sporting the blue and red like in present day Mario Bros. Ah, oh, I can take a snapshot. You think that would be done with the snapshot button? 
that they have, you know, on the Switch Joy-Con, but no. I'm up! Yep! Ha ha! Okay, so you know there's an area down there. And... Oh! I could just... plop down. Yep. Okay. What's down here, then? Uh, oh! 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 You see that? Okay. No, no, no. Please be, please be nice. What is up here, then? Just as curiosity's sake. Oh, okay. I understand. So I, I think I'm gonna piece this together here. All we need to do is land on you. Ready? Boop. Up. Ah, ah, okay. <laughs> be nice, please. Be nice. There we go. So we can go in and join you. Um, I don't know where that Koopa shell went. Elio. Yeah. Okay. So there are two moons in there. Another hidden chasm. Chasm? No, hidden chasm passage. Now I don't want to fall. I don't think. But that's how we get that other moon. Excellent, so that should be both of them in this area, unless there's something really hidden that I'm just not seeing. But for right now, I think that's in? All right, very cool. So let's get out of here. Because I could let myself lower here, but I don't think, like I thought that maybe that's how we got the stuff over here. But now I, I'm starting to see that's not the case. So let's, uh, I don't know what I'm doing. That's not making it any quicker. There we go. Oh no, oh no, problems, problems. Problems, oh, okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna get out of here. Wait, is that it? There's definitely something uh, overhead here. You can see that there's still some more ground. Okay. Hmm. Maybe I shouldn't leave so soon. Because if I could just let it bring me up here. Oh, there's gotta be a way to get over there. I'm not gonna let this go easily. Whoop, whoop. Hey, look at me, platforming king, I'd say so. Oh, we got some well-earned purple coins for that one. 37 out of 50. 13 more to go, and then we get plopped up, okay. Wow, you really gotta comb every waking area. And we get an extra couple coins for getting a moon that we've already gotten. I'll gladly take it. So there's Zan. If there's going to be, what was it, like 20, oh. Hello, you're back. If there's gonna be 20 something uh, different, you know, moons to find in this area, I, I'm starting to doubt that we'll find all of those. But I think we can still find a fair amount, like whatever in the world's going on here. Oh, oh, that was just coins? Hmm, I don't know, let's try it again. Maybe they, you know, it's like one of those things. Ooh. Hey, 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 I wasn't ready. They know it's me, <laughs> like they know it's Mario in there. <laughs> okay, so I don't really see that same thing over here. I mean, I think I found everything over here. I know there's an area to the side I need to get to and I'll get to that in just a second. Yeah, what does this pipe lead to? Um, I actually don't remember. What is this pipe? This wasn't here before, or was it? So it definitely is worth re-exploring areas because I swear this wasn't here before. Maybe hitting this one guy into the pipe is what active, I mean, one, this one guy into the little bullseye activated this. Oh, that's interesting. That actually might be the case. Okay, Um. so we got a bit of a uh, puzzle here, I think. Okay, um, do that. So we gotta hit this up. We gotta angle this up just right. Um, this isn't really just right, I'd say. Um, I'd say this is quite wrong. I think we need to get this chain jump mad. So if we could do that, or either that, or just control him and said, wow, an insta-kill. It's insta-kill goop. Yikes, we had double health and everything. We don't have no more, I can tell you that much. Do I have to do that again? Probably. Yeah, no. Okay. This one's a bit of a tricky one, huh? Oh, okay, ow. Um. Maybe, okay, maybe it's all about the angling. Maybe if I just, oh, okay. I thought that maybe I had to lure him over. Not quite. Okay, so this one looks like it might be a bit tough. Let's see what's going on around here. Get you, hold on, hold on, hey, I got you. So I need to hit, oh, not quite, not quite. Getting close, but not quite. So if I could, um, yes, okay. That's interesting, that's really fun. Oh, and that might be it. Hmm. 
Okay, and there's a moon for it. I don't see any potential purple coins around here. But there's another one done. So I don't know what's with the counter on the top left. Like, you know, maybe this, the four that were there, maybe that's just what I needed to continue. So I actually didn't even need to fight, face that boss. Interesting stuff. Maybe it's just when you defeat a boss of an area. Maybe just, oh wow, there it's some easy ones I missed. But um, maybe when you face a boss of an area, it simply just becomes, you know, more things are opening up. And then what is going on here? There's like some things on the floor here, like a little patchwork, I don't know what it is. Um, let's go ahead and break it up if we can. I mean, I should probably, it's probably the job for a T-Rex, and then I can use a T-Rex more and have an excuse to put him in the thumbnail. <laughs> so I'm gonna do exactly that. I'm gonna get you, bird! Oh, I can't get the burn. Hi, T-Rex, how you doing, buddy? I wanna grab you. Look, there's a moon there. There was not a moon there previously. You guys see that? Here, turn to the right. That moon was not there before. Oh, and now there's a pipe up there. I don't know what I did to activate that pipe. It must have just been defeating the boss. It might have just been that, you know, since it's a tutorial area sort of still, they blocked off some things. Oh, and there's like a, oh, there's a toad over there. Wow, there's so much more we can do in Cascade. Okay, no, watch out. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, toad, we're coming. Are you ready? Whoa! <laughs> that is amazing. I don't think we can get up there still, unfortunately. But we're gonna run this way. What is with that? I mean, I'm sure that um, maybe there's something we can do with that. But um, for right now, we're just gonna. Oh, geez, it was a shame chomp here before. I don't remember. Either way, that's a really easy moon now. Bada bing, bada boom. We got a moon above a high cliff. And what else is up here? I'm positive there are some purple coins right here, getting us all the way up to 44 out of 50. And down here, there's another hat door. These are so cool. Let me get this checkpoint so that I never have to um, worry about getting to the top of the big stump. And let's go in here and, and hopefully not take a bump. Oh my. I like it. What is going on here? Okay, we got a bunch of you. So you all leave me alone. I'm trying to do the thing where he circles yet. There you go. And there you go. Are you ready? You guys messed with the wrong Mario. I know I say that every time I get the T-Rex, but I get so excited. I need to have some kind of snappy line to say. That's how, you know, YouTubing works, right? Uh, <laughs> let's get a bunch of coins, this is fantastic. Oh my gosh. And there's so many of them just to destroy. I feel awful, but at the same time, it's really satisfying. Ooh. I gotta just do that as normal Mario when I get the chance. And they keep popping up, they never stop. There's an army of them. And there's nothing around here I'm missing out on, correct? I mean, I'm trying to like look over the edge. It's like Splatoon all over again where I'm looking over every single corner to try to find that one little secret. But here, that's the entire game. Okay, so there's clearly stuff down there. So I think that'll be my next destination. I mean, obviously there's gonna... What happened? Oh. Um. Okay. I guess I was hidden in a block somewhere? That definitely means I need to destroy as many blocks as I possibly can. Nothing else down here. Good to know. All right, T-Rex, move this way. He's got sort of a little bit of junk in the trunk. I mean, maybe that's just him. What? It's too big, I couldn't hold on to it any longer. Oh, I'm sorry. So it looks like even Cappy has his limits, but I can see that actually, I don't bounce up as high as the T-Rex. You think I'd bounce up even higher, but luckily they thought about that and they gave me a little pipe. So I could, of course, still hang out the T-Rex. It seems like the T-Rex is just never awake when Mario's around, so he can never actually be a threat in that line. So this is a lot of fun when I can just roll around, ow. That hurt. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and, oh, but I can't do this unless I'm already the T-Rex. So I'm doing silly stuff here, and, and there's no way to go down there. Okay, good to know. Okay, but it's very hard to turn when you do it that way. Oh, it's also peculiar. I love it. Whoa, hey, okay. So you all leave me alone. I wonder if, the, will this hurt you or will this hurt me? It'll knock you out of the way. It won't exactly hurt you, but all right, we're good to go. Let's get that moon and let's get out of here. So it looks like there are no semblance of purple coins around here. Good to know. Um, there, there we go. You got a moon, dinosaur nest running wild. Fantastic. Um, now what? I will probably get out of here, right? I mean, I guess that's the next best thing, and he just immediately passes out, the poor guy. So tired all the time. He's just hibernating. 
Um, okay, interesting. So that was, let's take a look at this. Um, if I go like this, I can go to our lists. And we still have tons to get out. We have nine out of 25. I would really like to find all of them in today's video. I'll try to, you know, focus a kingdom an episode. I feel like that'd just be a fun way to do it. Oh no. Oh, okay, we're fine. Um, ooh, what is this? A treasure found in error? I like it. What button? Oh, look at that. Okay, easy peasy. Moon squeezy. <laughs> what am I talking about? Treasure of the Waterfall Basin. So some of these are really challenging to get. Some of these are sort of just happenstance. Like, oh, I just happened to fall. Oh, I just happened to, you know, find this. Okay. So we found those purple coins right over there. That was the beginning of the episode. Flashback. No, 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 no. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. There we go. So what are you? Oh, my. Whoa. Spooky scarecrow. Oh, I don't have my hat right now, though, so this platforming might be a bit more of a challenge. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, no. Mario, Mario, Mario. Uh, uh, hold up, yeah, just barely. You got a moon, Cascade Kingdom Timer Challenge 1. So there's gonna be more, assumingly. Uh, cool, good to know. Now I'm curious about like areas like this. What is this saying? I don't think this was here before. Um. Travel tip, homing cat thrown, or cap thrown, not throwing cats. After throwing your cap, shake the Joy-Con again to perform a homing cat thrum. Your cap will fly towards the nearest target you can see. It's super handy when your aim is a little off. Interesting. Um, this rock keeps on like puffing. Yeah, yeah, I don't know what's going on there. Oh, hey, there's a toad here now. Hello, toad, how are you? Oh, you're an amiibo toad. Hi, Mario. To help out Princess Peach, I'm doing a survey of Power Moon locations. Having trouble finding Power Moons? I can help you out for 50 coins. Wanna buy it? Nah, not yet, not yet. We wanna save your coins. All right, see you later. And then, oh. Okay, we've we've already gotten these coins in the past. So I definitely think I wanna break those out blocks because I think that um maybe there'll be some purple coins behind them. I'm looking around for other secrets as well. I mean, really, the only thing I can imagine is that we have yet to climb up this. Oh, we can shake the Joy-Con to climb faster. Once again, I'm not a big fan of that. I, I really don't like motion controls or shaking stuff. Oh, <laughs> this is an easy one. So really, they just want you to re-explore areas you've already traversed, and they give you some pretty easy moons for it. This clearly wasn't there before on top of the rubble, and we've also been down here. But there's still more to explore. I've been talking about one side area that I've been meaning to get to, but every single time I get close to it, I get distracted by 80 other things. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go do that now before I forget again. Wait. Hello. You're adorable. What is the secret you are seeking? I know it, I know it, ha ha. I can't tell you, but I'll give you a clue. Very nice shot with the chain jump. It's hiding somewhere and no peeking. Go find it, go find it. Skrka! Very nice shot with the chain jump. All right, well, there's chain jumps all over the stinking place, so I think I have a while to find out. But let's get to this little side pocket area, this one. I mean, I already did this one. Unless there's a, you know more I can do there. Um, maybe I get it with another chain jump that's farther away, because that would be a nice shot. So these are some pretty easy ones, but even three uh, donut coins can make a huge difference. And then we've already gotten these. Okay. Um, there are chain chomps up there. And I haven't re-explored that area since defeating the boss. So I definitely think it's something worth doing. We've been up there. And... Okay. Um, and just poking around here, just making sure there's not too much. Once again, I'm probably gonna wanna look into destroying these things just to see what results it gives me, because I have to imagine that there's something maybe behind them or under them. We can do that all with the T-Rex, no problem, though. So I've explored all this. I don't really need to uh, be too diligent here unless I wanted some extra coins. I've been over here. Okay, there's no new moon. No new moon. No new moon at all. Maybe if I could climb up this pole. There was something up here that I missed, right? Whoa, it's the king health. Get all the way up there, Marion. Whoop. So that's just gonna give me the uh, plus three so that I have six in total. Beyond that, let's just uh, fiddle around with the chain chomps a little maybe. Now we can't destroy the chain chomps, right? What if I like destroy that? Um, Hold on, be careful, move it. Yeah, that doesn't do anything. But I'm gonna destroy as much debris around here as I can. The view is amazing. Just gonna enjoy the view while we do it too. Ah, serene. So this area is actually, yeah, it has a lot more depth than I thought. 
it definitely sort of unfolds a bit. Okay, he might be able to do that because he's a little closer. Oh, his stem is. Whoop. Oh, come on, you silly butt. I don't want you. Um, there you go. Okay, try this one out then. And this is just, this might just take me a little bit. A couple seconds of just trying over and over again. Okay, so I destroyed all of them. Doesn't seem to be getting me any results. That's okay, I had to try, right? I don't see anything else we get a hit from here. I could hop back up here. Once again, you know, these things might change. Doesn't seem like it though. That's fine, that's fine. Because we gotta still hop down to that toad over there and I haven't invented this area where there's the scarecrow now um, since we defeated the boss. So let's talk to you. Hello. Travel tip, triple jump. When you are running and want ex extra high, jump three times uh, with good timing. Your third jump in a consecutive series of jumps will take you extra high. So hop, step, and jump in the rhythm. Okay. So, uh, whoa, ho, ho, ho. Okay. Um, oh, oh, yeah, there you go. Ha, ah, triple jump, no problem. That's Cascade Kingdom Timer Challenge number two. Okay, what is this saying? Ooh, pop. Uh, what an odd stone you're telling me. Um, what is with this thing? The stone is certainly particular, but it doesn't seem to do anything. Maybe we need to do Mario's butt stomp of time. No, I don't know what that is. It seems to have like a very particular texture to it. Ooh, more purple coins. Ow, I always do that. <laughs> oh boy, this is a bit scary. Let me get across to here, get ourselves another moon. This is across the floating isles. That's indeed what they are, isles that float. And then across to here, yep, yep, yep. And that's all 50, yay, we did it! Look at me, I'm the best, not really, but hey, I try my best. And you know, that's pretty good, right? So what can I do about this? I mean, I can get up here, of course, but after I do that, what purpose does it serve? I mean, besides free coins, I think it's just a way to tr practice the triple jump. Um, we can't, yeah, we can't just, Mario's butt's not strong enough, unfortunately, to break those. Hmm. Okay, well, I think that's all I can find at this very moment. So I'm gonna go check out Toad. He should be down there. So if I just pop down like that, and then, oh boy. Hi, Toad, how you doing? It's Captain Toad. Mario, fancy meeting you here. That's right, it's me, Captain Toad. I'm traveling the world looking for power moons. There are so many rare fossils around here. I'd jump from joy, but you know. Oh, he doesn't know how to jump, that's the thing. <laughs> oh, I also found a power moon in my search, but you can have it. Hey, look, an easy one. Perfect. It looks like there might be a little like crevice behind us there, but good morning, Captain Toad. I guess it is morning, it's like 10 a.m. Which kingdom do you think I should visit next? All of them. Um, Is this little? Guess not, okay. Hmm. I don't see too much else over here. But I did also wanna say thank you because a couple of you actually let me know like you didn't ex you, like, plan or expect to enjoy this game, but you watch the series and you at least watch liking, or you like watching me play. And I think that's really cool. So thank you so much to those who are taking the time to watch this game, even if you might not particularly enjoy it yourself, like if you just enjoy me. That's really cool, it's super flattering. Let us go down that line and destroy a bunch of blocks that seemingly have no purpose. Maybe we can give them purpose. Being destroyed by a dinosaur, don't fall. Okay, yeah, charge for you guys and then just destroy this stuff. I mean, there won't be any purple coins because we've gotten all the purple coins, but um, I don't see too much else. So whatever else we find, it may just be that maybe there's like an extension to Cascade Falls or I just can't quite get it just yet, but this is how we can get over here with the dino, which is pretty cool. And once again, this stuff, once again, looked like it was oddly purposeless. I'm thinking maybe there's something hiding. Oh, there is a uh, little cat Mario hiding underneath. Whee! <laughs> um, so beyond that weird rock, that to me, I'm just gonna call the moon rock. I don't know what else we could do. Okay, let's, oh yeah, free coins. I think that might be about it. I mean, I'm gonna once again take a look at our map, maybe go back. Yeah, it's pointing me here because it really wants me to go to the next kingdom, which I'm totally fine with doing. I just wanted to try some other stuff first. Let's. So there's a talk to. Maybe we should go to Toad here, and maybe. Oh, 
Oh yeah, maybe this is, oh, this is the amiibo thing. Hey kiddo, I'm Uncle Amiibo, pleased to make your acquaintance and all that. Hey, you got any amiibo? If you happen to have some, put them to work. They're good at finding any stray power moons. And here's the kicker. Depending on the amiibo you use, you might get a little bonus costume tune. You wanna tap an amiibo? I don't have any. So it looks like I can't get all the costumes then? That's a huge bummer. If you ever want to use amiibo, you just let me know, sport. I really hope that there's other way to get whatever costumes that, you know, might be in the game, because I really, really want all the costumes. I really hope I don't have to cash out a bunch of figures, because I can't afford to do that. Um, hello? Having trouble finding power moons? I can help you for 50 coins. Wanna buy an Sure. Uh, thanks, I've marked it on your map, so take a look. Ooh. So there's something back over there on the stump area, right? Yeah, that's the stump area right there. So let's check this out. I'm curious to know. And after this, if we, we're, we're still struggling to find some moons. Yeah, I can't, he won't give me a hint for a moon we already got, right? That'd be the most bogus thing of all time. Definitely isn't, because I'm standing over here and it's like, maybe, oh, maybe this is the one where we have to do something with this chain chomp, potentially. Like, what happens if I, no, that didn't do anything. Um, weird. I'm not entirely sure. Maybe it's something on the other side here. Here, one more time, whoop. I mean, it definitely seems to be alluding to like something there, but that didn't do anything. Huh, whoa, okay, that's just the coins. I'm not really caring about that too much. Even though I just spent 50 coins, maybe I should be a bit more diligent with getting more. I don't know, this one's wacky. Maybe it's not here yet, like, you know, just like before. You know, there are moons here now that used to not be here. And maybe if I get stuff done in other kingdoms. Uh, but can I zoom in way in and find out like exactly where it is? Like maybe like on this rock? Nope. I mean, it's not trying to say like it's, what is this little section here? Not like that. Yeah, that's definitely way off. Unless it is trying to say that there is another moon in here. What if I go in here? And, oh wow, okay. It, on the compass, Darren, it definitely made it seem as though going in here and was the correct spot to be. So maybe I should search around here a little bit more. Maybe there is more than one moon to find. That's a lot of them. That's a whole big bunch. I don't like it. Where are there? Where could there be another one? I'm not really sure. Do da do da do da. But I'll sure look for it. I'm not rhyming, but I'm trying to make a song. Oh jeez. <laughs> I had to focus. I'll try to get away from these guys. Oh, there you go. So I don't know. From here, I can get a good look at everything, though, for sure. And of course, destroying things, if not productive, is at least enjoyable. Oh, no! Oh. I was trying to see if maybe there's anything up there, trying to get a good look. I didn't really see anything. Huh. I don't think there is anything around here. I mean, unless like really destroying, oh gosh, I really shouldn't do that. This is horrifying, but I gotta try it. Whoa, boy. Okay, you know what? Never mind. I changed my mind. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. See it. <laughs> but there has to be like, maybe like alone something, something somewhere, right? I mean, obviously the main purpose of this area is with Mario, but what happens if I don't use Mario? Like, where was that one block that was just, it was just randomly hidden in this one. No rhyme or reason to it. It was just snuck in there. So what are the possibilities of that being the case with another block? I mean, I thought I got the most of them, but maybe I missed one, and that one I missed was the important one. All right, I'll give it a shot. If not, we'll throw in the towel for today. I found a ton of moons. And the next episode, we'll adventure to a new kingdom. That sounds fun to me. Okay, so it seems like to me this hint was a bit of a waste of 50 coins. I tried what I could. And I just can't figure it out. So maybe it is trying to tell me about a moon I've already gotten, which would be silly. That'd be so silly, but it's totally possible. I'll talk to you once more, just in case. Um, what's the secret you're seeking? I know it. I can tell you, dinosaur nest, big cleanup. It's hiding somewhere and no peeking. Well, it definitely isn't what I just did, which is destroying all the blocks in that area. 
I mean, the only other dinosaurs around here, and and I'll try this one. Maybe like we could destroy. I mean, there really isn't too much to destroy around here. Uh, could scare away all the birdies. But I don't think that would do too much for me. I think it just means I'm mean to birds. And I come back very quickly. Uh. All right, well, I think I'm just about all out of ideas for this area. So let's deliver all of these moons, if I can. Can I just go in? Oh, oh, I can go inside. Ooh, what is going on? Oh, look at that the little mirror. Wait, is this where we can get new costumes? Mario Cap, a red hat that has seen its fair share of adventures. And then his other thing, oh, the Mario suit. This tied and or this tried and true outfit has weathered many adventures. So that's all we have right now, but we are looking fantastic. Look at the bottom of our shoes, look at the top of our head. We're looking good to go. Um, I don't know if there's too much we can do around here. Ooh. Okay, so this is another travel guide. I mean, I don't really know why I need that there, if I can just press minus at any given point in time. So we can go inside the ship, that's fantastic. I don't know when we're gonna use that, but I don't care, and we're just doing this. Oh, this is how we deliver the moons. So we have like eight moons. We're jumping from six to 17, okay, we had 11 moons, holy cow. Um, let's go. If we can, head off to another kingdom, set sail. Now, Cappy wanted us in the last episode to go to a different kingdom. I wanted to keep exploring Cascade Kingdom, but now I guess we're moving on to our next adventure, or we could go back. I don't know if there's too much more we can really find here, but we definitely have way more abilities than before, so we could adventure it, but I'm sure there'll be some story pieces here that we'll want to enjoy, so why don't we go to Sand Kingdom and find some stuff out here, just to explore it a little bit. I'm not really sure what we want to do. I'm still figuring out, because this game obviously, oh boy, don't let that fall on your head, Marion, isn't very linear, oh boy. Oh, here we go, we're setting sound. Off to a new kingdom. Oh wow, that is cool. It's so bright and shiny. The whole game is bright and shiny, that's what I love about it. The Hatmobile has taken to the air, and, and here is its new home. Hold on to those safety rails, Marion. There's no seatbelts on this thing. Hello. <laughs> oh. oh, look at that, we got a little captain's hat. Do we get to keep that? I mean, I don't know, but <laughs> looking fantastic. Here we go. <laughs> Awesome, this is so exciting. So what is Sand Kingdom gonna be like? Is it gonna be like our average desert level? Or is this gonna be the one that was in all of the uh, trailers, like the reveal trailer, or at least some of the reveal gameplay? It looks like it's sort of going backwards, you know? I would imagine the other side is the front, but I guess not. It just sort of has that look to it. So, how do you like me as a captain hat, or a captain's hat? Pretty classy, wouldn't you say? Huh? Yeah, I like it. Now then, where were we? That monster's name is Bowser? Well, we'll chase him down in no time in the Odyssey. Oh, so the ship is called the Odyssey. Seeing as how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. Travel tip, ground bound. Just smash blocks or enemies below you or to flatten out bumps in the ground. Nothing beats a ground bound. Flatten out bumps, hmm. Press ZL in midair to do a ground bound and pulverize with your posterior. Well, there it is. If you need some more review, you might want to take a look at the action guide. Okay, okay, action guide, there's action guide, that I know. You know, we can learn all about the controls here. I'm pretty familiar with them at this point. Um, Basic actions, look at all this. Oh, you can pick things up, you can triple jump. I mean, I don't think there's too many things I'm missing out on when it comes to the downward throw. Like, it's just about moving the Joy-Cons in a specific way, which I'm really not a big fan of. But anyways, uh, capture actions. Okay, yeah. Interesting, so we can learn more about the characters we've captured. I wonder if I can find any secrets by watching this. It doesn't look like it, but I tried. Uh, travel hints. Ooh. Assist mode, amiibo, amiibo 2, ranking, snapshot, view map. Okay, um, don't think there's really too much I can learn for right now. It's always here, or it's always there for your pursual. Just open the menu with, it, with plus and select the action guide. We should discuss the Sand Kingdom tune. As you've no doubt pieced together, it is entirely covered in sand, and as you can imagine, it's quite, it gets quite hot. Hmm. There are some ruins there, and an artifact called the Binding Band that links people forever, like a wedding ring, oh my. And this Bowser seems like, and this Bowser seems like just the sort of creep that would steal a priceless antiquity for his sham wedding. All right, well, we gotta get to that before he does, that's for sure. We both got a lady to save. You got your sister, I got my princess. Sounds like a goal. 
Okay, the Sand Kingdom. Toast, Toast Arena, I think it says. It's sort of being covered by the clouds. Yeah, Toast Arena. Or maybe Toast Arena? Atop the highest tower. So we gotta go way out there, oh my. So, oh, there's a moon. This place is beautiful, but also sort of kind of barren. Oh, it, it's chilly. Huzzah, I declare the maiden voyage of the Odyssey a complete success. But why is it so cold? I thought deserts were supposed to be hot. Huh? The top of the tower is shining. But how could that be? Could it be a power moon? Probably. Okay, so, interesting. I'm going to imagine that for whatever reason there's this ice caps here, that's what's making it cold, of course. That's so weird. Let's go ahead and, oh, looks, we have our own purple currency here as well. Oh, oh, we're gonna get the hatch store here. Those uh, coins are good only in this kingdom. I figured, I figured, so there's our first tune. Oh, this is so exciting. Hello there, little sombrero man, how you doing? Hi. This is so cold, everything just froze all of this is sudden. Oh no, that is a shame. Can I become the lizard? No, I can't. Uh, c come on, t taxi, been waiting forever. And I can't catch with these guys because they're already wearing a hat. Let me go ahead and get our flag fall. I love how they're green here instead of yellow. Maybe they change with each one. What does that say? Welcome to our sh shop, we got Crazy Cap. Oh, that's so exciting, but first, let's get up here. Ooh, hold on, whoop, yep. And then over here, nice. Oh yeah, we still have the Captain Cap on, I like that. That is really exciting as well. Is that we have different caps now, at least we have two. Awesome, let's hop down here and go inside. I am really curious about this. Um, oh, hi puppy, you are so adorable. You are to die for. Use this closet it's changed any time. Uh, in front of you guys, that's a little awkward. Oh, well, there's a moon back there. Huh, how I get back there, I'm not really sure. Hey, hey, hey. We accept two kinds of coins. Uh, coins and coins. <laughs> you can use uh, money, I'm just gonna call them normal coins. You can use normal coins anywhere, but purple coins, only right here. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, so with money coins, it seems like, wow, okay, Sand Kingdom Power Moon, a power moon that was discovered in Toast Arena. Wait, is this something I could find normally, but I can also get this way? I'm not really sure, but maybe I should just buy it. Is this what you wanted? Sure, I'll buy that. Got it, thank you for your purchase. And then we, oh, oh. So there we go, yeah, you got a moon, shopping in Toasterina, so I guess that's the only way you could have gotten that one. Nice to know. Now when it comes to the hollow out, hollowed out uh, power moons on the top left, I'm going to assume that's how many we need to get to the next area. Hey, hey, hey! Okay, so we could get a life up heart, this heart-shaped item raises your maximum life value of the six, I'm not really too interested. Whoa, okay, we got the employee cap, a crazy cap original. Is this what you wanted? Of course it is. Okay, and then, Maybe later, I don't wanna change anything just yet. You can change in the closet over there if you want. We got the employee uniform, show your crazy cat brand loyalty with this striking outfit. I love being dedicated to brands blindly. And then uh, one last one. For a thousand coins, can't quite get this. Boxer shorts, wait a minute. Comfortable breezy boxers in a vibrant mushroom-like pattern. If he has to buy boxers, does that mean he's not wearing any right now? Ew, unless he's more of a tidy whitey kind of guy. I can imagine Mario being that kind. All right then, so hey, hey, hey! We got the sombrero for five. How many do we have right now? We have 11. Oh, this is so cool. We got the poncho. So let's read all these. Sombrero, traditional to toasterian, 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 I can't even. Toasterian and, uh, no, no, I <laughs> can't. Hat, keeps the sun out of your eyes and is just plain fun to wear. Traditional folk dress of the toasterina region keeps the sun off and the breezes on. The cowboy hat, a classic hat perfectly suited for wearing as you ride into sunsets. Old fashioned, on oh, this cowboy outfit, old fashioned duds with a frontier feel, gunslinging and cow punching optional. Sand Kingdom sticker, a sticker inspired by the inverted pyramid. Inverted pyramid? Jaxi statue. In the Toasterina region, the Jaxi has lived in, alongside the people since ancient times. The statue is made from the stones of the ruins. And then finally, inverted pyramid model, a famous location in the so Toasterina ruins. Even the tiniest details are fa faithfully recreated like the reliefs etched into onto the walls. Come again, yeah, we don't have a much, much for any of that. I'd like to buy it more all in one go. Okay, interesting. I know there's a moon back there. It looked like there was almost like a door on the left, so maybe there's like a door over somewhere. 
I'm f f frozen to the corn. No one will buy our freezy treats now. I'll buy them. I guess you're not selling to me. I see how it is. What does this say? Um, travel tip, crouch. When you see something interesting out of reach and the ceiling is too or is too low for you to get there normally, press the L to crouch. You can also walk that way. Ooh, I like this. Oh. <laughs> is that it? Oh no, there's more. Oh, there's definitely more. Um, hello. I'll grab that. Yay, you got a moon, employees only. Not quite, but uh, <laughs> can I talk to you now that I'm back here? I mean, I'm probably just gonna be the same thing, right? Oh, ah! Ooh, you scared the teeth out of me. Want a job? Use the front door, please. How about you? Oh, ah! you scared the teeth out of me as well, okay. Interesting. <laughs> so we got our first moon in the area. And that one was just by sneaking around. So can I get out of here normally? Okay, yeah, it, it sort of skips some of it for me, which I appreciate. Um, oh my, whoa! Oh, hello you, you're the toucan. I hear the, the glimmer of another moon as well. What is the secret you are seeking? I know it, I know it, ha ha! I can't tell you, but I'll give you a clue. Herding sheep in the dunes. It's hiding somewhere and no peeking. Go find it, go find it, scr Okay, oh, it's right up here. Look at this, another easy peasy one. Okay. It would be if I could have some. I have, I'm having a really hard time doing the slide jump. I feel like it's harder with the uh, the Joy Cons than like a Nintendo 64 controller would be. You get a moon overlooking the desert town. Very cool. So let us plop into this pipe. And I gotta say, I'm having so much fun with this game. I really hope that you guys are enjoying my playthrough of it as well. Uh, oh, hello. Um, hi. There's a prize in this party room, but to find it, you'll have to feel it. Walk around, feel the rumble, let it move you to the prize. Oh, so there is a... I see. The, the, the controller is vibrating the closer I get to it. That's very interesting. Oh, hey, I found it! Hooray, is there more though? A rumble from the sandy floor. Is my controller vibrating anymore at all? It is not. Perfect, you let the feeling move you. I'm glad I could actually feel that. That's one of those, another one of those things where it's like, I think it's a cool idea, but it is sort of stinky that it's like mandatory. I don't know. I mean, I guess like, like for whatever reason, if you didn't have vibration or couldn't like feel it, I guess you could just butt stomp everywhere until you eventually find it, so it's not a big deal. You can open the map with the minus button, so easy and helpful. Uh, you can select the chat, yeah, I you know. You've activated it and then press A to fly straight to it. So yeah, we've already done that, but as you can see, there's other things here. There's Talkatoon. There is the shop, and then there is slots. I don't know what slots are. Maybe these are slots in this room over here? Hello, Yoon. Have I talked to Yoon? How oh, Kingdom froze when that strange couple got here, and why did they do this? Well, half the couple didn't have anything to do with it. Okay, so I just wanna be a little thorough if I can. Maybe get around here, just take a look at all these buildings, and of course fly on this thing, because it's a lot of fun. Oh, I'm getting some purple coins for it too. Well worth the adventuring. A hundred, so we have twice as many to find here than we did in Cascade Kingdom. I do wanna remind people that I will be reading comments and you know taking whatever tips or suggestions on what to check out, but do know I will be also recording in bulk just so I can get ahead on videos. You ever get lost, You're, you, you head for the bright glowy light, okay? Well done. So, uh, could I climb up? Oh wait, could I? Hmm, not quite. Cause I've gone on power lines before. Whoa, what is the little rocket ship? I'm not sure. Anyways, let's go into this uh, building right here. Cause it's the only really thing we haven't touched upon in this area and then we can move on. We can move forward. So what is this gonna be about? I'm excited. Dun, 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 dun. Play some slots at the Toast Arena game that's winning worldwide fame. It's 10 coins to play, what do you say? A power moon can be won, try it, it's fun. Sure thing, let's play. Yay, slots away. Okay, so um, use your hat your thro to throw on. So ding, 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 Yes, okay, there's one. So I guess I should have thrown it from the side. Yeah, okay, so when that heart is lowering. Oh, yeah, I got it! Ha <laughs> ha, that was awesome! Okay, so we got that. Yeah, Sand Kingdom slots. Anything else to win around here? Um, wait a plane. It'll be 10 more coins. And we're out of power moons, okay? So on a plane, no thanks. That's fine, stop by again at some time, okay? Let's get out of here. <laughs> um, that was really fun, I like that. So, 
let's get out of here and talk to you, because we haven't talked to you too much yet, have we? So I wonder if there a way to unfreeze some of this stuff. I'd, I'd have to imagine so. I saw the cr craziest couple come racing past on their way to the ruins. I, I, I figure they're still out that way. I hope so, that'd be nice. Oh, there's a little sign. Look, Bowser's footprints. Oh, oh yes they were. So he was just charging around here. What was making everything so cold? Maybe his cold demeanor. Travel tip, long jump. When you wanna jump really far, or if you just wanna zoom even faster than you can by running, Run, crouch, and then jump. You'll do a long jump and sail ahead. Don't worry, I do it constantly, but is that faster than rolling? Rolling, 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 out my face. Um, hold on, hold on. Oh, the four for one, I like it. So are these the ataxies they were talking about? I guess this is the statue, the, the jaxi, right? Is it like a jaguar plus, plus a taxi? Toast Arena ruins entrance, and already I can hear something up there. Not entirely sure how to get up there, but I definitely hear it, but wait a minute. Haha, <laughs> coins, go on. So any kind of bump in the road like that, we definitely want to take advantage. Hmm, I did see another couple over here for sure, so let's slam and jam. Just a coin there. What about like the bigger ones like this? Oh, no, it's, it's still only one. Now, I'm trying to yeah, do the little spinny one. That's really difficult for me to do. Um, oh, oh, come on, gotcha. So let's get across to here and, and check out this. Can I, uh, oh, whoa, 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 what's happening? Oh, that's really cool. So yes, there is a power moon up here. How in the world am I getting up here? Maybe I can fly at some point. There was the rocket way over there. I didn't really mean to stop, but there's so many different places to go. I think it would be good just to focus on the sparkly one first. But I gotta do this. Anything we might run into that we definitely think we can do, I will try to do. But beyond that, I will try to, um, what's it gone? Oh, oh. No, 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 hold on, hold on. Oh. Yep, 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 there we go, cool. But I will try to, um, beyond that, you know, just try to get anything on our way and then just get to the sparkly thing. Not seeing too many purple coins recently. <gasps> oh boy, here we go, so we can accelerate, but can we raise higher in the air? Doesn't look like we can, which is a problem, because, wait, can I break this? I can't, hmm. Interesting, I'm, I'm trying to figure that out then. If there's any way we could maybe get up there, that'd be great. We've already found five moons in this area, that is insane. So I don't want that one, but maybe later. And, oh, you know what, if I was you right now, I could, um, ow, fall into the goop, I don't like it. Whoa, we're sinking, jump, jump! I know, I know, I'm, I'm one step ahead of you. I've played a Mario game before. Quicksand is no stranger to Mario, and Mario is no stranger to quicksand. So if we could find maybe a bolt build that's being shot up from higher up, we can maybe fly over there. I don't know how far we can get with this thing, um, but we're gonna find out right now because I see this moon over here as well. And, ow. Um, and if we could set it up correctly, I just need to, whoa, it definitely has a bit of drag to it. I'm not just like, you know, playing awful. It's pretty uh, difficult to do. There we go, we got a moon on the leaning pillar. Now I'm sure that wasn't the only way to get this, but it definitely seems like the easiest way, leave me alone. They know it's me. That's the interesting thing. All right, up, oh, yeah, just barely made it. That was amazing. But there's more. We could sneak across that way, but is that really worthwhile? Aren't we gonna go around that way from here? Maybe, oh, wait, there you go. But there's also maybe some stuff hidden alongside here. Hmm, what is about that? Uh. Uh, where can I plant, where can we, oh, it's a nun. Hmm. A little nun, huh? Well, I don't really know what I wanna do with this just yet, so maybe I should put it back where I found it. And now I gotta go all the way around, don't I? Oh no, the mistakes I've made. There's this stuff everywhere, though. It's insane, like, I don't know where to go first, but I wanna try my best for everything. Like, I just love it, because it's just raw exploration. And it's interesting exploration as well. It's not like just run for seven miles this way, just hope that, you, you know, you don't get bored on the on the way there. And, like, there's stuff to do, and that's fantastic. So what happens if I do, and then go across to here? Is this something I want to be doing? I mean, I could be doing it. Do I want to be? That's a whole nother question. Oh, gosh. Um, I guess it just is sort of like an alternative way to get across to here. It doesn't seem to be really right or wrong. I mean, I can get this checkpoint now, which I probably should have gotten originally because I could, could have just teleported back up here, you know? But I'm silly like that. Oh, does the sign sign? Travel tip, ground pound. Yep, we already learned about ground pound. Yep, yep, yep. 
Um, there's an interesting little road sign. I like how the road sign just like a normal kind of road sign. Can I maybe? Not quite. Okay. I do see some invisible coins up here though. Oh. Oh boy. I don't like it. <laughs> it's really tough. I am not running into many purple coins though. That's sort of concerning me. But I'm going to imagine that's just because of how huge this area is. Oh gosh. Speaking of purple coins, those are blue coins. Unless my eyes are messing with me. Um. Okay. Hmm. Well, let's go through here and and try to figure this out. I'm a little, you know, nervous about these bullet bills, these bills of bullets. Oh, oh, I messed it up. At least we don't like turn into small Mario. There's no small Mario in this game. It would be cool if like maybe they made like a, like an extra little mini game where it's like just like a normal Mario adventure, just like this sound. Oh gosh, I'm on my last bit of health. I gotta be careful. Let's go ahead and be Yoon. So maybe I could bust. Oh, oh wow, that only lasts for one crate. Those guys are not as strong as they seem. Oh. Oh, okay. So right here, this is atop the highest tower. Look, there's the inverted pyramid. Okay. There's a ton of stuff around here. Hmm. Well, this is everything we've adventured thus far. And yep, there's a little, there's just so much. So much to take in and enjoy. Oh, there's another moon. That doesn't seem too bad. Atop the highest tower. Okay. Uh, break this. What does this have? Health, maybe? Oh, that's a moon! Okay, easy enough where you're going. Over there, really? All right, well then I will become a bill of bullets. There you go. Oh, there's a little lever over there. Or something. Oh, ooh, we broke the ice. I mean, we can, it seems like all the smaller bits of ice we can already break, but. All right, we get another moon. We got from a crate in the ruins. Then maybe I could bust some, ooh, that gives me my health back. There you go, I butt slammed. So a couple things I wanna do here, right? At least one thing I wanna do is jump on you. And then land here, right? Yep, yep, yep. Ah, so, what did I accomplish too much? A bit of a shortcut. But now I can just teleport back here and not have a hard time going over then. It's weird that we have sort of a loading screen even just for like a couple spaces over. But that's fine, I'll live. Okay, so, Let's, um, oh, uh, no, never mind. I thought I saw something. I did not. Oh, come on. Mario, did you really just do that to me? Oh, <laughs> okay. Never mind. Thanks, Mario. We got another moon. Alcove in the ruins. <laughs> I can't believe that. That was just such a happy little accident there. Okay, well, luckily, once again, it's not that big of a deal just to get up here. And man, even making mistakes ends up getting you collectibles in this game. I think I'm just gonna end up being a bullet bill here. I mean, I could just re-break this crate for fun. And it does, okay, yeah, it just brings it to you. I'm not gonna get that again. That's just not worth my time. Um, but I can wait for you to shoot a bullet, that bullet, bullet bill. Now wait, I, I can waste it entirely. What is wrong with me? Um, come on, come on. You know what, I'm gonna do this the difficult one. And that's when you give me a bullet bill, huh? Fine, you know what? Man, I'm better than you. I don't even need you. I mean, that's a little rude to say, I'll be honest. I guess, I guess we'll take it. But we didn't need you. It was just because you were attacking me. So what is up here? I mean, I don't know if it'll just be the moon, if we're gonna find some other, you know, maybe a boss fight, some collectibles, something. What is that? Ooh. Okay, good for me for looking. Oh, so if we went this way, we could have found some extra stuff, maybe? Or at least a shortcut once again. You know, we could have just skipped a huge chunk of this if we just wanted to go this way. I mean, if we could have gotten up there, I think we could have. So yeah, definitely there's some plenty of shortcuts abound. So one thing that's really cool about that is it makes it very speedrunning friendly. And that's exciting. Like, I really want to see some crazy speedruns for this game, ow. Let me uh, butt slam this little bump in the road. Some health that I just really need. And I see that right there. You see some, there's some uh, more purple coins, but they're blue. I don't understand why they're blue, but they are. I just have to accept that. How can I get that? I'll be looking. Oh, oh, that hurt. Okay, that that one didn't hurt as much. See, it's right here. What happens if I like, plop down here? Ooh, it's a secret. So there's three more, we're up to 24 out of 100. Oh boy, hold on. Oh, yeah, I got you. Okay, that looks a bit odd. Um, Maybe I could hop off a bullet bill and end up up there like that? I don't wanna die 
I mean, I've died a couple times before in the game, but I don't want to die. Oh, come on. That was malarkey. So if I were, like, oh my gosh, it's such a tough jump to make when I'm using the joystick. Oh, oh. oh that doesn't work, though. So maybe I'm not supposed to do it that way. Let's keep going this way and uh, see what we can figure out. Okay, this isn't fun. Oop, oh, oop, oh, yep. <laughs> sort of miss old Mario, 3D Mario games where, um, oh yeah, that wasn't as much as I thought it was gonna be. Unless it is. It is, yeah, look at that! You got a moon, secret of the mural. Cool. So we got a couple on purple coins for that. Oh gosh. <laughs> we got our buppy, but hey, at least I got my health back. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh no. Come on, keep moving, Mario. Keep moving, Mario. Keep moving, Mario. And we made it to the top. Awesome. Toaster in a ruins round tower with another, yet another power moon waiting for us. Hooray! Atop the highest tower. Hey! So we've already made fantastic prog progress with uh, finding stuff. Whoa. This looks difficult. Moon shards in the sand. Wow. Oh, look, it's a little, like, moon medallion. Interesting. Um, well, okay. Nothing too much else. I guess we should just keep going. I mean, I I'm afraid we're missing stuff, but that, that might be a bit of an inevitability. So what are these things? They look like little bugs. Oh! It's like a little hat extender. I mean, I don't know if that's the best way to explain it, but... Oh, jeez. Okay, that was a mistake. <laughs> hey, these things are from Super Mario Galaxy. It's interesting seeing some things like return like that. So I do not want to hit this one, because if I do, I might not be able to do this very easily. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, I am supposed to hit it. It's gonna explode the blocks. Hold on, hold on. I'm not ready. Oh, no! Was that a mistake? I, I think it was, yeah. Um, <laughs> wah! Okay, um, down 10 coins it seems. I think that we'll probably end up losing more coins the more we die, or maybe in more difficult areas it ends up being that way. But uh, everything's back, so that's pretty nice. Get all that. Oh wait, get all that. So I definitely want to actually explode this stuff. I just need to be good at jumping, which I'm, I'm, I'm decent enough. So wait right here, and then throw your hat. Oh, throw your hat. Throw your hat. Oh, that was almost too late. So that's gonna start moving a different platform, which is fantastic, because now I can get a couple of those, and then I can maybe long jump to here so that I don't miss out on too much. There you go. And I don't think I, I missed out on anything there. That's good. Oh, geez. Oh, it's activating all the other ones. Oh, that is both interesting and also really scary, because they're gonna keep repeating each other over and over now. Ooh, that's a bit of a challenge, I gotta be careful. Yep. Okay, we're fine. Can I also set it off myself? Oh, I don't know if that was me or not, but uh, you know, it doesn't matter. And quickly, get that. All right, we did it. Ooh. And we get another checkpoint, so we never have to do that again. Fantastic. Moai Habitat. Hello. Oh. Oh. It's a piece of a power moon. So it is just a power moon piece. Can I become you? Oh yeah, I think I know these things. Ha <laughs> ha you can turn on and put off the shades. They move so slow though. Hmm, peculiar, I love it. Oh, and there's more Bowser stomps over here. I'll have to follow those soon enough, but first let me get all these. This guy's scared of me. Oh, oh no, oh, oh okay. So they still exist even though, hmm, okay. So these things right here are sort of like checkpoints. Like if I go to them, well maybe not quite. Oh, you know what, if there, when a moon pops up there, once I obtain it, that's what like something happens there. What was that Bowser creep doing here? I'm not sure, but uh, do we really wanna know? So there is something over here, and something or these little Moai guys, <laughs> the Moai guys, uh, they don't jump. So as we can see, the birds, no. The birds, they have like that sixth sense. Zebras have it too, but I can't let you know, because it's a secret, it's a secret sixth sense. <laughs> but um, yeah, they just sort of knew there was something, there was footsteps. Where was he headed? It looks like honestly he was just straight up lost. He has footsteps heading in every direction. Um, hello. Um, I don't know, if, can I become the cactus? Oh, come on, let me be the cactus. <laughs> 
Hmm. So obviously there's some stuff up there as well, but how exactly am I getting there? Hmm. I don't know how to feel about this. Oh. What is that? There's a little P-switch. Not entirely sure what to do there. There's gonna be eventually a way to remove the ice, right? That Bowser sure was stomping around in a huff. Seems like it. Wait, is it? Oh, there's an elevator over there. Okay, that elevator is actually in plain view no matter what, so I'm just being a total dingus. So let's uh, whittle waddle over here to the coins and then wait for our... <laughs> These guys are the best, I love them. These might be some of my favorite guys we've uh, transformed into. So we could go right across for some free coins, which I'll take. You know, free coins is fantastic. Just don't fall off. Oh boy. Um. So far this seems to be quite simple though. I just go across here and, and we find yet another moon piece. But I feel like I'm missing one more, yeah. Oh, it's right there, okay. Way, oh. <laughs> These guys, they're strong as stone because they are stone, boom. So what is that gonna do? That's gonna combine to become one big moon and then we could go this way if we wanted to, which is quite the way to come. What about this other direction? Once again, I think this is maybe something we can't do. I mean, this is the direction we came from, correct? Seems like it, because we actually can't from this way. There seemed like there was a um, another like lever or something, a little switch in the ice there. So once again, we're gonna have to learn how to destroy the ice before we can do anything there. But in the meantime, moon piece. Fantastic. Woohoo! We got moon shards in the sand. Nice. We need five more, and then we're actually ready to go to the next kingdom if we really wanted to. Mmm. I tried to take a sip of tea at a good time, and it ended up being something else. Showdown on the inverted pyramid. As somebody, ooh, you can see it's Princess Peach calling for help on their gigantic wedding airship. I don't like it. That is not good. All right, let's uh, get ourselves psyched up. Mario, do some squats, do some squats. Get those quads on fire. So we can get a better view of that way up here. Showdown on the inverted pyramid, but on the way there, could we run into anything else? Fantastic, ooh. That looks interesting, but I feel like that's maybe a little too far off the mark. If anything, I should go get that checkpoint. Let's go and get that checkpoint, and then I'll keep going this way, so. Um, let's go like this, fix the camera a little bit maybe. The sand is much more red here. Sometimes he has like a little speed boost when he does this. I don't know if that's like a matter of timing, but I like it. It's like the belly roll from Hat in Time. I really like it. Oh, yep, yep, yep. Oh wow, look at that little inverted pyramid way up there as well. You can see that there's a moon up there. I wonder how I could get that one. I'm sure there's a way, but for right now we should follow the footsteps because it's fun and dramatic to do that. Um, hello. I, I sure <laughs> hope they don't steal our precious artifact. Things are heating up in the inverted pyramid. They must be trying to steal our legendary binding band. Oh boy, that's not good. I mean, what does that do? Does that like legally contract them to be together forever? I don't like it. Travel tip, roll. Oh yeah, we, we already know this one, we're, we're masters at it. When you wanna move quickly, just zip down a hill, or just zip down a hill, crouch down and press Y and you'll be able to roll. All right, whee! Oh, when we shake the, the Joy-Con, that's what happens, okay. Hmm. Hello. No, 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 my beautiful sheep. The three of them have escaped and now I'll never get them back. Oh, poor sheep. Oh, I see one right here. Hello. Can I, oh, and I can't become you because you're wearing a hat. All right, where are you going? Where are you going? Well, I'll try to help out with this. Please don't fall into the pit. Please don't, ready? Skill shot. Oh, almost in there. We ready for the slam dunk? Probably not, because I can just chase you. Oh, you know what this reminds me of? The game I always ogle about in every single Let's Play, Jack and Daxter, where you got the, um, you got the herd, the yaks, the yak count, not even the yaks, into their uh, pen. This is actually a little bit more in depth, I would say, because we can hit them around and it's like a bigger area to do it, but that's what it reminds me of, because I'm in, you know, obsessed with that game. Uh, what is, where, where is the last well, sheep? Hmm. Oh, there he is, I see him. Hello. I think you took a long term at Albuquerque, but uh, you can tell me. I've got a customer waiting, but from the looks of this mess, I'm not going anywhere anytime soon. Brrr. Oh, I can't become you, because you're wearing a hat. That's why everybody's wearing a hat in this game. <laughs> hey, look at that, easy peasy. 
We got a moon lost in the luggage. We just literally stole that from that dude then. Okay, so, uh, I mean, I guess it's for the greater good, right? Let's get you over here. I do want to switch back to Mario's normal cap soon enough. This cap is cool, but I also like this basic Mario. I mean, I want to try out some of the other costumes as well. I don't know if I should do like a costume in episode. I feel like that's pretty fun. Unless like I need a costume for something specific. Like, oh, oh, I'm so sorry. No, 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 stop it, stop it. Don't, be careful, be careful. Look at them, he's a little daredevil. Get that one. So you gotta be careful with the cacti because they're, they're prickly. And got him. Hooray! All three sheep are here. Awesome. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Hurting the sheep in the dunes. I think that was the one. Yeah, that was the one that little squawk parrot was all like, you should do this one. I did it. Oh, look at this. Whoa, there's a triple moon in this. Whoa. Ow. Ooh, that was a headache. A multi moon that we can't get to. You're telling me. Oh, we can knock the, the luggage around too. <laughs> There's a little bus thing here. Oh, can I sit down? I can't. Hmm. Hello, sir. How are you? That's the biggest tourist attraction in Toast Arena, the inverted pyramid. We keep a famous artifact in there, a treasure that binds two people together, even if their world's upside down. We call it the binding band. Pretty fitting name, right? but will bind two people even against their will, or at least one of their wills? Because that's a pretty awful band, if you ask me. Hello. I saw a weird couple go into the pyramid. I think they're going to see our celebrated binding band. That ain't gonna wanna have to get in there quick. Oh boy, it is creepy in here too. We just go into the ominous entrance. Inside the inverted pyramid. Look at this place, okay. I like it, but I don't at the same time. It's too creepy. And of course, I find it funny that you always find desert areas in Mario games as like the second or third world. Usually the second world. I mean, here was sort of the second world. The first world was just sort of like a bit of a tutorial, so does it really count as the first world? I don't think so. Oh, ow, that hurt. But I wanna be as careful as I can because, you know, going back into a place like this won't be fun if we have to, you know, come back for collectibles. Well, we may just have to do that. Okay, uh, let's check this out. Boop, boop, boop. Wait. Yep. And then let's go inside of here, and, and maybe we'll be able to do well. I'm not sure. Oh, look at this! Super Mario Galaxy throwback, huh? I think? Um, you bet, Super Mario Galaxy throwback. Look at this. I like that, it's very interesting. Now, like I said, they had the same thing in Super Mario Galaxy, where it's like, of course, if you are in this inverted little area. Now, if I fall through here, am I going to die? I mean, I can only assume, right? Uh, should I try to find out the hard way? Um, sure. Yep. Okay, well, I'd rather find out lose like what? 10 coins instead of having to do all that and then find out, oh gosh, there was a, there was a moon down there. It was, you know, that would be stinky too. So I think we made the good choice. I love how he has a little light too. It does help guide him a little bit. Perfect. See, I think we just got the 10 coins back right away. That's probably why they're there. Okay, well, on our way back up there. Move it, move it, move it. Yeah, we made it, we made it, no problem. Okay, so I didn't miss anything, it looks like. You know, some of these are a little tricky. You wanna make sure you go into every corner you can. But I don't think I missed anything. I mean, maybe I could end up finding something here, not quite. Upside down Goombas are hard to focus on, I can tell you that much. Oh, this is so weird. It's just still inverted. Oh, oh, oh come on, that was tricky. I wasn't, suppo I wasn't supposed to see that. Oh gosh, oh gosh, they're spitting out Goombas. Um, oh, oh yeah, I saw that a mile away. Come on, Ooh. Whenever you see an indent like that, that is very clear what it is. It is a moon. Hooray, you get a moon, secret of the inverted mural. I guess that's what they're called. These little um, platforming sections, these little 2D sections are murals, which is very cool. So let us uh, go up here. And Oh geez, we got more platforming to do, don't we? Okay, so I see what's happening here, and is that the, I guess the bull bills are going in the real life, out of, outside of the mural, so what is, ooh, what is up here? Ooh, what is up here? Look what I found, secret secrets. Awesome, whoa, ho, 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 look at us. That is so cool. Oh, but if we become one of the bullet bills, we can just smash on into that. Cool. 
Now, I'm not quite done with you, Bullet Bill. I wanna adventure around this area a little bit just to get a good idea, because I could go right through that block, or I could have just simply went around. And look at this, I got a little friend chasing me around, huh? Huh? Oh, can you catch up? Oh, no, you're a little too slow, huh? Okay, ready, boom! Oh, that just gave me some extra health, but I'll gladly take it. I think we're about to face a boss fight on the top of this inverted uh, pyramid stone. Worthwhile, but I see what we gotta do now. We need to lure one of these bullet bills over here, because it seems like the timer does not start until we capture them. So we wanna capture them in a good position. Be very careful that we don't run into one of these, but... Oh, oh, I got a little distracted, I gotta be honest. I was trying to see if there's anything down there. It didn't look like it. Got me really darn curious down. We already got these coins, so I don't have to worry about those, but wow, I gotta redo this part? Seriously? Okay, well, that helps. All right, follow me. Whoop. Up, 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 up. Wait, hold on, hold on, I need you to break this dude. Um, ah, dead, okay, yeah. I was gonna think twice about it, but then I figured I shouldn't. I should go ahead and get it done. But yeah, I'm glad with the amount of progress we've made in today's episode. It's been really cool uh, seeing how many uh, moons we can get in just one episode. All right, I mean, I know that the moons are actually a little bit more frequent than I was even expecting. They're just everywhere. They're super common. They're more common than stars or shine sprites are in the Galaxy 64 and Sunshine games, you know? It's crazy. And I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, it's, it's just a thing, you know? Hmm. Yeah, but I could try to land on the, you know, moving platform. Oh, look at that combo. Oh, that was cool, that was fun. Um, weird, but fun. Can I slam on these now? It doesn't look like it. Um, this is to be all we can do there, that's fine. Oh, but we're at the top, are we? Oh my. We are princess! We're coming to save you! First, I'm just gonna find some fun collectibles, though. I hope you can hear me. I know cell service isn't really great in this kingdom, so I haven't texted you yet. Um. Oh, oh, well, they're gone. Oh, it's you guys again? Oh, we defeated, oh, maybe, I thought that the one lady was here. I, I don't know. Looking for the binding band, chumps? Too bad that the boss has it now. And you guys ain't invited to the wedding. Oh boy, we got her to deal with. We dealed with the other lady now. I think that's why she's not on the ship anymore because we already destroyed her. Oh, she's bigger than she looks. <laughs> like everybody's bigger than Mario. He's a, a, sort of a bit of a small guy. Now she has a really big heavy hat on. So it's not gonna be easy to knock it off. I'm gonna guess that we wanna hit these mines right back at her. Oh, that almost worked. But maybe it wasn't big enough? It acts as sort of a helmet, huh? Oh, 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 that's dizzying. Okay, now we can get you. Just jump right on you. Gotcha. Okay. Oh, jeez. And it's like a UFO as well. Okay, she can do a little bit of everything. Oh, no. Ow, that hurt. Well, there goes my uh, no damage run. I think that, that ended a long time ago. Um, ow! That hurt too. Stop. <laughs> Poor Mario's looking a little more like Fire Mario right now, except without all the awesome abilities. Knock that back. No. Um. Ready? Oh! Got you that time. Oh, and it was enough to knock off your hat. Wait, where are you going? Where are you going? You get back here. You get back here. <laughs> All right, there's two hits. One more to go. Oh boy, we almost have 800 coins. It'd be cool if we can get over 1,000. I mean, don't we need over, I think we need over 1,000 for the boxer shorts. I gotta remember that. So let's hold on to as many coins as we can. Okay, so what are you gonna do now? You gonna throw another one of those at me? Ready? Ugh. Yeah, I got you that time. You're gonna start running, so I gotta be quick with this. Yeah, we got you. Another brutal defeated. Pretty brutal. Yeah, cool pun, Zebra. You're the best at punning, except you're actually the worst. Give me those moons. <laughs> okay, so three more moons for us. The ultra super duper awesome moon is in our possession. I love their little dance. These two make quite the pairing. You got the multi-moon showdown on the inverted pyramid. All right. I love all the views we get in this game. Like, it's so cool how we can just look off the top of things and literally see the entire level. I mean, I can say it again, it reminds me of Jack and Daxter, it's the same thing. Okay. Wow. So there goes the pyramid. Um. Well, I sure hope we got everything on there because if not, I'm in some bad news. I mean, I guess there's a flagpole on there, right? The hole in the desert. So we're basically going all the way back over there, and, but going into the hole. What's in the hole? Do I really wanna know? I guess we're gonna find out. The, that brutal slowed us down a bit, but we're still racking up power moons. How odd, the inver inverted pyramid is floating? And it's gotten so much colder. Is this more of that Bowser's doing? I say, he does make trouble, doesn't he? 
You can say that again, but it's nighttime, which means it's gonna get even colder. And look at that glowing bird, though, that's adorable. And so there's still some unanswered questions here. And oh gosh, what are you? It's a zombie. Ow, zombies. Oh gosh. No, they're more like mummies. But you know what? Mummy and zombies are sort of the same. What was that? Oh, did he shoot at one? Oh no, maybe that was Yoon? Hello? It's a Jaxi. So a Jaguar taxi. How you doing? I'm what you call a Jaxi. You want a ride? It'll be 30 coins. What are you saying? Not yet. I think that is something we'll save until next episode, just so you have something to watch next episode. <laughs> Gotta ride along to get along, bud. Okay, I, I wanna talk to some of the guys that seem like they have new information for us with their exc little exclamation points. This is, this is terrible, it's gotten so much cooker colder. And now that the inverted pyramid is floating in the air, f freezing winds are blasting out of, out, of, out of the huge pit where it was. Oh gosh, that's why some of these guys are frozen. C -c Cold got worse, but the shop's still open. I always gotta work through it. <laughs> the desert isn't safe at night. Ride a jacksie if you need to leave town. I'll keep that in mind. Oh, look at this. Okay, there's some purple coins frozen in here as well. Oh, oh, this is where we put the nuts. Okay, so I know where one out of these are. So we can, um. Oh, that's a tough throw, but we did it. So if I can find the other two, I know where one out of those two are. You can open the map, yep, yep, yep. What about you, what do you have to sign? Um. <laughs> crazy night. Wish I could see what's happening over at the pyramid, but it's d d dangerous out there. So what happens? Yeah, if I just go like this, will they be able to catch up to me? They do pop up rather quick. That's gonna be quite difficult if we wanna go ahead and get um that nut, but I am darn certain I wanna try. Okay. There's plenty more we can do here in Toast Arena Kingdom or Sand Kingdom, whatever it is. Oh, look at that, that's new. How am I getting that? Uh, probably not by the way I just did it, so I probably should've thought about that a little bit more. Okay, let's jump over this quicksand. Is there still bullet bill action happening? You bet there is, so that may become the bullet bill. Fly on over this way. Ooh, boop! So was there stuff I could only get accomplished during the day that I no longer can accomplish? Bullet bill breakthrough! We also have more than are needed um, to go ahead and get our ship to the next kingdom, which I'm not worrying about right now because obviously there's still plenty more we can accomplish here. And that's something I wanted to take a look at. One thing, I haven't gone through the brochure. Maybe I'll do this again at the beginning of the next episode because I don't know, I feel like people who will ask for it won't watch this far before they ask for it. So I'll do it at the beginning of the next episode. For right now, let's just take a look at our list. 69 to find, and we have found 16. Wow, that is a lot. That is definitely gonna take us more than one episode. But 16 to one episode, I mean, at that rate, about two or three more episodes in this kingdom, we got it. I mean, I'm sure some of them will be quicker than others, and it'll be a little bit more disproportionate that way. Okay, let me land on you guys. Oh, 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 hey, <laughs> that's always fun. So yeah, what was, oh yeah, the, the nut. I gotta go get the nut. So let's go ahead. Um, I'll take you, just because. And I'm trying to look out, maybe, where can I find the other nut? Ooh. Ooh, were you here before? I'm not sure, but you're extra glowy now, so I definitely know there's a moon in there. There's definitely a moon up hidden in that crane. That's not a hard thing to do. I don't know why I messed it up. Go like this. Yep, yep, yep. And then, got it. Yeah, look at me, getting now not 16, but 17 moons inside a block is a hard place. Inside a block is a hard place. Hmm, that's a weird way of describing it, but if that's the way you want to, I can't stop you. So I got this little um, golden nut. Now I can't do as much as I'd like with this. I gotta run back and be pretty much in danger. These guys don't move as quick as I do for sure, but it doesn't mean they don't move quick. So I just gotta dodge him. <laughs> Mars is like, excuse me, pardon me, pardon me. Oh, look at us, our dodge and weave skills are pretty, pretty good right now. So where could the other one be? I'm gonna guess it's gonna be somewhere out in this region. Um. I guess the southern region, or, no, this is east, so yeah, somewhere in the eastern region, I think that's, ooh, gonna be, but maybe I'm wrong. It'll take a lot of adventuring to find out, but that's what I love. Hmm, I'm definitely wary about all the purple coins we might have missed, especially these ones that I can't get right now. 
There's two, and it is saving in the bottom left. I'm glad to know that. I haven't really been paying attention. I've been worrying the game's not saving, but it is. Okay. I'm a little bit at a loss on what we should do first, because there's just so much stuff to do, you know? It's a little overwhelming. Now, we've been over here into this pipe, correct? Yeah, this is where we did the butt stopping thing, and then it was like the vibrating controller. I don't think there'll be anything new in there, but you never really know with this game. Hey, it's another one of these. Weird, I just gotta keep a mental note of where those are. And we found one in Cascade Kingdom, and now one here in Sand Kingdom. Oh yeah, there's that up there, huh? Not too many uh dudes around here. Now, I can go this way, but I can't do much about it unless I can really build up speed. Eh, now that didn't work. Okay, so if I have to do anything, I wanted to go way over here and check out this little temple, I guess you could call it. Maybe there's something worthwhile in here as well. You do have the uh, Jaxi corner, but Jaxi ain't here. Is there a way to call him? If I hit this, maybe he'll come on running on by. Just like look over here and just see him running over. That'd be hilarious. It would remind, remind me of, uh, what is that game? Hot Shots Golf? Whoa, 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 whoa. In Hot Shots Golf, you could shoot the go golf ball really far and sometimes like your little golfing guy would run after it and it would look funny. I don't know why I just I think about that. Um, You know, I think about where things are. Uh, let's uh, go inside. This hat door was open before. And now, I still don't know what activates these hat doors exactly, but I have to imagine that it's a matter of how many moons you have. Okay, so we wanna accelerate, but we gotta be very careful because that can happen. Yikes. Try to get three extra coins, end up losing 10. That's what you gotta be careful of. What about on the other side of this though? Ooh, I haven't even paid any mind to this. Doesn't seem like there's anything, but you really gotta use the camera to your advantage to try to find whatever you want, whatever you can. All right, ready? Shoot another one. Do it, yeah, okay. So, I guess I'll go through this way, I, you know. It's not the end of the world if I mess on some stuff over there. I could grab some of these. Oh, the tight turn. Oh gosh, you know what? Yeah, how about I uh, plop off of there and then wait for another one? Which way should I go? It looks like there's a platform over that line. It looks like this is the way I'm not supposed to go. Or at least, you know, I don't need to go. You know, and I, it seems to be overall correct. Hop out of that, pick up some more purple coins. We're almost halfway there with the purple coins, which is fantastic. Grab you, maybe. I don't know if that was a bit of a mistake or not, but I think what I'll do is I will drift. Oh gosh, the controls are just barely manageable. Get you. Oh, I like how you can sort of reposition right before you start moving. Oh gosh, we're going quick. Wow, there's plenty of places to go. I don't know which way is the correct way, but I do see the shimmer of a moon. Oh, oh no! Oh, come on, I lost my control right at the end. That was stinky. Okay, try this again, huh? Try this again. So I don't think I need to speed up to get anywhere. The only problem is that to move the camera correctly here, I have to move the camera in one direction and be moving the bolt bill in another. So let's go ahead and get that moon. And that is the bullet bill maze side path. Okay, so that's exactly what I wanted, the side path. Okay, go this way and then drift it. Ooh, good drift, good drift. Better drift, best drift. I mean, that wasn't really even a drift, that was just a basic turn, but it feels like it every time you move in this game, or not in this game, but as a bullet bill, you're drifting. So I definitely wanna, oh gosh, be careful. And it looks like, yeah, I'm good to cycle all the way around. Oh gosh, I don't wanna move too quick then. Definitely do not wanna move too quick. Whoop, yeah. And there we go, we got it. I don't think we missed anything there. So we got another moon, the bull bill maze breakthrough. So how many moons do we have right now? Have we gotten since we've last checked out the Odyssey? Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 20, 21. And if we go like this and go to our list, it says we've gotten 19 out of 69, so I don't know where those extra ones are coming from. I mean, maybe we had two left over, maybe I'm miscounting, one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, 20, or 10, 10, okay. I really need to figure out how to break ISO so I can do something about this, because looks to me now, if I ever want to get back up here, I'm gonna have to re-get up there normally. Like, Armiel, everything we just do, we'll have to do again to get to the Scarecrow because I don't know how to break the ice. So maybe I should be focusing on that. Become a salamander! Oh, darn it. I wanna become a salamander. Just like a tiny little salamander. That'd be so fun. Okay, well, let's, to finish today's episode off, we will try to get across to here and do this. Oh boy. 
I mean, maybe this will be a little much to do in today's episode. Can you guys stop it? Thank you, thank you. Oh, there we go. Just keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Ah, that hurt, that really hurt. Maybe we're in a bit of a danger. Can I talk to you now? Will you say anything different? Uh, my poor taxi down, I'll ever, it'll run, ever run again after this. I might be able to help you at some point or another. So let's run off to Yoon and just hop right in, probably. Hello, oh. hello. Welcome to Toast Arena, here to see the sights? You know about the action guide, right? I know already. What a relief. Wouldn't be able to let you sit here. If you didn't know anything about the action guide, I'd have to give you a full explanation. Oh, oh no. I'm a little scared now. Whoa, look at this place. Underground temple. I'm a little nervous because I am low on health. Now, where does this pipe bring me? I gotta just know out of just pure curiosity. Probably just back outside of it. Yep, yep, yep. What are you guys freaking out about? Um. I think there's something down there, but I'm not brave enough to jump in. Don't worry, Mario is. <laughs> Can't take much more of this cold. Okay, so interesting. Looks like we should just go through and do it. You know, we should just be a champ. Ooh, we already did it once, we're doing it again. Okay, well, I like it. It's very cool. Um, We're still only at one bit of health, so I just gotta be super duper careful. But also, oh, oh gosh. Catch! Yeah, okay, well, that was not a mistake. That's what I had to do to get across to here. And I did see a Goomba, yep, charging around here. Oh, I could capture that Goomba. I could become the Goomba, if it wasn't for the fact that I just destroyed him. Oh, that is exciting, now I really want to become a Goomba. I've been talking about that since the first episode. Whoop. I only need two more coins, and I have 50 of them. So it's good that we, you know, adventure down here. Get some extra coins for it. Oh, hello, Goomba. Yes, look at us. Oh wow, he has way better traction on the ice. Hey, these feet don't slip on the ice. Yeah, that's what I just said. Oh, and he jumps too. Look at Goomba go. Look at Goomba go. Cool. Well, it was fun being any Mr. Goomba, but I have to um have some other focuses for now. Let me throw my hat this way and then turn. Wow, look at it go, look at it go, look at it go, look at it go. Boom. And that's gonna hit another one way over there, but it's gonna destroy all those Goombas. I sort of feel bad for that. Um, but at the same time, oh, I can become the Goomba Tower. Whoop. Oh no, I could have done so much more here. Oh no, oh no. Can I, I should restart, shouldn't I? Okay, Wee! <laughs> I feel awful, but at the same time, they're bad guys, you know? It's what, it's what I do, is take care of the bad guys. And I think they're all back, which is good. So you can even throw your hat straight up into the air. It's just, I'm definitely not used to it. It's definitely still difficult for me to control the cap in that way. Luckily, it's definitely not mandatory. So I can become the Goomba here. Just to traverse this a little bit quicker maybe. So it really, if I don't wanna challenge myself here, and just do not hit those. Instead, just get over here and yep, up, 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 Okay, um, no, 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 they don't like me, I forgot. Um, up, up, oh, that was scary. So if I get back up here, and, oh, look at that, I added one to the chain. Maybe a little too much. Oh, not quite. <laughs> okay, cool. So I need that little Goomba guy back there, don't I? That's the answer to my question. I think, I need to get him, come back, oh man, I gotta get both of those guys. There's one down here, right? Or was that, no, that was the guy we weren't. So if I go back over here and get up, 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 we can get back over there, add him to the chain, and maybe that'll be enough. Just maybe. Hey guys, how you doing? Can I join you? Ow, that hurt. Okay, not how I'm supposed to do that. I did it in the wrong order. Um, no. Yep. Get you. There you go. Is that enough? It still isn't enough. Where's this extra Goomba? I don't know, up there. How do I get up there? How in the world? There has to be a way, right? Um, oh, hey guys, um, oh, um, no, 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 thank you. So I'm gonna plop these guys down here. So I actually didn't need these extra Goombas, I don't think I think if I could have gotten. I'm a little in a bit of a dangerous spot here, I gotta be careful. Like I wanna hop out, out of off of you guys so I can, oh, do this. Yep, and then become you guys. 
Get over here. Do not fall off the edge. What? Why didn't that work? Why didn't that work? I don't understand. I thought it was supposed to work. That was confusing. So maybe I'm doing this a little bit wrong. Maybe I could just jump, jump. Oh yeah, look at that. Okay, I'm gonna butt slam on these jerks. Watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it. Oh. <laughs> I feel awful, but at the same time, that was very gratifying. Well, you know, karma. Oh gosh, they're chasing me. They're chasing me. They're chasing me. It's gonna be much easier to get up on these platforms down, I think. I can also run. Oh yeah, look at that, I got a little run. Okay, then that's awesome. Oh, oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Up, no, no! This is gonna be a bit of a challenge, but it's worth it for the purple coins. They do all match up. Okay, that's perfect. Okay. Got it, got it, got it. Yeah, look at me, look at me. Now, I'm not gonna leave this tower until I'm certain I no longer need it. So we're gonna little waddle over here. And I don't see anything else it could be possibly used for, but once again, you just never ever know. So I'm gonna hop on this. Oh, that doesn't quite work. Okay, see you guys. <laughs> you were helpful while you lasted. Oh, they have little caps. Oh, they have little caps. Okay. Maybe I gotta lure him over here, hit him once, and then him another time. I like that, that's pretty cool. So you can't get them right away, so if I wanted to, I could speed up here. What's stopping me from going, say, over here? Well, from what I see, absolutely nothing. So we're gonna try that. We're gonna we're gonna do those other things, of course, but first I wanna try this out. Whoop, okay, get up here. Wow-wee, look at all these coins. And then what's over there? A whole bunch of nothing. There's a treasure chest over here, then. How could I get over there? I mean, I could try doing a bit of this, but I just don't know if this is exactly the best idea. Yeah, not looking like it, but I, oh. Or maybe I'm wrong. Um, okay, so, yep, wait. Yep, nope. Yep, nope, okay, hold on, Mario. And then, turn around. Perfect! Okay, so we got a treasure chest here. There's nothing on that side, then. Okay, oh, hey, look at that! It is a moon! Got it! It is the underground treasure chest. That one's a toughie. That one would've taken me a little while to find if it wasn't for the fact that it didn't take me a little while to find. Okay, so, um, let's get back across to here and try not to make any silly mistakes, but come on, you know who I am. I'm gonna make a silly mistake. So how do I get back to a location where I can get another bullet build. Is that location existent? Or do I just have to jump off? Oh, here we go. Oh, got it. So if I really want to, I gotta make it snappy if I wanna get across to here in one piece. Got it. Okay, I wanna go in there, but I'm also a bit hesitant on what else we might find around here. To be honest, it doesn't look like much. So I think we're just gonna go for it, but I could regret that decision. Hmm, oh my. Deepest underground, that's the head that's sticking from underground. You know, it's sticking under the ground, you know. You know the one, the one that has the triple moon in it. Oh, is this a little coin slot? I don't know. Dispense your penny, please, the mo Moai head. It's not a Moai head, I mean, I don't think. Oh, is this another boss fight? Two for one boss fight episode? You guys better be happy. <laughs> I mean, or not, maybe I'm not entertaining. <laughs> okay. Let's go and figure this out, whoop! Hello? Whoa! Were those bullet bills? What were those? Um, oh, I can move the camera a little bit. Where Ringo? Oh no! He's mad about the ring! You take ring! No, 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 that's a misunderstanding. Hey, excuse me. That's appropriation. Do you have any security camera evidence? I took it, no, I don't think so. I'm going to sue. Okay, well, oh, well, maybe he could smash it. That would be perfect. Ouch! Okay, you know what, we'll call it even. Just don't see me. Um, so can we get up there, maybe? Or maybe, oh, I can become the hand. Oh my, oh my, boom, what a punch in the face. That'll teach you. <laughs> stop hitting yourself, stop hitting yourself. Oh, he's not happy about it. Oh, that is so weird. This is like the most enjoyably odd boss fight yet. 
I mean, I know we've been facing weird bunny creatures, but this is pretty fun too. Okay, um, not what I wanted. Can I take it when they're doing that? I don't know, I'm being bombarded by, uh, come on. Ooh, oh, that, that hurt him. No, 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 hold on. Uh, got it. So we only have one HP after this, I gotta be careful. Yeah! So obviously we wanna maneuver to the side where his hand is not, because he's always gonna be naturally shooting from his left if he only has a left hand. Okay. Oh, 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 oh! Oh no, <laughs> I just sort of realized that they're not gonna slow down. Oh geez, okay, so at least I know everything there is to know to beat this dude up now. I definitely don't. So, no problem this time. Yep, yep. All right, buddy, come here. Ready? Yep, yep. Yeah. Okay, we're doing good, we're doing good. Just charge on over here. Hope I didn't miss anything back there. Doesn't look like it. So, I can just, oh boy, I almost missed. That would have been awful. Whoa. Okay, you know, we can skip it though, we've seen it. Um, Let's move over here. Oh gosh. Yeah, just slam here. Oop. Ouch. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry about your poor hands, but at the same time, I'm not sorry at all. So move to the right, because that's where he's not gonna be as advantageous. He looks so scared. I sort of feel bad, because this is just all a big misunderstanding. But almost every non koopaling or I guess non bunny related boss fight in Mario games usually is some kind of misunderstanding. Usually it's not because the characters are inherently evil. Maybe they just misinterpret Mario and his intentions. Can I? I don't know if I can. I think it can only capture his hand when it's beaten up. So do that. Got it. Come on. Oh, he's holding it more in the center of his face this time. He's learning. He's a very adaptive. Nice, nice indeed. We haven't taken any damage this time. Look at how excited I am. Oh, look at this, we can do the spin jump. Never thought about doing this. Oh, come on, I've played Sunshine before. I should have thought about it. Thought I could maybe jump between them. I cannot. He is not looking happy. Like, he just doesn't like to be like a very happy kind of guy, you know? He's like naturally a little perturbed. Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ow, okay, I just became a Mario hand sandwich. This is not good. We need the hands to... I'm the worst, we were doing fine and then I just ruined it. <laughs> when you get stuck on that ice cube though, it just, it gets tough. Okay, so I just hit him for the second time again. He isn't that hard for the first two faces at the least and I have one heart sitting out here, so I just need to dodge really obvious, easy to dodge shots like those. Just not be a dingus about it. You know, that's the number one tip for playing well at video games. Don't be a dingus, dude. Um, get across to there. Oh, okay, that one was very dingus-like of me, wasn't it? Ow, come on. That, that time I didn't have a chance. Okay, hold on, let me get this health. Perfect. Okay, back to full, back to full. And then slam onto the ice or miss. One of those two things will surely happen. Um, uh, uh, no, come on, yes! Oh, I can't believe I still got hit there, then. Oh gosh, he, he's maneuvering, but not maneuvering enough. Sorry, buddy, but I win. Give me your moons. Oh, and he explodes too. I, I sort of feel bad. Well, we got the moons. Where are they? They're here. Yay, okay, three more moons for us. What an episode, almost 30 moons gathered in one episode. I think that's what we call jam pack. I don't know about you though, you can let me know. And to finish it off with an ultra multi-moon, the hole in the desert, that sounds pretty good to me. Pretty good to me. Okay, so we get to go back to the Odyssey, which is fantastic, because uh, I'm a fan of fantastic. Yeah! Okay, and it's back to being daytime, woohoo! It's so hot now, but I do suppose that's what we were looking or trying to accomplish. Now I hope there wasn't stuff I missed, like maybe or maybe we could go back to those frozen over areas, right? If we keep up this pace, we'll catch that Bowser in no time. I sure hope so. Do we have enough power moons to reach the next kingdom? If you wanna check, put me on your globe. I'm sure we can. Let me go ahead and deposit our moons. If we go like that, we have way more than 16. I think we have nearly, what, like over 20? I don't know, maybe even almost 30. Holy cow, we had like 17 in there. And what is it gonna go up to now? Ooh. And that's our second piece of the sound. Oh, it doesn't even tell you how much. Oh, 43, okay. Wow, the Odyssey has powered up. So we could go to a different place now. And but I don't really want to, but let's find out what our next place could be. I mean, I guess we could. Hmm. Uh-oh, we've hit a proverbial fork in the road. Which kingdom would you like to go, or do you think Bowser wants to? We can either go to the Lake Kingdom, holy cow, 
or the Wooded Kingdom. Oh, that one, that's, I think that's been in the trailers. It looks so beautiful. Oh, I don't know, I don't like underwater levels too much. Maybe we'll tackle that one next after that. Here's the thing, Um, how about this? Every episode will try to adventure a new kingdom. And of course, we will go back and get the old stuff. I mean, I did I did say that we could go on the Jaxi today. But we'll go on the Jaxi eventually. I want to do some new stuff too. <laughs> we will, of course, definitely get to everything eventually. But let's try the Wooded Kingdom. The Wooded Kingdom, a splendid idea. Okay. Splendid, or what? A splendid Kingdom. That sounds fun. I want a splendid Kingdom. How many levels are there? Whoa, here we go. See ya. We're out of here! <laughs> awesome. Okay, so there we go. We're on our way to the Wooded Kingdom now. It's very exciting. I wonder what we're gonna run into here. Hello, oh, look at him looking through the window. He seems like he's having such a good time. Man, the world is huge. I love it. He kidnapped Yaron, and now with his binding band, he's got a wedding ring. Is he going to steal a whole wedding? Seeing as how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. Travel tip, homing cap throw. After throwing your cap, shake the Joy-Con again to perform a homing cap throw. We learned about that one. Your cap will fly towards the nearest target you can see. It's super handy when your aim is a little off. Well, there it is. Next, let's uh, read up on the Wooded Kingdom. According to this guide, there's a giant greenhouse there filled with flowers. It's famous for its beautiful sorry Saray Bouquet. Saray Bouquet, that makes sense, yeah. A little bit of a rhyme and alliteration. We all love those, don't we? I think that's the alliteration. I don't know. What a kingdom steam gardens. Oh, this is so cool. I'm so excited. Oh, we can already see the brutals in the distance. Okay. This place looks like there's lots to find. Road to the Sky Garden. So we're going to the big old piranha plant. Hey, look, it's piranha plants. So, uh, before we do too much more, oh my gosh. Oh, hey, look at that, there's a crazy cap stored. Wait, do you hear something? Possibly. Let me, uh, I wanna change our hat. If we take a look at some stuff, first off, you know, we got our boulder brush here, the Wood Kingdom, ancient gardens tended by futuristic machines, steam guarded the world's most advanced greenhouse population automated. Uh, deep and wide. Steam gardeners are the locals. Average 82 fair Yeesh, I did not want to be here. Currency is nut shaped. Uh, Guardians of Paradise, l the living factory. Lots of interesting stuff. Flowers as a way of life. Wow, that is cool. A deep wood secret. Oh gosh. Bring a pith helmet if you go exploring here. A pith helmet? What is that? Growing walkway. Safety tip. Don't dawdle. Oh, it might disappear. Three keys to the kingdom. Smell the flowers. Not that you can miss them, but do savor the scent. Admire the steam gardeners and their impressive devotion to their work. Appreciate machines and nature living in exquisite harmony. Very cool. So uh, other, other than that, I wanna go and check if we have 54 moons to find. So a little bit less than Sand Kingdom, which is still a whole darn lot. So let's go this way. It looks like there's a lot to adventure. Can I talk to you guys? Recent events have initiated my panic and spin routines. Panic and spin. Oh, that didn't help. I thought it was gonna help. I thought it was gonna like help them calm down, slap them out of it. A servant of, of the monster is illegally accessing our flower supply. During the last watering cycle, an unidentified object flew by. Oh my, a UFO. Hello. Um, oh, I like the song. Item dance. <laughs> I love it. He's breaking down, he's boogieing. <laughs> okay, what, what, what about you? Now you are the purple coin character. Initiating first greeting dialogue. There are two types of coins, yellow coins and purple coins. The yellow coins work anywhere, but purple coins only work in the kingdom where you found them. Initiating shopping support, support, subortine, subordinate? I don't know. Um, maybe I said subroutine. Uh, spend money. So we have an explorer hat, an explorer outfit, a scientist visor, scientist outfit, what a kingdom sticker, flowers from steam gardens and steam gardener watering can. So we will of course get all that stuff in due time. Um, what about you? Spend money. We have acquired many products to sell. Life apart, wooded kingdom power moon, mechanic cap, mechanic outfit, boxer shorts. So they sell the boxer shorts everywhere, huh? Okay, then the, uh, okay, so interesting. So we could just go ahead and buy another wooded kingdom power moon. Sure. Is this the desired selection? Yep. So this is, oh, that says Famicom on it. Oh, that's really cool, the little outfit there. 
Ooh, so I gotta get back here when I have like about 12, maybe 1300 coins. We got shopping in Steam Gardens, our first moon here in boxes. I like how they don't even have a store more than they do just like a little tree stall. I like it, that's actually pretty quaint. Respectable. We are programmed to show flowers. The flowers are programmed to grow. Okay. Now what about this? This seems like it's out of place. Um. Well, greetings, traveler. And to your hat as well. Can you answer my riddle? What does a monster want from this kingdom? Water, wood, flowers, or soil? Flowers. You are correct. Perhaps that wasn't much of a riddle. Anywho, proceed. Maybe you should go back to the sand kingdom? I mean, hey, if you like it here, more power to you. Uh, oh, hey, look at that, our first purple coins right on the top of this tree. Oh, I get it. Nut-shaped coins, not in the tree nut kind of way, but the nut as in like the m machinery kind of nut. Interesting, so we already have five of them. How many in total? 100. Oh, and another one of these weird moon rock thingamajigs. So I've been trying to figure out more of the moves. Cause, um, I, apparently there's a way to like dive. I know I need to figure out the moves a little bit more, probably check out that action guide, but I don't want to do that right now. Oh boy, okay, so I definitely want to get as many coins as we can, but taking an extra couple steps with this wood actually seems to be very fruitful. Oh, hey, look at that, I can pick it up. <laughs> um, Let's uh break these two. Okay. Oh, we are really showing it to them, these darn rocks. So I'm at full health, so that'll give me an extra couple coins. Whoa, what is that? It's hard to read, Um, it's very bright. Oh, take a picture of hint art. Um. So I could, no, 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 wrong button. There we go. And then I can maybe just zoom in. Oh. So there's somewhere where there's gonna be a couple, how can I take the photon? Um, uh, well, I think I just take it like this. Oh, I see. Okay, Um. I don't know when we're gonna use that. But uh, I'll try to be attentive to it. That it seems to be it's gonna be in the Sand Kingdom. So I've heard some people say, I'm not entirely sure how true it is, but there's two types of costumes you can buy. You can buy costumes with yellow coins, and then you can buy costumes with purple coins. Now apparently the purple coins actually serve more of a use. Some people are saying that uh, some of those costumes will actually, like you'll need to like, access some areas that you won't be able to access without having those costumes. I can see that being a thing. So of course, we'll try to earn up the uh, purple coins, as always, we'll try to earn up a little bit of everything. Maybe at, uh, towards the second half of this episode, we'll explore some of the previous kingdoms as well. I just wanna do something new every episode because I don't know, just, you know, more people click on the video that way, to be honest, but uh, let's uh, keep going this way. Wow, this is very cool how we can just go way out this way. I didn't really expect to explore as much as I am, but you know what, exploring is good, because we get more purple coins. You know, we're already more than one-tenth of the way there. I like it. I don't know what the moonstones are gonna be like, or what they're gonna be used for, but I definitely will try to stay aware of them. Let's roll down this mound. Okay, maybe that's a mistake! Oh gosh, that was scary. But from here, we also get a decent view of down below, just in case we might have missed something. We maybe get a second chance to take a look. Oh, hello, you. Oh, can I be... <laughs> hey, look at that! I'm a little doodad! Uh, let's uh, get over here. We don't waddle, we don't waddle. This is so fun! <laughs> I'm very tall, and then I'm very short, and then I'm very tall, and then I'm very short. Okay, that's cool. I can dig it. So with that, we can get some very interesting platforming going on. We can whittle, waddle, whittle, waddle, whittle, waddle. We're on little stilts, and now we're not. Oh, that is so much fun. I really love it. But you guys have been super duper helpful in the comments. You guys have been letting me know of different things I have missed out on. Oh, hey, look at that. We can, is that just a moon? A top of a tall tree? Oh, you know what it is? I guess I didn't notice the moons are a different color. I thought that maybe like it was a different kind of moon. It's just that we're in a different area and we have different color moons. Okay, well our second moon of the area, we didn't have to buy that one. Didn't have to cheap out. I mean, I guess not. I guess buying it isn't cheaping it out, you know? But uh, you know what I mean. Get out of here. Um, oh gosh, I gotta out Tom. It's a contest. Oh, yeah, get out of here, buddy. Now I think that, oh, oh, it makes more of them. Okay, I thought it was like a little, um, like a little sewer grate hole thing. So I'm trying my best to look around, because a lot of you were super helpful in the comment section about me finding um, some moons that I missed, and some of them like were literally right above my head. I just didn't think to look, especially in Cascade Kingdom. You guys were super helpful with that. 
because I'm recording this before episode three comes out, so I haven't gotten too much advice on that, which is sort of what I want. I want to, of course, give it a best shot to find it myself before I, um, this is fun. <laughs> before I, and I go to you guys to advice. Not because I don't want your advice, but because it's also fun, of course, to play the game, try to figure out how to get them myself before, you know, I hear any feedback. Oh, hello. Um, oh, oh, you're not nice. I thought I was gonna be able to talk to you. Boink. <laughs> Probably could have became him, which m might have been fun. Oh, you know what? I might have needed to. Um, let's do that. Oh, what is all this? I feel like I'm going the wrong way, but once again, there's no wrong way in this game. Let's little waddle over here. This is so cute. I'm so happy. Oh, hi. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, no, you don't. Okay, so I would have supposed to become this, these guys again, so I didn't exactly do anything wrong. Oh, the music here. Oh, this is fantastic. Can I get over there? I mean, it, no, it's sort of, the angle's weird, it's hard to, ah! Wait, no, there was purple coins in there. How do I get in there? No. Oh, that was evil goop. Well, there goes some coins. Jeez. I definitely, oh, way back here. Okay, maybe that area's a little too challenging for me just right now. Maybe I could just enjoy some stuff around here. Ooh, okay, easy purple coins, I can tell you that much. Anything behind me? Doesn't look like it. Hello. Travel tip, backward somersault. If you're looking for the easiest way to, to get somewhere with, that a regular jump won't quite reach, stop, crouch, and press B to do a backward somersault. I know. Well, but you know what, I'll do it again. Okay, so I feel like this is the same area. It is, oh it is. Yeah, we just came in from a different line. Okay, just leave that poison to me, really? Oh hey, look at you! I guess it is indeed poison, so. Wait, hold on, what? That's helpful. I love how all rainbow he gets. I wanted to change your hat down. Hmm, oh, this is probably how we get inside of there. What am I going to use to explode a big rock like that? First off, let's get ourselves a checkpoint over here. Yep, there you go. So we're on Iron Road entrance. I wanna go back to the beginning really quick, back to um, the Odyssey. I wanna change our hat, because right now we're the uh, Captain Cap, and that's fun, but I wanna do something a little different. Maybe we could um, try an outfit today. I like how it, for a second it does. Um, how do I get in? Oh, I got it. Yeah. We need 16 moons though. We, we got two of them, so we're one eighth of the way there. Um, and then we go here. I'm gonna take some tea, but oh man, he looks so cool. Uh, but yeah, I think this is more of what we want. Just to try this out. This is the employee uniform and the employee cap. Let's try this out. <laughs> And if, you know, after this, maybe we'll go back to uh, normal costume stuff. Yay! And then everything else here, I think we can uh, see in our own time. We can look in the mirror, look at our dashing self. But uh, let's go. I'm so excited. This is so much fun. But now I can warp back to the place we just were, or we can adventure some more. I never really went this way. Now I moved to the left here. Oh, I guess there really isn't too much here. Okay. But still, I'm sure there might be some things I didn't exactly find. Maybe if I poke around a little bit more, or at least find like a couple coins here and there. Like I could climb all the way up there, but it does seem like a little bit of a hassle. Hello, you, you're a little bunny. No, wait, wait, wait. Oh, do I have to catch you? But I can't catch you normally because you have a hat on. Look at you, look at this, ow. My, my nose, I just bonked my nose something fierce. But I can't hit him with the hat, like it won't do anything, I'm gonna guess. Oh, I almost got him right there. He's only running into a little circle, so if I cut him off, we got him! Yeah, easy moon! All right, that was so adorable. Adorable moon. Caught hopping in the forest. Fantastic. Okay then, now I really think that's it around here. But you never know, everything sneaks up on you in this game. Okay, hop, 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 yay! So we've gotten all this, so we can continue this way, where there is plenty more goop. What is this, platoon? I don't think so, but. Sure as heck feels like it right now. Ow. So just as one point of damage. Oh, we're all purpley, but we were already purpley. Ooh. <laughs> we're tearing up that rock, that's for sure. So I have a lot of work to do if I want to get up to as many coins as I need. Let's get some purple coins in the meantime. Oh boy. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, okay. Oh wow, they are everywhere. I mean, we're gonna need a bunch of them, so that makes sense. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Please come back. Okay, they do come back. I was gonna say, I don't want to be stuck here. Ooh. There's some underwater stuff here as well. Hmm. Let's get across like that. And 
Travel tip, ground pound jump. When you want to get up high and regular jump won't quite do it, jump right after a ground pound. This was a so-called ground pound jump and it'll give you the boost you need. Really? Wait, um, oh, hey, I like that. It's very good. Oh, hello, Talkatoon. How are you doing? Um, I didn't mean to land on you like that, sorry. What is the secret you are seeking? I know it, I know it, haha! I can't tell you, but I'll give you a clue. Elevator escalation. It's hiding somewhere and no peeking. Go find it, go find it, Skaka! All right. And then what about over here? Nothing? Nothing. Well, what about you? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. I'm, I'm a crazy cap employee. You must tell me everything you know. It appears the monster's minions are still on top of the tower. I worry about the flowers we were growing there, but what can we do? You don't have to do anything. Mr. Crazy Cap, AKA Mario, is here to save the day. So we can swim around under here. So it seems like we're still getting a little bit of swimming action in this kingdom as well, but it's definitely not as much as what would probably have happened in Light Kingdom. So I could run out of water here if I'm not out of water. <laughs> There's plenty of water. I run out of air. What happens if I go through the pipe though? Oh, okay, I do get a refill. Maybe there's some air in the pipe. Oh, look at this. Okay, this is filling up. It's actually making me uncomfortable. All right, well, get some free coins, quickly. Yeah, okay, that's good. Nothing up here. Oh, and it lowers again. All right, so be careful because of these little spinies are not spinies. Oh, okay, that's all they do. I could have gone under for some water. I'm in for water. Why, why, do, I, why do I replace all the words I'm trying to say with water? <laughs> Okay, um, there's something up there. Wait, oh, I can do the, wait, up. Oh. Haha, <laughs> look at that, and we found a secret moon. Oh, that is awesome, give it. Yeah, flooding pipeway ceiling secret. Four moons, very good. Okay, let's plop back down, yep, yeah, now, that aren't. Um, oh boy, yep, lower ourselves, lower ourselves, and then definitely get these purple coins, not purple water, <laughs> that's called grape soda. Oh jeez, oh jeez. Uh, oh, I don't like this, I don't like this. We gotta move quick, gotta move quick, gotta move quick, and I get it. Awesome, flooding pipeway. Five, and we, I love how we get a health refill. I definitely need it, because I am awful at this game so far. I need more practice, but you know, I only have so much time. And then just pops me out, okay, that's good. At least we know a good way to warp around, or loop around, I don't know. That's what I'm trying to say. So let us keep moving. Oh, I like how you can do that as well. Um, if I go like this, and then I, um, no. That's not what I wanted to do. But if I go like this, and I can, whoop. <laughs> nice and easy. So we haven't been up here yet. Oh, these guys are what's making the goop. Uh, do I look like a plant to you? Ooh, close one. So we can't become these guys, they just eat us. Or maybe if we like snuck up behind them, if that's possible. I guess not. Mm, these guys are too quick for us. I don't like it. Oh, yeah, no, ah, gotcha. Okay, so unfortunately we cannot become a piranha plant. That's fine. These areas are so beautiful though. I really, really like them. I would really hope that, you know, if we do get a new Mario Party or Mario Kart game, that we end up seeing these areas around there as well. It would be very cool and exciting to see um, these kind of areas in a Mario Kart game or something like that, just racing around in a beautiful area like this. That sounds like fun. Oh, look, a scarecrow. Oh my. This one might be a bit difficult and we won't have a hat to help us out. That's sort of the scary thing about these is that you just don't have a hat to help. Gotcha. Oh, that was it. <laughs> okay, that, never mind, that was easy. Um, So let's get that. Yeah, fire in the cave. Cool. And then we also get a couple extra coins for doing that as well, I think. So let me, uh, Get my hat back if I can, thank you. I like how it turns back into Mario's cap that whenever you throw it on somebody. A little weird like that, but it's fine. No, you guys are back! Oh, you're the worst! You are the worst, get out of here, you jerk. They only give me one coin, so it's not really worth going through all that energy. Oh! Wait, hold on. Oh yeah, we need to be one of the tall dudes. But there's none around here, oh! Maybe that's why there's the one up there. Okay, so I will be right back. Let me also get a couple coins if I can. None of these are giving me coins. Let me go all the way up to the top again if there's no other way to do it and get one of the, you know, the the stilts guys. Maybe they can help out. Oh, oh, because they had a helmet on, I couldn't normally become them. I just wanted to become this guy so we have them in our arsenal. Oh wow, they don't walk. <laughs> he jumps really tall though. Oh, that's cool. Look at him go, yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> I like him. I don't need him, but I like him. What I do need is one of you. There's still purple coins and stuff here, but to get them, we have to break that. I'm still just not aware of how to do that. Now, over there, I don't know if we've been. I don't know. But for right now, the thing I'm concerned about is trying to survive. Oh boy, big jump for little legs. Here, get up like that, and then oh, oh, get up like this. Oh, oh, is that it? I sure hope not. I was thinking this was gonna be a little more. Okay, maybe that was a little bit out of my way for something so simple. Oh well, I can still get across to here, no problem. I love this hat, or this costume. Costume, absorption, uh, I don't know. <laughs> but uh, I love it, it's great. We can get really high up too. Not high up enough for there. And, oh, and there, I, I'm such a dingus. I went all the way around for that when there was a sum right there. Okay, so I could hit these gray blocks. What did these gray blocks have? Not much of anything, it seems. Oh wait, that's not what I wanted. Um, let's re-become you. Oh geez, these guys aren't nice. <laughs> wait, hold on, whoop. Let me land on your head, or not, okay. Oh geez, okay, this one has stuff. Get rid of you, thank you. Hey, okay, we got a couple extra coins. Um, oh my. Oh. Oh, does that start lowering at any point? This is interesting. I don't know if I'm going the right way or not. Oh wait, this the last time we broke one of these, it had a moon. This one does too. You gotta moon the nut in the red maze. Cool, and there's definitely some coins up here. Yep, 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 yep. Oh wait, I missed one. I need them on. If I could get like 12, 1300 coins by the end of this episode to get uh, Mario his trousers, that'd be perfect. Uh, oh, gotcha. Now let's get these ones as well. See, this is some easy coins right here. Oh wait, I missed one. I don't know how easy it is then. We got it. So we can raise that, and we can go like this. We gotta be careful, I'm sure, because it starts lowering, or not. Okay, interesting. Do none of these have some like free coins in them? I guess not. I mean, I don't want to spend forever doing it. Let's uh, do that. Okay, we're almost halfway through with all the purple coins. I feel like this area isn't as hard as the uh, Sand Kingdom was. Ooh, free health, extra coin, more extra coins, everything I've ever wanted. Iron Road, halfway point. Hmm. Just trying to look, now that we have a good view. Oh, I did miss some stuff over there. I guess I should run all the way over there and get them. Oh, look at that, okay, we're also at the ending area for here, so let me uh, scoot around here really quickly, see what we can find. I do see you over here. So we'll go ahead and get that stuff and then run all the way back down there to get those extra purple coins, I suppose. Or maybe I should try this first. Hello there, please don't hurt me. Oh, you, you hurt me. Why, why must you be so mean? Um, hmm, there's the stuff all over though. Oh, this is gonna be another moon. Look at that. These moons love to be in nuts for whatever reason, the nut on the, at the dead end. Well, I'm glad you let me know. I was gonna try uh, looking around here. Yeah, it definitely looks like a dead end then. Can I hop on this? No, I can't, okay. Okay, so I'll go all the way back then. All right, so I ain't doing so hot right now, but that's okay. So I gotta do, uh, once again, I went through all this trouble to try to get um this kind of stuff, but then I ended up not even having to. Okay, get a couple of those. And then what is over here? Oh yeah, we definitely missed some stuff. That's fine, because I actually had to go back regardless, because um, there was the little sightseer thing that I never actually ended up doing. Oh, and that's how we get back here, and the nut round the corner. Cool. So we only need one, three, four, five, six, seven more moons until we're good. We have, um, oh my, I don't want to fall down there. Until we have um, all the 16 we would need to potentially go to a new kingdom, which is not what I want to do. So all I wanna do now is I wanna pop out of you probably, and then become Yun, because this is one I have not done. Basically, I just need to not do that. I wanted to see, we, we oh yeah, those are the Brutals. We're not worrying about them right now, we're just wor worrying about the road to the Sky Garden, because it's the Sky Garden, I guess. So um, deal with this punk, let's do it. Okay, mister, I'm gonna clean up all the goof around here, because it's just what I do. All right, there you go. Try to get this dude as well. Wait, oh, yep, yep. Yeah. If I get rid of all the goop makers, there won't be any more goop to deal with, which will be great. I would be very happy about that. It's just, yeah, I have such a hard time shaking the Joy-Con in a way that makes this little circular motion happen. It's just not very easy for me. Okay, so I will deal with you soon enough. There we go, okay. Boom! <laughs> okay, that was actually pretty easy. 
So there's a couple more coins for us, and then more importantly, boom, another moon. Yay! Whenever we're on this little platform, we have a special little dance. We got a moon. Road to Sky Garden. Gotten. Good, good, good. So that is going to do something fancy. Oh, the P block. Or I guess the P button. Flower Thieves of Sky Garden. Ooh, I like it. So there's a lot of stuff to do around here. It seems I can see Mari in the background. Okay, so um, before we do any of that though, I do wanna break up these little blocks, or these little stones, because they might end up being helpful. There we go. Um, okay, so they're not actually holding anything. What a mistake. I feel awful for doing it then, because it was a waste of time, but that's fine. Uh, Let's press the button. Whoa, neat, we can use that to get across. That's for sure. I'm a little scared though. I don't wanna move too quick. That is so weird, but so awesome. So what does this button bring me to? Somewhere. Um, I'm not really sure if this is a better way, a not better way. I feel like I should be going back there to find out what, yes. Oh no, <laughs> it's too late out. Too late out, I have to come back. <laughs> okay, um, yeah, let's check this out. Oh yeah, I definitely messed out on some stuff. So before we use this to do whatever we need to do, let's check out around here. And I do see a little banana on the floor. Or is this, that supposed to be a moon, I think? I don't know, regardless, it doesn't seem to be doing anything. So we can take this little platform, be careful of that. Yep, thank you. And then, oh, perfect. Let's become you. Oh, rude. He was a rude dude, but a smart dude. Yeah, break our heads on that. Do a bit of that, get an extra couple coins. We're not quite done, I wanna get on top of it, because I'm sure there'll be nothing. Uh, I can't quite get up there. Okay. Uh, hmm, I'm just trying to be extra careful then, because we could whittle waddle, whittle waddle, whittle waddle, whittle waddle. What is up here then? Oh, hey, look at that! Easy moon! If you ask me, we got a moon not planted in the tower. Oh gosh, we gotta be careful, it's gone now. Oh wow, there was some purple coins over there. Ooh, tricky. Okay, so I'm gonna try to just angle up so that I can get them, because I think what I gotta do, and, is not that, um, but to get on top of you, and then to whittle waddle, whittle waddle, whittle waddle, come on! Oh, I got two of them, but not all of them. Do that, get that. Okay, so this guy is gonna be very helpful. I gotta keep him around. So let's get back up here, and, and maybe if we can get to the top of this tower, we could access some sort of, um, whoa. Uh, am I going the right way? I, I gotta wait, I gotta wait. Maybe we could access some sort of boss fight and that would give us a multi-moon that would fill up most of the rest of the slots. We need three more, or we need five more. Yeah, let's get up here. We were already up here, but I just sort of want a better view. Definitely haven't missed anything from this angle. It's about to pop up. Yep. Oh geez, that was almost a little too soon. Um, I will try to do the same thing I've normally done just over here. And that seems to be it. Yep, that's the loop around, so we're good. We've gotten everything. We did it all as a little stilts. Guy. Oh, and for doing that, we'll get another moon. Yeah, stretching your legs. So we got four more again. Hopefully we get three more here. Let's find out. Hello, hello. Who do we got? What do we got? Um, oh my. Oh no, we're not the little guy anymore. But we are on the Sky Garden Tower. We are definitely facing a brutal here. A brutal brutal? There's only three of them left. Oh, no, no, that's no. okay, so she's still there. So what about that other bunny lady? She just happened to be hanging out? Too late, jumps. We snagged the soiree bouquet already. Now, why don't you scram so we can get to grab the rest of the flowers as well? Or maybe I'll just make you scram. Oh, my. I don't like this guy. He's sort of scary for a bunny. Um, oh, my, and he, he's, he's, okay, poisoned. I think he needs to see a doctor. To be honest with you. We have six health though. I think we should be able to handle this. I mean, what I probably should be doing is that. And then, oh, there we go. And then land on him. Ow, that hurt. Okay, I'm the worst ever. <laughs> Can't believe I got hit there. Get the extra health back. Becomes a UFO. Oh boy. I don't like it. So really, we just want to make sure we're doing a bit of this. Spinning around as much as we can. Oh boy. Come on. Where are you going? You're going right here. And then I can quickly hit you again. Yeah, okay, we just gotta be quick with it and we're fine. This music is actually giving more of a Kirby vibe. Kirby's coming up on the Switch, I'm excited for that. I mean, I probably should be just focusing on this game. Ow, darn. 
Okay, so, um, let's just wait for you to land and then immediately throw it at you. Because you can do that, so why wouldn't I? And this boss is defeated. Cool. That's pretty easy. Now, we got three more moons, a multi-moon. I was correct that we get a multi-moon. I love how they are different colors. But I don't know, something about the dark blue makes me think we've already collected it. Like, it's sort of like that darkened, you've already collected this kind of thing. But nope, three more moons with a beautiful multi-moon. So there we go, there's a fun little already half hour in this area. Flower Thieves of Sky Garden. Very, very cool. And we're off, off to the races. Whatever races we're going to. Whatever races we're going to, we're gonna win them. Okay, fantastic. Yeah! Path to the secret flower field. Oh! So is it a little, yeah, it's a little different this time. I like it. Okay, so we, oh, did I just see something just land up there? Probably, oh, these guys have new things to say. What will become of our secret flower field? That monster servants take take our flowers again. Panic cycle initiating. Another unidentified thing flew by, or perhaps the same thing. It is unclear. What about these little flowers? Grabbing one of these flowers will result in a substantial speed boost. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, that is very substantial. Somebody slow! Ow! Oh! Oh my head! My ache in Mario head. Can we recapture you? Are you gonna be the same moon? I think so. Yep, okay, had to make sure. And there are some extra coins sitting around now, but you know what time it is. It is time to buy Mario's trousers. Is this the desired selection? Yes. Thank you for your coins. Change out. You will need, You will wear the boxer shorts immediately? Excellent. Is it excellent? Is it? Please come again and buy things. <laughs> we are beautiful. Obviously, we're a little chilly. We're out here in just our, our underwear. Oh, hey, the little Sphinx is gone. Ow. How many times do we wanna do that? Hello, Yoon. What do you gotta sign? Um, oh. The monster's minions must not discover the secret flower field. The entrance is just ahead, but we dare not attempt it. We need assistance. Okay. And I know I keep on... Um, checking this area out, but I just wanna keep checking out because I don't know, like maybe I'll miss some stuff that's now up there. Either way, I find it so funny that we're in our underwear now. Let me, um, I guess, probably do that. Oh, are you ready? Oh boy, nobody's catching this Mario. Oh gosh, there's tanks. Ow, <laughs> that just never not happens, does it? Hmm, can we become the tanks? They don't seem to have any hats on, they do not. Holy cow, this is so cool! <laughs> this is so cool! Boom, wow, we're just a little tank. Oh wow, and we can break this apart. This is so much fun! Hey buddy, you over there? <laughs> I gotcha. Nothing new up there. Oh, we get the coins that way too. That's an easy way to get it then. Oh, this is so awesome! I'm having so much fun, we're a cool little tank. I mean, I wanted to do this and then we'll make our way, okay, I can't, I can't hop over ledges sound. Mmm, that's the situation. Our little Bowser branded tanks. Hello, pull the lever to receive a seed. A seed, huh? Oh, there's a purple coin up there. And, um, what's it saying? I require time to prepare the next seed. What is the seed for? Probably for the same thing that um the seeds are in Cast uh, not Kate, but Sand Kingdom. How in the world am I getting up there with one of the tall guys? Of course, the answer is simple. Let me go ahead and get one. Ready? Uh, gotcha, gotcha. And then it's a little while of you over here, just like that. I love seeing the little mustache. Shut up! Oh gosh, we're under attack. Gotta move, gotta move, gotta move. But if I go like this up here and. We can certainly get something. Oh yeah, a couple purple coins for us. But there should be more. Because remember, um, this is also where we saw purple coins in the wall over there. So how in the world do I get those? I wonder. Because it feels like I can hear almost a sparkle of something. But still, nothing. Because if I go back this way. Oh wow, things are a little bit different here though. Let me, um. 
do that. I wanted to get these if I can. Oh, I can't. I actually, can I not get up there? Oh my. Um, how in the world do I do this then? Wow, you really can't. Not even these super tall guys. Weird. I don't know, that doesn't seem right. This is the best way to get a good look up there though. There's purple coins in there. How do I get in there? I'm not sure, that one's a little tricky. I also don't know what to do with these nuts. I'm sure we'll find out sometime soon, but I wanna find out sooner rather than later, of course. Um. Okay, let's talk to you. You must have something new. The piranha plants aren't here anymore, which is great. The entrance to the secret flower field is that way. That way? But I was already in there, and there didn't seem to be too much of an entrance to anything. What do you mean? Hmm, odd. Nothing new here. Let us try looking around up here really quickly. But I mean, because there is still that one area I was supposed to go in there too that I sort of skipped over because the flower path sort of took me on the wrong way. So I just wanted to sort of check out, check out what's different around here. And there might actually not be anything. I might just want to, I mean, it's mostly the same. It's actually different now. The, the, okay, so the, the one that was here isn't here anymore. Okay, well I think we'll explore that more than maybe after we explore some other stuff. Like I'll probably come back here because obviously it's gonna take me a lot more time to get more stuff there than I'm anticipating. So I think now is a good time to go back to the Cascade Kingdom to um check out some stuff basically because a lot of you have been giving me great advice in the comment section. What was that about? Um, so I definitely want to you know heed some of it and try to find some more moons there. So first off, let's get back into our normal outfit. Even though I love the trousers, the boxer shorts, comfortable breezy boxers in a vibrant mushroom-like pattern. We gotta keep it with the basic for now. Yeah. Okay, so let's go back to Cascade Kingdom. And I mean, there's still Cap Kingdom to explore. I don't know when we wanna do that. There's just so much to do. I don't know which, like, what to do first. But yeah, we got almost all of it until we can go to the even, uh, like, even another kingdom. But um, maybe next episode we'll do Cap Kingdom. I'm not really sure. I'm still gonna keep the episodes about an hour each. You guys seem to enjoy that so far. Let us go in. No, I, no, I gotta do that. I always forget what I'm supposed to do here, but. Yep, we're heading to another kingdom. Even though it's not really another kingdom, it's a previous kingdom all the way over here. Let's set sail. Whoa, things are definitely different here. Well, you guys left me with some pretty good advice for some of the ones I got stuck on, but there's some even more stuff here. So I'm gonna adventure it. Um, there was some, yeah, there's something way over there. I'm not really sure what that was, but I wonder if maybe we keep helping people from other kingdoms, they'll end up coming back here, I don't know. Oh, ho, 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 hello, how are you? Ah, oh, welcome. When it comes to coins, there are two sorts, yellow and purple. You should know yellow coins can be used in any kingdom and purple coins can only be good in, in the kingdom where you found them. We know, hello, hello. Oh, you're so cute. So we should be able to buy all of this because we have all 50 purple coins. Unless they extended the amount of purple coins you can have in this area. Caveman headwear, primitive plumbers fashions uh, these from the skulls of parabones. Was that what you wanted? Sure. Thanks ever so. Uh, maybe later we'll change. Uh, when do you want to change clothes? Just find a closet. Caveman outfit. Early adventurers wore the, the, these outfits for maximum freedom of movement, if not maximum warmth. Okay, let's buy it. And once again, we'll equip it later. He's got that Flintstones look. Okay, so we also have the Cascade Kingdom sticker, a sticker inspired by the T-Rex. What are stickers for? Where do these go? Um, thanks ever so. I shall go stick this onto the Odyssey for you. Cool. T-Rex model. The dino's pose is so impressively lifelike, you can almost hear it roar. What is this what you wanted? Of course. Thanks ever so. I'll have this sent to the Odyssey. And then finally, the Triceratops trophy, replica of a real dinosaur fossil from a cas from the Cascade Kingdom. Hide this on a wall and it'll completely transform a room. Was this what you wanted? Yes. Thanks ever so. I'll have this into the Odyssey. Okay, so there we go. We've, we've spent all 50 coins worth of stuff here in Cascade Kingdom, so I don't think there'll be any more. What do you get this sound? It should be the same as everything else, but there is the Cascade Kingdom Power Moon, a power moon that was dug from the Fossil Falls. Um, oh no, I am short on coins, what do you know? Okay, I'll have to come back for that. Um, interesting, so even this one has it. Let's dance. I like how each you know, each place has a different song. Oh no, it, it got sucked there. <laughs> so, 
Let us start adventuring. We've already done that scarecrow. And I don't see too much else around here, but I do know of some other stuff that we can definitely find. One of which was, some of you guys were telling me, yes, there's one just right over ahead. And I sort of totally missed that one. So I need to figure out how to do that. Now, I don't know what happened to the pipe. I think it's under this. Yep, okay. Go through here. And then, I don't think there's any way to get to that from here. Maybe there is, and I'm just not seeing it correctly. But more importantly, is this area down here. Now, I searched for this area at the end of episode two, and I didn't really get what I was supposed to do, but now I do. I thought I had to clear out the area of all the blocks. Instead, we need to clear out the area of all the enemies. I thought the enemies would just respawn over and over again. Maybe I'm wrong, maybe you have to do it within a certain time frame, but we're getting it done now. Let's destroy some little innocent monsters that I guess aren't too innocent because they attack Marion. We're just gonna attack as many as we possibly can, because most enemies respawn pretty quick in this game. So I just didn't think that would be a thing, but it might end up being so, and we just have to be quick about it. Um, which might be quite difficult, because the dinosaur is a little hard to control. I mean, technically we could try it as Mario, but I just don't think it'd be very good. But we're over 100 coins now, so we can, of course, get that moon um, from the shop. Okay, got some of that. Let's run over here and destroy all of you. Come on, down with the evil little dudes. Now, there aren't any in the ledge below us. I remember that much. This is a really good way to, you know, earn up some coins. I'm sure if you did this over and over again. Is that not all of them? It is, hey, what do you know? So there we go, there is our additional moon. Whoa, boom, hooray! Dinosaur nest, big cleanup. Cool. So let's hop out of here. And I think that's everything in the dinosaur nest. I really don't see what else we could do. Um. So now what? Hmm, once again, we can go back to the shop. If we go like this and we go like that, we can also see there's still the, the very nice shot with the chain chomp. And then there's also one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more to go. So we have nine more to find somewhere. I'm just trying to figure out, I wish there was a better way to look at that island that's like way overhead. So overhead I didn't even see it. That's why there's a shadow here though. Hmm. Some people are saying to climb up a pole. Obviously there is a pole right here, but I don't see how this pole could help. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll try it. Yeah, that is not gonna help. <laughs> hmm. I'm not sure how in the world we would get over there. Unless we can actually capture one of the birds, like these guys. You can't, you definitely can't. That would just went right through them. If there was a way to capture the birds, I'd save them, yeah, potentially. But I'm not sure if that's the case. Beyond that, maybe I just gotta keep looking around. Okay, well, I've been looking far and wide, and I just, I can't find much of anything now. I don't know what, how they can hide eight more moons in just such a tiny little area, and including all the other secrets, so it's just really confusing me. We got everything here, so I'll go ahead, and at least we got two moons out of it. Maybe I'll buy a little extra something from, um, buy. There you go. Maybe I'll buy a little extra hint from the toad. Maybe he can help me in that way. Because of course he gave us a hint on the one above, but he didn't give me too much of a hint on it. He just told me where I was. So uh, maybe I could get a little extra hint from him. Beyond that, I mean, I'm just clueless. You know, there's just, this area isn't very big for all of that kind of stuff. It makes me very worried about the other areas, you know? How much of a hard time I'm gonna find it, you know, finding every one of those. Having trouble finding power moons? I can help you for the coins. Wanna buy a hint? Sure. And if we can't find anything more, we'll definitely move on to back or back to Sand Kingdom. Thanks, I marked it on your map with mine to take a look. There? Which one's that? Can I find down? Maybe I could find out the name of it. Shopping in Fossil Falls. Very nice shot with the chain jump. Interesting. That is up here. And so I guess we could give that one a shot. Oh, that is really weird, what? Yeah, okay, so a shot with the chain chomp. Oh. Um, that's sort of a predicament. I think I'm sort of starting to figure out what exactly that means. The problem is how in the world do I break these blocks? There's no way I can get the dinosaur up here. Or maybe there is. Maybe if I could find a way to make him run onto the, the spring. The spring's way down there. That could make that, maybe. 
If we could, we could break those, and there's probably a pipe under there. Let's give that a shot. Oh boy, that's a big jump, and we made it. We'll give it our best shot, you know, that's all we could ever do. That has to be it though, right? Oh, that is gonna be such a big jump. Ready, set, um, boing. Oh geez, I messed it up. Ready, boing. Oh gosh, but it doesn't let you go the direction I wanna go. That's really awkward. Maybe if I just plop down as gently as a feather. Oh, come on! How in the world? There's definitely, like, I can't get the chain chomp off the chain, you know? Ooh, there's no way. Like, I'm really trying to charge at it, too. And maybe if there was a different angle I could hit it from, or maybe just in general, maybe there's a different bounce patch somewhere. I'm gonna try it one more time from this angle, at least. Ready, angle it up, let it rip. Oh, there's no way, there is no way. Weird. Um. Oh no, it's timing out too. What if I if I did that and? Okay, it's not timing out anymore. Can I break these? Um, I can't actually fit down there. Okay, it's, it's being really awkward with it. There's definitely none over here though. So where could there be another one? I mean, I could of course plop down here and cause total havoc. But that doesn't really help me. Oh, I just don't know, I just don't know. And once again, there's another one down here. But this one's obviously, very clearly, not gonna do what I needed to do, which is get me up there. Then what do I do? I may never know. Oh, okay, no, that was just a coin popping on. This is where the old Odyssey used to be. Clearly there's not really anything here now. It would be cool if there was like maybe a pipe there. But there is not. I just, I have no idea. I mean, maybe the map is actually just telling me to go down here, which would be really weird to me. I mean, I guess it would make sorta of kind of sense because this is the one where the nice shot with the chain chomp was. So maybe, like, I mean, I, I really think there might be something under those um, stones, but this is one we've done already. Do we have to redo it? We might have to. No, we don't, okay. Maybe I missed something. Maybe there's like an extra area here. Because that one makes sense, I guess. Might be a little crazy still, but because we've done this, and then it's like, yeah, ha, you did it. Here's your moon. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That's what they're gonna do to me? Holy cow, that is so uncool. All right, all right. No, that was sort of wrong. Um, maybe I need to hit you more on a dead on angle like that. Definitely not. Okay. Um, and hit you at a super far off angle like that. Yes, oh, almost, almost. A little too far off. So like this. Oh, nope, still a little too far off. We're getting there, we're getting there. Come on now. Ooh, so that the arrow is like halfway, I would say fully. No, what the heck? It's very diligent. <laughs> That's why it's a very nice shot with the chain chop. Gosh darn, that is not easy to get right. Because of course I can make it hit him making it hit him and make it do that. So there's that moon. Wow, what the heck? Um, There you go. So we got the very nice shot with the chain jump, which is great. I still feel like I'm a, I'm a little lost, but. Oh, and there's, there's definitely nothing more anymore, right? Okay, okay. <laughs> so yeah, I was just totally misled by that one. I got a little con out confused. Maybe it's because of how many concussions Mario gets by bashing his head on the door like that. Okay, so I do have enough coins to ask for another hint if I want them. Should I? I think we, we wanna get at least one more moon here in Cascade Kingdom before we move on to something else, right? So there's no way you could tell me to get the one in the sky because I've already gotten that one. Having trouble finding power moons, I can help you out for 50 more coins. Wanna buy a hint? Sure. Thanks, I've marked it on your map with minus to take a look. Right there. Okay. And then we can talk to Talkatu because I think he'll tell us more about it for free. If I'm having a hard time, that is. Um, so where exactly is that? I think that's right where the Odyssey used to be. Right on over here. Right? Yeah, right where the Odyssey used to be. Right here. No. Right here? Not quite. Um. Oh, the sparkly rock! The sparkly rock of sparkliness! Ah! 
Ah! Yeah! Ah! Come on, Rock. You're gonna break eventually, right? This, bro this block is really strong. I mean, it's not even a block, it's a rock. Come on. Ah! Yeah, hey, okay, that one was really easy. I'm just a dingus, I never saw it. Rolling rock by the falls. Okay, I feel really dumb for not finding that one. But I'm glad I'm finding it now. I don't wanna waste all my coins, but at the same time, how else am I gonna find this? I mean, I gotta make sure I just pick up these. Because they give me like a free extra couple coins just by walking by them. We can, we can do one more. We'll do one more, and then we got plenty of easy ones to find over on Cascade uh, Kingdom. Not Cat uh, Sand Kingdom. That'll be fine. I hope. <laughs> so one more over here. Oh wait, I can't find any more. Oh wow, that's all he has. We didn't find all of them, did we? No, we, we are plenty more to find. Um, definitely no more that we got a hint for. I would just say that maybe we'll talk to Talkatoon and maybe he has something and if not, I'll throw in the towel for now. So yeah, Talkatu and Toad won't give me any more hints, so oh, look at that, we got our first sticker here, that is awesome. So with that being said, we are good to go. We'll put these four in there. I mean, I don't think they'll count towards the progress for the um, next sale, yep. So we will diddle daddle a little bit in Sand Kingdom. Not a huge amount, because we're already pretty far in today's episode, but yeah, next episode, we'll be doing more Sand Kingdom fun, we'll be doing more Wooden Kingdom stuff until we have enough to move on to the next kingdom or something. That seems fine to me. But for now, we are heading out of here. See ya! Okay, so I'm not gonna rely on any hints just yet. I don't wanna buy anything with purple coins until we have all of them, because I don't like the fact that it depletes our amount, and then that gets me confused on how much we're supposed to be having right now. But everything is, uh... Melted, as you can see, that awful ice, gone, gone, gone. Finally, it's warm again. We're safe, safe, safe. I really like repeating him. A puppy! Hi, you're adorable. Where are you going? I don't know. Maybe that's a sign that they're doing. Oh, you know what would awesome would be if they do a Nintendo Dogs for Switch? Oh, I really hope that's like a weird hint to it. Don't you just love it? The desert is back to normal, hot, hot, hot. Now tours might start coming back. I hope so. Oh, maybe it's this guy's dog. Oh yeah, he got himself out of the ice. A taxi, a taxi, you pulled up finally. Take me to the Metro Kingdom. Sorry about the holdup. I had some car troubles you would not believe. Can't leave them for the Metro Kingdom yet, though. I promise I'll get you there. Just gotta dice, just gotta dice the everything. Okay, Um, can I talk to you? I guess not. We could, whoa, okay, break this thing a little bit. <laughs> Nothing up in the sky, right? Well, there's definitely more things we can get now. Of course, like these uh, couple coins here. Hey, look, the, the nuts are growing. Oh, that is so cool. Now, there's a couple around here, I think, that got frozen in the ice. You know, we can open the map, of course, of course. Uh, what happened? Who knows? Who cares? Uh, hello. You know about Amiibo, right? Just about any time you like, you can hold down the blah, 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 and do the yeah, Amiibo stuff. Something good will happen. You see, I don't have any Amiibo. You guys did let me know, though, that I don't need Amiibo to get all of them. Uh, now, this is Toastarina. Shake it, shake it. All right. Oh, I got a coin for that. Only one, though. Hmm. Oh, Talkatu's up there. Maybe he can give me a hint. Oh, yeah. Talkatu, help me out, buddy. How you doing? What's the secret you were seeking? I know it, I know it, haha. -ha. I can't tell you, but I'll give you a clue. The treasure of Jaxi Ruins. So yeah, we should ride Jaxi around for a couple minutes. Enjoy that. I'll stay true to my promise of playing Jaxi this episode, even if just for a moment. But Jaxi is next to a taxi, which I find fun. But it does cost us money. How do you do it? I'm, I'm, I'm Jaxi. 30 coins ain't too much, on. So what? You doing some sightseeing? You gotta check out the inverted pyramid. Controls are snappy, break ZL dismount. I'll take off as soon as you're strapped in, but watch yourself, I go quick. Okay, let's do it, do it. Oh, okay, so there's no way to uh, speed him up any more than this, which I think is just fine. Oh, man, he is so quick. But they said he was quick, but they, they really meant it. Okay, oh, on, and we can stop him maybe there. Ah! Okay, don't fall off. Okay, holy cow, we fell down here. Um, Wait there for me, Jaxi, if you can, because there are some checkpoints I want to get if I can. Get the bird? I don't think we can get the bird. Let us get the checkpoint. We're at the desert oasis. Let's talk to the little Lakitoon. How you doing, like dude? Oh, it's time for fishing, cause it's fishing time. Oh, look at this. Can lower the line. Get myself a couple purple coins, maybe? There you go, fishing for purple coin. Good, 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 this is relaxing. <laughs> I love that, that is perfect. Okay, so get that, and then, yep, yep. 
And then, if it, oh wait, there's a little turtle down there. And, oh, you see that there are little fishies in the sand. Can I get them? I mean, I don't really want to. I'm not really a big fan of fishing, but maybe if I just have it like this, it, maybe it'll scare away the fish if I'm not careful. I'm gonna be, you see him? Oh, I gotta reel it in, reel it in, reel it in. Um, um, or shake the Joy-Con. Okay, I'm gonna shake the, okay. Uh, hi, oh, you gave me a boon. Thank you so much, we get fishing in the oasis, but there's other fish around you. What if I try to get them? Like this. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. I see you. Do you see me? No, you're going the other way. Come on, this is like Animal Crossing now. Oh yeah, the new Animal Crossing game's on phones now. I wanna check that out. We're doing a tons of, ton of games right now. I'll probably do it uh, in November when it releases in America. I know it's like like out in Australian. Oh, no, I felt the vibration. Oh, he must have just tapped it. Hmm, I don't know if we can get more from this or if it was just the one. I don't see any more fishies. Looks like that's, oh wait, there's one more. We'll try for one more fishy today. This guy over here. There was also one I scared away. Oh, okay, so this time it just gives me health. Okay, I'm glad we got one, that was so cool. Oh, hey bird. Oh, hey, <laughs> that was pretty easy. He just popped up right in front of me. Okay, there's another one. This is the bird traveling the desert. Now I know there was one of them around the beginning area. Maybe it's the same one? Oh, hey, look at that, there's another one. <laughs> what a great start. Where are the birds gathered? Okay, so any kind of bump in the road there, you definitely want to butt stomp on. So we did a lot in the last episode, especially when it comes to exploring, and we're now on the Jaxi. So we're gonna be continuing on the Jaxi. All right, I want to become the Jaxi, but I cannot quite do that. Oh gosh, we move quick. It's just like, it's really hard to handle, but it's also a lot of fun. Okay, <laughs> what is this about? Um, Travel tip, cap jump. Hold down Y after throwing your cap, and it will spin in place for a little while, and run into the cap, and you'll take a big bounce off of it. Okay, but what about this cacti? Oh, ow, that hurt. Oh, he's got little spindlies on his nose, poor Mario, I feel bad. Um, geez, okay. What do, what do I do about this? I bet you, if I was careful enough, oh, there's there's more fishies over here. If we get the Lakitu over here, and I bet you that's what we're supposed to do. Like I could, as Mario, just float through and get this coin. But I don't think that's the idea. I think I'm supposed to go get the Lakitu again, which we became in the last episode. And we're supposed to catch it. Okay, Lakitu, it's fishing time again, buddy. Now we can't make him move any faster. That's fine. He's so cool though, I love him, the bits and pieces. He's fun. So let's wait a while on over here. Just slowly but surely floating. And I see a fish right here. So the big fish I think are the ones that are gonna have the moon on them. So this dude right here. Oh, there we go, we got him, we got him, we got him. Oh hey, it was Captain Toad. <laughs> what are you doing down there? I got buried down there. I'm so lucky you came along. Oh, but I forgot, I found a power moon under the sand. Thanks for the treasure, for the rescue. I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, hooray, but we are the ones that got treasure. You're quite a catch, Captain Toad. Cool, so we found Captain Toad in this area. That was unexpected. He are so fresh. I guess, um, oh, we scared him, wine. He's clapping and everything. I don't think we're gonna find too much around here, but that was very interesting. The problem is that I don't know how to get the Jaxi out of here. I might be out of luck for that, unless I can charge him in to one of these things. Oh, that is not happening. Jaxi, I think we might have to end our little friendship here because I don't see any way I can get you out of here. Um, That feels like a bit of a trap. I spent 30 coins for you. Um, Oh, maybe I can call him up here? Call for the Jaxi, yes. Hey, okay, that works. Um, Get back on you. And we are off. So yeah, there's still so much to explore in this desert. The desert is huge though. Oh, what about Yoon? Hello. Let's talk to Yoon. Now we got a, a hint about you in the Wooded Kingdom. Hey dude, you up for a challenge? Everyone loves walking, right? Problem is, most don't take it seriously. That's what a trace walking is all about. If you can walk like a champ, you'll win a prize. Wanna try? Sounds fun. Sweet. Okay, what exactly is happening now? We're walking. Rules are cake. Just walk around and follow the arrows on the ground. Here's the fun part though. The arrows disappear after a bit. Oh my. Okay. You gotta score 80 points or more to win. I think I can do this. Like the, the second half is easier because we got those bushes to sort of guide us. 
All right. Now I can, I can actually run. Oh, okay, I can actually run. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. It's actually much more difficult than expected. <laughs> that is a lopsided circle. <laughs> That'll do it, let's see. You need 80 points more to win. Think you got it done? 94, wow, look at us. I mean, was it out of 100 or like 2,000? Okay, that walk uh, was serious business. Boom, this power moon is yours. That is awesome. Yeah, walking the desert. Cool, already five moons in, four moons in in today's episode. I'm out of prizes, but you can try for a higher score. No, thank you, but thanks for offering. That's cool, let me know if you get serious. Okay, so we still have to find one more of those golden nuts. But I mean, there's stuff everywhere. Oh, look, there is another bird around here. Don't touch that stuff. Maybe you can ride something across it, oh, you bet. Oh, and there's purple coins on them. Ooh, that's gonna be a bit of a tough thing to figure out. Ah. Okay, there's not too much here except for an extra couple coins, which is totally fine with me. Then do that, get two more. Oh, there's like a little, oh, is this gonna be where the Jaxi Temple is? Um, The Tolkien who talked about that in the last episode. Where did that bird run off to? Or fly off to, he's over there now. We can definitely get him. It's just a matter of, can I run into him? Like full speed, I can, holy cow, break it! Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, got it. Okay, bird traveling the waste. So yeah, there is more than one bird, just like in the desert level of Super Mario 64. Very cool. So I'm gonna, oh gosh, it almost hurt. No, no, oh come on, that's not fair. That's not fair. Oh, that was stinky. I was gonna try to butt slam them. I don't think there would be anything under those for the because there were purple coins there. Way back here. And well, luckily, I, I think I keep the Jaxi unless I have to pay for him again since I die. No, he's back here. Cool. Um, whoa. What is that on the top of the tree? There's a little music note. I haven't seen that before. Climb faster, Mario. Climb faster. Hee hee. Okay, get across to here. Oh, it's one of these. Oh yeah, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. I am so not gonna be able to do this in time. Go, 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 go up. Oh, I hate shaking the controller to do this, it's awkward. Oh, uh, can we do it again? Okay, we can. Luckily, it's not like one of those like, you know, one chance or you're, you're done. All right. Uh, maybe uh, Hattie can help? Yeah, you can, hooray, thank you, Hattie. No, no, you're not Hattie, you're capping. This isn't Battle Block Theater. <laughs> you got a moon, taking notes, jump on the palm. None of those up there, no, okay, we're good. That was so cool. I'm so happy we tried that. And we can get up here. All right, back to you. And we still have the left to the uh, left of the town to explore. It's just a matter of there's just so much to explore. We've already found this bird, so I think hitting him again won't do too much for us, but you know, we can try if we want to do. Oh gosh, um, breaking it. Oh boy. Wow, I can't hit him for the life of me, apparently. <laughs> oh gosh. It's cute though, the way like he piddle patters. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, stop, stop. Ah, yeah, okay. Just had to check, just had to check. So what about you over here? You're just sort of chilling out, taking in the view. Hello. A secret passage goes up there. It's underground, so they say. There's even a Jaxi thing up there. So if for whatever reason we lose our Jaxi while we're in here. Oh my, okay, so it's like a whole little temple. Oh my! It's like Super Mario Sunshine. Because you know in Super Mario Sunshine you can ride the little bloopers on the, it's like that. Oh gosh, this is scary. Now I could go right down the center for record time, but I need this stuff. Oh gosh, oh, oh, he's trying so hard to slow down. Ah, no, come on, he stopped slowing down. What? That's malarkey. He stopped slowing down, that wasn't me. There you go, back on the Jaguar, the Jaxi. Luckily, they'd give you plenty of coins just in case you do make that mistake. This is harder than the, the bullet bills, and I really have to sneeze. It's just sneezing season, so I sneeze in season. Oh, I really like that. I made it funny. So I think that's the way we're supposed to go over there. So if we go, gosh darn it. <laughs> really? Is that really what has to happen here? Okay, well, I missed it. I'm gonna go get some of these purple coins if I can. Oh, just barely. It's really hard, you gotta really angle yourself up from far away. Just like that, oh no. This is not happening. This is not happening. Uh, there you go, there you go, there you go. No, 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 yeah, we did it! Holy 
Holy cow! Oh my gosh. That was so difficult. Ready, set, hop! Yeah, yeah, perfect timing and everything. Jaxi stunt driving. Sorry, Jaxi. I don't mean to just, you know, make you feel like you're just a vehicle. You are much more to, than that to me. You are a true companion. I wonder if Yoshi's in this game. It would be fun if we could ride Yoshi. I mean, honestly, this is pretty similar to the Super Mario Ga I'm going in a circle. Um, this is pretty similar to the Super Mario Galaxy missions where you could ride Yoshi and get like the hot tamale. Oh gosh! Okay, so at least I know there's nothing over there now. Lesson learned. Booty burned. Take the turn. And, um, I don't know. I, I can't think of anything else that rhymes, come on! It's, it's just like the consistency changes. You're gonna be turning sharper on the, the solid than the liquid. And it's, just, it's stinky sometimes, that's all I gotta say. All right, so I'm gonna start from really far away and just try to work my way into this straightaway because this is actually, once you get angled up, this is much easier. And I like how that, now that the purple coins have served their use as purple coins, they just become normal coins when you pick them up. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? This is so difficult. Like I'm almost there too is the worst part. Like right there, you can see the moon at the end. <laughs> Come on, one more time, one more time. Uh, yep, go this way. Just like that, just like that. And then land here. Oh, oh yeah, 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 that's good, that's good. I believe in myself. I hope you guys believe in me too. Uh, uh, yes, that's good. Are you, I don't. Oh, okay, you gotta do it the difficult way to do it the easy way. Gee, thanks, game. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Yeah, we finally did it! See you, Jaxie, I'm out of here, because I was the biggest pain in the butt. You got a moon, Jaxie driver. Okay, and there's nothing else I'm missing here. I never want to do this again. It doesn't look like there's any way I can go up there. It doesn't look like there's anything I want up there, so we're heading back down. So we should be popping up at the top. I don't think there's gonna be... Oh. Then how do we get up there? That's a bit of a surprise, I gotta say. Ow. Yeah, he was all saying, you know, oh, we'll go up there. I, I would love to. Sort of the same question for this tower. There's so many little areas in this game that are so high up, I just don't get how to get there. And maybe I can just jump off his end. A secret passage goes up there, it's underground, so they say, but not the underground passage I was at. A different underground passage, which is great because I don't have my jacksy anymore. That's stinky. Um, unless it was uh, under there and I have to redo it and I'll be the happiest zebra in the world. Except that I won't be. Um, whoa, a little bit of a close call there, hey Mario? Almost walked you right off the edge. Well, there is a Jaxi uh, thing right there. So I'll get that in a moment. Sometimes it is easier just to travel this stuff by foot, just to foot it. I love how he's getting sand all over him though. That is just so cool. Um, there's so many different places to go. Just gotta use the sand dunes to my advantage to roll around them. Hey, it's another one of those sphinxes. Uh, last episode, those gave us a puzzle. Oh, um, I guess this is another way we could have gotten to the pyramid. Okay. Um, I don't think I wanna go down there. I don't know what our goal is here right now. I actually don't know if we have any kind of specific goal. I guess not, right? Um, well, that's fine, because I can just shake on over here and climb up this and get three more, because we're, after this we'll have 75, so we'll have three quarters of the way there when it comes to purple coins. Wait. Oh yeah, this is the hole that the thingamajig made. Okay, no, I'm not going in there, not me, not ever. I'm doing it. I'm really curious now. What is gonna be down there now? Uh, ouch, deepest underground. What is that thing? Is that a coin bag? Classic coin bag, oh gosh, the zombies! The zombies, they're here! Oh no, 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 I made a mistake! I made a mistake, leave me alone, you fiends! Oh boy, get him, get him, Cappy. Oh gosh, but there's more of them. I need to get this dude because it would be satisfying if I could. You know what, never mind. Wait, what is this thing? Is it a, whoa, okay, we're this way now. Can we do, use this to launch ourselves? That's what I just did. That's not really what I wanted though. Oh, that is so weird. What does that pipe go to? Hmm, I wonder. I mean, probably back to where we were. But I'm gonna find out. Oh gosh. Um. Decent way to earn up coins if you're patient enough, I guess. What is down here? 
This might just pop me up back at the surface, but yeah, it does. So was that really worthwhile? I mean, maybe if I miss some secrets. Oh, look at this, this has to be something. Boom. Nope, sorry. Boom. No, we already got that one. Darn. What about the Sphinx? This has to be another puzzle Sphinx, right? I'd imagine. Hello. Um, seems like it. Hello. Can I not talk to you? Yeah, I know. I want to talk to you, buddy, but you won't let me. Maybe if I get on top of him? Can I even get on top of him? Am I not good enough for you? <laughs> what is this? Uh, Mario, you're not a hat. Well, I sure feel like it right now, because he treats me like a hat. Why can't I talk to him? Maybe I need, maybe this is where we need a certain outfit. Ooh, no taken. So maybe I should, there is a checkpoint like right there. Oh, I really didn't want to buy the costumes until we had all the purple coins, but like I might have to just do it anyways. Because what if he doesn't talk to me unless I have the costume, but why wouldn't the first Sphinx do it then? It's just weird that he isn't talking to me, but obviously he has something to say. I don't know. Oh, we could try to get you down. We're gonna have to be on top of the building now. So let's uh, get up there and try to be prepared for it. Yep, yep. Hmm. Uh, I got a power line all the way to the pyramid. Oh, cool. Can I, oh, I can. Okay, hold on. I don't wanna do that just yet. Oh, and there, oh, that's how we get that moon. Ah, where are you going? Come back. He is out of here. But maybe that's not the right one. Hard to say. Okay, let's take the power line then for now. Wow, we move quick. Oh, wait, 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 how do I get the, wait, 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 you can't stop manually. Oh, hello. Who are you? I'm traveling all over to glide from all the highest places. This fall looks pretty good for a blood pumping power dive. Screw here. I can be you, can I? Okay, well, we'll come back for that for sure. My, t my goal right now is to, bop, no, I pressed the wrong button. Oh, I just barely made it, holy cow. Okay, we got a moon on top of the stone archway. There's another one done. Oh, you see those hidden purple coins there? I can't believe I missed those. And we got some barrel Goombas, adorable. I can't believe I missed these over here. Now let's do that. I can become the Goomba if I wasn't the worst ever at video games. There you go. Can he just like walk through these? Oh, he can't. Okay, that was a waste. Just get these three extra, that's gonna pump me to 78. I get so distracted so easily in this game and I love it. Um, let me get back up. Is there any way to get back up there? Yeah, yeah, just up there. Okay, good. So let's try you. Oh gosh, this might be really fun. I need to hold me to glide. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, I said glide. Hold me to glide. Oh, I'm doing it wrong. If we get back to a high place, we can fly again. Well, I did that wrong. <laughs> Let's try that one more time, shall we? Oh, there we go. So if I hold down, he's gonna nose dive down, which we do not want. So let me, um, oh, yeah! We got on the lone pillar. I wonder how often we could do something like that. I mean, if we had this in Cascade Kingdom, oh man, that'd be easier. I'm gonna doubt that we could actually glide to here, because you start you know, going downward quite a lot, quite quickly. I mean, <laughs> He's a lot of fun, I can say that much. Um, but that's about all I see here. I'm trying to find out maybe where, where's another good gliding spot. Not here, that's for sure. Let me go back to the top of the tower again. Then maybe we can find something. Of course, he's facing that way, but there surely is other places. It would be cool if we could bring him somewhere more helpful. <laughs> But I mean, obviously there's only so far I can travel him. Hmm. Okay, well I'm looking around, I don't see too much. Like obviously there's the one way, way, way over there that I'm just not gonna be able to quite get. I could try to make my way out here and see what we can accomplish, but once again, it's one of those things where I don't really see what we could do. Hmm, maybe I'm going a little ahead of myself. Still don't know about that. Okay, we're gliding. <laughs> Oopsies. Luckily, we can do a little jump, too. 
I just really want him to talk to me. Why won't you talk to me? Why am I not good enough for you? Weird. I mean, maybe now's our time to uh, go and try some other things. We could uh, go to the Wooded Kingdom, uh, complete whatever we need to do there. That way we can move on to a different kingdom. That might be fun. But you're freaking out again. Maybe I can help you once more. Um, hello. Oh, well, now you won't talk to me because I'm a, you know, a weird thing. No, 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 my beautiful sheep, three sheep of, okay, yeah, but I've already done this, right? If I do this again, will it even work? Why would this one restart? I don't see why it would restart. So maybe we could do an additional time and get an additional set of sheep, or additional moon for saving the sheep. I'm sorry, there you go. There's one. Yay, dun, 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 dun. There's another one here. So I'll go ahead, I'll go ahead and do this off camera. Since you guys have already seen it, it shouldn't be too big of a deal for me to just go ahead and do it. Yep, okay, it was one we already got. That's sort of lame that it doesn't, like, like why would it restart? It, it alludes to me that something else is going on there. Hmm, okay. I'm just trying to figure out what more we can do. I mean, we could have, oh, get the bird up here. Cause like, I think it's the same bird that's just traveling from place to place. As you can see, he's already leaving. But he gives you a different moon for each location that he's at, which is really weird. I don't mind it, it's just, just seems like a lot of waiting around for him to come back. Cause he's gone, he's out of here. So let's go into this building. I feel like we've, we, we might have gone into the building yep, at least once before. I don't think we could get every, I don't think we did get everything in here, or did we? Okay, maybe we did, maybe I'm getting mixed up here. Oh, maybe it was worthwhile, cause there's a scarecrow up here now. Okay, we haven't found too many scarecrow in this area. Ooh, that one looks tricky. How am I doing that? Oh, I have to roll, don't I? Yep, yep, okay. Now get up there quickly, Mario. I know the timer's running out. Ready, ready, get it! All right, that was Scarecrow Ch Kingdom Timer, or Sand Kingdom Timer Challenge number one. Okay, I'm glad I did that then. I wonder where we can find another one. Probably in other areas we've been to before. So if I, um, we definitely wanna revisit some areas we visited in the last episode. Like that's definitely been a good move to make. So the next thing I should have done is probably just use the zip line instead of on other ways. See, I don't know how you get those. Okay, 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 okay. Um, turn back. Oh, nope, not what I wanted. So like, what if I, ah, no, no. Dang it. That's not what I was supposed to do. Oh wait, the bird, the bird's here. Okay, I sort of died. Well, I didn't die, but I had to like go all the way back here. No, wait, no, wait, come back. Oh, come on. Oh, he's the worst. But hey, we can do the rocket now. What is this rocket gonna be like? Um, oh, um, well, we get to go to the moon, of course. Wait, is this really gonna bring us like a moon cave? Whoa! I guess they have a little bit of an extension here of their town. Holy cow, what in the world? Okay, uh, we might wanna be the Goomba, you know, to defeat the Goomba. We must, oh, I don't have my hat here. Oh, this is like one of the Super Mario Sunshine challenges. Oh, I see, we couldn't have continued without the hat. Yeah, but this is like one of the Super Mario Sunshine challenges without Flood. But instead of that, it's uh, without uh, Mario's hat because of Cappy. Cool. Oh, some purple coins there. Oh, no. I didn't factor in the fact that there might be some purple coins hiding around. I'm definitely gonna have to look back after we're done, try to see if there's anything I might have missed when it comes to purple coins. It'd be cool if there was maybe like a purple coin finder, like an item we can get maybe if we get like all the moons out of an area for having a really hard time. <laughs> see it. <laughs> okay, with some certain purple coins. I hear the sparkle of a moon as if there's one closer than you would think. Because there is maybe? I w was I supposed to become the, no, okay. I was gonna say, how can I become the Goomba then if I don't have the, uh, oh geez. Um, get up like that. Yeah, okay, not bad. Above a strange neighborhood. Now that's not the moon I was supposed to get. Yeah, there's more over there. There is some more there. I gotta look back. I don't think I missed any purple coins, but it's very possible that I did, and that would be the stinkiest thing. Um, I really don't know that. There's definitely one set here. Seems to be pretty clear with where they are though. The thing is, how do I get those without falling and dying? I might not be able to, I might just have to do it that one. So if I'm smart, I should jump down, land on this, and then now what? Um, well, I guess I should just jump. Yep, okay, I got it, I got it, I figured it out, figured it out. Long jump! Okay, we made it. 
Still don't see any other purple coins, but I do get a moon. Strange neighborhood. Yeah, this is a very strange neighborhood. Cool though, look out for rocket ships. Hey, don't leave without me. <laughs> of course I wouldn't, Cappy. I'm out of here. Whoa, we're just flying back down. <laughs> This is so cool. Just randomly like this. That's sort of the thing. These episodes have been an hour long and like in every single minute of it, we're doing something crazy and new. Here comes the bird. I'm ready for him this time. I'm gonna stay over here because I think he'll be pretty low to the uh, the buildings here. Look at him. He's just like, ugh. I don't like being up here. I don't like heights. Uh, wait, okay, okay. Wait, 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 wait. Hoot, hoot. No, Mario, why do you have to? Ooh, Mario, I'm gonna tell your parents on you because you're making me mad. I don't even know who your parents are, but you know what, they did show up in Yoshi's Island. Um, Gosh darn it, Mario, do you have to grab onto the cactus so awkwardly? I think if we stand on that cactus, that is a perfect place. Oh, that is just tough. Here, I'm gonna one, two, yep, get up here, and then hop up here, and let's see, is it on its way? It is, so every time we restart this area, the bird makes its way over. So basically, it just resets the bird. Okay, you guys ready? I'm ready. Set. Jump and throw. Yet. Yeah. Um. So are there more than one bird? That it's so hard to know. I don't really know how I feel about it then. You know? Oh, you know what? I don't need this extra one. It'll give me a couple extra coins, which would have been nice. But you know what? Sometimes we can't always take what we want. Okay. I don't know too much more we can do in this area specifically, but we haven't traveled to the left side of this. I see a Jaxi thing, which might be nice, but beyond that, what else? There might be something more. Only way to find out, of course, is to go over. I mean, maybe I should be uh, getting the Jaxi right now, but uh, for right now, I think that's everything we can do in this area. I'm gonna run around with the Jaxi one last time in this side, and if not, we'll go to the Wood Kingdom. We'll finish that up. That'll be nice and fun. Call for the Jaxi here. Do I have to pay him again since I haven't run him in a little while, or since we paid the 30 coins, we just have him forever, or maybe for the duration that we explore this kingdom, and then we have to, if we leave, we have to repay? That probably makes the most sense. Oh, come on! You, t you can say that again. But there was a little th something something down there. Nothing ventured. Nothing gains, but you know what? I still feel the right to complain. And stop. Okay, somewhere around here. Yeah, just right down here. Man. Oh, this is the nut. I found it. <laughs> With lots of searching, I finally found the nut, but the long walk back now might prove to be difficult. I mean, how am I even gonna? Oh, mine. Oh, <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. No, please tell me it's back over here. Please, 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 please. Oh no, okay, okay, okay. That was a bit of a scare, I gotta be honest. Sorry, Jaxie, but um, you might have to stay here for the rest of eternity. Or, gosh darn it, I'm trying to turn the joystick. Come on. Ah. Um, I'm gonna... How can I just place it down? Oh, okay, that worked. Hmm. Okay, so now I just have to... Oh, and now we can do that as well. So maybe I can make a bit of a shortcut here. Toss it over there. Yep, do that. Okay, that's awesome. I gotta go get the nut back now before it disappears. <laughs> quickly, 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 quickly. Oh, nope, yeah. Okay, so I could go back this way. I mean, really, that's just sort of a shortcut. It doesn't accomplish anything. So I don't care to right now. For now, we'll go this way. And just deliver the nuts, see what this is. It'll probably just give me another moon. I mean, I don't see why I would do anything really more than that, but hey, we just gotta run all the way back. Luckily, it's not too far of a run. It looks like a far run, but once you start legging it, it ain't too bad. So we'll just do it, get it done. Do the deed we need to do. The, the, the rocket ship thing was really fun. Oh, what is this over here? It's all locked off. We gotta check that out right after this. So, deliver the nut, and then, oh, yep. Oh, you know what? Do I have to come back later? I think I gotta come back later. Okay, nice to know. Let us come back here. Hello. Dress like us, party like us, that's what we say anyway. But your hat and clothes need a little local color. Look around, you'll get the idea. Okay, 
So there is something very specific there. I could do it now because who knows, maybe there are purple coins in there. Oh, but we gotta move on to some different kingdoms now. I mean, obviously we still have a lot more to go. How many have we found so far? 36, we, we're not, not, not even, okay, we are a little more than halfway through. But barely halfway through with just this kingdom. Crazy stuff. So before we start trying to dive in and do more here, and we are going to live our moons, go to Wooded Kingdom, do the one thing we need to do to I think unlock the next kingdom, go check that out and just continue exploring. Like I, I wanna try to do it slightly linear and slightly non-linear, you know? Obviously I want to enjoy whatever we can, but I also wanna give you guys something exciting to watch every episode, make sure that you guys know that there'll be a new kingdom to explore every episode, because I feel like that's pretty exciting. That's a good reason to tune in, right? Either way, let's go back to Wood of the Kingdom. Okay, so I sort of saw for a moment, the camera sort of brought us up here and I did see some purple coins. Obviously, it might be a little bit difficult to find them from this angle, but that's good to know. I mean, we were only about halfway through, but we found those first half very quickly, which I like a lot. So we're gonna start exploring and we're gonna find whatever we can. And hopefully that's nice and fun. Um, Cause we did find a little bit here. We, we have the tanks. Once again, they were saying this is the entrance to the secret forest, but I couldn't find any kind of entrance. He gave us a seed. Pull the lever to receive a seed. Um, it's a big seed too. Oh, 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 that was so obvious. Oh, that was so ridiculously obvious. What about this other area? I mean, I could explore that a little bit more. I mean, it's really mostly the same thing, so let's maybe just focus on the main mission here. Try to accomplish that. Okay, so can I just climb this? I can. So let's just shake our Joy-Cons as much as we can. I'm, I really have a hard time with that. I mean, I tried actually cho choosing an option that said turn Joy-Cons, I mean, turn motion controls off. And I did, and motion controls still work. So I don't know if that option doesn't work or if I'm misinterpreting it. Either way, boom, got that. I think on the top of here, there might be some purple coins. Um. Got it, got it, got it, got it. You know what I really like about this game though is it really does have a lot of like styles and observations that some of the other 3D Mario games had, but they improve on them. And I think the purple coins is a, oh, really good example of that. The purple coins are really obviously supposed to be like the blue coins from Super Mario Sunshine, but not really a little bit different of course, but it, the special kind of coin that you can only collect once and then beyond that you can't collect it again. Oh, look at this. We gotta collect a whole bunch of mini moon medallions. That might be a bit tough with how easy it is around here. I'll do what I can. Um, but in Mario Sunshine, they end up being a little egregious because of one thing, how difficult they were to find and how how you found them, which is a little bit of a pain in the booty. Um, but here I feel like it's a little bit better and it, like they sort of learned a little bit from it, which is cool. Hey, look, a Paragoombun. So we can fly around with a Paragoomba, which might be very helpful. And, um, I can't fly too low though. Luckily the camera won't follow you, so you know where too low is. Um, so we have found three. Here's our fourth one. I, I would really be worried if there might be some purple coins here though, I'll be honest. Okay, whoa, what are we finding down here? Um, oh my, there's more down here. Oh, the fifth one. Got it. But there's still more. I'm gonna, I'm gonna adventure around here. And definitely following the coins seems to be getting me something. So maybe I could even find an additional thing around here. I mean, maybe not, maybe it's just a whole bunch of nothing. But there could be some purple coins down here. There could be maybe an extra hidden moon. Like it's a little like a little shadow here. Odd. It's just so hard to see. Like I, I might just be completely going the wrong way now. I honestly don't have any clue. I just, I'm totally turned on. Oh, like this though, like this, okay. There we go, there's an additional hidden moon there. I hope there's only one. Yeah, not hidden in the fog. So there's one. And then if we go back up here, we can go get the other one. I'm pretty sure they usually only have two hidden in these kind of areas. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? It's so hard to tell. I'm really scared. When you're just flying and there's nothing, like it's just white. Oh, that is really creepy. I just can't tell. I can't tell. Where am I? Um, hello? I can hear it, but I can't see anything. Gosh, okay, there it is. Boom. Let's get the heck out of here, wandering in the fog. Ooh, that makes me uncomfortable. Get out of here. This place is awesome but creepy. What a cool idea. Man, the controller vibrates so loud, I'm worried the microphone's picking it up. Ooh. Well, there's that done. Wow, look at the little Goomba wave out there with the fancy little sun hat, that's adorable. 
So yeah, we're on the top of here. And... Hmm. I'm just trying to get a good sight for everything. It looks like these guys are like filling up. The recharge station is crowded. Oh no, looks like this guy wasn't able to get there. And, um, poor thing. Uh, patience. Wait, wait. Please hurry, I'm consuming the, the Zygol of my energy with panic. Is it my turn yet? Is it my turn yet? What do you have to say? Um, ooh, wait a minute. Easy, yay, okay. Oh, it was good. That was, thanks for the charge. Can I speed this up anyway for you? I guess not. Yes, I just gotta watch the carnage. You know, you'd think that, you know, somebody could fill these up with energy. Maybe I can. I don't think so, though. I mean, I don't just don't, I just don't see a way out. Um, we got this flagpole. So now we can start going this way. Where I'm sure there will be a slew of fun things to do. Like, become a Goomba. And join the Goomba Society. I wish there was a way, you know, we could join the Goomba Society and they wouldn't realize we're a Goomba and attack us. You know, maybe we're just a weird fan of Mario. Um, oh, finally. Finally, out, finding out. These purple coins, come on, leave me alone, leave me alone. Not many, one, two, three, four of them. Oh wait, did I miss it? I guess not. Okay, maybe it was only three of them. No wait, it's still here. What the heck? Okay, there you go. 56 out of 100, we still got a lot more to go. But uh, that was good, that was good. Um, ooh, you know what I gotta do? I have to be a cunning Goomba. I gotta run over here. You're gonna chase me, I'm gonna hop on top of you, you're gonna join the pion. I'm gonna run over here. You're gonna chase me? I'm gonna hop on top of you, you're part of the pile. Part of the pile. Come on over here, buddy. You're gonna be part of the pile, pile too. Oh, that didn't work. You guys are too tall. Okay, I gotta have them chase me around. Um, Yeah, just like that. Ooh, yeah, there we go. Hello, Miss Goomba. I'm here to uh, please you. Oh, look at her. I guess there are lady Goombas. Cool. I mean, it might not be a lady Goomba. Maybe she just... He has just a, you know, affinity for cool hats. You got a moon, love in the forest ruins. Okay, so what happens if I, oh. Oh no, she, she skedaddled. <laughs> Sorry, I ruined the love. Okay, well, I don't think I need you guys for anything else. So see ya, bunch of coins from me. I need the coins, you know what? It was a necessary evil. So let us uh, get up here, get a bunch more coins, and then, ooh. Let's see what we can do about this. We got ourselves a cool tank. This is just so much fun. I love this to bits and pieces. Got Yoon, got Yoon. I'm trying to, oh, now I don't have the motion controls for the aiming, which is the only motion controls I liked in this game. Okay, I'm gonna turn that back on. That is so bogus. Uh, controls, there. There, okay, now it's back. It's not a bunch, it's just a little bit of extra motion aiming. Oh yeah, we've already been over here. This is where, ooh, I see, but wait, oh. Let me try some of this. I might want it to, to be one of the tall leggy guys but uh, not quite working. And there's a cat on the desk! Don't be on the desk! Get out of there! Oh, there were purple coins up there. And, oh, I can get them too for like this. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I'm sure there's an easier way to do this for sure. And, but hey, you know what? However I can get the job done, you know? So I don't, there's purple coins up here. And, ooh, okay. Who? We did this last time. It shouldn't be too hard for me, but it is still quite difficult. Oh. Oh gosh, but we did it. Oh, that's not it either. There's more. Now this seems like, oh my gosh, Mario and his inner acrobat going on here. Um, Swing, ooh, wait, am I doing this right? Okay, I guess it's enough. Oh, oh, oh gosh, I don't, I don't exactly like this. It doesn't make me feel exactly safe. Oh, okay, we made it. And then we just gotta fawn, but just gently fawn. Okay, that was not gentle. That's fine, we made it, and we get another moon. So all these nuts always have a moon in them. Over the cliff's edge. So we've gotten five moons here, even if they weren't entirely necessary. I mean, of course they are, we need all of them. <laughs> we are gonna get every single one of them for sure. Okay, luckily we're starting in a good place. Oh, okay. So from here I could have probably easily gotten up here or something. But yeah, I sort of figured out a little trick by accidentally falling all the way down is that, wow, okay, so I could, Whoa, that is weird, I like it. It's a cool weird, but still a weird weird. Hmm, but yeah, we're climbing up in those purple coin counts. So let's get that. So, like I found out earlier in today's episode, it does, I did confirm my suspicion that we do need certain costumes purchased with purple coins to get certain things. So that means that in Cascade Kingdom, there probably will be a blue, or blue moon, a moon that I can get 
that you can only get by um having, uh, what's it called? I think there are things about the timeout, I'm not sure. But um, there's going to be some kind of um, moon you can get by only having the Cascade Kingdom costume in Cascade Kingdom. I don't know what that's going to be, but I really hope we can figure it out. I hope I'm not like messing this up. Like maybe I can make my own staircase up. Oh, there is a blue moon up here. It is a moon, but it's a blue moon as well. Okay, ooh, that looks pretty fancy. There's some coins behind it too. All right, so let's get up here. Oh, come on. That was stinky. Try that again, try that again. Oh, the tanks are coming back, they're respawning. I think the best way to get that, like I could, you know, maybe we should try our new trick. Um, okay, that, that wasn't exactly what I was looking for, I'll be honest. Um, try that again. Okay, I didn't exa exa exactly have to do the trick. I swear I saw coins back here. I guess not, maybe it was just a sparkle of it. Okay, cool, we did that, <laughs> no problem. Get the checkpoint first for sure, get that. Turn back around and then there's some easy purple coins. Whoop, 65. So what do we got, 20, no, 35 more to go. Okay, good. Oh, how do we get these blocks? I'm not sure, can we talk to you? Um, oh, you got something on your head, that's why I can't become you. That slope is too steep for you, try enhancing your foot speed with a flower. I will, I won't. Let's also check this out if I can. Um, LOLO, we got the path to secret flower field. Oh, there's a blue moon in there. I know they're just normal moons, but for whatever reason I have the temptation to call them blue moons. There's something way over there, and I'm sure that'll serve a purpose, but um, also what's cool is that we're in this huge like dome, and outside is just these cold, cold mountains, even though in here it's nice and hot. Like it's, they, it said it was 85 degrees in here, Fahrenheit, pretty crazy. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is, instead of using it to bring me that way, I'm gonna run into these blocks full force. That didn't really do as much as I was hoping, but can I just, I can just put stomp these, okay. No problemo. I was just worried because I didn't know what was in those and I didn't want to miss out on them. Doesn't seem like there's anything else over here though, so I think we are, wait, 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 ow. What is over, yeah, there's definitely something over here as well. I mean, I want to get to the end of this area, but I also don't want to miss anything that I might be a hassle to come back for. There's certainly something. Get you here, boom. Now this is probably just a pit we fall down if we mess up a jump coming up. But I gotta make sure, and oh, that's actually not the case at all. We have a hat area. Okay. Oh, this looks like it might be a bit of a challenge. Nothing over here. Okay, okay. Let's press the button. Oh boy, this might be a little bit difficult, actually. Oh gosh, oh gosh, hold on. No, that's not what I wanted, but I guess it works. I wanted to take care of these guys. Oh, you know what? We're probably gonna need a Goomba Tower for some reason or another, which might be a bit of a challenge because, um, Okay, so you can add a Goomba to your tower as long as um, they are at least two Goombas. So if there any, or at most two Goombas, at the three Goombas you can't make the jump. So I don't think I can use these guys again. I don't think they'd make that jump. So sorry Goomba friends, you're gonna have to stay where you are. I mean, they might just uh, fall. Oh, ho, ho, I'm so sorry. Oh, well. Hmm, what is with this peculiar little dip? Hmm. Oh, wall jumping, wall jumping, wall jumping, wall jumping, purple coins, purple coins. Yeah, okay, that's 68. Oh, it's gonna pop out the other side, ain't it? Yep, I called it, I called it. There we go. And then get these, I guess. Um. Ooh, 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 ooh. Nice, there. Okay, now this is gonna expire soon, so I gotta be quick. Um. Oh, geez. Oh, and it's just like a huge ship. Oh, got it. <laughs> sort of this, but we got Flower Road Run. Cool. So I think we got everything there. We could have missed something, but because I moved really quick, but I think we got everything. Oh boy. So there's that, which means we can make our way back. I'm glad we did that, and we can get a couple extra coins by just doing that. So we're definitely slowly but surely making our coin count go back up after we spend a bunch of it, a thousand coins on some underwear. <laughs> of course, that's something I just do. Spend a thousand coins on underwear. I mean, hey, you gotta get some good trousers. Don't want chafing. Oh, was I supposed to, I think I was supposed to keep going up, but there is a flagpole up here that I definitely want to get. I think this is the way we, we were supposed to go. Iron Mountain, path, path eight. Yeah, this is the way we're supposed to go, but we could have kept going up from what I've seen. Regardless, I gotta, ooh, okay, there's a couple things here. First, we're doing this. Now down there, is that a location I've been to before? Oh yeah, that's the uh, location that we've been in the first episode we were in this Wooden Kingdom, which was last episode, I think. Um, let's do that, get two more. 
Okay. There is a nut there. I swear I saw a nut here. There is. Oh, and there's Captain Toad. But we've been over here. I can't believe I missed all that. Okay, it's a very good thing I just got that flagpole. Let's plop down here and get this one. This one is climb the cliff to get the nut. Got it. And then get up to here if I can. There's there's cats making weird noises. Sorry, I'm getting distracted. Hey, who's shooting at me? Oh, I didn't even see you. Okay. Oh, was that not a Captain Toad? I thought it was a Captain Toad. That was a fire bro. Okay, maybe I took the, the wrong way around then. I think so. So we could go back up wherever and I need to not be a dude. Or no, I can be a dude. Iron Mountain Path Station 8. Let's try, wrong button. Let's try that again. Cause there was another nut. I didn't see another one. I need to sort of angle myself to find out where it was exactly. Oh, there's a lot to do in this area. It is overwhelming. Um. Yeah, right there. How can we get that? Well, if I do this right, I might be, can I pop? Yeah, I can. Um, no, wrong button. Um, I can't make that jump though. Ooh, that was tough. How can I do that? I don't think I can properly do it from this angle, that's for sure. I mean, unless I can like change my trajectory. Whoa, I did it! Whoa, look at me, platforming king. You can say that again, king of the jungle, king of platforming, the nut that grew on the tall fence. And that's all I see for sure this time. Okay, now I could go back that way, but it would be easier just to go to the flagpole right there. So even if it's like a half a second loading screen, I'll take it. But yeah, we should keep going. We should definitely keep charging. Cause there's some stuff here obviously. That probably probably won't get me a moon, but might get me a couple purple coins. I wanted to get up there and all the way to the top this time. I think we'll need to get like as many as we possibly can. That's not what I wanted. Um, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, stop, stop. I can't stop myself. Hoot. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. Whoa, I'm going the wrong way though. So you really gotta spend a lot of time angling yourself up just right, but if we could do that. Ow, I can go in there. Okay. So I might not actually be able to get to the next kingdom in today's episode. I would really like to though, but then I might just have to save until next episode. I'm trying, I'm trying my best, but we can get up here and, ow. And there's, an, is there another one down there? There's certainly something down there. I will keep that in mind, because you can see for yourself, there's something. There's just so much to do. I mean, how can I keep up with all of it? Oh my. Um, First, let's look behind us. Uh. There's something up there. Let us get this tank. Oh, don't shoot at me, please, thank you. Get that. Lots of stuff to look at around here, but I think the thing we wanna do is press this button. Whoa, wait, hold on, hold on, I'm not ready. Wait, what was that? I need to know, I need to know. <laughs> okay, maybe we can come back and find out. I gotta remember to come back into this building and try to just figure out what else we can do. All right, get all that, definitely. Pursue this room in every angle possible before we break this. Try to make sure I'm not missing out on anything and making sure no cats get into anything I don't want them to get into. Because the cats are very uh, mischievous today. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. Oh geez, that's a lot of fire bros. Whoop. Hey, stop, there you go. Uh, Get you, oh geez, that missed. Got it, and then, whoop, whoop. Oh no, I, I knocked his fire bro, I knocked fireball. He is the fire, bro. Oh, oh geez, that missed. I gotta shoot faster. I can shoot way faster than I am, so I don't know why I'm not. But we can also hit the purple coin just like this. I have a feeling that what we missed might have been purple coins. Either one. Um, I don't see anything else, even if we miss out on coins. It's not as important as purple coins. So if I could get an extra one or two. But we're almost done with We're almost you know, two thirds of the way there, just like we are with the uh, Cascade Kingdom. We're definitely getting purple coins much easier in this area, but this area definitely is, I feel, much more condensed than Cap Kingdom, or not, or Sand Kingdom. Yeah, that's what I meant, not uh, Cascade. We already got 100% on Cascade. Um, there you go, 100% okay, purple coins. You know what I mean, I would hope. If not, I'm trying my best, there you go. Uh, let's try to get all these, if we can. You never know what might be hiding behind them. Just like that, get all this stuff, dude. Yep, yep, yep. All right, oh, and there's a moon waiting for us. Now I gotta be extra sure there ain't nothing else over here. Doesn't look like it. So, get that, get the moon, 
And then we gotta go back into it. Elevator escalation. Boom. And now let's, um. oh yeah, I think that's the one that Talkatu told us about, right? I think elevator escalation sounds pretty familiar, unless he was saying that in another area. There's just more than one elevator escalation. So down there, we've been down there. Yeah, we've been down there. Okay, so go back in, and the first thing we're gonna do is that block has to serve some sort of purpose. It has to. Can we go back through that door, Toon? We can. So what is this about? Hey, hey, I was right, perfect. So we're gonna get that. We are then going to skedaddle. Yep. Yeah, elevator blind spot. And then nothing else down there from what I see, so we are good to get out of here. And I love how they do leave the entrance open just in case that really was your pursual, was just to do that. So now we can, oh no, make that jump. Cool. Let us do this one. <laughs> There's just so much to do. So very much I don't wanna miss any of it because I don't wanna run all the way back out here for one thing or another. Because I'm sure there's gonna be something worthwhile on one of these, right? Ooh. Even if it is just plenty of coins, like that's definitely something we need. Ooh, got it. But it's gonna take me a while to get through everything no matter what. Oh, that's how we get over here. Okay, well I guess there was more than one way then. Because I was planning on just plopping down from falling, but you know, this is just as good. So, let's give this a shot. I hope I didn't miss anything. Um, I actually might wanna try to go back down. Just poke around a little bit. Uh, okay, we're good, we're good. So go back in here. Just like that. Now this area is a little tight. So I just wanna, you know, check all the, the corners and everything. Whoa! Oh, this is so cool! Oh my gosh, this is my favorite. Whoa, 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 there's big old bombs. Big old bombs. Oh, oh, that hurt. Um, got it. Got it, no wait. Yeah, okay, okay. Get across to here. Get as many coins as I can. And of course, a blue moon where I can as well. And how do I do that? Do I go from the left platform? I think the, the right platform. I'm gonna have to run like that. Yeah, that'll be easy actually, just. <laughs> yeah, real easy. Let it get all the way to the top then. Perfect. Yeah, we got a moon back way up the mountain. I guess it is a back way. Look at all those flowers down. So after this, we definitely should plop down normally, because right here, this is what we're supposed to be at. Is whatever this bomb shooting thing is, that's our goal right now. But what about here? This is uh something, the music's changing. I don't know which way we're supposed to be going right now. Oh, this is real confusing. I feel like we're not, I don't know if we're going the right way or not, but I'm getting this. That's the moon we've already gotten. <laughs> I went the wrong way for sure then. Um, We'll have to remember that. For right now, we're going back to uh, Iron Path Station 8. Iron Mountain Path Station 8, actually. Correction, Zebra, you are wrong. There were many things you make a mistake on, but at least you correct this one. So yeah, we'll have to go back around maybe at some point and try to get with there. But I really wanna check this out now. So do that. Break you, break you. Now they will eventually respawn, so I do have to hustle a little bit, but what's behind us? This feels like a Sonic the Hedgehog kind of song. Oh, look at that. Oh, there we go, this is an easy way to get those purple coins, ain't it? <laughs> I feel like I'm totally cheating that out, but you know what, if they're gonna give me that opportunity, I'm sure it's not gonna take it. So what is with this stuff? Okay, there is some health bonus. Nice. And nothing else around here. So you know what we're doing? We're taking on this. Got a bunch of balls with Bowser's face on them. I don't know if those uh, blocks were for my protection or not. They might have been. I mean, we're shooting marbles, which is funny. Can I shoot this into the thing that, oh, look at that, we're supposed to shoot the Bowser face. Okay. Um. Yep. Yep. Okay, overall good shot there. So was that all we were supposed to do? Okay, I thought we had an intense boss fight ahead. I was mistaken. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, so let's go ahead and get this, and that'll be another fancy one that's gonna unlock something more for this area. We got a moon, path to the secret flower field. So do we have another target here? Because usually it seems like there was only two targets in the Sand Kingdom, and there were two targets in the Cascade Kingdom. How many targets will there be here? Another one, defend the secret flower field. So we aren't quite done, and it's right here, so we'll do it, we will definitely do it and then we'll finish it off for today's episode. So, boss fight? I hope so. Looks like the secret flower field is just through here. Ready? I sure hope so. 
Oh gosh, I wasn't ready for that kind of drop. <laughs> I was hoping that maybe could be an elevator. Whoa, this is like the PD Piranha boss fight almost. Secret flower field, what in the world is this thing? This isn't a bunny, is it? Oh no, it's taking on the flowers. You fiends, I'm gonna become you. Yep. And then, ready? Yeah! Okay. Whoa! What in the world is this thing? I don't know. Flowers, 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 must have all the flowers. You look like a flower, I get it. Whoa, do not mess with me, biped. Yikes, pulling out the insults. It's like Mario Galaxy now. You are not nice. Okay, Um. whoa. Wait, can I? Yes, okay, so using this little guy is going to be a huge advantage for me. Oh, we get some extra health here if we needed it. <laughs> I'm not gonna need it. I will need it, actually, by the way. Uh, let's just stand right into the center. Luckily, it's sort of grid-like, so it isn't too bad to see. Move it, move it, move it. Got it, okay. Oh, now we can go ahead and hit you on your weak point. So I'm gonna say that's probably hit number one. Oh, all right. Okay, so he's, yeah, she's getting mad. I don't know if it's a he or she, or if it's an it. I mean, it might just be a robot. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Okay, we did it. Oh, that was tricky. I like it, but it's also scary. So, we got another one of these. Oh, hitting it right away. Oh, not quite done. Oh, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Oh, now it's moving tune. A bit complicated, don't you say? Oh, oh, okay, hold on. I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Somebody help me. Um, okay, maybe I, what? What, that was baloney. Okay, that's really weird. That is really difficult, too. Because this is so easy to mess up and then you're stuck up here. Come on, get out of here, get out of here, get out of here. Move it, move it, move it. Yes, okay, we got that one. We only have to hit it once. It's just hard to get to that point. But once he's trying to shoot at you, that's when he starts making the mistakes. So move like this, move like this, hit this, like that, run over here and get this extra bit of health. Look at the health does not disappear. And then, oh, so far it hasn't. Maybe it just takes a long time. Just like that. There's two shots. If we could do that one more time, which might be easier said than done, but we will try our best. I just gotta look to where his little legs are. Because that's gonna be like the biggest indicator. Oh my. One more, one more. Or not, it might have been it. Oh, that was it. Okay, so I'm gonna try to be quick with this. I might be able to snag one right away. That was really good. So he's not moving it now because he's mad and he's trying to shoot this thing at me. This is where I take this opportunity. Whittle waddle, whittle waddle, whittle waddle. Oh, good, good, move right here, hit him. Oh wait, a little bit more. Yeah, we beat you. That felt like a big like Super Mario Galaxy throwback. The way that the enemy moves and how it looks, like just reminds me of Super Mario Galaxy a lot. And we get an awesome multi-moon. We got a lot of moons in today's episode, especially just here in Cascade Kingdom. Our, this is not Cascade Kingdom, this is Wooded Kingdom. All right, another one for the both of us. We're one step closer to saving Princess Peach and Tiara. That's her name, right, Tiara? Defend the secret flower field. Got it, that has to be all the things we have to do in this kingdom. Story based, I guess not story based, so like the important events. I guess I could just call them events. Hmm, we're about to find out. Yeah. Yay! Okay, see, so yeah, that seems to be it. That is all the important events here in uh, Wooded Kingdom. Mmm, smell those flowers. So things should be a little bit more peaceful, which is really enjoyable. Oh, look at the little squirrels. Hi, squirrels. You're the best, I love you. But first, maybe I should talk to some people. We, of course, got a hint toad here. I could, you know, get his help, but nah. Of course, this area does seem to be a little bit different, a little bit brighter than the last time we saw it because of the fact that uh, we just finished another event. So who knows what's different about this area? Maybe I should check it out for a couple seconds. It looks like there's even this right here. If I can get a tank, I bet you I could come back here and get some stuff done regarding that. Let's see if we can't do that. The tank should be through here, right? So let's see if I can't get one, bring it all the way back over, unless the tanks aren't here anymore. Many of us are busy watering. Watering flowers is plus one to satisfaction. The butterflies seem free of any bugs. Ack, paradox detected, error, error. <laughs> uh, it looks like, yeah, there are, there's all flowers here. The bird count is increasing, activating content, hu con contented humming. All right, so I don't wanna do too much here. I'm gonna make it back to the Odyssey in just a second. The steam gardens are objectively superior to other regions. Woo! <laughs> um, 
but yeah, like I said, what I wanted to do was, you know, just do that one. Wait, why didn't that work? Oh, I pressed the wrong button, that's why. There you go. Okay, what did you say? I have cleaned up the poison. The area is now safe for your kind now. Cool. So, not too much I can really do then. I'm gonna head back to the Odyssey and we're gonna move on to, I guess, Lake Ken Kingdom. I don't know if I have the choice to move on, move on beyond that, but I don't really want to. So, ow, that hurt. My poor Mario head. Let's get back across to here and let's get to it. Throw that over there. Wait, the Odyssey needs one more. I needed one more before we deposit our like 15 that we have. So there's a bunch more from 70, 76 to 93. Okay, almost 20. No, more than 20. Wait, no, less, a little, okay. 17. The Odyssey is powered up. So we have 93 moons in total so far. Fantastic. So we are moving somewhere, anywhere, sure. So what is that? We can go to the Lake Kingdom now. Maybe we'll catch up to Bowser there. Maybe, so yeah, we don't have any choice. We'll make our way to the Lake Kingdom. Sounds nice and fun to me. I can't wait. A new area to go. Sounds fun, We See, so yeah, how do we make our way out of here, by the way? You think that this big old dome, maybe it'll just let us through? We will never know. It does not show us. Okay, interesting. So yeah, we have 93 moons. I can't wait to see how many are in the game. I mean, some people were saying there's like a lot, like over 800 more than like, as much as Breath of the Wild has those little nuts you can find or whatever they were, the eggs, I don't remember. Uh, to think their precious soiree bouquet stolen. We can't let that Bowser keep doing whatever he wants. Seeing as how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. Uh, wall jump, we all know we know all about wall jump. Jump toward a wall and then crowd, uh, touch it. Press B to do wall jump. You can press B again to reach a facing wall and then keep repeating they've reached really high places. Well, there it is. Next, let's read up about the on the Lake Kingdom. Ooh, this is what I want to hear. And it says there's no, they're known for their fashion. And oh, there's a famous wedding gown. They're called the Louch, the Lock Lady dress. Ooh, interesting. So all these important components to a wedding are being built up here. And now it's the dress. Before it was the bouquet. Before that, it was the wedding ring. Interesting. Lake Kingdom, Lake Lamode. I already saw one of those on. Uh, Little what's some calling the little brutals. I don't like it. Ooh, look at these. They got little water drop coins. Oh, this area is so cool. Brutals over the lake. Usually I don't like water areas in Mario games, but this one's looking nice. I like it. So I wonder which one we're gonna face this time. I think the tall one. The brutals, they're here too. But yeah, I think we're going to be facing the tall one this time, because that's the only one we haven't faced. But we got our first three of these little purple coins. Very, very cool. Looking around. Whoa, okay. Hold on, where is that? Where is that? Oh, it's gone. Darn it, I missed out. Interesting, so there's a little mermaid lady over here who wants to talk to us. I would gladly talk to you, mermaid lady. How do you stand? I guess you're not really a mermaid lady. You have like a little dress on or something. My goodness, that monster's minions just stomped in here uninvited. And they stole our kingdom's finest lock lady dress. It's a tragedy. So they've already gone through with it, huh? Sorry. Oh, you have a little headpiece on, so I can't capture you. That's okay. Uh, let's try to, oh! Oh, what is this? Hey, look at that, whoa, pink moon. Instead of a uh, blue one, like the last one, we got a nice pink one. Very cool, on the lake shore. So there's our first moon of the area. I don't see too much else going on here. We can check out the little crab. Uh, there is some glowing stuff around here, but it's not the normal kind of glowing we're used to. Okay, it's just, it's just sparkly around here because of how wonderful it is. We've already talked to you. Um, I guess our goal then would be to check this out. Oh, there's some mermaid ladies under the water. Can we talk to them? There is lots to do for sure. You can even go that way. There's another one of those moon rocks. Each area has had at least one moon rock. I think I've only seen one moon rock per thing. But the Brutal's over the lake. So we're gonna go ahead and deal with that. Looks like there's a checkpoint over there to get us there a little bit easier once we make like, way. They've broken the stairs to the water plaza. I see that. Trying to make it harder for me, huh? What is that? Is that a zipper? There's a zipper over there. Can I throw my cap underwater? We're about to find out. What is with the zipper? Oh, oh my. What in the world? Oh yeah, I can see like there's a little upside down. It's a Waluigi symbol. <laughs> this is where we get to play Waluigi. Oh, look at that, a couple purple coins. Cool, I like that. Very interesting. Um, So there is a couple more. Let's land here. Hmm, now we got these as well. And this one, the one in the center. Right, why can't I hit it? There you go. <laughs> interesting. This area is so cool. And there's definitely more underwater. I'll probably explore, explore that soon. I just wanted to go into here. If you're looking for the water plaza, the way is right behind me. Oh, another one of these zipper things. So let's figure this out really quickly. And, oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, that is so crazy. But uh, I wasn't quite done. Yeah, not quite done. Let me butt slam on this, plop on it, and then we need to further explore this area as much as I can. Ooh, easy coins there. Nice, a ton of them, almost at 700. We haven't found the uh, Crazy Cap store for this area just yet. It might not be available, but I'll look for whatever I can. Ooh, okay. Well, I can't get past the Moon Rock, but I can do is this, okay. Got those, nine out of 50 now. I don't know when we're gonna learn about that Moon Rock. It's just a yet another collectible that's daunting me. So we need to dive. Let me butt stomp into the water. And then, go. Okie doke, so this is gonna be Ooh, more. As many as I can get, really. There was one little mermaid swimming around here, and we're most at home in the water, I can see that. So finally, we just have this little thing right here, and I think that's everything we can really get to in this area. But this might be, this is probably gonna be another moon. So, let's go ahead and get it. Oh gosh, this scares me. I feel like I'm gonna run out of air before I even get to them all, but I'm gonna try my best. Go, Mario, go! Go, Mario, go! Go, Mario, go! Oh gosh, he's really just running out of air here. And halfway through down. Oh, we got it. Actually, we're fine. Ready? Oh! And we get a moon for it. So moon number two has been unlocked and will be achieved. Achieved? I don't think it's a word. <laughs> Taking notes, dive and swim. So I see some coins around here, but I don't see like anything specifically sparkling, except for the entire area. So I think we're good. I think we're good to move on to this little area down here and see what it has in store for us. So it looks like we're taking a bit of a detour compared to the Goombas and the Koopas and the bad guys in general. Oh gosh, oh, are these air bubbles? I think so. So yeah, watch out for those spikes. I'm watching and I'm looking. Okay, so let's go over here first. This looks like the not correct way to go in the long run, which means it's gonna have some important collectibles that I can't get anywhere else. So only 50 purple coins here, opposed to the 100 in Lake and Sand Kingdom. That seems a bit more of a breeze. I do like this area. It seems a bit more linear than, once again, lake, or wooded, did I say lake? Or okay, uh, wooded and Sand Kingdom, which I appreciate. Personally, I do like the linearity in this game sometimes. I like the open world as well. Which way am I supposed to go? This way it looks like it has some uh, health for it. These guys are creepy. Can I even deal with you? I mean, can I become you? I cannot, you guys just break in half. Poor little dudes are so fragile. I don't know if I'm going the correct way, but there is a checkpoint. So I'll go this way. I will get myself a checkpoint. Oh, look, it's the little guy from, oh, and we become a, ah, everything's so perfect. Underwater entrance, look at this place. I'll take a look at it again in a moment. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna go back this way. Um, Cause we can dive a little bit. I wanted to go, we went through here, but we have not gone through here. Ooh, come on, get that air. Oh, I don't need air, I'm a fish. Oh, this was perfect, I'm glad I got out here. Boom, here is another moon. That is treasure in the spiky water line. It is very spiky, and it is a water line. Can't deny any of that. I like how we don't have to wor worry about air anymore. This is fantastic, I'm having so much fun. Okay, so I gotta be careful though, because these guys aren't fun. We move so quickly though, it's beautiful. I don't think we, we have to worry about running into our own, oh, we do, <laughs> our own fish friends. Hmm, look at this, there's already something here. Um, oh, just some coins. Okay, nothing too crazy. I don't know what Cappy said there, I sort of missed it. Um, sorry, Cappy. Um, well, there's our first, looks like we gotta get a couple of those, but you might see that on our little buddy here. Ooh, out of the way, please, hold on, hold on, hold on. At least he's polite about it. Boom, we got a moon, Dory Backrider. So his name is Dory. Once again, he's on. Uh, he's in Super Mario 64, but he has a big old hat on, so we can't become him. That would be so cool to become him. And we get another one. Cheap, cheap crossing. Nothing crazy there, except for some extra health I would love to get if I don't get hurt getting it. There you go. Perspective is a bit weird there. But I feel like I'm keeping my eyes open and I'm getting some good benefits for it. Now, we could of course go to the surface here seemingly and get stuff done, but I don't wanna do that quite yet. I definitely want to enjoy the underwater portions as much as physically possible before we go up to the top, because I'm sure if we go up to the top, we can face the brutal, do more than just that. Uh, maybe even get more of the medallions, I'm not entirely sure. Just trying to swim through it all, find out what I can do and how I can do it. Ooh, there is some stuff in here, another moon medallion. I'll gladly take it. But yeah, we've already gotten five moons in this area, and how many are in total? I haven't checked. 33, so one of the least yet. Um, only The only one that's less, of course, has been Cascade Kingdom. So let us uh, go down, get some extra coins, because I could gladly use those. I do have some more stuff to buy, of course, at the shop. Whenever we find it, we'll probably have another moon to buy. Ooh, I see this little zipper. 
So I think this is where I might want to remove the um, the cheap cheap for now. Oh gosh, not fun. But there is some stuff that's worthwhile here. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I'm getting a little scared. But I will get an air refilled. We're doing that. They, they just never stop either. They just keep coming. Come on, Mario, go. Go, Mario, go. Go, Mario, go. So there's another piece of that moon medallion. We only need one more to go. I'm sure we'll find it. For now. Ooh, look at this little hat room. I'll take it. Let's go inside. So, oh, this is cool. Oh, just a whole bunch of nothingness. That is creepy, but awesome. Do that. And this reminds me of Yoshi's Woolly World. Oh, it's fun. Is this gonna be like wall jumping? Not quite, it's gonna be a bit of a bridge. So I could get across to here. It looks like I need a key of some sort to get in the here. Oh boy. Um, how about I, uh, oh, not do that. Uh, that's for sure. I still can't become these little Goombas, but that's fine. Do that, get across to here for whatever reason. Oh, you know, this might be something I can wall jump up. No, it isn't. Okay, yeah, I do have to do that to get across to blood. If I can find a way over there and get some cool bonus stuff, some extra coins, something crazy, but you know what? I could use some coins every once in a while. All right, let's go ahead and do that. Land on your head. These guys are just easy for enough coins though. I like it. Here, wait, hold on. Oh, got it. Throw that there. Unzip it, unzip it, unzip it. And then I gotta remember, hop through here. Oh no, am I stuck? I'm not, okay, I got, I got plenty of room to hop back up. Oh, and you guys are back already. Uh, bunches of coins. I was 50 coins, I think, or about 50 coins, cool. Um, So satisfying to see a big bundle of coins like that. It always is. Hmm. Let's get over to here. Whoa, that's a lot of Goombas. Okay, hold on, whoa. Now I learned a little trick is that if I do that, and I do like a little spin instead, that also counts as the Cappy spin, which is way easier for me than trying to flick the Joy-Con. It's just, it's also not easy. Okay, um, no wait, no wait. Okay, well there's enough of them I don't need to do a spin attack anymore. Get that, oh, oh so it's way back there. And this platform can split in two for some reason. I don't see what the, like, the purpose or the, the perk to doing this will be, except for me to be, you know, speedy. Uh, well, see, Ian. What if I did that without getting the key? I just would have been foolish. Okay, well, I'm glad I didn't do that. Okay, so, let's, uh, there you go. Go, 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 and then, whoa, 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 oh, gosh, oh, <laughs> that was maybe a little foolish, but hey, we got a moon, unzip the chasm. Cool. That's all I see to do in this area. Now, typically these areas have more than one moon. And now that I'm looking at it, there's something there. And how in the world do I get up to there? And clearly there's a way. I mean, here I think I could, whoa, okay. Wasn't expecting that to be honest, okay. Um. Oh no, okay, there's a zipper in here as well. And so what is this one gonna be all about? Ooh. So that's gonna fall. But how in the world do I get up to that one? Oh, I don't. <laughs> it falls with this one. Obvious enough. So what's in here? Oh, what? 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 Oh, hey, look at me, I'm okay, <laughs> wee! <laughs> okay, that was scary. We got it, super secret zipper. No purple coins at all in this area. But two moons, cool. We only need one more moon until we can move on to the next kingdom. How crazy is that? Um, But before we do, of course, I wanna be able to enjoy more of this kingdom. I think this might be like one of the kingdoms. So far, this is the easier kingdom for me. Oh gosh, so that I almost die. Oh. So I wonder if maybe this might be one of the first kingdoms we 100%. And if we ever run out of places to go, we can always go back to the Cap Kingdom because it's just something we haven't done. It's just there's always something to do. And that's both the best thing and sort of the worst thing about Let's Play in this game is that uh, I never know what to do first. It's always overwhelming. So let me get a couple coins. Just because they're here, you know, why not? And then, Get this, so there's another little mermaid here in our precious lock, lock lady dress. Stolen, I can't believe it. Let's get this, uh, oh, is this gonna be like, oh, I think there's air here. Oh, that's cool, I like that. Hmm, look at all these glimmering fish, that's cool as well. And let's get across to here, because there are some purple coins we can grab with ease. And then it looks like I can go into that area, which I wanna try to do, but if I wanna go into that area, I think that's gonna be like its own direction as well. 
Like, I could go in here and it seems like there's- Oh wait, I can't go in this way! Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Oh gosh! I thought you could just enter from anywhere! You can't! You can't! That's not the case! Ah! Should've just became a fish earlier. Um... Is the monster still out there? I hope not. Um... Am I supposed to be going down here? I think? A little confusing. Uh... What about you? Oh, I can talk to you. Hello. Oh, the shop is on the level above and the roof level above that. And there's a roof level above that. How do you get up there? The same way you go anywhere in the water. Swim. Cool. And what about you, Dogadoo? Okay, so he has a secret, you know, we are seeking moon shards in the lake. Oh, well, I'm already doing that one. Like, literally, I just need one more moon shard and I think it's gonna be on the surface. I mean, they do say in the lake, but where have I not explored at least from this level? Really, I don't know. Up here, up here, up here, up here. Okay, let's swim up here then, really quick, really quick. Yeah, I already see it on the top. Okay, who put this rock here? Isn't it dreadful? I uh, guess, um, how do I get up there? You know what, I bet you I can, yeah, there's another way up from here. Cool, so let's do that, and then, butt slam! So while we're over here, that moon's gonna pop up at the entrance, so the game really wants us to go in there and explore more, which I would glow, well, I will gladly do. First, I just wanna get to the surface now. Now that we have sort of thoroughly explored a little bit, I don't know how open the area is up here. Like maybe it's very open. It seems very open. Oh man, there's just so much to do at any given point in time, huh? Trying to decide which thing I should do first is going to be not an easy task. Can I talk to you? I can't stand that monster's vile henchman. They stole our beloved Lock Lady dress. Maybe we can stop them before they get away then? That might be good. Uh, we can slam down here. I want to go back to that entry level, though. Uh, you can get up to that roof through that shaft. Cool. I thought this was the roof. Ooh. Oh, this shaft. Interesting. So I'll worry about that soon enough. Now is not that time. Uh, oh. So if I do this. Ha <laughs> ha! There we go. Cool. I'm starting to figure it out. Starting to get it down. Um, anything else up here? I guess not. Hello. I miss our beautiful lock lady dress. Is this where, oh yes, it used to be showcased there. Interesting. Welcome, you've come at a troubling time. I can see that. You guys seem to be peaceful though. Peaceful creatures, I can appreciate it. I am also one of those. Hello. How may I help you, traveler? Okay, look at what they have. Underwater dome, swimwear, swim goggles, Lake Kingdom sticker, I like it. Uh, come back soon. Okay, so, what about this? How may I help you, Traveler? We have some new products in. Let's buy this right away. Buy it. And then we have some cool costumes. Oh, wait, wait, wait I wasn't done. But hey, I got a, I got a mood for it. Shouldn't complain. You got a mood shopping in Lake Lamode. And then, if we go back, we can get a fashionable cap. Was this the one? Yep. I like that a lot, I might equip that soon. Yeah, okay, I just equipped it now, okay. Now we get the fashionable outfit, I'm not clashing, you're clashing. Also, I never heard this, an upscale upgrade to an un un upstanding hero's upper half. I don't like this one as much, I'll buy it, but I don't think I'll equip it just yet. Uh, maybe later. So we got the Famicom equipment, which I think is cool. I mean, that actually might work well with the Mario hat. Mechanic cap, a good hat to wear when it's time to get down to work. Yep, and I won't uh, equip it. And then finally this one. This is the, what is this? This is the mechanic outfit. An outfit seemingly doomed to get stained in motor oil. Cool, so I'll buy that. I won't equip that yet either, maybe later. Okay, so I'm recording a lot ahead right now because once again, I wanna try to avoid spoilers as much as I can, I love that. A lot, I, I'm gonna guess that a lot of people are asking me to buy costumes. Like I wanted to buy the costumes once I max out on the coins, but I'm really worried that maybe we're getting limited on areas we can't get to without the coins. So maybe I should buy this now. I don't know, it's a huge tangent. Maybe I should just always buy the costume. So we'll buy this. We'll definitely have to go back to Sand Kingdom to get that one as well. Um, maybe later. And then buy this. And then maybe later as well. I mean, maybe I should quit this stuff now while it's relevant in this area. And a lot of people also said they want me to change outfits more often. So maybe we'll just always wear the area's relevant costume just in case. So where's the closet at? Um, they act like there's a closet around here. Um, I guess I can't now. It's too late. Okay. Oh no! No, it's not. Okay. I thought I was. If I backed up anymore, I was just gonna get me to leave the area. Okay. So. 
since we're in this area, we'll do that. Okay, I wasn't done. <laughs> Not really the combo I wanted. Hey, yeah. so cute either one. He has little flippers too, I love that. So we got the swim goggles so fashionable you want to wear them on land and the swimwear. The floaty ring does not actually float, it's just an accent on the elephant. Cool, so definitely, I mean, I plan on exploring every kingdom a whole lot more. Of course, we're gonna 100% them on, but maybe there's a little, oh, I love his different footsteps too. The attention to detail is amazing. I, I would like it if it actually made it swim quicker, but of course it does not. Hello, Yoon. There was a lovely lock lady dress in this display window. But that monster came and stole it. He stole our kingdom's greatest treasure. And... Oh. So this is where the dress was displayed indeed. Oh yeah, see, we can enter from here. And if, you're tra if you travel all the way from the kingdom, you should dress for the occasion. To get into the lock lady dress display window, you'll have to dress like a swimmer. Traveler, you look ready to swim. Please go inside. So, looks like it's already benefiting me. Let's go on in. Um, ooh. So obviously we can't do too much here. Oh. Wait, the, okay, I thought my hat disappeared. Um, so obviously there's not too much we can do in this area for now, or maybe, maybe once I get the dress back? I don't know. Um, and I've already been in the area below, so let me just quickly mess that up. Uh, well, there's other things we can do. Can uh, do this, oh wait, hold on. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so what else is going on here? You should see the beautiful shop display on the next floor up. Oh, hey, look, it's a little Princess Peach. Yeah, extra health I don't need, so it's more coins. We chopped their coin amount in half, so. So we could either go up or down, which is quite confusing to me where I really wanna go right now. Because I'm tempted to go all the way down there, right? I mean, what could be down there? Are we swimming quicker? I don't think so. I think it's just in my head. Here, uh, let's try this one more time, ready? Oh, yeah, look at that, the timing. I gotta get back up there though, so if I can, um, what's it called? Get all the way back up here, get that flagpole. I guess there's a flagpole on the top and on the bottom? Or have I gotten this? Oh no, I haven't. Water, pause the display window. Cause there's one down here too, right? I guess not. Oh yeah, I forgot about the moon. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and get that. Yeah, you get a moon, moon shards on the lake. So now we have enough to go to the next kingdom. Obviously we're not gonna do that. Instead we might just do this. Whoa boy, that is so scary. But there has to be something down here, right? Well, this is really deep, you're telling me. But maybe we could get down. Maybe we could get down to the bottom or something. I'm getting a little, a little scared. I don't know if this is gonna work. Um, uh, oh gosh, this is giving me like major anxiety. Uh, oh, there has to be something cool down here though. I'm gonna start running out of health in a moment. But I think I'd be able to make it to the bottom. Is there anything down here for me, then? Like any kind of... Oh, quickly. Hey, look, it's Captain Toad. How did you get down here, buddy? I don't know. I don't know. Oh. Hold on, let me get back out here and explore a little bit. Wow, we... We went really deep there. Okay, Captain Toad's taking a nap. How you doing? You'll give me a moon for sure. Swimming with this backpack is tough. I don't even know how I made it here. Oh, but I discovered this power moon here. You can have it. Awesome, thank you so much, Mr. Toad. We get ourselves a moon l something, or let's go swimming, Captain Toad, I think that says. Okay, uh, cool. It's so quiet here, I wonder when I'll get home. I don't know. It is actually very quiet here. I like it, but it's also very creepy. So there we go, that's what's at the bottom of that. So at this point, I guess my best bet is to go up an additional time. And then, um, I know you're upset, but I gotta go up another time. Yeah, okay, I'm not doing the right thing. Cause we could just swim up to the surface, but I don't think that's our goal is, I mean, we could take the shaft up and I think the shaft is just easier to work with. So we should probably try to do that. So get over here and then butt slam it. So let's go into that shaft. I know I could get all this coins again, but I'm not really interested in the moment. I just wanna go, 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 because we've been spending a lot of time here, and I don't wanna bore any of you. Oh, the purple coins are down there, though, so maybe it would've been worthwhile. Okay. Interesting. That makes it much easier, though. Okay, so now I can pop down, yeah, plop down here uh, without any kind of regret. There you go. So I'm 31 out of 50 purple coins, but I've, I've only have 16 at the moment. There we go. So let's uh, float all the way over here. And there's a zipper spot, okay. Let's see if I can't do this. Oh, well, camera gave up on me. 
I didn't want it to do that, but it did. Uh, oh, come on. I know I can do this. There we go. A little bit of a difficult one, but I made it work. And some more purple coins for us. Cool. Can we get up here? I want to try to get on one of these pillars, maybe. Because clearly there's stuff up there, but there, there might be an easy way up there. Okay, Mr. Goomba. Get out of here. Oh, oh, I got two. I tried to get three. Come on, come on. Gotcha. So... Hmm. Yeah, we never went over there with the, the pipe, the, mo the the mosaic pipe or whatever they're called. I think they're mosaics, right? Yeah, I just barely made it. Okay. We've been going a little while without finding it, you know, the next hint for the next area, and, because we can go up there. And, I mean, if we get up there, very simply, we're gonna be facing the brutal. So, yeah, either I'm doing that or not, I'm not sure. There's just so much you can do before you even get to the goal of the level, you know? It's crazy. Oh, geez. Uh, oh, look at this. Oh, I like this. I like its level design too. It looks really cool in here. It looks like, you know, some kind of a, uh, like, you know how they'll, they'll make like little box rooms to practice game design and stuff? To practice like the basics of the game? It looks like one of those. Um, so I think, yeah, what I gotta do here is I gotta land on the little wall holding section. I messed it up entirely. Come on, right here. So which way am I going? I guess I'm going this way. Do I wanna go this way? Is it any better or worse than any other way? Well. I guess I chose the correct way. 38 purple coins now. I only need 12 more. That's nothing. Oh, Mario. What was that for? <laughs> okay. That's fine. We can make it work. We can make it work. I just need to get back up. Get back up and running. Whoa. What was with my little footsteps? Was this happening before? I don't know, but it looks amazing. Okay, so I'm just not even going to land on the platform because I don't need to. Oh, gosh. I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this one bit. But it is definitely the correct way to go. Oh, no! Why? Why does it have to be that way? Oh, that's stinking. Come on, come on. Okay, we made it this time. Not a problem. Want them to sit in there focusing. It's definitely much easier. Okay, so now, now, now no more wall climbing or holding or something. We're just doing straight up floating around. Okay, we're back to this. Okay, I almost got all the coins there. Almost a feat of awesomeness. Oh, is this gonna move up? You bet it is. Here it goes. Ooh, I don't like this. This is really tight. Ooh, like it's not that bad if it wasn't for the fact that you fall all the way down if you get hit. Hmm, I guess that's the way we're supposed to be going is down there. I do see the moon down there. But once again, these areas usually don't just have, oh, I see, I see, I see. I think we can get up there. If we wait for that to lower and then raise again, we certainly can get something up there. I'm not sure what it is, but it's something. Um, oh, oh yeah, here we go. I was wondering where it could be. So I just need to be careful with this. I just need to get up there if I can. Okay, I can, Mario, Mario. Stop, stop being the biggest dingus I've ever met. I don't get that. He should have held onto the ledge like he almost does every other time. But not that time, he just wasn't in the mood to. He felt like dying. I gotta start from the beginning again. Okay, this time I got it, right? Thank you, Mario. All right, butt slam on that, butt slam on it again, and do that. Oh, wait, hold on. Yeah, okay, so here's one moon, and then we'll get another one. We plop on down over there. I could get a bunch of coins here as well, but who needs that? I just need two moons, yeah. Jump, grab, cl cling, and climb. <laughs> Interesting name. Hard to read over the, the white shimmeriness, but we made it work. Okay, so there's that done. Another one of those areas finish off. We've gotten 12 moons. Okay, here's four more coins as well, so we're at, uh, we have we gotten those? Yes, we have. They're all uh, grayed out. Look at all those Goombas. So we got a couple options here. I could, of course, go up there and then go up and fight the Brutals, but what about this area? What about that over there? I mean, when it comes to over there, I don't see too much, but um, here, we can get to here, booty slam, booty jump. That's not a booty jump, but you know what? what where's this pipe gonna bring me? Oh, totally secret. Ha <laughs> ha, so the costumes even translate to here. That is so cool. Wasn't expecting that. Now I need to see all the costumes in like portrait mode. Oh, this is so cool. Um, yeah, we did it. So there's another moon force. And if you see to the left there, there is another secret. So let me do that. Yeah. 
And then if we plop down here, maybe we'll find some extra coins or something. You bet. Fantastic, so there's four more. We only need four more until we've gotten every single one of them. Okay, fantastic. Uh, you've become quite skilled at being flat. I thought I was gonna say, I thought it said being fat at, uh, for the first second of it. I'm like, jeez, Cappy, you're brutal. Okay, so let's, um, I think I might wanna hit this and then butt slam it and then actually fly over here. Cause who knows what's gonna be here. Um. So far, not too much. Oh, hey, easy moon. That one's gonna fly way over there. Okay, well, that's what was supposed to be in that area then. I, I understand now. Darn, darn it, I messed it up. I need to do that, do that. Oh, yeah, I'm really starting to get better at the platforming, I think. What do you guys think? Probably not. You're like, oh, see if I can platform circles around you. Something like that, right? Uh, Let's get across to here. Nice. And then, another moon! Yeah, what's in the box? I know what's in the box. A moon that flew away from me, but then I caught it. So yeah, we're at, we missed the first one, apparently. He's talking about how easy it was to find some of them, and I missed the first one. 14 out of 33, we're not even halfway there just yet, but we're getting there. I don't see anything else in this area we need to accomplish at this moment, so I'm gonna go like this. Hit Yoon, and I mean, once again, some of it might open up more once we complete this event. That is not something we are a stranger to. So um, I need to, uh, no, come on game, come on. Okay, you know what? Oh, that worked pretty well. <laughs> Get this checkpoint and we're at the Water Plaza Terrace. What do you jerks want? So we're facing the tall one, I think. Oh boy. <laughs> You're too late. We already got the lock lady dress. And it even matches the boss's tuxedo, so no way we're giving it back. Oh boy, he's got the deepest voice. Oh gosh, and he's got a bit of a cowlick too. Ah, wait, hold on, that's not what I wanted. I hope it's just landed right on top of it. So of course he does that, and then I can hit him with the hat, almost. He's so quick, and then hit him. He's so tall, too. Oh, did you see that? He has a little flower on the back of his cap, so I'm supposed to hit the cap. I think that's exactly what we have to do. We're not gonna be able to traditionally jump on him, but we can do a bit of that. Come on, come on, he's like, oh no, where'd he go? You think he'd be able to look up with how tall he is, but maybe he's not used to it because of how tall he is, huh? Oh gosh, now he's not so tall. Oh boy, uh, move it, move it, move it. <laughs> I love this, though. this is cool. Okay, once again, this boss music reminds me so much of Kirby. I think it's so much more Kirby-like than it is Mario-like, but hey, maybe they're trying to redefine what Mario-like music is like, boom. There's two hits, we need to do that one more time. So for the Brutals, once you figure out their little their little quirk, they aren't too bad. As, I mean, honestly, this game, like it hasn't been, I would say, difficult, as much as it's been challenging to find everything, but once you find where it is, actually getting it isn't too bad. Like, I haven't had too many challenges like, ooh, I'm stuck on this one. I'm usually stuck on actually finding it. Either way, we beat you up nice and well. You and your bow tie fall on the ground and explode into confetti. Okay, there's our triple moon for this area. Awesome. Great progress so far in today's episode. We have a little bit more time today to get more done. We could either do it more here in the Lake Kingdom, or we could go to some of the other kingdoms as well. And I could go finally buy that costume for Sand Kingdom, same thing for Wooded Kingdom. So much to do everywhere, I just don't know what to do first. I definitely, like, I don't know what the final area will be. I'm gonna assume it's gonna be like a Bowser's Castle kind of thing. If we ever see Bowser's Castle, I'm probably going to stop there and try to 100% all the other areas before we do anything there, you know? But um, I don't think we're anywhere close to anything like that. I'm worried about those two. Let's get after them, I'm trying. So we finished the area, which means we just start back here. Fantastic, that was, that was really snapping. So I wonder what more we can find around here. I and mean, we only have four more purple coins. Splendid, looks as though we have, yep, I know we don't. But I'm not too interested in that. Uh, hello, Yoon. What do you have to say now? Thank you for chasing away that monstrous minions guy, Traveler. I wonder where our luck lady dress is. I hope whoever wears it looks good enough to in it to justify our heartache. Oh, that's that's sort of really awful. I mean, I guess that's a good way of looking at it, but it's still awful. Thank goodness the stairs are fixed. No more going the long way around. You're telling me, lady. Which maybe means there's more in the long way around than I'm perceiving. Oh, another one of these little hints. What is the difference? The difference is the little bone. One, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four. So the sixth one, the closest one to Uncle Amiibo. There's something about that bone. I wanna take a picture of that, capture, take it. 
what is with that bone that we might have to be careful of? Do that. And then, oh, look at you guys. So you guys, oh, that is so cute. So um, before we do anything there, okay, more Goombas. Hold on. Oh, yeah, okay. Um, So really, I want to become this stack, because this stack is a three stack, so we can't hop on it as a two stack, that's for sure. So there's also another fishing one of you dudes. Interesting, there's so much more now. Yeah, okay. No more uh, little wedding outfit for you. Can we? We can't do that. So how are we gonna get you guys? Oh, you know what? We'll, we'll lead you over here. And I'm sure there's some use we can have for you. Ow, that hurt! Why didn't it work? Wait, what? What am I supposed to do then? Um, Maybe lower you one? There you go, and then become you. Go like that, and then hop! Yeah, that worked. We're just out one. <gasps> The final four, 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 pop, pop, pop. Yeah, all 50 of them. Get out of here. <laughs> awesome. Let's become you and start fishing. Oh, and there's another one of these super. Whoa. What is that? What is that? It's one of the paintings. Last time we saw a painting, it was all grayed out. Why is this one not grayed out? What did we do? I don't know. We'll find out after some peace, peaceful fishing time. Um, I'm gonna scoot this, you know what? This big one is gonna be the one with the, the moon. So I'm gonna lower it right there. And somebody's gonna get it. One of you guys is gonna piece it together. Come on, big guy. Turn it around. I know it's a little hard to maybe turn around if you're that big in such a small pond. Oh, that was just a little fish. Where's some extra health that I desperately needed though, so I ain't gonna complain. This guy's just, he doesn't like looking at something that isn't a wall. It's just his thing. Come on, buddy. Just turn around. Okay, he's moving around this way. Oh, no, he's not. Okay, let somebody else get it. Now, this one's interested. Got it. No, no, he didn't hold on for long enough. It's really hard to tell him. Um, come on, come on. No, come on, it vibrated. I guess you need to wait for it more. I guess he was trying to be gentle with it. Will he come back? I sure hope so. Yeah, he's back, okay. Hopefully, he won't be too long. Okay, he's trying again. Gonna tap it. He's gonna tap it. Oh, there we go, there we go. No, what? Wait, what? I was pressing, oh, dang it, I pressed the wrong button. That's stinky. One more time. He's right there and he ran away. There we go, I think I finally got him. Yes, geez, that took way more time than I'm willing to admit. Way more time lake fishing. All the other fish would always come up and bother me and then end up scaring the big one away. It was really dumb. Anyways, I don't care about you anymore. We're going into this mysterious painting if we can. Or should I? What is this thing? I don't know, like, should I do this now? What in the world is happening? Cappy, save me! <laughs> oh! What in the world? Wow, what the heck? Luncheon Kingdom, it's a different kingdom. Something smells scrumptious. Mount Fulbono. Is this the only way to get the Luncheon Kingdom? This just doesn't feel right. Well, no, this is just a, this is just a moon I can't normally get any other way. Ain't it? Wow, secret path to Mount Fulbono. Maybe I shouldn't have picked that up just yet. <laughs> I don't know, maybe I should have done it all. Like I, I like doing it all in one swoop, right? Um, but now I can go back. Ah! It does take a little while. We saw it up the first time. We got it. <laughs> what in the world? So that's the, that's all it was. But we can see a different kingdom now. Can we just go to that kingdom whenever we want? Probably not. We probably still have to traditionally unlock it. But why was that painting available? But the painting in the first world, Cascade Kingdom, why was that painting not available? If I go back, will it be? Maybe it's about hitting a certain threshold of moons. It just doesn't really tell you. Again, um, I bet you if I was on... Still, uh, yeah, if I was still the tower of uh, Goombas, I could probably get that, but is it really all that big of a deal? Doesn't look like it. I could go back around there and look around a little more, but it doesn't seem like they have too much for us. Also, let's check out the thing. 16 out of 30, I mean, we still have plenty more moons to find, but we have no more, um, what's it called? No more uh, purple coins to find, so I'll definitely, by the time we get to the shop again, I will hopefully be able to uh, just buy everything. Why, why wouldn't I be? I don't know why that has to be a hopefully. This is such a weird thing. I love it, but that's why it's weird. Because I love weird things. There we go. Cool, and that's another moon for us, so we're one less there, 17 now. End of the hidden passage.
Is it really though? I guess it is. So, if we run over here again, I can get a good view of everything else. I'm sure there's plenty under the water to achieve. But I'm focused about over the water things for now. I mean, honestly, it doesn't seem like there's too much more of new areas open for us right now. Oh, well here's one of them. Oh, I see the moon down there. Okay, do that. I don't know if that was exactly necessary, but I'm doing it. Come on, come on, one more. Perfect. And that is Lake Kingdom Timer Challenge 1. Cool. So if we look around elsewhere here and, oh, look at this. Okay, this used to be blocked off no longer. So let's go ahead and try to get to that. This right here. The rock is gone, you can go inside now. Indeed I can. Ooh, hello. Uh, I want to fix it, I really do, but it's just so heavy. Hmm. What exactly is going on here? Oh. Um. Okay. Yay, I did it. That was pretty simple. <laughs> I didn't even realize what I was doing before I already had a halfway solved. Is that it? A successful repair job. Cool. Oh, it's just a little building now. Nothing else around here? That was a pretty simple one. Oh, you didn't have to do that, but thank you so much. Okay. Is that really all I can do around here? Because once again, usually these areas have more than one puzzle to solve, but there's no more little nub on there. So I, I can't do anything even if I wanted to. All right, well, that means I'm finished up. Let's get out of here. Ow. <laughs> Every time. Every single time. Okay, so there's another moon. What are we at, 18 now? Cool. Hmm. I have my costume on. Maybe I wanna go back in there. It does, like this little dress thing does sparkle as if they're, wait, I can't go in now? Uh, if you travel all the way, yeah, I do have it. Maybe I just have to talk to you to unlock it. Yes, I do. Okay, we'll figure this out. But it glows as if there's a moon. Wait. Ah, there we go. Okay, I just had to hold on for a little bit longer. Give me that. Yeah, I feel underdressed. Awkward. <laughs> so there's that one. So it makes me think maybe these ones, these moons I've been looking at far, far and close, high and low, for the ones like in you know, Cascade Kingdom, maybe I can't find them because it's a result of you know going through another one of these paintings. So we're gonna get into the purple cap stuff. Um, so that's a, um, wait, what is this? This is a Lake Kingdom sticker, a sticker inspired by the Lock Lady dress. Okay, buy that. And then we'll take care of this sticking on the Odyssey cool. Rubber Dory, fans of the universally loved Dory have been clamoring for a quality reproduction like this. It's designed to feel just like the real thing. Cool. Adorable. Adorable. Ha <laughs> ha. Um, underwater dome. This snow globe featuring the water plaza in Lake Lamode uses water for the Lake Kingdom. Cool. Thank you very much. We'll send this along to the Odyssey for you. Cool. And that's everything you can get in the Lake Kingdom in terms of purple coin merchandise. We've already gotten all the yellow coin merchandise, so all that means now is I'm looking for more moons, but I can do that any other time too, if I wanted to. I'm just trying to think and look about, well, we could talk to talk to you. Maybe he's got something for us. Um, Found with Lake Kingdom art. It's hiding somewhere in an OP game. Lake Kingdom art, huh? Oh, you're the, you're not, you were, you used to not be here. Hello. I was planning to grow flowers, but I lost my seed in a spiky tunnel. See, there is stuff back in that spiky tunnel. When I say, oh, look at the riches over here. How do I get up there then? Oh, by wall jumping. Simple enough. Boom, boom. Look at all this. This is probably somebody's hidden stash I'm taking. Oh well, not my problem. I mean, I could go back down there and don't think it's all that much of a you know good idea. I just I don't think they would make you want to just go all the way back down there. Like going down there once is cool, going down there twice is a chore, you know? So I'm trying to look. What else might be different? Um, Dory looks the same. He still has that one moon on him. Okay, if I could become one of the fish, that'd be great, because that'd make me get through there quicker. But maybe there's a seed down there. So I'll have to be careful, because I'll have to travel with the seed through probably a bunch of stuff. So I'll try my best for that. Gotta be careful with the seaweed, please leave me alone. So which spiky tunnel? Probably this spiky tunnel. 
Uh, or not. A different spiky tunnel, huh? Not this one. Oh, no, I was just about to use you. I mean, I guess this really isn't too much of a spiky, spiky tunnel, huh? All right, let's get over to here and I'll keep rolling backwards because I could still find it. You know, I don't want to throw in the town just yet. Oh, there it is, there it is. Okay, so I think it would actually be easier to pick it up and head up here. Now, as long as I don't press the, the, the Y button again, I should be able just to hold it. So I just like let go of it there. Ooh, this is different. The water levels are different here. Okay. Maybe I could uh, do that. Yeah, the water levels are definitely different here. Did you enjoy the water plaza? It was fantastic. Thanks for asking. Well, I don't want to do too much here that I can't handle. Because once again, I uh, don't have the what's it called. So there really isn't too many other stages to this area. That's really it. This is a one stage area, interesting. I'm gonna go ahead and bring this back up. And then we definitely wanna go to Cascade Kingdom maybe. Wait, what's going, oh yeah, that was a moon there. I already found that one though. Or maybe, it was, no it wasn't a moon, it was just some coins. Either way, we can swim all the way back. Can I, actually, no I can, wait. Oh yes I can, and look at me, I can swim. It's just a little bit more difficult and a little bit more scary because I could easily um, not go as quickly and end up running out of air, but I'm almost there, I'm almost there. Open to the water plaza, thank you. Do that. Yeah, I did it! Okay, so, I was planning to grow flowers, but I lost my... Maybe. I guess I'll have to come back at some time? Interesting. Maybe I could just like, travel to the same place I already am, or something like that, come back down, and maybe it'll just be grown. Cause I think that's the idea here. Cause that's one thing, we put them up back in the place in Sand Kingdom and it didn't grow yet. Yeah, it still hasn't grown. Maybe I just have to come back at another time. Maybe it's based on like real time di di like difference. I don't know. I don't know if there's anything more I can do then. Like if I look around. We did get the uh, Brutals over the lake, so that was the first one. I mean, we're 29 out of 33, only 13 more. Uh, we could pay, what's his name? That might help us. So let us go back to the beginning, back to the Odyssey, and pay the tip toad, the toad tip guy that gives us tips. Hint toad, not even tip toad, tip toes. Uh, and see ya, what, what can he do for us? Having trouble finding power moons? I'll help you out for 50 coins, yes. Uh, thanks, I've marked it on your maps, take a look. Uh, that's probably the one I just did and I just can't do yet. Can I get another one? Um, yes. Thanks, I'm marking it out on your map. Something there by the little circle. Hmm, what could that be? I'll check that one out, and if I can't find anything else, then I think it's it's time to throw in the towel for now. We can uh, go to other areas. I mean, we've already actually approached almost an hour just playing this kingdom alone, so I'd probably just go back to Cascade Kingdom. And then... Uh, so it actually does give you the little X on the mark, or the X mark on the map. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Um, what could it be? I mean, it could be as sim simple as something in the ground here. And I just didn't really see correctly, because it, it says it's like right here. Oh yeah, okay, there it was. Hard to tell, I didn't see any glimmer there whatsoever. So we'll go down there and grab that one, and then I think I'm out of here for now. Wow, good find, thank you, thank you. Boom from the broken pillar. So, if we uh, head back now, it really wants me to head back. I wonder what our next kingdom will be then, that's exciting. Surely it'll be something good, right? Um, Needs eight more, we got way more than eight, buddy. We're jumping from 93 to like 110 or something. Yeah, about 110, I would think. Maybe more. Ooh, we almost got like a full sale going on. 100 and what, 116, so six more than I thought. The Odyssey has powered up. Fantastic. Hmm. I love the little song. So which kingdom would be our option, probably for next episode, way over here? We have enough power to make it to our way to Metro Kingdom. Time to cross that vast ocean to New Dong City. Not right now though. Uh, <laughs> let's go to Cascade Kingdom. I wanna figure this out. What could this little puzzle mean? Like, here's the thing. It's telling me about that little spine bone there. 
I think what it's trying to tell me is I gotta play as a dinosaur, go back there and smash that little spine bone and see what happens. So the first thing I wanna do since I'm here is actually run back into the Odyssey so that we can go and change our costume to this, you know, Cascade Kingdom thing. Oh, look at all of our statues over here. This is awesome. So I don't really know, like once again, I haven't found any use for these yet, but I'm sure the use will come about. It has in every other kingdom, or it seems to. I can only imagine that's the case here. So, let's get it done. Sorry if my voice is all groggly, I've been speaking all day. So it's this one, but we need to break it somehow. I love how, even the hat's a little different, it looks, it looks really cool. Um, <laughs> the thing is, is there's just not many units to talk to around here. You know, usually it seems like you have to talk to somebody and then they give you a door to unlock or something like that. Not the case here because there's just not anything like that. And when it comes to everything, I know that we like broke a rock here and like one of them, yeah, it's this one has the moon in it. Not really too con like concerned about that. Um, talking to, I know they don't have anything for me. We already tried that. We, were, we went through that like last episode or the episode before, I'm not entirely sure, but something like that. Let's uh try to get up here. Uh, yeah. And then up here as well. Okay, good, good, good. And talk to you. I guess not talk to you. But consume you, you are mine. So now that we have this, I can just charge through, hopefully without too much strife, finding coins and the such that I don't need right now. Not concerned. And we're just gonna break that and just sort of see what happens. Is it still there? Yeah, it just hasn't loaded yet. That didn't do anything. Um, that didn't do anything. Game, are you kidding me? Wait, maybe I can butt stomp it. Yes, okay, I found it, I found it, yeah! Boom, found the Lake Kingdom art, or found with the Lake Kingdom art. So maybe the rest of them we just cannot find until we have specific art pieces. That could be the case, could be the case. So I don't really know about any other things for this um, kingdom. I feel like we have a couple more minutes, so maybe we could um, uh, head off to another kingdom and we could go to Sand Kingdom, do the thing we need to do there, which is buy that costume, buy everything there, and, and unlock that secret area. I don't know what will happen there. There's definitely more in Sand Kingdom we can find, for sure. <laughs> Mario looks so weird with black hair. Just like, the long black, dre black dreads is just really weird. Okay, so now that we're here, we'll go ahead and buy a sombrero. What did that say about the sombrero, by the way? Uh, change now, yes, we'll change to the sombrero now. Can't wait to put on the sombrero, huh? A uh, traditional Toasteranian hat keeps the sun out of your eyes and is just plain fun to wear. The paunch or traditional folk dress of the Toasterina region keeps the sun off and the breezes on. Yep, and then we're going to equip that right away, just like that. Uh, can't wait to put on, yep. So why do we have two such? We also have this stuff here. So I might not actually be able to buy everything, but the cowboy had a classic hat perfectly suited for wearing as you ride in the sunsets. Is this what you wanted? Yes, but I'm not gonna wear that just yet. So there's two sets of stuff here, maybe later. Um, maybe that's the benefit of having 100 coins instead of just 50. Um, and then we got the cowboy outfit, old fashioned dudge with the frontier feel, gunslinging, cow punching, optional. G good, don't punch cows. They don't, they don't ask for that. That's just mean. Um, and then we only have enough coins for a couple of these. That's fine. We could just buy a Toasterina sticker. Thank you for your purchase. Let's me stick this on the honest. Okay. A sticker inspired by the inverted pyramid. In the Toasterina region, the Jaxi lived alongside the people since the ancient time that the statue was made from the stones of the ruins. Cool. And then we don't have enough for the uh, the model of the inverted pyramid. But we will eventually, once we have maxed out in the purple coins. We're getting close. We're getting close. Yeah, look at us. Fantastic. So let us. Um, get across to here, because it's where we need to be, is um, moving over here. Come on, almost there, almost there, almost there. Move it, move it, groove it, groove it. Yeah, you. Hello, I got your, your outfit. We're twinsies. Dress like us, party like us, that's what we say anyway. So snappy hat, check. Snappy poncho, check. You are ready to party, head inside. All right, what is inside of here then? I'm really curious. And I don't know where the, um, Closed specific room is for what a kingdom, but you dance and you dance and you dance. Everybody dance. Oh, ha <laughs> look at us. We got a little, uh, what is it, Sriracha? No, I don't know if that's the right word. Um, I don't know what the name of this kind of music is, but well, we got it going. Yeah, hooray, we got a little moon for that. Everybody dance, hooray. That was awesome. Mm, dancing with new friends. 
New friends indeed. So there is another moon for us at the least. We got two new moons outside of Lake Kingdom, which is great. Beyond that, oh, look at, how long have these been hiding here? There we go. 86 out of 100, I can't believe how many times I've been through this town, how many times have I missed those? Jeez Louise, and I've gotten you. I know that for a, case, for a fact. Oh, I almost tried to get you in this additional time. So uh, of course there's plenty more we can do here in the Sand Kingdom, and I'm sure I'll be getting to it soon. Maybe I'll buy a couple hints just to find out what some of that stuff is, but beyond that, I think I'm a bit on my own, excuse me. Um, oh. yeah, let's just get back over here and talk to Hint Toad. Maybe he can help me out. Hello. Having trouble finding power moons? Wanna buy a hint? Absolutely. Thanks to Martin on your maps with minus. So, that one's right there. Man, they always they always make me feel silly, don't they? <laughs> always make me feel so dumb about the ones I'm missing. What about, oh, it is sparkling, isn't it? I gotta really get used to looking for that sparkle. Oh. Wait, what? Oh, 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 okay. Just like the dress, okay. I gotta remember that, maybe throw our hat on some stuff like that. All right, cool. That one's hang your hat on the fountain. We're heading right into the, the ship and we're just going right on over to Metro Kingdom, New Donk City. There's a big old airship here. Oh, I wonder if maybe we'll uh, run into Bowser again. We've run into Bowser, you know, a couple times down, but we haven't really reached him. As soon as we get there, he's heading out, so. Maybe now that we've defeated every brutal, we've defeated every brutal as far, as far as I know. Now even the big one that doesn't fit on the ship that you usually ride around on. Maybe there's more like that though? Cause I don't think we're anywhere near the end of the game. But we've defeated all the brutals. Usually like if you defeat all the Koopalings, you know you're close to the end, but I don't think that's the case here. And speaking of which, I wonder what the Koopalings are up to. If they haven't been you know, part of this adventure, seeing as how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills, travel tip, triple jump. I already know all about that. I don't think I need to read this. Uh, your third jump, consecutive, blah, blah, blah. We've learned about it. Well, there it is. Now then, let's see what there is to see in the Metro Kingdom. Everything. This place is getting a little crowded, by the way. Goodness, what was that? Um, <laughs> we look so silly in our poncho. Uh, whoa. That's the big old ship, all right. <laughs> Look at us and our poncho, so silly. Oh my. Maybe we should run him back into normal attire before we want to enter this cutscene, but hey, we'll do what we need to do. Look at this. Okay, we're catching up. There's the big old bouquet. That is the soiree bouquet. Oh, hey, Bowser. We got a little bit of a flyby going on. You want to fight? I got my poncho. Made of steel. No hats were hitting me out of orbit this time. Cloud Kingdom, Nimbus Arena. Okay, we're skipping Metro Kingdom. We're going to Cloud Kingdom, Nimbus Arena. Look at this place. So cool. So before we go on and explore this area, which I certainly want to, let me go ahead and change my costume. Because I, I, don't, I want to do it as normal Mario. I figure, you know, we'll try to dress accordingly to each area. And if we don't know what to dress as, just dress as normal Mario. Why not? So do that. Uh. Yeah. Looking good, looking good, I like it. So, now, we can go and face Bowser, maybe. I'm excited. I can't wait to face him. Where is he, huh? Um. Now, are there any stars, or not stars, moons for this area? Uh, maybe we'll find out. Okay, I need to get used to playing the game. I haven't played in a day or two. I try to, you know, get ahead of recording so I can focus on other things. Um, there's another one of these moon rocks. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Hi. So you, you wanna you wanna do this now, huh? Let's do it. Oh, okay, a little too close for comfort. I can smell your breath. That might kill me faster than you can. Mario, I don't have time for you. I'm busy planning my wedding. Don't you know how stressful that is? Well, no, because we're not getting married. Oh my. She's not looking so good right now. She looks upset. So does Tiara. All right, you wanna fight? Are we, are, oh, whoa, whoa. He might not have a sentient cap, but it's it's still ready to go. Holy cow, he's got a, a punch out cap. Okay, what in the world are we gonna do about this? Okay, watch out. Can I become him? He doesn't have a hat on right now. Oh gosh, he's coming back to him. Oh, I saw that. His little hand signals. Come on, we can get over there. Come on, come on. No, 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 I got it. It's not working. Oh, maybe his head's too big. Ow, ow, that hurt. Maybe I have to hit the hat itself then. Maybe I can hit it back to him. Here, come on, come on. 
Throw it. No, wait, I missed. Come on, that's stinky. Maybe I gotta stand on one of these platforms. Maybe I'm just not at a good. Uh, yes, 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 yes. Okay, I hit that. Now hit it again, maybe. Oh, whoa! <laughs> oh, buddy, you've messed up. Okay, punch, punch, um, punch. Here, hold on. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah! <laughs> that was amazing. That'll teach you, all right. Oh gosh. Okay, so it's not about the size of the hat wearer. It's about the size of the hat. Oh my. Um, I need to dodge that, and then I need to hit that. Yep, yep, yep. And then, yep, wear it. We're gonna go get you. And luckily we can still wall jump and everything. We just gotta be careful because this stuff is a problem. Whoa, whoa. Okay, he's just throwing small planets at us. Is this Mario Galaxy now? I just lost, by the way. Okay, weird stuff, but I think we got this. Let's redo this boss fight, huh? Okay, got it, got it. Let's figure this out. Do we have to, you know, do the, wait, okay, for a second I thought he wasn't there anymore. Okay, so how am I handling this student out? I mean, first off, we know how to do this way better now, so I can just simply do that and try to catch up to him. He's gonna still jump around like a maniac, so I gotta be careful, try to dodge as much as I can, and then just punch him. Oh, <laughs> it's so cool. All right, we gotta get out of here, though, quickly, because I throwing my hat at you just doesn't work. I like also, he has a bit of a comb over. Look at his hair. I like his new dune. Bowser's new dune. Come on. Boom, yeah, got it. Okay, give me that hat. And I'm gonna catch up to you as much as I can. I mean, I don't know if I can. Oh geez, yeah, he, small, he throws the small planets, but I just dodge him. I love his comb over, he's looking so dapper. Like, I know that Bowser was already a stylish guy, but now more than ever. It must be that he's just too big, but the hat just won't stay on him. I, luckily enough, that doesn't work the other way around. The hat can never be too big for you, but you can be too big for the hat. Okay, there you go. Now let's get over there as much as I can. Where are you gonna jump? You're gonna jump over there, you're gonna jump again. An additional time, sure. I think this might be the last hit we need, so let's hope we can dodge it up. Come on, there you go. Go, 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 go. Don't make him throw any more mini planets. Oh, oh, he blocked it that time. Whoa, 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 I wasn't ready for that. <laughs> okay, whoa, did I do something wrong there? Maybe I have to hit him from behind, or maybe I just have to jump that properly. Hmm, peculiar indeed. No, 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 come on, punch him. Come on. Okay, he's gonna, oh, I messed it up. I think I gotta hit him after, like after I dodge it, I have to hit him. That's really tough though. Okay, come on, we got it, we got it. Bowser, you're going down. You're going down, Bowser. Come on, ready, punch him. And then he's gonna show us a little bit of tail, and then jump, yes, 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 he loses his balance, and then we got him, see ya. Oh, ho, ho. nice. Hi. Come on, Peach, just jump off, I'll catch you. Or not. Oh. Oof. He ain't looking so good. Oh, he's mad. You angry? Fire! Okay. Who's firing? Like, who is on the ship? Probably any of his minions, I guess. <laughs> run, run, run. No! Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. We're falling. So is the Odyssey. Oh no, that's awful. See what you're up against, Mario. Yeah, he's not playing around. He wants this wedding to happen. This ain't no good. And that's sort of the thing I haven't talked about. If Bowser marries Peach, doesn't that mean he'll have control over the Mushroom Kingdom? Through just, you know, whoa, the Lost Kingdom. This is awesome, but it also means I'm not getting to New Dog City just yet. Wow, it's beautiful. Oh, we're okay. This reminds me of like Yoshi's Island. Ugh, where are we now? Oh no. Oh no, the Odyssey is all busted up. We'll need some power moons to fix it. Let's get looking. Okay, how many power moons do we need? I don't have many right now. This is so cool, we need 10 of them. Oh, I love this. And they're also a uh, leafy little purple coins. There's one right there. I'm gonna have to be careful though, because who knows um, how deadly this goop is. It looks pretty deadly. So let me land here, and then super jump. Oh, you see the little slingshot over there? Maybe I should look for a slingshot around here. Can I get any? Oh no, am I stuck now? Oh no, not quite, not quite. Or maybe. Hmm. 
how can I do this? Wait, yeah, that insta-kills me. Something ain't right here. I think there might be some invisible blocks somewhere. I mean, I got the purple coins, which is good, but if I can get something from down there, I certainly want to get it, now don't I? Um. Hmm. Maybe not? I don't know, that's really weird. Something ain't right there. Maybe I could consume some, or I can uh, capture somebody, not consume, uh, and that will help. But for now, I have no clue. Can sneak behind the ship a little bit. I mean, I could still go inside, I'm sure, and I don't really need to do that. Okay, weird, we'll just explore here for now. Just have to remember that that's there. You know, that's the most important thing. Hmm. Whoa, hello! Hey, look here, little buzzard! Ow! Oh, that's not good! <laughs> it's the little hot steely buzzard from Super Mario 64! You get back here, you jerk. He's helpless, poor little Cappy. Oh, great help, I'm trying! I'm trying! How are we gonna get up there? Actually, oh, can I butt slam this? Oh, I can, if I go on the other side, I can hear him screaming, poor Cappy, I'm coming! I'm coming! Wait for me! Oh, geez, we're not going this way. Oh, there we go, oh, yeah, I gotta get over to here. So while there is tons of stuff that seems like I can do here, I probably wanna worry about it once I, oh, but that's an easy one. Let me get this one, sorry, Cappy. Gotta get some fun in, inside the rising stone pillar, sure. <laughs> Okay, oh, 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 nice. Get this checkpoint, oh, I don't have the cap, so I can't throw it. I'm trying to throw it, so used to that. Help, I'm trying! You get back here, you fiend! Oh, yikes! <laughs> Come on, I saved you. Yay, I saved you. Whoa, thanks for the rescue. That was unpleasant and rather pokey. I sure hope that it doesn't happen again. Now to pluck a to pluck up our spirits. Let's go collect some power moons. I already collected one while you were gone. Okay, I already hear a shimmering of another one as well. Can we become you guys? I can, this is so weird. Um, I can stretch. Um, cool, whoa, I love that. Oh, this might be how we get that key. Oh, it definitely is, it definitely is. Okay, good to keep that in mind. There's a moon medallion down there, a moon piece. I definitely hear, oh, there it is. How do I get up there? Probably like this, and then maybe I could do that and then become you again. That's it, that's it. That's how we're gonna get over here. Yep, yep, yep. Ha ha, easy. On a tree in the swamp. I'm sure that's not the only way to get that one as well, which is cool. All right, I can do this a little bit. <laughs> this is so cool, I love this guy. A little stretchy squish and squash. I wanna call him squish and squash. There you go. Oh geez, don't fall down. And we look, we look like a little doggy, you know, like normally. <laughs> okay, and there's no way to you know to jump. It's just you know doing this. So I need to do that and then get back over to here. And cool. This is so much fun. I want to hop down there and deal with this whole situation, but I feel like there's a better way to approach it. And look at that way over there. How am I doing that? I'm not really sure. Maybe at some point I can become like a bird. I'm not entirely sure. But there's obviously more to do around here as well. Even like if I check this out. Some way, oh, it caught me. No, 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 oh no, how do I get you back? Oh, interesting, so I could do that. Ow, okay, that hurt, and that was a really dumb way to do it. Let me get some health if I can, or not. Okay, here, hold on, do that and just stand on top of the block. Nice, okay, there you go, yeah! I don't know. What was that? I got so excited, I was just like, yeah! R wrecked rock block, okay. Um, I hear another one. I do definitely hear the shimmering of another one, probably up here. No, not what I wanted. No, also not what I wanted. Oh, it's right here. Okay, I was gonna try to slam on the top of the tree. Instead, below the cliff's ledge. I gotta keep my ears out for that kind of stuff. Cause it could be anywhere, and absolutely anywhere. And there's our moonstone again. Okay. Doing this doesn't do too much for me. And I can even go down here, because I skipped the most of this, you know, in terms of finding Cappy. Yeah, there's much to do around here. I mean, when it comes to that, the only way I know how to break a cage I talk to is to uh, get a bullet bone. So maybe there'll be one around here, but the, uh, everything around here doesn't seem to be like any type of Bowser's goons. Regardless, I missed some purple coins up here that I definitely want to try to grab. So landing on these things is no easy task. Come on. 
Like that. There you go. Wait, wait. Awesome. I don't see any others up here though. So that was about the extent of that. I mean, I could probably make that jump if I tried that again. Now let's climb back up and go like, Mario, why you go that way? Okay. And then if I want like, no, 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 not quite the angle I want, but like this and then, oh, not quite. Okay, maybe not, maybe not. Maybe if I was a little bit better at it, I'll be honest, but I don't think that's how I'm supposed to do it regardless, so. Okay, we're back here, actually it's really a bit of a shortcut, so I won't complain. Hmm. Okay, we should might, we might as well start uh, looping around this. Otherwise, I'm seeing lots of these purple leaf coins. I don't know how many we're supposed to find. I haven't been paying too much attention to that part. But I could um, look around this. Not really too much. This is what we use to take care of the bird thing. I guess there's not too, too much more to it for right now. Over here though, this platform is moving and grooving. I just wanna get this stuff. Still 50, it's not gonna be a huge area. But there are purple coins under this, I believe. Either that, yes, there are. Or I just saw it wrong, but I did not see it wrong. How in the world do I get those? I would imagine by, oh, oh. I'd imagine my best bet would be to flip down here, but no, not quite. Oh, look at that one down there. Another one I'm not really sure how to get. There must be some kind of flying, oh gosh. Oh, some kind of flying, um, capturable enemy around here. Because a lot of the stuff is just sort of free floating in a way that I just don't understand. So maybe we should just explore a little bit more, not get every last thing just yet, but just try to make our way through and maybe we'll find more capturable friends and foes and all the sort. This is an easy one over here. I mean, we need, we're four in, we need 10. Oh, not quite. <laughs> there we go. Whenever you see his little legs in place, Saren. That's good. Atop the propeller pillar. There you go. Oh, this one has a little hat. Look at how adorable you are. There you go. Get these three. Another easy moon. We've collected half the power moons uh, we need. Ow, that hurt. You stinker. Come on, just move out of here. And then maybe we should try with the medallions now. I mean, I see one, two, three, probably four in there. Is that five? Oh gosh, oh gosh, yeah, you don't wanna do it that way, do you? Oh, oh! You don't get any jump out of that either. That was silly of me, that was all me. Okay, this is all very interesting and peculiar, but also very challenging, which I like. It's just a weird area. I feel like I just, it's, it's one of those areas where it's hard to figure out how to properly explore it at first, and because of that, you just have to do some kind of like weird exploring. Hmm, so I could have came over here from that line. When it comes to that moon, like I could probably get it, but I die right afterwards which is not what I want. There you go, got that. <laughs> I love this this thing so much. It's a lot of fun. Move it, move it. So let's get medallion one. And I could have, like, I, this is probably much easier how we're doing it than if we did it with normal Mario. So I could go and do this, get number two. Oh no. <laughs> I love this thing. This is one of my favorites so far. It's just so, you know, stretch and squash. A little stretch and squash, I love it. Get that, this will be number four. Now I think five is like hiding behind something or somewhere. I'm pretty sure it's behind this tree. Oh no. Okay, come on, go, go, go. Oh, can I not land on this tree? I can. I'm pretty sure it's behind this tree. Yep, there it is, there it is. Got it, boom. So there we go, it's way back there. I can make that, I can get back there. Not too much of a problem, I think. We'll find out. Oh, ow, that was rude. Get me out of here. I need some heals real bad. Also, can I become, maybe that, that was dumb. I didn't know it was gonna do that to me. I wanted to see if I can become one of the fuzzies. Maybe I can't though. I think we maybe have tried in the past. All right, well, the moon is, uh, oh gosh, that was way too close. The moon is right there now. And then we'll be more than halfway through, which will be fantastic. Go like that, nope, go like this. Go like this. Oh, why didn't that work? What, what, what? No, 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 come on! <laughs> what? All right, butt slam on that thing. Got it. I'm gonna squish that moon with my butt. Moon shards in the jungle. Six out of 10. Great. All right, let's get across to here. Mountainside platform, which means I can hop on into here. Oh, look at that, interesting. So a lot of you told me that it definitely seems to be that 
almost every time, there will be two. Um, there will be two moons in everything. So I'll try to look out for that. I mean, I don't know if this really counts. Yeah, avoiding fuzzies inside the wall. But apparently there's almost always two, I think there's something here. No. <laughs> I tried, I tried. Um, there's always two inside a hat room. This might be a different, like a special one, because it's like, it's not really inside a hat room. Even though there's like a little nub in the wall here as well. I mean, the wall seems to be overall inconsistent, you know? So it's really hard to tell whether I'm like missing a secret there or not, but if I only have coins to lose, I definitely want to try to figure it out. So I'm gonna try again. You can see like there's a little dip in the wall on the bottom left there that I'm trying to figure out. All right, ready? Down. Okay, I think that's the only moon we can find there. Rather easy moon if that's it, but I'm not here to complain now, am I? Okay, so let's die again. Great. Eww. We're gonna be totally broke by the end of this. I mean, luckily we only lose 10 coins every time. I thought that eventually would start like losing more. All right. Um. Great. So I could, I mean, I probably should be doing this as the uh, stretch and squash guys. But um, yeah, I can't become you guys. For one reason or another, come on. Come on, that was stinky. You know it was stinky. <laughs> one more time, one more time, one more time, one more time. We got it. All right, you ready? Uh, go like that. Go like this. Oh, yes, that's all I wanted. Thank you. <laughs> you got a moon over, over the fuzzies above the swamp. All right then. Nice, okay, so we're out of here. I am running. I'm scaring you away apparently. I mean, I hit you with, I got I got rid of your hat is what I did there. Still don't know how to get that one. I think I just, well, maybe I could do that as a stretch and squash. Now that I'm looking at it at a different angle, let me try it. I don't got anything to lose by trying it now, don't I? Get across to here. Get across to here. Get across to here. <laughs> get across to there. And then grab it. Man, easy. Peeking out from under the bridge. So let us uh, go back this way as much as I can. Nope, hard to see, hard to tell. Do that, do this, and maybe we'll go back to the key room. I wanna definitely go as far as we can though. I mean, we can go back to that at any point. So let me loop around back up top. Oh wait, how do I get that now? Hmm, not like that. I haven't really messed with this one. Ah, I see, I see. Okay, let's get back around up there. So there's a condensed amount of moons around here. If we check the map, there's 25 to find in this small, small little area. You haven't checked this out too much, actually. Lost Kingdom, remote island chain in the tropics. L lively paradise surrounded by sea of death. Wow. A uh, symbol of ancient times, so if we see that button, we'll just hit it, okay? Um, three key keys to the kingdom, enjoy the breathtaking scenery, but beware of the death-dealing poison. Watch the tropical wiggler grow and shrink. It is simply mesmerizing. Puzzle over the odd mechanics of these strange ruins. Okay, cool. So let us get back up here. I know we're sort of a very scatterbrained this episode so far, but it's worth it because we're getting moon after moon. So we do have 10 moons now. We could go and fix the Odyssey, but you know I ain't done with that. We gotta keep going. Um, yeah, let's uh get back up here and see what I can do. Excellent, we've got all the power moons we need, I know. I just said that, you're just repeating me now. Ripping me off, aren't you? Next, you're gonna say that you're a zebra. That's what I think. I mean, if you wanna be a zebra, it's up to you. I'm not gonna judge, Al, but I am gonna be in pain. Awful, awful pain. Oh, so apparently I can climb this thing. So this is how we're gonna get those other purple coins. Awesome, that's actually just fine. Oh, 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 oh. Cool, so that's 28 out of 50 now. I like it. Here, get across there. <laughs> Let me get back up there for the 80th time now. Okay, so I did see, I think there's also purple coins under this platform, so I'll have to climb this one as well. But I did notice, yep, there's a couple more here. Awesome. But yeah, I don't wanna go back down there because I've gone down here so many stinking times and then I've had to climb back up, but I guess I gotta do it an additional time because I gotta get these. And then what is this gonna be? This is going to be 33 out of 50. So we're getting there. We are definitely, definitely getting there. So I don't know what is um, across here, and I'm curious why the, all the butterflies are going around it, but uh, yeah, it looks like we can do that, and then I can, oh boy, ow, that was a waste. 
I gotta stand on the block. That's the best way to do it. Okay, that got rid of one of the blocks. Oh wait, that's enough to fit through. Excellent. Uh, I'll deal with you soon enough, hold on. Hold on, that's also not what I wanted to do. I wanted to spin and then throw the cap so it's spinny. Yay, we did it. No, wait, now we did it. Oh, that was just health. Fine, I need it. I definitely need it. Uh, let me plop down here. 35 out of 50, that's good. Now Yoon. Oh, let us deal with you in any way we can. Oh, I can. There you go. Perfect. All right, let's try that again, huh? Um, If I can. There you go. Get rid of this block as well. I'm, I'm sort of scared there might be something hidden behind them. So I gotta sort of keep my eyes out for that. But it doesn't look like there is, so I can just keep going. Oh, hey! Thank you for the free coins, I could really use those. And this one's easy. Yeah, look at how easy that one was. Boom! On the mountain road. Boom. Anything else around here? No uh, purple coins hanging off a ledge or nothing crazy like that. Well, let's read this sign. Um, Travel tip, wall jump. Jump towards the wall, and when you touch it, press B to do a wall jump. You can press B again when you reach a facing wall and keep repeating to reach really high places. I know all about that, but you know what? You can show me a photo anyways. I can't do this one, obviously. Have to hit this big button. And, oh, okay, let's be quick about this. Ready? Oh, 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 oh. There's also this little ledge. Oh, look at that. There's um, the hint toad then. I'll have to come back then. Oh, hello. Look at you guys. <laughs> There's tons of stuff going on up here. Um, First talk to you, who are you? Howdy, oh hey Mario, I didn't expect to see you here. Exploring Nye came to open a store. Nothing tops this location, right? Step on inside, take a look around. Okay, so you have your own crazy cap location. They have quite the chain going on here. Um, So we haven't got all the purple coin stuff yet, but if we talk to you, hi Ian. So we can get this, yep. All right, and it looks like we don't have any other um outfits right now to buy for yellow coins. We got a moon shopping on Forgotten Isle. And then, Hyan. Wow, look at this stuff. Oh, that is so cool. So we got the aviator cap. Gotta keep those ears warm at 33,000 feet. Is this what you wanted? Yes. That is so cool. I'm gonna equip that right now. Change down. That is so, so cool. And then we got the aviator outfit. This jacket is, is how you let people know you're a pilot when you're not in a cockpit. I love it. Buy that tune. Um, and then when it comes to this stuff, we'll buy what we can, buy that. So the uh, Cloud Kingdom doesn't have any of this stuff. It doesn't seem to have any purple coins or anything. Potted palm tree, I actually didn't read that. Sicker inspired by the, by the Forgotten Isle. This plant grows all over the Forgotten Isle, hardy enough to thrive even in a poisonous swamp. It has become quite popular with gardeners. Cool. There's that, so I'll we'll have to come back with 15 more uh, purple coins. I will come again, don't worry. Um, yeah, look at us! So cool, a little tubby, but that's fine. Looks more like a winter jacket than, you know, pilots, you know, aviator stuff, but that's cool. So what more can we do around here? Obviously there's that moon. Um, excellent, we've got all the power moons we need. We can fix the Odyssey now. I know you've told me so many times and I still don't care. Boom, enjoying the view of a forgotten isle. Very cool. And then there's, oh, you know what? We're probably trying to get to that one. If I lo also look, I mean, we're still at 13 on 20. We don't even have half of them. Crazy stuff. I, mean, I know about that one. If I'm looking around, I honestly don't see too much more. I mean, we can get those purple coins over there with the, gl in the gliding. I can, oh, look at that little butterfly. I think I wanna plop back down there now. Um, I could, of course, glide, but I think it would be better and cooler just to be here. And the captain is missing. The captain's missing, Captain Toad. Um, oh, you're not him, Toad. Okay. What is going on around here? Um, and then these. Oh, oh, geez, I messed it up. All right, there you go. That's an easy moon. Bam! Cave gardening. Yay! That's fun. Okay, so here's Talkatune, and here's a little. Oh, you haven't joined anybody stuck in here. Captain, you in there? You got some uh, purple coins in here. That's for sure. Oh, is that it? Okay, twelve more to get. I know where a couple of them are too. Oh, there's a little Princess Peach. Good, good, good. Let us, I'm a little nervous walking down here. Uh, hi. What is the secret you are seeking? I know it, aha. I can't tell you, but I'll give you a cool twist and turn up treasure. It's hiding somewhere and no peeking. I think that's probably the one we'll probably find like in the key. Arian. 
Oh gosh, no, no. Dang it, okay, well I gotta make my way the long way around now. I probably could do that. I've already found this one. <sighs> well, I mean, I guess I didn't have to do it this way. I could have just, well, I'm already doing it, but um, I could have just um, teleported back up to the top. Either way, there's still so much more to find around here. Small area, totally jam packed. It's smaller than like Cascade Kingdom. I mean, I know I still haven't gone to Cap Kingdom. It's just, I wanna keep moving, you know? Keep moving forward. All right, flying, flying, scree, scree, scree. I'm trying to look down there. I guess there really wasn't too much more I could find. It looks like I found just about the, the extent of it. Wait, no, I never got the butterfly. Where is that butterfly at? Um, The butterfly was there. So, oh gosh, let's uh limbo this line. Oh boy. Wait, what? Where are you going? Come back. It's gone. It's flying away. Did I just miss my chance? I hope it comes back. What if I, what if I teleport back up here in the Rocky Mountain Summit? I just gotta throw it at it instead of chasing it. I thought that that'd be a good idea. I guess not. Uh, is it back or is it flying flying around now? Uh, there it is. Okay. Let me. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Awesome. A butterfly's treasure. Sorry, butterfly, for taking that from you, but it, it was necessary. Okay, so now we can go back to the top an additional time and start riding that guy around. We can at least get one more moon from him, a couple more purple coins. The rest of them, I'm not really sure. But uh, we'll figure it out together, right? So yeah, take Yoon. Instead of going that way, we're gonna turn around here. And, and I can either go that way for that or I could fly all the way down there. I mean, I bet you I could go and do this now. Oh geez, we're going a little quicker than I thought. Um. Oh, okay, no, I missed one, come on! No! No, 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 that's so uncool. There's no way I can get back up there, I know it. I know there's no way we can get back up there like that. Oh, that stinks! There you go, that's all I wanted from you. All right, so we could, uh, oh wow, yeah, there is one over there as well. I, I think that, what did Hattie say, or Cappy say there? I think he said, I, I I take my hat off to you, but you know, here's a hat. Okay, so there's some more purple coins up there, and then I can go get the moon. Luckily, I start back up here because this is where I last activated my checkpoint, which is great. Uh, beyond that, I honestly really don't know where the other purple coins will be. I mean, I don't remember how many more we need, but. These will be quite easy, as long as I land on it just right. Oh, come on. Oh, that's awkward. I don't like how awkward it is. Jeez. Games have been like nonstop beating me up today. I've just like been dying so much in all the games I play. You know, you just have days like that, but you know what? Just because I'm having a bad day doesn't mean I can't, you know, suddenly curate time later to record. This is the time I have to record. I gotta do it. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so. Now I could probably just teleport back up there an additional time. I know you guys are probably so sick of seeing me do that, but it'll be the last time for now, I promise. How many more purple coins do we need? I don't know. I mean, hopefully we can find a couple more and that'll help answer that question. Get Yoon, jump like this and just start gliding. Wee, oh, oh. Come on, come on, come on. Got it. So that is soaring over the Forgotten Isle. Very good, now I can hop off of this. I don't think there's any purple coins up there, doesn't look like it. No, I'm done with you. <laughs> you can stay on this, this little island forever. Rest of your life, just right there. So the last thing we're doing is we're gonna go in that keyhole, try to figure that out a little bit. So let me roll over here and try to find one of those little dudes. I still have no idea about this cage. Like I don't think we can just break it normally. So I think our best bet is to get one of these dudes, which there's one right here. So do that, do that and keep moving. And it just seems like with every single kingdom, you know, more gets unlocked the, if you come back later. Because that's what some people are telling me in the comment section, that there's still some stuff in Cascade Kingdom that just like you can't do yet. Like I know that there's like the painting thing. Beyond that, apparently there's more you just, you can't do right away. Even after you've completed, you know, the basic stuff there. Maybe that's not true, but as far as I saw, it seemed pretty true. So let's plop down here and do this. Now this is, so disappointing, I'm so disappointed in myself. 
okay, so I need to reach in there, get that key. Oh, it's just gonna give me moon. I thought it would be like an extra little room in there. Okay, so what is this one gonna be? Boom. Twist and turn of treasure. Okay, so I was correct about that being twist and turn of treasure. Cool. We're still missing some purple coins that I think I'll just have to live with not having for right now, because I think we're all finished up with this area. I mean, I've been exploring it quite thoroughly, and I don't see too much more I can find right now, so maybe we can come back later to get that out. But for now, we have more than 10 moons to deliver, which is great. Hopefully, it'll fix this bad boy up, and we can keep going. We took quite the beating here. We should probably just get this thing insured. Okay. Yay, perfect. The Odyssey is repaired. Again, I mean, it is still sort of needing a better paint job. It definitely needs a better paint job. Look at this thing. But you know what? We can worry about that later. For now, we are off. See ya. Whee. I love our new costume, though. It's great. So where are we off to now? I mean, we could be <laughs> off to just about anywhere at this point. Um, but hopefully, it's actually Metro Kingdom. Um... I'm not sure though. Like, it's not really telling me where we're going. We're just sort of going. We just found the, enough power moons to fix up the Odyssey. Thank goodness. Seeing how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. Aside somersault, I know all about it. Don't worry about it. Uh, well, there it is. Now then, where were we? Ah, yes, we were on our way to the Metro Kingdom. The whole kingdom is one vast city filled with skyscrapers. It seems it was built using the energy from power moons. Very cool. Wow, beautiful. Look at this golden shimmer we got. That is just so exciting. Oh, wow. He paid the big bucks. This city is just covered in ads. There's some taxis crashing in as well. I mean, maybe he didn't pay for it. The scourge on the skyscraper. Oh, look, it's Pauline. Hey. Well, things aren't looking so good. All right, we finally made it. Things don't look so good then. Look. It's Bowser's ship, let's go! You know what the weirdest part about this is that this isn't galaxy. You know, we're not traveling to different universes. This is all supposed to be taking place, I guess on the same planet that the Mushroom Kingdom does. Maybe we'll even get to visit Mushroom Kingdom a bit more. Oh, that's probably. So humans have lived on the same planet as Mushroom Kingdom the whole time? This can't be good. That's a lot of dynamic. What do you think, Mayor Pauline? She's the mayor. Look at you making your way up in the world. How you been? Long time no seen. I'm sorry, but I don't really have the time to chat right now. I need to figure out a way to save my city. Aww. Things have gotten been in utter chaos since uh, the brutish monster showed up. And he has to, and the nerve to, ad, uh, to be advertising this wedding of his all over New Dong City? A bit tasteless, if you ask me. She didn't even recognize us. She didn't even recognize us. Maybe I gotta go change my costume. Maybe if I change back to normal Mario. I don't know, that might be the case. <laughs> Like, she didn't even pay us any money. I know she's concerned, she has an entire city, but she could've done this like, oh, hey, Mario, how have you been? Um. No, there you go. <laughs> so, let us um go back to normal, just like that. And then, no, I wasn't, I wasn't done. <sighs> yeah, that does not match out very well, Mario, I gotta be honest. But yeah, I mean, she just might not recognize. I mean, it's been one. When's the last time Pauline's been in a game? I guess she's been in the Demario and Donkey Kong mini game kind of thing. But like, I mean, in reality, I mean, I'm sure it's, you know, like who knows when those games actually take place. Maybe it really still has been like 30 years since they've seen each other. I don't think she'll have anything new to say then. I could try it then. Oh? Uh, yeah, okay. I think she's taller than she is like in the actual Mario, Mario versus, or the original Donkey Kong game. So is Donkey Kong gonna show up? Oh, cool. Pauline is on the coin. What is this? Uh, what? 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 No. <laughs> no, we're already dead. That is gruesome. We just fall right off the side of the building. And down the 541 coins for like the 80th time. Okay. No dilly dallying this time. We're making our way right over and we got another one of these moon rocks. Lots of strange ha things happening to this city. But yeah, this really changes the lore of Mario. You know, if all this time there have been humans, what have they been doing? What have they been up to? Me heading to the city? Forget about it. I'll do it, don't worry. Me. This city is torn up though. Usually, from what I've seen, it's usually nice and sunny. There certainly are a lot of nasty looking bugs here. Hey, I can say that again. I can't become them, I just have to beat them up. All right, oh, do that, do that, 
Do that. These guys are sinkers. I don't like it. Oh geez, and there's a tank over there with a little hat. <laughs> so I could worry about getting the purple coins later, I guess, um, when things are a little bit more peaceful. Maybe now I should just be focusing on a, a sign of super tacky. You're telling me. Can I not get in here? Yes, I can. Maybe I should just uh, take out what I can and go wherever I'm supposed to go, wherever that is. I'm not really sure. I'm just trying to save the city though. And we could go into the crazy castle. I would rather just focus on saving the city for now. Um, I think that'd be cool. And then we can have a more like dedicated exploring the city episode next time. So I'm sure there aren't like, you know, moons you can get here that you can't get later, because the game just doesn't seem to work that way. But no matter how I know the game works, doesn't mean I can play it well. I'm always gonna be falling off the ledges, aren't I? Let's try again. Oh, way back here, oh, stink. That's fine. It'd be cool if I could become one of the cars. Just become a car and drive around. This place is torn up, though. Yeah, I cannot become a car. That'd be so cool. All right, you know what? I can become a tank, though, because the tank is sentient. Why? I don't know. I don't care. I pressed the wrong button. All right, got you. Oh, the splash damage is great. Okay, don't get hit by that. I'm already on my last bit of health here. I don't like it. There you go. Get rid of these punks as much as I can. Good, good, good. So let me go ahead and do this correctly this time. Hopefully, it's just, it's actually pretty slippery, it feels. You become a Goomba. Goombas definitely have better traction. Oh gosh. Are you gonna plop down here? You don't. I actually don't like that. Um, I love the little construction hat you have down. Gosh darn it. You know what? Fine. I was gonna try to stack them up a little bit. I'm sure that would have been helpful. Oh gosh, we're being shot at again. Shots fired, shots fired. Um. Yeah, if I would have stacked that up correctly, I could have gotten up here. I mean, I might still be able to. Got some health for it, good. Okay, get that health. We have all this traction I wanna keep. I'm sure the tank would have nice traction, though. Oh, wait, wait, there you go. <laughs> oh gosh, alright, behind me. Ah, yeah, get out of here. Oh, there's a moon in there. Cool, once again, I, I feel like I wanna get all the moons and like all that once it's sunny again. I just feel like it would be cooler that way. And I'm really particular about that kind of stuff. Sound. Oh wow, holy cow, we might be causing more damage than we're worth. Uh, Pauline might not be happy to see us. Ooh, we interjected that shot. Oh, look at the little question block street sign, that's cool. Okay, well, uh, let's keep, whoa, 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 okay, lots of tanks. We got lots of competition now. I'm not really doing very well against any of them. Jeez, this is crazy. I love it. Uh, get you guys, this is so much fun though. Like, this is the area I think everybody was looking forward to, is New Dong City, and so far, like, I can see why. It's so cool. Um, there you go. Let me take care of that Goomba up there. <laughs> yeah, there you can by me. It looks like there was only one way to go, really. I was worried that maybe we'd go lost and sort of go the wrong way, but it seems like it's pretty linear right now. Looks like we can go up those stairs. This weekend, it's a fire escape. Luckily, uh, safety is a factor here for uh, New Dong City. Hopefully everybody's hiding in their, build, in their homes. You know how much I'd freak out? I mean, I'm not a human, but you know what? If there is a world in Mario where there's humans, I really hope there's a zebra some here in, somewhere here in Mario World. I always said we're doomed, nobody ever listens to me. The mayor's gonna earn her salary now, and I don't know. Whoa, hey there, little man. You're not with that monster fella, are you? The whole city looks pretty bleak if you ask me, and even if you don't. Okay, I'm concerned too, don't get me wrong. What is, okay, oh, some purple coins. Let me get this checkpoint, because it'll be so much easier to explore the city later and if we do it that way. Um, oh, I guess we're going in here. So what's going on? New Donk City, Hall and Tier. Now, obviously, I'm guessing it's New Donk City, because obviously, the, the relation to, one thing, New York City, and it's obviously a relation to Donkey Kong, and that's where things get interesting. Obviously, in some semblance, Donkey Kong exists in the same world as Mario. Which, if we tie that back into my previous conversation, there have been appearances of zebras in Donkey Kong Country Returns. So if Donkey Kong is in the same world as Mario, clearly, I would hope that unless <laughs> Donkey Kong is an interplanetary traveler and I wasn't aware of it, I'll get these. Um, oh gosh, oh that hurt, that really hurt. Um, unless Donkey Kong is for whatever reason an interplanetary traveler, or interdimensional traveler even. Oh gosh, I thought I was totally done for there. Um, there are zebras in the Mario world. Through the lore of everything, I figured it out. Okay, I'm not doing what I wanted to do there. 
It would take my, my time a bit more, I think. Go like that, jump up. And then if I land on this thing and actually scoot downwards, I get a couple more purple coins. We gotta get 100 of them. I'm not really too surprised that, you know, New Donk City is gonna be a large area. And from what I've seen, is very expansive. I've tried not to see it too much, but it's sort of avoidable in some of the trailers. Okay, there you go. Get some of this. And then let's get up here. Yep, yep, yep. All right, we're doing good. We're doing good. Get it, get it. Okay, good, good, good. No, that's not good. Oh, wait, okay, I realize they're charging at me with one health. All right, get rid of you guys before you turn into bugs. You guys are a little larva, huh? Oh, no. Oh, gosh, I don't like this anymore. This isn't fun. This isn't fun. All right. Oh, just give me some health. Thank you. Is that gonna be a full restore? Yes, it is. Thank you so much. That is good, which probably means we're about to face a boss fight, right? I mean, I thought we saw that. We should have saw it on the building, right? Some crazy looking thing. We're still not high enough? No, we're not. New Donk City, City Hall rooftop. Oh, hey guys. Um, That's not what I want in the game. Like, I'm trying to do the little, I know like, a lot of people would tell me, Zipper, if you you know circle the joystick around and do that, you can do a little circle move, but it's so difficult. A friend of mine went up there to the top of the building. He has not come back. I'm sure, I hope he's okay. Who's your friend? I don't know, we'll find out. Let's get up here and, whoa, look at this place. Okay, uh, whoa. I did see something here and it's not there anymore. It's gone. It's that thing is trying to suck up the beetle, the, the beetle just now, the juice from our city. Weird. What do I do? Um, maybe I could just fight it. Oh, oh, here we go. This thing is creepy. I see what you mean, it really is sucking up all the juice. That's our juice. Don't take it from the people. Oh my gosh, what are we gonna do? This thing is like a million times their size. It's huge. Oh, it's creepy too. Oh gosh, Mario, I hope you know how to fly. There's no way you're surviving this one. Oh, oh, that's a strain on the ankles. Oh, okay, wait, become a tank, become a tank. Yeah. Oh gosh, are we supposed to shoot at him? Of course, that is so cool. Oh, this is awesome. This is a fun boss fight. Let's get rid of this tank too, so he doesn't give me any issues. I'm gonna get rid of his tail a little bit, and there we go. Now we're getting him. Is this our chance? I hope so. Shoot like crazy. Come on. There we go, perfect. Okay, that was good, seemingly, where you're, you're, you're ripping a hole into the dimension, and now you're popping out of here. You are, wow, you're quick. <laughs> I would hope you are with all those little legs. He is just a big old centipede. Okay, so he's popping out here now. Same thing where I can't attack him, doesn't do anything. I gotta wait for him to probably be back onto a wall. So he's heading this way. Yep, yep, oh gosh, watch out. Is there something I can do about this? Maybe I have to hit him like dead, dead on the face. Where does he move this time? Oh no, he's moving back on the wall now. Good, good, good. Okay. Oh geez, what is that stuff? Uh, whoa, okay, it's coming right for me. <laughs> Holy cow. Um, all right, just shoot as many of his little light bulbs as I can. Oh, hit that one at the end, if I can. Got it. Maybe I should hit the front of you, because that's probably not making it easier. Oh gosh, he's invincible. I think it'd be easier to shoot these things away than to actually dodge them, oddly enough. But I mean, I guess that makes sense. Oh no, I didn't get the chance to take him all the way on. That's really tough. Is he gonna come back with all the light bulbs? Ooh, that's difficult. Come on, come back on the wall, or not. Um, oh no, he's going back on the wall. Okay, no, that's good to know, is that his light bulbs aren't all back. Ow, that hurt. How did that not land? He moves so quick. Okay, now he's slowed down. Get those two, get those two. Perfect. Okay, start shooting him like crazy. Go, 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 go. <laughs> he danced around like crazy, was that it? Did we beat him? Oh, he's mad. No, that's it, we got him. Whoa, what a boss fight. Really cool, but really weird. And that's what I like about Super Mario Odyssey. It has both of those things, so there we go. Another boss fight defeated and New Donk City possibly saved. At least for now, at this very moment, and even the rain has stopped. Your weather forecast is uh, a full moon. <laughs> okay, New Donk City's pest problem. Interesting, that was very cool. In a very like weird introduction in New Donk City. Wasn't expecting to be that way, but now it is the dawn of a new day. Much more sunny. A fresh start for the city. Wow, look at this place. And there's Mayor Pauline just chilling out. 
She looks a little concerned still. I mean, I would be too if a gigantic wiggle monster attacked my city. We got rid of that big bug thing and the weather cleared up. But Bowser must have gotten away from the scuffle and we should probably get back to chasing him. We don't have enough power moons, so let's look around the city for some. Can't wait, we've already gotten three moons in this area, apparently. Oh yeah, because it was the multi-moon. Okay, okay, good, good, good. So, uh, good to see folks in the city looking chipper again. What do you have to sign? Mayor Pauline is the bee's knees. I wonder what she's up to now that uh, after the most recent excitement. I'm gonna find out, but before I do, I already see myself a moon in here. How do I get this? There has to be an entrance somewhere. Oh, right here, right here. So this is our first moon. Seems pretty easy to me. Boom! Secret girder tunnel. Now, if I take a look, how many we got? We got 66, actually not too bad. It's, it's still a lot, don't get me wrong. But uh, I thought it was gonna be like our most yet, but I think it's still beaten out by Sand Kingdom, so crazy stuff. I will be going back and exploring other kingdoms soon, trying to catch up on some moons, but for now, it's just so exciting to explore this stuff. Uh, is the mayor back at, at the city hall yet? Uh, press down, you can take a snapshot. I know, lady. This is our first time seeing a lady. We've seen a whole bunch of men, but uh, I mean, besides Pauline. Business lady looking like everybody means business here in New Donk City. We're all, they're all prosperous, like I said before. I think I said prosperous. Maybe, maybe I didn't. Um, okay, I'm just making sure I didn't miss anything. Because we missed a lot of stuff in the last episode because I just wanted to sort of get to the point of the area. And I wanted the more in-depth explore in today's episode. Oh, this is so cool! The Main Street entrance. The mayor sure did ba a, bang a, a bang up job of getting the city running again. I guess she did. I can't become any of the humans because they're all wearing hats, except for this dude. Wait a minute. Ah, oh, I thought I could ride the scooter. Wait, I can! Ha <laughs> look at me, woo! Oh, this is so cool, watch out! I don't, I don't, I don't have my license, I'm a plumber! Oh no, whoa! <laughs> okay, wow, that was awesome! I don't know what I would do if I was just walking down the street, everyone's like, hey, here's Zebra, shouldn't you be in the zoo? Well, of course not, that's prejudice. And then I just see an Italian man, you know, half the height as everybody else, just jumping around, doing some crazy car cartwheel flips. I'll be like, it's a weird day, ain't it? Anyways, talk to you, what's up? <laughs> He's gonna be, this is the moment before he gets a really bad bang in the noggin. What is the secret you're seeking? Uh, I can't tell you, but motor scooter escape. Ooh, it's hiding somewhere, no peeking. Go find it, go find it, call. What is this about? Uh, it's a little screen. The rankings board will allow you to see records from other players worldwide and share your own. Ranking board for what? Okay, after playing Jump Rope Challenge, oh, you can check out the rankings. Hello, jump man, okay, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Faster, oh gosh, I don't like this. I'm getting a little scared. Come on, jump, Mario, jump. You're the best jumper in video game history. You should be able to do this. I wonder how many times Mario's jumped collectively throughout every video game adventure. Probably like trillions of times, okay, maybe not trillions, but definitely in the, a, a good couple billion, right? Okay, there you go. Oh geez, uh, I've totally lost touch on how, ah, oh, I messed it up, you'll get it next time. Do I eventually get a moon for that? I hope not. Uh, back up and give it another try. I just wanna talk to you. Uh, would you like to connect to the network? Sure, I just wanna see how I did. Probably awful. I mean, I didn't really do all that great. Um, but I wanna, I, I'm curious, like maybe there's a certain amount I can reach to get a moon. 429,123 for the world rankings. Uh, for the friend rankings, 69, not bad, hey. All right, I'm comparing with my friends. And that's all I got, okay. Well, what is my best friend rank? Let's give you guys a little bit of a feature. Every one of my friends is a Zebra Herd member. Uh, my friends list has been maxed out since like the first month of Switch launch. Every single one of them is one of you guys, so you might be able to see yourself here. Um, Let's see. Oh, get all the way up here and, wait. Friend rankings, why does it only go up to 20? Maybe I can't see it because I'm not high enough level. I wanted to see who's number one. All right, well, highest I can see is 51 by Campbell, and this guy, I don't know how to pronounce your name, sorry. <laughs> okay, so, oh, look at you jamming up. Mama always said go play outside. Okay, oh, I just ruined his jam. Sorry, didn't mean to do that. Okay, what is this thing even supposed to be? It's like a little bit of modern street art. Wait, what does that say? Um, New Dunk City Festival, music festival, it looks like, under construction. Oh, they're constructing the festival, okay, cool. Lots of people walking around. I like how they sort of become little sprites if you walk away from far enough. Can I become a taxi now that they're alive? Or they're not alive, <laughs> but um, I can't. That's a bummer, I really do want to become one. Whoa, okay, hold on, no, don't honk at me. Honk is, I'm walking in. <laughs> okay, get up here, get up here, get up here. Um, oh, that didn't do anything. But up here, 
We got ourselves a couple more purple coins. I hear the glimmer of a moon, which makes sense because we did, there was one around here before. Oh, okay. How are my kids so good at this? Oh yeah, he's having an easy time. But I can do it for him. Look at this, whoa, whoa, actually this is a little weird. I'm trying to steer and it won't let me. Um, it won't, oh, I'm steering with the wrong one. Okay, never mind. Oh, this is really weird, yeah. I don't know how, yeah, the, how are the kid's so good at this? But it, I don't know, this is so cool that there's like a little track just in the, little, in the middle of the city. Everyone's having a good time. Seems like a fun city, I'd like to visit this place. There we go! You got a moon, remotely captured Karn. Cool. What about you over here, you're looking serious. Um, oh! I feel the spirit of a remote control and you step right in. What is this, like the committee of remote control users? Oh, look at that! Look at this place, super exciting. I don't see how it's even possible to get under 35 seconds. The trick is to not bump into stuff. <laughs> what are you now? Um, and then how am I kids? <laughs> You're the same guy from before. Okay, so let's try to get under 35 seconds, see if we can get ourselves a moon. Three laps though? Maybe it's just, oh, we move quick then. Oh, I love the Mario Kart music. Haha, <laughs> this is so cool. Oh gosh, this, this is a treat. This is like, they do have games like this, I think. Like, um, like little RC car style games like this where you're controlling the car with a stable camera. There's even been Mario Party type mini games with this. Come on now. Come on, I just gotta keep making it. I think we'll be able to clear 35 seconds. Mario is the best. Yeah. I guess he's, nobody knows that Mario is doing it. <laughs> RC car challenge, new record. Nice, right? Our best lap was 8.5 seconds. Beat that world record, boards. You probably did. Hmm. Let's try this. There you go. RC car prone. Cool. So we got a lot of moons to get in today's episode. I'll be doing what I can to get as many of them as possible. And um, oh my. Can I become the trash can? I cannot. Can I become the rat? I want to become the rat. Rat Mario. Oh, he disappeared. I don't want to do that. Whoa, what is this? Whoa. Whenever you see a little question mark on there like that, I definitely got to take advantage of it. Um. Did we just die? <laughs> Did we just fall into the abyss? Whoa, look at this place. A lot of paint down here. Whoa, keeps sort of lagged out. Okay. This is so cool. Oh, I love this, it's a little maze. There are some little piranha plants as well. Um, How do I get this one? Probably not like that. Um, If I just do that, yeah, that's really simple. <laughs> that is, <laughs> okay, do that, there you go. Apparently, some of you will let me know if I sneak behind them, I can actually become them. And there's an extra moon over there. How in the world do I get that? I gotta find a way on top? Yeah. Looks like it, at the least. Um, yeah, now I gotta get around to here. Oh boy, yeah, uh, not happening. Oh. Or maybe when they're yellow. Let's try to get them when they're yellow. Oh, no. I don't know then. Oh, well, doesn't matter too much. Because I can just do that. Land on you. Pretty good, pretty good. Um, I wanna go like this then, and then hit it, and then hit it, and then, okay, that was wrong, but that's right. And get our health back up to five, and then I don't even have to deal with you. So here's the last little piece right here, and I gotta find a way on, okay, I think I can do that. Yeah, I can make my way on top of this thing for sure. Cool, that was a nice little breath of fresh air there. I mean, this whole entire game is a part of the fresh air from Monos, but definitely this was. You know what? It's just like, the city makes me hungry because cities like this remind me of just fast food inside of the rotating maze. So there's one and we're about to get another one. If we, uh, one, two, three, oh, yeah, that was easy. That was easy peasy. Oh yeah, that's right. Somebody thought of a really good pun in the comment section that I just, I keep kicking myself for not thinking of. Somebody, you know, I said easy peasy lemon squeezy, more like easy peasy lemon squeezy. That just has made me smile for a while. And that rhymed too, which also makes me smile. Okay. Uh, What else do we do around here? You got anything to say, lady? Doesn't look like it. Oh geez, what is up there? Why is there a little traffic going over here? Oh, oh, whoa, 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 that's not the way I wanted to go, but I guess I can fling myself with this thing. Whoa, whoa, look at us up here. Top of the world now, right? Well, at least on top of like probably some kind of taxes building. Pay your taxes here. All right. It's crazy how they made a city that, you know, like, 
the city itself, like, I want I don't say it looks boring, but it has like a lot of gray tones to it, a lot of gray and brown. And usually you can't make something that looks like with a lot of gray and brown look this interesting. And it's really just a little touches of color on top of that. Like, you know, this green stands out so much, even though it's a pretty basic green. Um, it stands out so much just because of all the other, you know, lesser colors, I guess. The other, you know, muddy colors. And that's just so cool how they did this. They made a color look, or a, a city look so jubilant. I guess this is a good word for it. All right, let's on. Never mind. Uh, oh, I just barely made that football. See ya, football. Wow, whoa, we're flying. We're flying, holy cow. Wasn't expected to be tossed that far. And there were some purple coins up here. I'm sort of aimlessly running around at this point. I mean, it's hard not to with a big sort of cityscape like this. Oh, you see that? You see that? Which one wasn't? Oh, no, it's none of them. <laughs> it's under it. We get ourselves another moon. Awesome. Who piled garbage on this? I don't know. Oh, this is so cool. I'm not gonna be able to get over it. It's just so awesome being around here. But I do wanna get the objective done. I don't wanna get too out of the way. Ugly, look, look, look at that. I thought we traveled super far. Not really. So let's uh, go across and talk to Pauline. Pauline, how you doing? Long time. <laughs> okay. Hold on, take a moment to take that in. You're the mayor of this city. You're very concerned because it just got attacked. Everyone was in danger. And then you're just sitting here, you know, on your main street, you see this small Italian plumber rolled up in a ball, rolling down the street going, screaming your name, Pauline! <laughs> I would be having a panic attack. Like, what is going on? What is my reality? Hi, Pauline. Hi. New Donk City really means the world to me. I just can't thank you enough for all of your help, Mario. Mm -hmm. So she knew it was us. It's just she didn't really, it was like, hey, long time no see, how you been? Uh, you really must join our, us for our upcoming festival. I'd love to show you my gratitude for both you and the city with a surprise. Do you think you can find me four backup musicians so I could do a small musical number? Something simple. Okay, sure. Can I go inside? I can, this is City Hall, the New Donk City Hall. Oh, the auditorium. So this is where we're gonna have our little, <laughs> good to see this old joint still standing, you're telling me. I don't even know about it and I think it's great. So I guess this might be actually, oh, where we originally saved Pauline from Donkey Kong. Okay, those were just normal coins, but maybe on the other side, there might not be normal coins. I should check. Um, nope, just normal coins. Okay, I was gonna say, there were some, there would be some pretty well hidden purple coins if that was the case. Um, If that's the case, that's really cool. You know, that she got saved from the city and you know became the mayor. Maybe she was already the mayor. Yes, indeed, even over the rhythm of the city, I heard you two talking. Been a while since I was able to be a part of this, of this city's festival, been a long while. If she'll have me, you'll tell you'll tell the big lady that it'd be my pleasure to join her on stage. Yeah. Oh, cool, and they give us just a moon. Okay, cool. There's one of them down. Drummer on board. So we got a drummer. I know where our guitarist is. Maybe we could find a lead singer somewhere. We gotta find four people then. Oh. You were able to recruit a musician. This is so exciting. Thank you. We still need three more for the festival. If you find anyone else, send them my way. Everybody's already so excited. Look at all these people. This is so fun. Okay, so let's head out and try to find more. Where can we find some more musicians, huh? Oh, oh, there's definitely one. So they definitely still have the glow. Let's get across to here. And get this. Oh, it's a piece of this thing. Seeing a trash like this makes me feel kind of bad for it, but only kind of. Not at all for me. And the thing, the mayor had once had a really special handbag, but she lost it all. I've always felt a kinship with birds. Cool. What's with the serious face, pal? Wait a sec, yeah, I heard about you, little man. You're on a musical mission for the mayor, right? Don't sweat it, say no more. For all that she's done for the city, I'm down. Oh, you're the bassist. Cool. So we found a bassist to jam out with? It'd be cool if I, well, you know what? She's the vocalist, bassist on board. Yeah, Pauline's the, the vocalist, so I guess we're not looking for that. Maybe we could find somebody to play the triangle. I think Mario would be a mean triangle player, or, oh, he would tear it up with a cowbell. <laughs> or maybe, you know, they just have somebody who claps. You know, they, I don't think enough bands have a resonant clapper. Um, right now, nobody gets in here but the building inspector, and it's obvious from that setup that you're wearing that you're not the, oh! Are we gonna get a Super Mario Maker costume and be able to get in there? That is so cool. So how are we getting over there? I don't know, but there is a little rocket ship. Looks like we need a green pipe. Try to keep in, keep that in mind. All right, excuse me, taxi. I'm walking in. 
I don't care if this is the street. Um, let's just get somewhere high up. I think that's gonna be helpful. I mean, I know where the guitarist is, but <laughs> Cranky Street, hold on, or a Cranky Street, an Espresso Street. I mean, an Espresso Street, I don't really get too much, but Cranky, Cranky Kong. We got Dixie Street too, a lot of Donkey Kong references. So obviously they exist in this world. Um, so there's a the guitarist. Let us go ahead and recruit you as well. Hello. Hey, what's up, Fred? You looking for, you looking to score an autograph? Say, I've heard about you. They're going around getting musicians to play with the mayor for the festival. I got that right. Uh, well, for the gig rates the mayor pays, I'm definitely in, and uh, you know, Civic Pride in New Dong City, New Dong for life and all that too. All right, sometimes, you know, it's all about the money. I can respect it. We all got bills to pay. Yeah. Guitarist on board, cool. See, I don't know what, maybe a keyboardist. Oh, probably. Okay, let's talk to you again. The preparation for the festival are going are all going smoothly and it looks like you're actually putting together a band for us. We just need one more musician. Do you think you could get one more to join us? I'll, I'll try. Where could that one more be? I need to get somewhere up high. That way I can maybe look down and try to find out that way. Or maybe I'll just happen to run into them. Maybe I could, uh, well, I already have some. Let's see, outdoor cafe, rooftop garden. Let's try this one. That seems like it could be pretty high up. Maybe, maybe not. We'll find out together, me and you. Okay, yeah, this is plenty high up. But not, you know, obviously some building's getting away, but hey, there you are. All right, small world. Let me uh, get this way. Whoa, okay, not quite the way I wanted to go, but it, it happened that way. How in the world am I getting up there? Very good question. I think I'm gonna get, use, of course, more of these little cones, but I just don't see any cones around here. Or any cones in a way where I can get up easily. We'll try to figure it out. Get up here. Uh, no, Mario, come on. Oh, Mario. Mario, Mario, Mario. <laughs> Mario, Mario, Luigi, Mario. Okay, so, gotcha. Oh gosh, oh, just barely made it. Oh, you're a saxophone player. That is so much cooler than all of my ideas. Hello. What brings you all the way up here, groovy hat man? Oh, you like my hat, thank you. One sec, are you are you the one looking for cats to play with the mayor? You are. You tell me the mayor anytime, any, or you tell the mayor anytime, any place. I wouldn't miss our festival for the world. Yeah, cool. So there are four musicians and four moons to accompany them. Trumpeter on board. Trumpeters? Really? Trumpeter? That's interesting. I didn't know that. That's all the musicians we need. Thanks. I'm amazed at your persistence. You should consider running for public office. <laughs> Mario for mayor, huh? I love it. They're playing the Mario theme. Now I just need to figure out this other problem. See, the underground power plant seems to be out of commission. We need that thing to supply power uh, to the festival. I don't suppose you're familiar with underground work, are you? Are you kidding me? Do you not even know us? I'm guessing that maybe Pauline and Mario don't have as close of a relationship as I thought. Maybe he just happened to save her one time and they don't really know each other too well. And, all right then, um, there's nothing too else interesting there. We got a whole crowd of people now just jamming out though, it's great. Oh, right over here, okay, awesome. Whoop, whoop, whoop. What's up? Let me ask you something. How am I supposed to inspect that power plant and nobody can get this manhole cover off? I can do it, don't worry. We're nice and strong. <laughs> and, and we're also actually the manhole cover. Can I just play the whole game as a manhole cover? Well, how would you do that? Don't tell him, don't ask. I won't tell you. Because uh, it's too much power for one one person more than Mario. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Underground power plant, look at this place. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, I'd be freaking out in there too, holy cow. You'd think that this would have happened sooner though. You know, with how long this this place has been around in the Mario world. Okay, let's get some easy coins here. I have almost 800 coins, I am definitely bouncing back. I haven't found a crazy cap just yet, but I hope we do find one soon. So I'm gonna guess that this area probably has more than one power moon in it. I'm not really sure though. Okay, let's um, yeah, dodge that if I can, and then land on you. And then let's get across. You know what it was? Some people didn't tell me that I had to be facing a different way. It said if they already have something in their mouth, I can then become them. Okay, that makes more sense. There we go, that was good. I gotta remember I can shake the Joy-Con and that'll give me the, um, ow. 
the ability to, you know, auto aim basically. <laughs> Ouch, that was dumb. That was dumb of me. That wasn't just like, you know, dumb in general. Got it, okay. Um, That is all the wrong way. What are you doing? Okay, sometimes the auto aim isn't the best, but it's doing what it can. This area is so cool, I'm having so much fun with this. Okay, Um, yeah, I just can't become the rats. It would be so much fun if you could. Now on. Look at all this momentum. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, I'm scared. Wait, what is up here? Oh, I told you there's more than one moon. This is the sewer treasure. I didn't think you could find anything, you know, treasurable in a sewer, but look at all this graffiti. It's weird seeing Mario in like a real life sewer. It's like some kind of weird fan game. It really feels like it sometimes, but like in a good way. Also, there was some, wait, I wanna read that graffiti about Bowser. Bowser and Peach, Royal Wedding. Oh, it's probably made by Bowser, one of the goons. <laughs> How did she get down here? She's quick. You think that if she could get down here so easily, she'd get the power to stop it. I wanted to get that first hand look at the problem down here at the power plant. Well. Looks like that monster's friends need to be taught a new donk lesson. I'll be glad to teach him it. Okay. There you go. Boom. Nice. So let's get rid of you as well. Yeah, that was a little wonky, but we made it work. And there you go. There's a the moon. So this was the issue with the power plant, now solved. Let me get these coins first, because I need them. There you go. And perfect. So there's yet another moon for us, and that's actually one of the event moons, so something should be changing up now. Powering up the station. Awesome. So that's going to, ooh. Very cool. Everybody's so happy about it. <laughs> Time to fire it up. You betcha. Boom. So now the power plant should be going in. Wow, look at this thing. Classical ingenuity. Whoa, look at all those power moons. Wait, I need those. This ain't good. They're taking the life out of the power moon. Thank you, Mario. Now that you've <laughs> powered up the city, it's time for the festival to begin. What's with the ahem? Now we can finally kick off the festival in style and power, shall we? Oh hey, would you like to participate in the festival? Turn up your alley. Sure. That's awesome. Great, I know you'll do us proud. Wait, do, do, does Mario get to sing? I wanna hear Mario sing the theme song. A traditional festival. What is going on? Oh, it's the theme Ladies song. and gentlemen, welcome to the New York City Festival. A celebration of the history of our city. And now, to get things started, her honor, Mayor. Wow! That is so cool! Wow, look at this place! I'm like blown away right now! Oh my gosh! I don't know the lyrics to the song. Yeah, I don't know it. Do, do, do I know how it goes? Like, I don't know how the music is. Jump, man, jump! Everybody loves Mario now. No, I don't know it. Um, okay. Wait, how do I get up this? Oh no, I'm, press, I'm pressing the, the buttons, not the joystick. I keep forgetting that. This is so cool! Oh my gosh, jump! Whoa! So there's probably plenty of moons to find around here. Well, this is so cool, it's like a part of the performance. So I guess this is how we do this level, and if we ever want to do it again, we'll have to probably well, let me hopefully do well enough so that I don't have to do it multiple times. Okay, do that, and then get all of this. Ooh, 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 awesome. Paulina is so cool, by the way. She is like super duper awesome. Like, I mean, I'm not the kind of person that's like, oh, I want Mario to be with Peach or Pauline. Like, you know, Mario can choose that himself. But um, Pauline is very, very cool. Whoa, look at this. We're, we're going Sonic the Hedgehog up in here. Awesome. I don't understand how these people's, you know, understanding of how physics works aren't, it isn't like totally broken. But obviously, you know, this is a big reference to how Donkey Kong has been a part of this world. I really hope that Donkey Kong shows up somehow. That'd be so cool. Oh, what is up here? Some kind of secret. <laughs> I made the little Donkey Kong level up noise. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, so here's another one. How to see, how to see. I know that part. A celebrating in the streets. Whole crowd is excited. Just waiting around hoping that he shows up over here. That's cool. Mario is such a superstar, ain't he? Uh, let's get back up there. 
Oh gosh. Oh, oh no. I forgot which gravity we were in. Awesome. Now let's keep going this way. We can have a bunch of coins. Oh my gosh, I'm having so much fun with this. Whoa, whoa. Nice, there's so many coins. There were over a thousand coins down. Haven't been that. Oh, hey, there's Donkey Kong. Hey, that's so cool, main man. Um, let's wait for that, and then boop, boop, and then, oh gosh, that might have been a mistake. The DK right now on the coins. All the people in the city so happy. So they don't mind Donkey Kong, even though he was sort of a guy who terrorized their city, just like the bug. Will they have a, will they have a festival about the bug at some point? Or maybe, you know, they've made amends with Donkey Kong somehow. I really hope Donkey Kong shows up like in his like modern day form, like here he is now. But I think this is supposed to be like, you know, it's supposed to get the idea that this is like a light show. You know, it's not actually Donkey Kong, ow. Um, let me get that health back. Luckily, it's not as difficult as the actual Donkey Kong, because that is usually ridiculously difficult. There you go, sorry DK, you're out of here. <laughs> awesome. Hello. How are y'all doing? Everybody's so happy. All right, we made it. Thank you again, Mario. I'm dedicating this festival to you. We couldn't have done it without your help. Please accept this as a gift. Ha <laughs> ha, look at that. We get even another multi-moon. All right. Even get a custom little jingle. That was the coolest thing, a traditional festival. Definitely traditional for a Mario fan. So three more moons for us, that's fantastic progress. I mean, this way we were probably just about ready to, um, what's it called, move on to a next kingdom if we wanted to, but I don't quite wanna do that. Okay, so everything's back to normal, but I guess I could go back and out in case I need more. I definitely want to, but at the same time, I do wanna explore some other stuff as well. And, uh, we don't have enough power moons yet, so we're, we're almost there then. Look at this view, and I wish I had a camera. I mean, it is a good view, I wouldn't give you that much. It looks like we have some purple coins over there on the island. Hmm, I keep on thinking this is gonna be a power moon, but it ain't, it just gives you coins. Okay, well, what more can we do around here? Is that it? Like, I guess there's not many other events around here. Obviously, there's going to be more to do, but event-wise, I guess that's about it. I can talk to you guys, Uncle Amiibo and uh, Hint Toad. All right, so um, let's buy a hint. Let's just for the heck of it. Yourself over a thousand coins. I still definitely want to find, um. okay, what is that one? Interesting, and we also never took a, took a look at the brochure here. So let me do that as well. Of course, New Dong City, the city that never leaps. Never leaps, huh? Instead of never sleeps, of course. But uh, doesn't really make too much sense. Uh, New Dong City Hall and Mayor Pauline. Uh, fun tidbit RC cars, yeah, we know about them. Three keys to the kingdom, Appreci appreciate the constant power moon based progress and development. Visit those welcoming souls who just leave their doors wide open. Participate in the citywide festival if you can. Schedule, subject to change. Scooting across town, tougher than it looks. Uh, always be constructing. Crazy Cat flagship store, yeah, where is that? I'm gonna try to find the flagship store. Oh, it's right there. Okay, cool, maybe we did find it, I just decided not to get I think we found it when it was raining. That might be the idea. You're not from here, are you? Hi, hi, you again! Oh yeah, we met in the Sand Kingdom, remember? Or don't you, I remember. Either way, need to be, need to bump into you. Best part of travel, the people you meet. Here's a gift, friend. Hey, look at that, easy one. A tourist in the Metro Kingdom. Uh, I've seen some sights. Take me to a new place. I'd like to see a waterfall. Big one, biggest ever. Cascade Kingdom. No problem. I'll get I'll get you there in a jiff. Just gotta get the mayor's autograph and we're out of here. Cool. You mean you're not from here? You wanna you haven't gotten the mayor's autograph in the past? I mean maybe just travels lots. So we have collected enough power moons now. Let me just go to the uh, the cat area. But maybe we'll go to Cascade Kingdom and see if he's there. Um Come on into the original Crazy Cap Store. Cool. And I can go to either which one. Cool. Okay, it's easy enough just to walk across like that. Let's check the yellow store first. Hello. Welcome. Hey, we got some great new swag to sell you. Oh, do you? Ooh, look at that. That is dapper. We got a black suit. You can wear this outfit just about anywhere. It always looks good. We can blend in with the city a little bit more. Nice, okay. Um. You can use the closet to change. And we also got, hold on, what does this say? 
Black Fedora, perfect for business, business casual, casual or casual businesses. Awesome. And then finally, we'll buy that moon. That one's pretty easy, change now. No, I didn't want to, oh well, I'm gonna be changing again in a moment anyways, I think. And then um, this power moon. Thanks. So there we go. Awesome, awesome stuff, we get another power moon. Awesome, shopping in New Donk City. <laughs> that looks so silly, that's why. Let's go here and start buying some stuff from you as well. Hello, lady. Uh, builder, how I was right, look at this. Whether you're building or inspecting, you gotta keep your head safe. That all you wanted? Or that this is what you wanted, okay, yeah. And then we'll equip that, because we can go and do that right now. The builder helmet is really gonna work on you. The builder outfit, the perfect outfit, whether you're constructing or inspecting the construction work of others. Sure. And then we got some other stuff as well, I guess because of all the um, purple coins we can get in this area, we also have the golf cap and the golf outfit, which is very American. I wanna call it, I guess I just don't wanna call it American because I don't know if this, this is technically American. Um, Metro Kingdom sticker, sticker inspired mayor by Mayor Pauline, New Dunk City Hall model, Pauline statue. Very cool. We'll get all that stuff, of course, in due time once we get all the purple coins in this area. But for now, we're good to go. So now what? Um, good question. Let us, maybe, we'll, we'll do one more thing. To just enjoy this area a bit more, we'll go wherever, ow. We can go to get, oh, is this? K. Rule Avenue, I like that. Um, we'll go over, we have to go to get into this room. I think this is it, yep. Hello, I can get one side now, right? Right now, nobody gets in there except for the building instructor. Ah, I see by your uniform that you're the building instructor I was waiting for. All right, please step right in, sir, I will. You better not doubt it. If you ever doubt me again, I'm gonna fire you. So quick, it'll make your head spin. I'm not gonna do that. Mario's a nice guy, I don't think he'd fire anybody. Oh my. Uh, this looks a little scary. Yeah, that's actually really weird how that works. Because you just sort of travel in a straight line, you have to hold the joystick wherever you want it to go. Okay, which way am I supposed to go? What is this about? Whoa. Holy cow. <laughs> with the clouds just perfectly level with this area. This is a really tall building. Sort of intimidating. Um, go. Oh, you just gotta time that right, huh? Okay, well this wasn't even the way we are supposed to go. Lots of coins for it though. I mean, I'll gladly take them. I just also wanted to, you know, go the correct way. I still don't know about this stuff. Oh! Okay, I still don't really exactly know how I did that. But, good enough, right? Um, okay, hold on, hold on. There you go, and then one more. Gotcha. I gotta be careful in this area. You never know uh, where there might be purple coins or on um, moon showing up. Whoa, whoa, can I get, can I hop out there? I mean, I bet I can, just like that. And what's, oh, here we go. Talking about moon showing up. I think this might be one. Oh, wrong one. Yeah, okay, there we go. There's another pretty easy moon. And that is off the beaten wire. Cool. I should be able just to plop down from even here. Yep. Wee! Oh gosh, hold on. No, I wanted to do the spin. There you go. That's the sign telling us to go this way, obviously. I know to go this way. Oh gosh, we gotta go. Oh, oh, these are little multi-moons. Not multi-moons, but moon medallions, I wanna call them. Okay, we got it, we got it, we got it, we got it, yes. Go! Oh, without getting a single hit, fantastic. So there's another moon. It looks like those are probably the two moons we can get. Okay, cool. No purple coins in here at all, though. All right, and what is that one called? Rewiring the neighborhood. Did we, we really didn't rewire it. We didn't do anything worthwhile on that. <laughs> we just sort of rode the wire. Okay, cool. And is that it? Looks like it. So there you go, two power moons for that. Very, very fun. Let us get out of the Metro Kingdom, New Donk City, and move on to something else. I don't think I want to move to a new kingdom just yet. We will get a bit of a taste test on what our next kingdom will be for next episode. But more importantly, I think it'd be cool just to get some cleanup duty as we normally do throughout these episodes. I'm doing the wrong thing. Okay, so, we got like what? At least 10 here. So we are closing in 150 moons. We have a lot more to go now, don't we? All right, it's tallying up. On to 158. The Odyssey has powered up. Very cool. Okay, so that means we can go to a new kingdom where that new kingdom would be, would be. Uh-oh, we've hit a proverbial fork in the road. Which kingdom do you want to go to? The Snow Kingdom 
or the Seaside Kingdom. So I get we get we guess I get guess we get to choose now. Well, we've been to already the Lake Kingdom, so maybe it'd be a little bit more interesting if we do the Snow Kingdom. The Snow Kingdom, a splendid idea. We won't be going there right now. So we're going all the way back to the Cascade Kingdom. Oh, look at that! <laughs> He's right over here. Okay. It's me, it's me, your friend from, well, the Sand Kingdom, but also the Metro Kingdom. I'm the I'm the taxi guy, I mean, he's the taxi guy, but I'm the guy riding the taxi. Here, gift for you. Cool, he just has plenty of these. So there is another one of these, a tourist in the Cascade Kingdom. And then what else? Um, I'm up for a bite, some neat eats, yummy grub, major meals, and no place like that. Oh, that little gourmet kingdom we ran into for just a little bit. And in the perfect place, we'll be there in a flash once I get a chance to pet one of these giant metal pooches they got here. Cool. How does he drive to these places? Like, how'd he get here, <laughs> by the way? Um, now some people were commenting telling me to climb this pole. I feel like I already have. Yeah, I already have. I mean, there ain't too much on going on here. I mean, or was it they wanted me to climb it or get the dinosaur to take it out? I can't actually remember. Uh, maybe we'll, we'll try to get the dinosaur back over here then. I mean, we've already had the dinosaur take care of that one bone and maybe people are getting confused, but we'll try it. I mean, I'm getting really close to getting everything here. We have 20 out of 25. The rest of the stuff is real darn difficult though. I can tell you that much. I mean, maybe some of it just simply hasn't shown up yet. But I'm, I'm not too certain. So I'm gonna go and try to find out. See, people told me to destroy this pole, I think, and then like, maybe butt stomp around here. I don't even remember exactly where where it is, so I don't think that's gonna be something. Maybe it was a different poll, maybe I'm just getting confused. I don't know. For now though, I think that's all we can do in this kingdom. I really do think that maybe there's a way to unlock more things. So I don't see what else we could do around here. Either way, 159 instead of 158 now, fantastic. Let's go on to a different kingdom. I really wanna go to Cap Kingdom, but not today, not today. Um, Sand Kingdom, I think there's definitely more we could finish off there. And, what the kingdom for sure? Hmm. I think we, we definitely need to go somewhere we haven't gone too much. I feel like that's, that's a wooded kingdom. I feel like for the size that it is, there's still a lot more we can accomplish here. So let's get some more wooded kingdom in. Okay, so did we ever buy stuff from this? I don't think we did. I really don't think we did. Well, we get to now. Spend money. I know. Explorer hat, just because the territory is uncharted doesn't mean that you ha your head should be uncovered. Uh, is this a desired selection? Yeah. Thank you for your coins. <laughs> He's so happy. All right, we'll change now. You'll wear the Explorer hat immediately. Excellent. Explorer outfit, clothes that keep you comfortable even in the deepest heart of the wilderness. Is this a desired selection? Of course it is. Silly robot. And whoa, look at this. They're like a Professor Oak costume over here. Um, scientist visor, a strange piece of headwear that gives a, off a sciencey vibe. I, I would, do they, does this mean that there's like two secret areas relating to clothing? We'll keep the Explorer stuff for now. We got the scientist outfit, what did it say actually? It said, it's a scientific hat that nothing says scientist like a lab coat. Okay, interesting. Get this desired selection. Thank you for your coins. And then I'll leave the rest of the not so necessary stuff for later, even if we do have enough coins to buy some of it. Um, yeah. Oh, did I, whoops, okay. Is there a closet around here or no? I don't think there is. I don't think there is at all which is weird. All right, well, I'll just go back to the Odyssey and change that really quickly because we're in the wrong doodads. What is this about? There's another, ooh, another one of these. Maybe I could get that. I know there was one nut that was, you know, that we used one of those times over here to grow that, but in this room, maybe that's still over here? Let me check that out. Uh, many of us are busy watering, I can see that. Yeah, this guy can give me a nut, doesn't he? If he's still here, he is. Uh, pull lever to, okay. Awesome, let's go ahead and bring the seed over there. That might actually be very fr fruitful, or seedful. <laughs> uh, many of us are busy watering, I see that. I'm not trying to bother you. I mean, I know you're so excited to tell me about your own. Uh... <laughs> look at his flips that he could do while holding on to this thing. It's very acrobatic, but I think we all already knew that. He looks so cool with the little backpack too, that's my favorite thing about this. Um. Oh, is that just a shortcut? I mean, even if it is, that's still pretty cool. It is just sort of a shortcut, but it's a useful shortcut, for sure. Um, I don't see too much else going on around here. I haven't really thoroughly explored. Oh, Slingshot. Ah, that's another shortcut for me, cool. 
I mean, I don't really need it too much because, of course, um, I could have just teleported, but... Can I get up here? I've already gone way up there, so if I could just land on the platform or not. Okay. Oh, I tried. Go, 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 go. It's so cool running around the little explorer's outfit. There you go. So there's still more we can explore. Iron Mountain, past Station 8. Because we got all the way to this point, and then we went into there and we did some things. There's another seed giver guy. Maybe there's a place to place seeds. Oh. And there's a pipe somewhere, I'd imagine. Hmm. Oh, what's a little peace switch block? Uh. Oh my! Uh, pathway engaged, such as it is. Okay, whatever that's supposed to mean. Uh, oh, yeah, we made it, look at that, okay. Got a new thing here. Oh, hey, look, it's the glider guy. Flying, 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 scree! Oh, we gotta get up here with a seed. That's gonna be a bit more of a challenge now, ain't it? All right, let me start rolling. No, roll, roll, roll. That's not what I, I'm pressing the wrong buttons, that's the problem. Okay, interesting. Give me a seed. I don't know what we're gonna be able to do with this seed, but hopefully something awesome. Well, I mean, I know what we're gonna be doing. I just don't know the thing it sprouts from the seed. I don't know what it's really gonna do for me. Probably just bring me higher up into the air, but beyond that. So I can just jump this, hopefully. I do like how there's no run button in this game. It's either full speed or not. I mean, I guess it depends on how much you press onto the joystick, but in general, yeah, it's like full speed. So you don't have to worry about you know holding things and pressing the run button at the same time. It's not too complicated. He said yes when he actually missed. <laughs> yes, I missed. I wanted to see if I was perfect or not. Gosh darn it. Um. Jeez, I can't do that for the life of me. Took me a while, didn't it? Okay, what is up this thing? Whoa, we're going somewhere. That's for sure, look at it go. It just doesn't stop. Whoa, we're going to like the top of the dome. What in the world? Is the camera not gonna, oh, there we go, it's like a teleport. Hey, look at us! Oh, I love it! Classic tunes. Oh, that is so cool, I love this song. This is a song I know a lot more than the theme song. <laughs> There's no lyrics either, so it's hard to mess up. Oh, and some purple, not coins. So I only need 20 more left and then we're good. Okay, so I definitely, I actually wanna be tall here. Okay, I see. That makes sense. All right, get as many coins as I can. Go, go, go. Get all that. Yep, yep, yep. And then I gotta wait. Oh, wait, 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 before I do. Grab that. Yeah! Above the clouds. This is quite the view. At least it was. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, oh, gosh, oh, gosh. That was scary. I almost missed it. You wanna get one more? Good. Yeah! Walking on the clouds. Awesome. Ah! <laughs> There we go, we did it! Two more moons for us, that was really cool. How many moons are in this area, by the way? Um, 54, and we're at 30, so we're more than halfway there, fantastic. So that was that for that, but I'm not quite done, as you can see. We could maybe get across to there and, and do some things, but flying, 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 fly, scree -hee. We could just go across to there. I think that's our main goal, and that's what the game wants us to do, and what I'll gladly do, so let's just go. Oh boy, I'm a little nervous, son. I don't know what this pipe is gonna bring us. I am pretty curious about that as well. Ooh, nose dive. Ah, so you're just a uh, Captain Toad, right? Uh, looks like it. Hooray, hi Captain Toad. Uh, Node, Captain Toad. I'm not sure how I got here, but it's great. Such a nice view and fresh air. Oh, and I found this power moon. Would you like it? Sure. Yay. Okay, you got a moon. Look at how happy he is in the background. He's like, yeah, I was a part of this adventure. Looks so nice over there too. Yeah, I agree. Which, I feel like we've been to parts of that area, but not all of it. I'm trying to figure out which one. I'm not sure. Where does this pipe bring me? Oh, all the way back up? All the way back up, which would be great if the little, oh yeah, he is. I was gonna say if the little scree guy here is back, and he is. Awesome, so I wanna be able to glide and like turn around a little bit if I can. Um, Cause I think I've been there, but I don't think I've been here. Maybe I have been here. We're about to find out. Um, yep, okay, I've already found this one, which sort of stinks. I might wanna go back up to the top then, which is right here, observation deck, and try the other one. I'm pretty sure I found that one as well, though. 
I'm almost positive. But you know, like, what else can we do around here? There's surely more. And we still have 24 more moons to find. I'm just trying to, you know, sort of scout out from up here and what might be easier to do. Especially when I'm not 100% familiar with everything just now. I mean, I think I've been there. and I think I can go ahead and try to find something else. Um, oh gosh, I gotta remember to hold the button. Yeah, I do wanna get across to here, and if I can. This is where that boss fight was, but more importantly, oh, oh, purple coins. I could get across to here, and quite an easy way to do this one. Don't think it was the way I was supposed to, but it's the way I'm doing it. Boom. Cracked nut on a crumbling tower. This is where we were supposed to take that flower path, I believe. I mean, I, I probably still wanna eventually take it, you know, to make sure I don't miss any of these bad boys. Oh gosh, oh gosh, that's so not cool. That is so not cool. Oh, come on. Out. <laughs> There's a little bit of an insult to injury right at the end. Why'd I do that? Come on, that was stinky. Let's try that again. Just get that, oh, I'm way back here now. All right. So normally what I would do is come down here and, and then butt slam this if I can or not. And there's clearly something over there and something I've already explored though. I'm almost positive. And this is what we messed up with last time. And there's also a slingshot, maybe just to make that whole situation easier. But my goal is to go this way because I never went this way last time. Um, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Come on, Mario, quickly get up there. And then get up here. And then I just need to snag that one purple coin. <laughs> 84 out of 100, 16 more left to find. So we, we now have, uh, excuse me, my voice is dying. Um, we now have that moon. We don't have this. This might be helpful. Or this is gonna bring me in a circle. Oh, okay. No big deal then. So what is this doing? All the way up here. No, too far, too far, too far, too far. Oh, come on, I didn't want that. I don't want that one bit. Get back up here, Sky Garden Tower. That might be easier. And I just gotta grab those four purple nut coins. For sure, for sure. Um, and what else can I do around here? Not too much, I don't believe. Uh, but it's always worth, ooh, if we could get a seed here. And I don't know how we're doing that, but that might be quite the challenge. Get a couple more of these. Yeah, how in the world are we getting a seed here? Like, I mean, maybe that's where we wanna bring the slingshot into play. Ooh, whoa, look at us way out here, huh? Oh gosh, can I land on this? I can, so I wanna go out here. Oh gosh, I'm not gonna make it. Oh well, I tried. <laughs> we just kept falling. We just didn't stop. So where I wanna go now is I wanna, um, I wanna go to this one, I think. Forest changing or something. Forest changing something, something. And we can get to see from the guy and then run all the way back. Maybe there's a closer seed? Uh, this device can be used to protect all small flowers. Okay. I don't know exactly what I'm looking at here. I mean, I can hop on top of him. Oh. Uh, I mean, I've already gone up there for that. Now, these guys are freaking out. Oh, look at you. You're new. You weren't here before. That's why it's worth re-exploring all this stuff. Cool. So, oh, oh. Platform's leaving without me, I don't like it. Get across to there and then, oh, yes, 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 yes. Oh gosh, oh gosh, yeah! What did Kingdom Timer Challenge, oh, we didn't find Timer Challenge one, so that's a bit of a problem. Hmm. I wonder where that could be. But for now, it's not the most of my concern. I'm actually not even in the right location I wanted to be at. I, mean, I think it's just like right below though, so I don't think I should have a problem yet yeah, jumping off. And, oh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh, that was as close as it gets. That was almost a huge mistake. All right, uh, oh, now, oh, you know what, I actually did timer challenge one already, now I remember. So we can get Yoon. Wait, you don't have any more seeds to give? Darn, then there must be another seed giver around here. Hmm, wonder where that could be. You know what, maybe that wasn't a thing for a seed, maybe that's where these guys just pop out. Yeah, that might be it then. And if that's the case, then I don't really know if there's too much more I can really do around here. And I mean, I could go to Talkatoon. Let me uh, plop down like that. Go back here and let's talk to Talkatoon. Maybe he can help me out here. Hi, Talkatoon. Can I talk to you? I can. By the babbling brook in deep woods. All right. Well, I think I know where that is. The, the deep woods is this part. So if we go back here and I'll try looking for that, and if not, maybe that's where we'll finish it off. I mean, I think at this point, maybe I should just start focusing on going to New Kingdom, but to New Kingdom, you know? 
the same time, it is always so much fun to explore. I mean, I, I know I'll eventually get to it. So the babbling brook, I would imagine, is... Oh, okay, cool. Kicking rocks, not what I was really looking for. But this part, right? By the babbling brook. Hmm. I mean, it doesn't definitely seem to be babbling. Maybe I could just... Hmm. I don't know. Maybe there isn't too much I can actually do. We can go up here and see if there's any other kind of uh, babblingness happening up here. But uh, I'm not entirely sure. Uh, oh gosh, I just fell. Oh no. What? Whoa, 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 what? Wait, what? Wait, there's stuff down here? There's stuff down here? I've been missing it the whole time? This is Deep Woods. What? There's been stuff down here the whole time I didn't know. Wow. Oh, poor guy, he's been down here too, isn't he? I am providing security for this vault. I was told to only permit explorers inside. Excellent, you are cleared for exploration duty. Enjoy the mysterious unknown. Holy cow, there's so much more of a dynamic to this place than I thought. I wouldn't have known if I just wanted to, you know, avoid dying. It wasn't a dingus. I was just getting, to be honest with you, I was looking at my phone. <laughs> but, um, exploring for treasure. Holy cow. Well, what an interesting happenstance. What else can we find down here? Um, we can talk to, oh, you're another seed giver. Put the lever to receive a seed. Ah, wait, throw that over there, or not. Um. So what is this thing gonna do? I'm gonna probably, probably just bring us back up. I'm curious, so we'll stay on the top of it for now to see where it brings us. And I'll probably plop back down because I'm really curious to explore more. Holy cow, what a discovery right at the end. Okay, right up here. Oh, and then it retracts. Oh, that's sort of boring. I want it to stay there forever. I'm gonna beat you down there, that's for sure. Because I'm excited to explore more. Okay. What more can we do then? I mean, I sort of immediately explored the right side. Maybe now I should need to explore the left. Oh, wow. Some stones, maybe there's another tank down here. And is that a little Christmas tree? Also, did I ever go into the place with the... Yeah, I did, it was a treasure chest, I was gonna say. Oh. <laughs> I can be a tree? Look at me, I'm a tree. I'm getting tired. I can't travel too far from my roots, I guess. All right, that was cool. I had the experience being a train. Beneath the roots of a moving train. Yeah, you know, like I said, you can't travel too far from your roots, can you? Oh, oh, there's a dinosaur. What is there a dinosaur down here for? Oh gosh, you're not nice either. Um, run, run, Mario, run! Oh gosh, no, this is a lot worse when he's not peacefully sleeping. Can I get rid of his hat? Oh gosh, he is not nice. I can't really get rid of his hat. I can't do it. Oh no. No, 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 become a tree, become a tree. It's more peaceful when I'm a tree. He doesn't care, he's mad. He is out for blood right now. We gotta get out of here. We gotta get out of here. Now, now I know why it's deep woods. What? I'm so sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Oh gosh, we only need nine more. He left me hurting. Oh, he's back. We need to be careful. This is why we're an explorer. All right, he's moving down that way. I wanted to see he ever get tuckered out. Clearly he must, because these blocks are destroyable by a T-Rex. Maybe I could throw this at him. Oh, wait, is this actually a glowy rock that didn't start glowing until I attacked it? Because that's sort of super bogus if that's the case. Come on, come on, come on. I think this is actually one. Yeah, there it is, cool. That was sort of bogus zone. A rolling rock in the deep woods. Or maybe that it can be any kind of rock. It just happened to be the one I started rolling. Like it'll just give it to you depending on which rolling rock you start attacking. What's over here? Okay, this is another way out. Not really interested in that. I wanna stay in. No matter how dangerous it may be, it's for the sake of adventure. So many different, you know, block spots. Ooh. Okay, first off, over here. Can I bud this flower? Not quite. But I can, but stomp here. Or not. Oh, oh gosh, it was an attack. It was an attack. Maybe I should've just gave up on try number two. <laughs> okay, got him. But what about, 
You, Mr. Scarecrow, what can I get done with you? Where's that? Oh, the context isn't very clear. Um, hold on, what's in that? Wait, okay, just coins, not very helpful. I don't know where that is. Oh, it was right there, right there, whoa, it was all rainbowy. Maybe just because it was there just for a second. Okay, please don't notice me. How do I get him? Maybe I just have to simply land on his head. Or maybe he does eventually fall asleep. One of those things is probably true. Please don't notice me though. Oh, it's right there. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Wait, yeah, no! <laughs> Dang it. Okay, well I know exactly how to get there, I think. It might be better to loop around this way. Come on now, throw it. Oh no, wait, throw it. There you go, I know exactly where it is. You don't have to give me the, the little scene here. You don't have to paint me a picture. Oh, we just have to run, we just have to run. Or long jump, or do whatever we need to do to get over there. Yeah, okay, much better. You got a moon glowing in the deep wood, so I figured that this pipe here was going to end up bringing me. There he is. Um, back up, maybe it doesn't do that. Huh, guess I gotta choose my own adventure here. I chose the left pipe. I'm gonna keep choosing that left pipe. Oh, that was, okay, that wasn't right. So the left pipe, originally, that was a good choice. So, left pipe, let's try the right pipe. Left, right, and center, right? So, I'll try the right one and hope that the dinosaur doesn't find me, because that's still freaking me out. That was wrong, okay, that was the center one. Never, never go right, never go right. Luckily, it's the same thing every time, so I'm not just, you know, making new mistakes. All right, go down the center now. This is an interesting little puzzle, though. Wasn't expecting to find this either. I mean, this has been a whole slew of unexpected turns, so now I gotta choose a couple, huh? Oh, it makes a little M. I think this one. I like the look of this one. Not quite, oh, that is tough. I mean, I guess it's not tough, it's just time consuming. <laughs> Come on, get up here. And then we'll go down the center one. And then I'm gonna say the bottom right one, because we haven't had any right focus ones. Um, I'm expecting that to happen sooner or later, right? Or maybe it's this little green patch. Nope, ain't some kind of trick. No, that wasn't right either. All right, it's just a process of elimination. So I've tried all of the ones except the correct one. I didn't think it would be this one, but it clearly is this one. That's so weird. Okay, it was left, center, center. Cool, we got another moon for it. Pass the peculiar pipes. Hey, here we go. We're going to Snow Kingdom. This is our first snow-like area. That's why I wanted to choose this over uh, Ocean Kingdom. Now I remember, it's all coming back to me now. See, so yeah, I wonder what uh, we'll find out here, what our adventure will be like. I'm actually pretty excited just to get somewhere new. I definitely think that maybe I should start focusing on just getting to the next kingdom quicker. I still want to think want to you know do the pace of like one new kingdom an episode, but just have that focus right away in the beginning of each episode, and then, you know, jump around, try to get some extra stuff done. That way we are um, just making progress no matter what, seeing as how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills, travel tip, crouch. I know all about crouching, don't don't worry about it. Well, there it is, let's check out the Snow Kingdom next. <laughs> it looks cold, and it sounds like the races in town are quite popular, and the prize is a frost frosted cake? Well, we know what they're stealing next. A frosted cake, okay, well, what's a wedding without a wedding cake, right? I don't know, I haven't been to a wedding before. Snow Kingdom Shiver, Shiverian, Shiverian? Well, obviously it's supposed to be like Shivern, so I'm gonna say Shiverian, but obviously, I don't know, it seems like it come off the tongue better if it was Shiverian, or Shiverian. The Cake Thieves Parting Gift. Oh my, this area is very hard to see in. I definitely think we wanna change up our costume a little bit. I don't know if uh, we're good to go. We'll try to find enough purple coins to get ourselves this area's thingamajig. We'll try to do that, I think, each uh, kingdom. We'll try to get, of course, enough moons to move on to the next kingdom, and then also enough purple coins to buy that area's specific costume. So there we go, there's that. And we're good to go, yeah! I do just want to say I'm still recording these episodes a lot in advance at this point just because, you know, scheduling wise, that's really just what makes the most sense for me. But I do want to thank you guys. I do look back and read every comment that, you know, lets me know any kind of advice or tips. It just might take a little bit for it to get to me. Um, but I do read them all. So thank you guys for all of your awesome advice and tips and just, you know, letting me know that you enjoyed the series. That kind of stuff is super motivating. Okay, so, yeah, where exactly am I going? Can I just pop down? 
I can. This place, it, this is very hard to see in Mario. And still is not dressed for the occasion. The poor guy's getting all covered in snow. And, whoa, 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 okay. We can go back up that way if we wanted to. Cool. Now I probably don't want to land in the water here. Okay, traction is not good. Cold, cold, get out quick. So it's just like the uh, ice levels in Mario 64, or if we do land in that, um, we're gonna end up, what's it called? Taking damage. So this is, whoa, 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 it was a trap. It was a trap, where are we going? Um, oh, it's cozy in here. Shiveria town. Hey, you scared us. I don't know what kind of, kind of voice to give you guys. They're like little auruses. We're just all a little on edge right now. I don't know what kind of voice this is. Welcome to Shiveria. Okay, cool. Oh, hey, right, look at this. We got ourselves a little secret for um, Lost Kingdom. Hmm. Oh, is that Poochie? Hey, that's Poochie. We gotta go check that out. Oh, that is so exciting. Let me take a little pick of that. Snap a pick. Um, okay, I took the capture. No, I don't wanna take a video. No, no, stop the video. Okay. <laughs> um, leaving, goodbye. Oh, look at this, we got our first little snowflake coins. Cool. I didn't mean to take a video, but okay. Uh, do that. What is going on here? We got a bunch of boxes, well. Oh, I was supposed to use that. I could probably still make it. Wait, if I could, uh... No, not quite. Oh, maybe I can. Maybe I done goofed. How am I gonna get that now? Uh, that doesn't help. <laughs> oh no, oh no. Well, maybe if I did that and then, no, okay, I'll have to come back. That is stinking. Maybe there's a way I could just go through and then go through. And now I, I feel silly. I shouldn't have broke that. I heard that you had the shimmering. Yeah, let's go, whoop, yeah! <laughs> and right back in the Shiveria tent. I love this place, so it's awesome. It's really cool. It's so cozy, which is great because it's becoming winter time and you know, the area that I live. And I just love the idea of it being cold outside and getting all warm and toasty inside. Okay, ooh, and the boxes go away afterwards. Entrance to Shivarian. nice. Okay, so let us run over to here and see what else we can get done. Wait, oh, there we go. There's a lot of guys around here. Ooh, and the entrance to the, uh, the crazy cat. Hello, dudes. That must ruined everything. No cake and no racing, no fun! Oh yeah, these guys love racing. For souvenirs, you're, you're in the right place. I'm just gonna give them the wackiest voice I can think of. I don't even know, I'm just trying different vocal cords. Uh, you guys are so adorable. So we don't have any purple coins to give you. Welcome, mustache friend. Okay, so we do have 100 coins though, so we can go ahead and buy the Shefaria, you know, Snow Kingdom uh, moon. So why not, you know? Easy moon for me. Shopping in Shefarian, and we need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eight, ten moons to get out of here. And welcome, mustache friend, snow hood, snow suit. Oh, that stuff looks perfect. It will keep Mario nice and toasty once we actually get it. We need uh, 15 in total for that then. Not bad, not bad. Okay. Um, that mustache of yours must keep your face nice and toasty. Not toasty enough, look at Mario, you're so cold. You need a rounded body if you want to race. Oh, okay. Hello. That monster stole our racing prize, a frost, frosted cake. As if we, that weren't bad enough, he blocked the entrance to our race course. We need power moons to get back in. I'll help you out with that. So in here, uh, racing keeps my heart warm. Please open the door. So I need more power mo moons. Oh, look at this big screen TV. That ba that's Bowser's ship. Our frost, frosted cake is gone. I can't believe it. Our poor prize gone. So that, I guess they raced for it. Interesting. So maybe this is like a, oh, do we have to like go through each door, get a moon out of it? Ah, that is cool. Hollow crevasse. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I don't like it. <laughs> Not fun. These guys really aren't fun, they're spooky. Okay, get across to here. Oh, what is up here? There's definitely something of uh, notes. Oh, wow, interesting. So they give me an extra second. Oh. Oh, look at that, look at that. Okay, no, no, no. Oh, okay, almost made it. I need you to go over here, buddy. This is very interesting. Um, yeah, bring me up here if you can. Oh, I missed it, really? <laughs> okay, <laughs> if you say so. There you go, seven out of 50. That's gonna be helpful. Um, okay, I gotta get better at this game. I, I haven't played in a couple days. 
Oh, come on. No, I was about to get to the top. Get out of here, get out of here, get out of here. Okay. Oh gosh. You know what? Maybe I should get that soon. Luckily, you can pick those up with the hat, which is fun. Oh, geez. Ready? Uh, yeah, that was good. And then, whoa. Oh, oh, what is this about? That was a, a little tricky bit of a secret right there. And that is the moon. Cool. So that's treasure in the ice wall. I'm gonna guess probably there's two per area, like normal for this kind of stuff. I wanted to like move my camera a bit over there. Maybe I should just, cause yeah, that's where the moon is supposed to be as you can see. So if I can find one more piece to it, which is right here, and I'm not quite done. It seems like there are some purple coins around, so I should adventure a bit more. Hmm. Okay, not on this side, but definitely over there, there was some more. Yep, yeah, right over there. Anywhere else, though, it doesn't look like it. But I'll try to find what I can, so help me out. There we go. Um, get that. Oh, darn it, couldn't quite, couldn't quite. I hear the shimmering of another moon, though. Well, I mean, it might be the moon we just got. Yeah, it's still sitting up there, isn't it? Can I get up here? What about that? Ooh, there are some coins. Ooh, yeah. Nothing up here, though. Okay, I had to try, I had to try. These guys are all just frozen in place, what do you know? Perfect place in the, in the you know, in the world to be frozen is in the Snow Kingdom. I could probably get up here and, yep, without the help of you bozos, get out of here. Okay, no, okay, maybe I do need your help. I wonder if that's the only moon though, because I do hear the shimmering in the field. It sounds closer than what it actually is. I'm not really sure, I should just keep an ear out after I pick it up. So there is a event, an event mood. Moon, mood, I don't, I can't speak correctly. <laughs> okay, the ice wall barrier. And that's going to be one door down, cool. I don't hear any other moon now, so I think we're good. I think we are definitely good to go. So let us hop on through and see what else we can get done. The energy of the power moon seems to open those barriers. So let's go to this next one. I like this, it's really fun. Cool idea, for sure. So this is going to be, ooh, I love the little Santa hats. Oh, that is so cute. Not much traction here, but we're definitely gonna wanna become Goombas. Wait, whoa. Whoa, I don't know how to feel about that. Um, I'm gonna knock your hat off. I don't wanna, you know, beat you up. Okay, so if I do this, it should activate the, interesting, <laughs> I could just do that as a Goomba, cool. Not too much else going on around here, so let me whittle waddle across. Oh gosh, this makes me so uncomfortable. What? Yeah! Whoa, what is that? Oh, I need to be four Goomba. How in the world am I doing that? And what is that about? Um, Something curly's going, oh, you know what, that probably, oh, you know what, I should probably redo this, huh? Okay, well maybe I can come back somehow. Or maybe they'll just respawn. That'd be cool if they could just respawn, but I, I doubt it. Doesn't seem like that usually happens. And then what is up here? But I need to be four Goomba to get through there. Good to keep in mind. And then of course there's a pretty easy power moon just waiting for us there. There we go. Or I could get these. I need four Goomba in total though. So unless there's one more somewhere, and this ain't gonna cut it. Come on. Oh, there you go. <laughs> awesome. Now what is with this little center area? Not really sure. Um, oh, they are back though. Okay. But they don't want me a little while on back down there. And, oh, look at this, purple coins. Okay. Yeah, there we go. That was some skill. Cool. Oh, and there's some more over there. Ah, I see. I definitely see how to get those. You just got a wall jump up, nice and simple, nice and enjoyable. So purple coins have been a real challenge in this area so far. They are very well scattered throughout different places. There you go. There's some icicles falling. Oh, what is this about? Oh, is this how we, oh, move. Oh, okay, maybe this will hollow out the center in, in some way. Uh, whoa, holy cow. That's an easy way down for us for sure. But now I gotta sort of platform back. I actually don't know if I can do this as Goombas. Oh, I can. Okay, um, plop down. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, watch out. <laughs> Excuse me, pardon me. Yep, yep. 
Oop! Ha! <laughs> I did it. That's at least four Goomba. So let it do its thing. Awesome! That was so cool. So let me uh, go ahead and get that. Awesome! Ice dodging Goomba stack. <laughs> that was so much fun. I sort of feel like I should uh, go back to being a Goomba for this but I think I can handle it. I gotta get good at ice platforming if we're gonna keep hanging out in the snow kingdom, so maybe now's my time to practice. Awesome, so two more moons. Very good, not bad so far. The icicle barrier. So if we, I guess we definitely have to get the event moon to continue onward, which is interesting. I mean, I've been hearing some interesting criticism for the game. Now that the game's been out for like, I think it's been like, what, a week now? Yeah, I think as of today, as of recording this, the game has been out for a week. Um, we got two more to go. And that's very interesting because a lot of people are saying that the game at times is too easy. And I think really what that is, is that there's hundreds of moons to get, get obviously. So if you just want to progress to the end of the game, yeah, that might not be too difficult, but that's not where the difficult part is supposed to be. It's a Mario game, first and foremost. Ooh, here we go, this is gonna be easy. This better be a moon. Nope. <laughs> okay, it tricked me. It got me all excited. That's fine, that's fine. So can I become the Spinies? Probably not. Can I become you guys? Wow, look at this. Oh, that is cool. Can I like jump so I can get out of here? I can't, I'm stuck in here. That is so interesting. Now what about the little Spinies? I cannot become them because obviously they have something on their head. Um. So I just wanna push this over here like this. Yeah, no, it's, it's staying over there, buddy. It's staying over there. Um, or I guess, it, it, I mean, it doesn't really have to at all. I mean, I don't really see what the point of that is, but um, these things are so interesting. There's more purple coins over there. Eventually, we're gonna be able to fold around you. This guy over here is not contained, lucky him. Oh, I see what we gotta do here, at least for some purple coins. Hmm, oh boy, be careful, be careful. No, I said be careful, Mario. <laughs> um, Cause I could, oh, oh, no, 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 come on. But yeah, I feel like it's a Mario game. Everybody should be able to complete a Mario game. It should be pretty open, but if you wanna get on 100% in this game, it's gonna be quite the challenge. And I do like, you know, like some people say they want it to be more like Mario 64, that's awesome. Where it's, Mario 64 only has 120 stars compared to this game, it's like hundreds. We already have almost 200 moons. I don't think we're anywhere close to beating the game, you know? Um, let's uh, do that. And I hear the glimmer of a moon. I think we're getting close. So I just wanna go this way and pick up whatever purple coins we can get before we move on to anything like that. Or not. I actually don't see the moon anywhere. Maybe it's in the act of destroying all these guys. Get out of here! <laughs> see ya! That might actually be the case. Okay, I got a couple more of you. Awesome, yep, that's what made it happen, cool. So even though the moon didn't exist in the world really, it still made the shimmering noise. So that's good to keep in mind. We're almost halfway through. There's actually only 50 uh, coins in this area. I didn't realize that. Okay, so gonna be a smaller area than say Metro Kingdom what we explored in the last episode, but still good. The gusty barrier. Cool. But yeah, that's sort of my response to that kind of criticism to the game. I actually don't think how easy it is matters just because there's a lot of depth to it. There's different you know, things you can do that are a lot more difficult, and I'm sure the farther we get in, the more that'll be apparent. And I'm sure getting 100% is where the real challenge really lies. Okay, so we only got one more to do. Ow, my booty! That hurt! <laughs> We're all sooty now, too. Yeah, I don't like it, Mario needs a shower. Okay, so what's gonna go on in here? Um, This is Snowy Mountain. Not too much going off the edge of here. Uh, ooh, okay, and let me, uh, there we go, get rid of the snow. Who needs a snow plow? I mean, I like a snow plow. Snow plows make uh, the winter time easier, but look at this. Oh, what's this gonna be? Just a coin. But somewhere there might not be. You can actually see it peeking out of the snow just a little bit. So you definitely wanna be diligent with it because it's so bright here, it's easy to miss a glowy spot like that. But there's another one here. But good to know. It's gonna be more air. Yes, it is. Whoa. That is so cool. I wonder if there'll be any way to clear up all the like blizzard action happening outside, you know, the uh, Shivarium. Because it looks like there probably could be maybe a couple moons around there. It's just so hard to tell. Speaking of which, let's actually take a look at the brochure really quick. This is Shivaria, uh, population middling. Uh, I don't know what that means. Average 14 degrees Fahrenheit, yikes. 
A warm community, a frozen land. Some animals brave the cold. Is that a penguin? Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see that. Uh, Bound Bowl Grand Prix. Oh, that sounds fun. Icing and racing. Crevasse Menace, we, we already checked that out. Three keys to the kingdom swim. Only in short bursts if you like being warm and enough to stay alive. Dig for the gate to the town, which is frequently buried in the snow. Bound your way through the erase, build and species permitting. Hmm, interesting. But how many, um, we have 37 to find here. And, okay, that's actually not too bad. Manageable. How many did the Cascade have? 25, okay. Still, quite a lot. Um, let us get out of here then and not fall down the edge, but instead, oh wow. Okay, so this is just a bunch of snow. Can I just, I can. Um, how do I throw it up? I forget how to throw it up. Maybe like, oh yeah, like that, that is so cool. Okay. It's just some Joy-Con action. It's so hard to tell where these are though. Okay, Mr. Snow, is it like falling down? Is that what's happening there? Not really sure. Or is this like snow respawning? Where is this? <laughs> there it is. Okay, so let's uh, throw more more of Cappy in the air. Yeah, it is falling. That is so interesting. Okay, so what is this gonna be about? We haven't found even one moon in this area yet. So we, uh, we have to be diligent. We have to be ready for whatever might become available. Hmm. Oh, look at this! Oh gosh, I almost just walked right off the edge. Good thing I kept an eye out, because that is an easy moon. Awesome, behind Snowy Mountain. And then we need one more, and we're actually good to skedaddle, which is pretty cool. I mean, I'm probably not going to skedaddle right away. If I can find more, that'd be great. I can hear the shimmering of maybe yet another moon. Oh, oh wait a minute. Are we fighting some Brutals? You wanna fight with me, Brutal? Let's go! It's just them again. So who are we going to fight for the, f the second time for the first time? <laughs> We've got the Frost and Cake, the Frost Frost and Cake. The boss man sure is fussy about cake. Reckon we got him the best one though. So it's you again, we fought you last time. Find you again now, so I guess the Brutals aren't done for. More Brutal fighting, ow, that hurt. Okay, you know what, you wanna try that again? You know, ready for round two, sir? Ow, okay, that's not what I was looking forward to. Um. Ow, okay, hold on, hold on, give me that health. Thank you. This guy is tough. Oh yeah, I forgot how I fought him. <laughs> he's like, where to go, where to go? Right here! Hope that hurt, you jerk. Okay, so he's in his little, it's so difficult when we're icy. I wonder if, could we have done this as like a Goomba? Probably not. Oh my, here we go. Uh, uh, oh, okay, 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 can I make it? Can I make it? Can I make it? Yes, I can. Cool. The coins are disappearing now, which I don't like. Not too much I can do about it with how icy it is, though. Just sort of have to live without them. Come on, come on, leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. And then throw it, throw it. Do your worst. Okay, maybe don't do your worst. Like, like, yeah, literally do your worst. Like, do a bad job. Oh, yeah, okay, just barely got him. I mean, I guess I had two more hits left, but. And he's out of here. See ya. How many times are we gonna have to fight those guys then? Probably many times. I was hoping maybe, you know, we won't have to redo any boss fights, you know, keep it a little more interesting, but I guess they are slightly different, so that's fun. Either way, another moon for us, and that makes 10 in total in Snow Kingdom, the Snowy Mountain Barrier. Cool, that was fun. And that's gonna open up the last door so we can go down there and show Bowser who's boss, right? The Bound Bowl Grand Prix. Oh boy, that is so exciting. I really wanna check this out. This looks like a lot of fun. Ooh. Okay. No dilly dallying for me. We're just gonna head right in. Huzzah! To the race course. Wait, can we talk to you? Yay! The races are back on. Everybody's oh, everybody's spectating it. That's cute. Hello. The forest frosted or the frost frosted cake got stolen. So for now, the racing prize is a multi moon. Uh, but you're too small to race with us, Mustache Man. Yikes. Why? I just wanna enjoy the race. I wanna, you know, I'm competitive. Oh, look at this. Looks like this is where our little hidden um, costume specific area is. Our, yeah, our what, what is the acronym for costume specific area? Our CSA. I'm not gonna remember to call it that. Why can't I land on the pole? Okay, you know what, let's just go get the costume now. Maybe it'll give me more confidence in landing on poles. Um. Yeah, but it's gonna be the puffy little jacket. Will that also help us maybe look a little larger? 
Welcome, mustache friend. Um, yeah, so let's get the snow hood. Yep, yep, yep. I didn't read the description for it, though. Uh, what does it say? Change down. You will wear the snow hood immediately. Great! A down hood that keeps the cold from making you bitter. And then the snow suit after, after decades of ice levels, finally a good warm jacket. I agree. Okay, much thanks. And we'll equip it right now. Cool. And we could buy some other stuff. I'm not really concerned with it now. We'll buy it later. Hooray! <laughs> he looks so comfy. I love his little traction shoes as well. He's got like little cleats. I don't think they're gonna make walking on the ice any easier. I think that they're all cosmetics still, but we can at least feed our curiosity about what's inside there. Let's get up to here. And then jump. Yeah, did you see how easy that was? It's always supposed to be that easy. Hmm. Now what's over there? Definitely something. So we still have a lot more to adventure in Shavarian. Hello. You cannot enter unless you are properly dressed for the extreme cold weather, like up with fluffy hood and warm boots. You look ready for the snow. Glad you know what you are doing. Go on in. Hooray! Let's go on in. I like. I, what did he say? I tire of standing here. I thought he said I like standing here. Not quite. What is this about? Um, a bunch of nothing. Okay. Yeah, but it's still very slippery around here. Oh, look at this. It's a. Uh, Whole bunch of moon medallions in a portrait level. Oh gosh, I love this. This is so cool. Look at Marion. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I gotta be patient. Do a little bit of an icy moonwalk. Which which this is very cool, because I don't think there were any traditional ice levels in the original Marion. Like there were levels that I think were snowy, but they weren't like actually um ice physics in them. Okay, that hurt. That, that was foolish of me. I was foolish to believe I could succeed that way. Okay, I can't make that jump. I was hoping maybe that'd be a bit of a secret. Jump it. Oh, hey, cool coupon. A cool coupon. And that's gonna get it for me? Not quite. But it will take care of all the bad guys. That's good. Ooh, what is up here? <laughs> um, oh. Big jump. Easy moon. Cool, slip behind the ice. So let us um plop down there now with all of the uh, spinies gone. Oh gosh, oh gosh, run, 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 run. Uh, uh, no, 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 I gotta be ready, gotta be prepared, gotta be prepared, gotta be prepared. Oh, ah, darn it. I messed it up, Hold oh, on. Um. I tried not to, I did not succeed. That's fine. That was really cool, I'm glad we got both of the moons there, which means of course now we have uh, the 10 we need. I mean, we have the 11 we need now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. And then, oh yeah, the 12, right here. I was gonna say, aren't we missing one? Moon shards in the cold room. I love the little peace sign we're throwing out. Awesome, so we can head out of here. That was a fun area. And let's go to the other side now. If we can manage, I think we can. All we gotta do is get across it. Uh, well, never mind. Racing here looks looks to be serious business. I agree, but so are moon. So I'm trying to get back up there. Okay, this should be easy. Yeah. Okay, so I just gotta throw my uh, hat around a little bit. See what we can find, maybe. I don't think there's gonna be anything around here. Or is there? Probably just coins. It's always been coins. Oh no, it's a moon. That's a really easy one. Shining in the snow in town. Cool. Then what else is around here? Whole bunch of nothing so far. But I think there may be a door behind here. A door to new possibilities. Cool. What is up here? Oh, look at this. Is this gonna be another moon? You bet it is. This is the Shavarian treasure chest. So there's a bunch of moons. We aren't quite done though, because we got a race to do. <laughs> Sorry. You guys seen that pretty thick head sound? Are we large enough to now do this? I really hope so. You now we got the big puffy coat on. Oh my. Oh, come on. We're a racing machine. We gotta be able to race in this. This seems to be the uh, the starting area, Snowline Circuit, or not? Oh, you look important. Hmm, can't start without one more racer. Me, me, pick me, please. Hello. One racer won't come out of the waiting room. What's taking so long? Hmm, I'm itching to start this race. These guys look racing ready. Cool. Then what are we gonna find in, out my head. <laughs> oh, you know what, we could probably just capture whoever it is and races with them. That sounds fine. Oh, wait a minute. I don't trust this. One of these is gonna have something, ain't it? Oh, apparently not. Okay. Well, good to know. 
What about over here? There's there's definitely more secrets to find around here. Um, ooh. Okay, at the least, we get some purple coins. If I could throw my hat up a little bit. Okay, I don't see too much going on here. Oh, let's let the snow fall on our heads, though, our noggins. It doesn't look like there's too much going on there. Uh, hello? Anybody home? Oh, hey! What's wrong? You look so sad. Yeah, your hat's not there. Oh, he's so sad. Race, I don't want to. The other racers are too serious. I don't stand a chance. If someone else wanted to race, they would become they would be welcome to take my place. Okay. Look at me. Whoa. <laughs> I can bound. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> this is awesome. So I guess I can go this way now. Give it a bit of a taste test. Try this out a little bit. Alright, jump. Oh gosh. Whoa, okay. Here I come out. Oh, 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 oh. I'm ready to race. Hello? Oh, oh gosh, whoa, whoa, I'm just trying to talk to you. Um, yep, there you go. Finally, now we can start the race. Our frost frosted cake was stolen, so the prize will be a multi-moon. Are you ready to race now? Yes, yes I am. It's been a while since we've had a race, so we'll start with the summer training. Oh my, okay, if you want. Oh, look at this. Okay then, so we can bound. Should we bound over the jumps or not? I don't wanna go out of bounds. I'm guessing that's cheating, right? I mean, it might be, it might not be. I mean, maybe it might just be one of those things where it's faster. Whoa, whoa! <laughs> okay, so yeah, if we land on the track, we end up getting like some little speed boosts. This is really weird. Whoa! Okay, cool. Let me try it for real, let's start. I don't really know how well I'm gonna do. Bound Ball Grand Prix Snow Line Circuit Class A. And we're in the middle, so we're not uh, all the way in the back, so that's cool. Unlike Mario Kart. Fourth place. Whoop. Wait, hold on. Oh, I didn't get a good start there, but I'm not behind just yet. Yeah, look at us go. Whoa, cutting that turn a corner pretty well. Look at me! Oh, we're going! First place, Zebra takes the lead. We're going across one of the last corners here. They're catching up, they're close behind. Oh, whoa, 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 come on now. One last jump, yeah, there we go. Did we just win? Oh yeah, that's right, there's more than one map. <laughs> oh boy, were there a bunch of Goombas up there? I think so. Yeah, I guess the Goombas enjoy the race as well. Are they Goombas? It's, we're moving too quick to actually tell. They might actually just be, no, they're just snow guys, okay. They just have like little brown, brown like gloves or something, or like sleeves, so it looks like Goombas from far away. Oh, there we go. We're doing really good. Like, I don't even know where they are. Like, they might be right behind me, for all I know. But it sure as heck doesn't feel like it. Oh, look, I'm catching up to some of them. I'm a natural. Whoa. Okay, hold on. Don't land outside of the, you know, the field. It isn't really a field, but you get what I mean. There we go. I mean, maybe this is supposed to be really easy, but that was so much fun. Hooray, we win. Wow. Best lap was right at the end with 20.01 seconds. And second place just crossed the finish line. Cool. What a race, you are like a supersonic snowman. Your prize is a multi-moon. I wanna do that again, that was so much fun. Everybody else is upset that they didn't win. Hey, there, there's more life than just winning. I hope you all had a great time. You beat me fair and square. And this can't be happening. Oh, like I said, life's not all about winning, it's about getting multi-moons and saving the planet. Or actually, no, we're not even saving the planet. We're just trying to stop a wedding. <laughs> Pretty selfish. <laughs> okay, the Bound Bowl Grand Prix. Very cool to get a multi-moon that isn't for uh, a boss fight. That's pretty interesting. Okay, so now what? Ooh, there's some penguins up there. I didn't see them before, but now it's a lot clearer here. The weather's much nicer. Wow, so we could keep going. Look, the sun's out. It's, it's still c cold though. Yeah, you're telling me. Oh, hello, it Toad. How you doing? Um, I'm not really having too much of a trouble, but sure, you know what, thanks, I marked it on your map, so take a look. Way out there, and interesting. A lot of you have been letting me know, of course, when we get near those X's on the map, it does show up on the compass. The only reason I don't really use the compass too much is it gets me very turned around and confused and just doesn't end up helping me too much. I'm glad it helps some of you guys, it's just, that's why I pulled the map itself to take a look. So I don't know if any of this stuff used to be out here, but I certainly didn't find it before. Okay, so uh, 36 out of 50, we need to find 14 more purple coins, and I think they end up, they will end up being out here. So it's cool that there's areas outside of Shiveria, though. Like, that's very exciting. Ooh, we can find a seed. 
fun that it looks as though we've plenty enough power moons. I know, I know. I just wanted to do other things, because it would be fun. Um, There's a lot of the uh, moon medallions around here. And, oh yeah, this is a, the air thing that'll send me up. So let me get as many moon medallions as I can. There's two scarecrows here as well. Hmm. What is up here as well? Oh, there we go, look at that platform. Oh. Okay. This area is so serene now, I love it. So if we might want to be one of those dudes who blows the air, and so it looks like there's just some benefits to have. I see a little hat room here, a little hat house. <laughs> uh, oh, I love this. Oh, and there's one under the water there. Oh, maybe I can become a little penguin. Hi, penguins. No, come back. How do the penguins fly? They're penguins. The penguins don't fly. These are some special penguins. I love them. Okay. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, oh, I thought that was ice. Okay. Whoa, we can walk on the water. Look at us. <laughs> okay, yeah, get that. I think I need to hit it with my hat. I don't know if I can just run through it, so. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, I'm scared. I don't know if I'm going the right way or not. Ah, no, I didn't jump. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. Let's try that again. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. What is behind me? Anything of interest? I always have to check. Some coins, nothing crazy. Yay, okay, we got him. So let's get back over to here. Oh, and don't land in the water, please. And then super speed! And then throw it down! Super speed! And throw it down! Another super speed! Okay, watch out, don't land on that. Oh boy. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Grab that, start making my turn. Grab that, oh, I missed that one. That's bad news. Okay, I'm still good though, I'm still good. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, I'm running out of uh, speed here. I gotta grab this. Awesome. Okay, whoa, where are we going? We're going up here now. I missed one now. I missed one. Oh gosh, okay, so here's one moon, but if I still had more speed, I could get up there maybe. Come on, oh no. Huh. How can I do that? I bet you if I run all the way down, maybe I could. Oh, this is a lot steeper than I thought. Okay, I didn't feel that way when I was just, um... oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh, ow, okay, that worked. I, I landed on it though. Look at me. So if I go like this, I probably need to get like all of them. Oh, oh, I need that one now. Oh gosh, what did I hit? What did I hit? What are you talking about, game? Okay, here's my chance to redo it then. Let me try one more time. Let's go. You ready for this? Oh, oh, oh okay. Now I just, my goal is just to get every single one of them. I can't walk through them, I have to hit them with the hat. So let's try to angle ourselves up just right every time. Jump over that, throw that there. Good, good, good. I bet we could actually like skip this whole corner here. Okay, I missed one, I missed another. Come on, that's sort of stinky. Okay, I've gotten all of them so far. There's gonna be one like right here, and then we just keep going. We just go as fast as we can, dodge that moon, keep running, I'm running out of them, I can hear them going away. Okay, go, 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 go. Yeah, we made it, we made it, we made it, look at me! Oh gosh, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh boy, that was close. Dashing above and beyond, so cool. Hello. Getting here was good job. You really are something. Cool, thank you, you're so nice. So what about these little wooden platforms? Could I have like landed on these? I guess I could have, but it wouldn't have done much for me. Interesting. Very cool though, we actually did it. I almost messed it all up, but I didn't. So hooray, let's get out of here. That was a fun one. I really like that. It, it brings me back to Galaxy 2 with Yoshi. Okay, so let us uh try to get across to here without being in the water as much as possible. There's two more. Okay, we've gone into a bit of a circle. I guess not. What's up here? I actually can't really tell. Can I even get up here? It looks like I can. Maybe if I... There you go. And then I can do that same thing. Yep. No, wait. No, darn it. <laughs> it's so easy to mess up in this game. Maybe if I just... There you go. So we just gotta do a bit of a backflip jump. I can get up here. I guess there wasn't too much for me, except to take you up. There you go, and then get you again. Cool. Now before I do anything else, ow, oh, oh. <laughs> I'm making all kinds of crazy mistakes. We got two out of the, you know, several medallions. There is the nut as well, so I'll try to grab that soon. There are little ice fish. I just don't know how to, I guess I would have to go under the water to get them. Hmm, okay, that was a bit of a mistake, I'll be honest. Um, there we go, look at me. Cool, and there's our moon rock. And another hat. 
Uh, hat house. I'm gonna keep calling them hat houses. It's a bit of a tongue twister, but it's fun. Oh, look at you all bundled up. Hey dude, you up for a challenge? Everyone loves walking, right? Problem is, most don't take it seriously. That's what trace walking is all about. If you can walk like a champ, you'll want a prize. Want to try? Sounds fun. Sweet. Cool. Um, oh yeah, this thing. All right, the rules are cake. You just walk around and follow the arrows on the ground. Here's the fun part though. The arrows disappear after a bend. You gotta score 80 points or more to win. Okay. Can I? Oh, does that not count? Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Yeah, that doesn't count. Oh gosh, I messed up. <laughs> that was all wrong. You need 80 points, what did I get? 48, yeesh. Um, yeah, so running like that doesn't count. So let's try that again. Um, gave you a little hop on the head out of anger. Yes, sweet. So no jumping at all. We just have to keep our feet to the ground. Let's go, let's go. It'd be cool if we could do this as like a Goomba or something, that'd make it much easier then. It's gonna be more of a heart shape than a triangle, but you know, when I tried my best, is that gonna be at least 80? I would hope so. No, not at all. I was so off. 54. Oh no. This is really tough. I mean, maybe if I was going slower, maybe I'm going too quickly. Yes. Sweet. Um, ready. I know 80 points. I mean, it doesn't really give me a timer, so I just have to hope I'm doing good. Oh gosh, and this is where I sort of lose it, but definitely going slower helped out a lot there. No, but I was still way off because I just, I can't get to that point in time. There's no way I was 80, 63. I'm getting closer, one more time. One more time, you talk way too much, dude. You talk way too much. Come on, come on, yes, yes, yes. Okay, so I gotta go, it's just, there's no context clues either. I mean, except for the Koopa himself, but that's not very good of a context clue. So straight off like that, and then, that should be good, right? I would hope, that might be good. That was much better. What did I get? 89, booyah! Cool. That walk was serious business, boom. This power moon is yours. Cool. So there's another one. Now, is there going to be another? What if I talk to you again? I'm out of prizes. No, I didn't want to try again, sweet. But we're in a hat house, which means, I guess I'll try it one more time, see if I can't get it any better. But there might be more in this area than it's letting on, because this will be like the first hat house I ever go into that doesn't have two moons in it. That was really good. Okay, it could have been better. 83, so actually it was worse, okay. Um. Let me look around a little bit. I don't see anything else. So maybe there's only one moon in here. That would be pretty peculiar, but I guess it is possible. Weird. I'm not really sure. Either way, we still have more we can adventure around here for sure. Another scarecrow. The scarecrows are all over the place in this level. Hello. Oh my, that one seems quite difficult if you ask me. Um, oh, and we can't, I always forget that we don't have the hat. Oh gosh, get out of the water, get out of the water. No, no, yeah, not bad. You got a moon, that was actually timer challenge number one. And then if we, uh, oh gosh, give me my hat back, give me my hat back, thank you. <laughs> Let's try this one. Okay, I wasn't really ready, but we gotta go into this room. Ooh, this is a bit different, isn't it? Um, so I don't need to care about you too much now, do, do I? Ooh, it's all watery. Weird. But there's no timer. So is this really a timer challenge? I guess it won't be, ow. It will be a scarecrow challenge, but not a timer challenge. That'll be a first. I just gotta avoid these, these Goombas. We're gonna call them Koopas. They ain't no Koombas. Koombas? Kagoomba? They combined, and now they're a Kagoomba. A Goomba with a shell, or maybe a Koopa that's in the shape of a Goomba. Something weird like that. Okay, whoa, look at how frozen we are. Poor Mario ain't doing so great. We're supposed to get up there and somehow. Well, not that way. Uh, let me get up like that and then, yep. We gotta be getting close. I do hear the shimmer of something. So I'm going to assume that we're getting close. Oh gosh. Yeah, we were about to freeze there. That wouldn't have been good. Like, do we just instantly die when we get frozen? I'd hope not, but it might be the ca the case. Okay, so this is water again. I, I think I actually want to go up to the top. 
Because clearly, there's something up here. There has to be. You can't really tell too easily. Oh yeah, look at this. Look at this, okay. Whoop. Oh, okay, so there's even secret moons in this kind of thing. Freezing water near the ceiling. Maybe this makes up for the missing moon that we couldn't find in the previous hat house. Okay, ready? Oh gosh, I almost got frozen there, that wouldn't have been good. But there's our other one. Cool, two more moons, jump and swim in the freezing water. Okay, let's get the heck out of here. This place smells bad, it does not. It just there's a lot of Goombas and sometimes they have bad DO problems. So yeah, that was just not a timer challenge whatsoever. Weird. It's just It was just a bit of a challenge because of the fact that we didn't have our hat. Oh my, now this one, this one's definitely a bit of a challenge. I want to um, get up here and then I need to really shake the Joy-Cons. And then, come on, come on. Oh, hey, okay, that was really close. Snow Kingdom timer challenge too. Whoa. Okay, I'm falling. I'm falling, I don't got my hat. There we go. So, I still have plenty more moon medallions to find that I definitely want to. Oh yeah, okay, okay, okay. Let us find a, moon, a, a little gust of wind guy. It might be easier just to go back up to the Odyssey then, because there's one right up there. And then we can blow that wind over there and for the, to push that block. Lots of interesting things we can still do around here. Where is he? He's over here. Ow. <laughs> Excuse me, Uncle Amiibo, I don't need you right now. Need to move out of my way. There you go. So can we lower ourselves? Oh, maybe that's the trick with these guys, is that there's no way to, wait. <laughs> there's no way to lower yourself, so you're just sort of where you are. There's one moon medallion there. I'm not really worried about that one, that one's easy. And there's one over here, that one's easy as well. So we'll grab those two, and then there's one underwater. Where's the underwater one? I mean, I guess I'm supposed to be a purple fish for that, so I'll wait for that one. Um, let me just hop out of you. And then, whoa, yep. Okay, good, 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 move, move. Where was the other one? The other one was by the beginning area. So if I can just go up, or go down, maybe. maybe. Where were the purple fish? You're not over here, that's for sure. Okay, Um. there we go, got out of there. I'm getting better with that, I'm really happy about it. Wait, I forgot, I pressed the wrong button there. There you go. And then get under here, and then quickly. Yeah, look at me! So I can, I can't dive into this stuff, huh? Wait, or can I? Nope, didn't work. Plenty of coins around here, and, but not too much beyond that. Like, they got these little question blocks that I'm not really too interested in. I really just wanna find the underwater spot where there's the medallion. This is fun, I like this. Oh my, I might not be able to get to it right away. But there are some purple coins. Okay, let's grab a couple of these. Can we take this little fishy out of the water? Like, what will happen? Will we just sort of flop around? Um, oh, fish out of water, fish out of water. <laughs> and there's a little music note too. Like that might actually have to do with underwater stuff. So there's one more medallion. I know where the other one is. It's quite an easy place to get it to. Whoop, hold on. Got it? Oh no, okay. We don't want to be a fish for this, I don't think. <laughs> okay, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, okay, wait, we're not done. We're not done. Oh gosh, that's really weird. I don't know how I feel about that. There we go. Get down here. Oh, there's a little hidden snow thing down there. Yeah, okay, that was good. That was really weird. But I like it. That was a lot of fun. And get that one. Taking notes, snow path dash. Why is that taking notes? Oh, because they're, they're music notes. Okay, I get the pun. Hello, oh hey, it's Captain Toad. You're an easy little uh, spot to find. It was so cold, I had to find some shelter. But I got buried in the snow, purr. Luckily, I found a power moon in there. Enjoy! Yeah. Hooray! So we haven't found our Captain Toad everywhere, but we found them in a good chunk of places. So we've got so many moons at this point. We have 20, one, two, three, four, five, six moons. And how many were there in total to find? 37, so we still have a lot more. Well, it says we've only found 24. So I guess we already had two? Or maybe I'm just miscounting? I don't know. Hmm. Okay, so let me find one last uh, moon medallion. I know where that will be. Now, other things going on here, like this platform. Oh, you you know what? Ah, if we were playing as that dude up there, and he's not there right now, and that's how we could probably blow this over. I've been doing a lot of exploring in this kingdom in today's episode. I just, I've been enjoying it a lot. I don't wanna leave. I don't wanna go home. Oh, hey, hello you. Sometimes these turn out really well for me, sometimes they don't, but 
the big one is always the one with the uh, what we're looking for. So let's just wait for it. Go, 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 go. Yeah, okay. Wait, you were just a fish. Oh no, you were on the moon. Okay, yeah. <laughs> we got the moon fishing in the glacier. That's another good one. I think these are all other normal fish, so I'm not gonna worry about them so much. Hmm. Now I'm still on the lookout for more purple coins. Oh, hello, little rabbit. We found one of you in the wooded kingdom. But I don't think hitting with the hat's gonna help. I think we need to chase you enough so that you are. Uh... Oh. oh, no, wait. I forgot that that's not the dive button in this game. It ain't Super Mario 64. We got gotcha. you. Yay. <laughs> awesome. Caught hopping in the snow. You were adorable. Hmm. Now, what is with this stuff? Oh, there's purple coins behind here. Oh, those were easy. We got three more left to find somewhere, somehow. And then we've got all those too. Things are working out pretty grand right now. So we'll teleport back up to the top. And then we will um, finish a couple things off. We still need that fifth medallion. I know where that is. That's easy. We'll get Yoon, if I can. And then we gotta float over there. And you can tell there's something up there. What exactly it is, I'm not entirely sure, but that's what we're gonna go find out. Look at this slowly floating over with our big old Mario cap. This thing is so weird, but I love it. It's a cool kind of weird. And then everything is else in this area I think we have found. Maybe this will be where our last purple coins are. Nothing behind them. Good to know. Um, and then I can just hop out of this dude and be on the platform, I think. Yep, there you go. So what is up here? Oh, look at this! Let's enter! We have found the Cascade Kingdom secret portrait. I mean, it isn't exactly what I was looking for. Whoa! <laughs> I gotta see this cutscene again. It's just so silly. Whoa! It's so cool. This game is so cool. It makes me all smiling. Okay, so finally I found out how to get this. Island on the sky, you're mine. Secret path to Fossil Falls. Cool. Now, nothing else looks new around here, but I'm glad to have uh, figured that out. Okay, awesome, let's go. A lot of people did confirm in the comment section as well that a lot of new stuff does open up once you beat the game. I guess, quote unquote, beat the game, not 100% it, but once you, I guess, beat Bowser or do the whatever the final boss is, maybe more things will open up in the way that, you know, we can go back to Cascade Kingdom and get even more. So that's pretty cool to know. Let us plop out of here, Snow Kingdom. And, um, where do I need to go now? I now need to run on over here, and throw that, and then, there we go. Didn't even have to touch that frozen water. Nope, that was the wrong button. Okay, hold on, hold on. Yeah, there we go. So you can really spend a lot of time like out out in the air, basically. It's really cool. I really like the, this game's control set. I've probably talked about it a bit too much for most people's liking, but I feel like this game has very solid controls. It's probably one of the, like, control-wise, yeah, one of the most solid 3D platformers I've ever played, which is, you know, saying a lot, So I'm a big fan of those. Let us get across to here, then, because at this point, I'm scavenging for a couple things. Any kind of moon I can find, and then also any kind of hidden purple coins, because we only need three more of them. So what do we got in here? Oh my. And then behind us, that. So it seems like there's a bit of a puzzle to solve here, oh my. How are we solving this? Let's uh, first become Yoon. Yep, yep, yep. And it looks like, ah, okay. So what we need to do is push this stuff across so that we can get up there as normal Marion. Interesting. Now, we could probably jump up there right now, no problem, is a thing. But I don't think the game wants us to do that. Now, if I were to do that, oh, okay, I see the issue here. Is that I need to blow this one back. Oh, it's stuck down. Okay, maybe I just have to leave it like it is then. Um, That's fine with me, because we could maybe come back into here and Oh wait, can I just, oh, I can't go in though, because the puzzle's not solved. Hmm, then am I sure I can't move this? I guess I can't. I feel like I messed it up then. Because if this is all the way over there, I'm supposed to be able to put it there. 
Maybe if I do it, oh, okay. There you go. Okay, that makes a bit more sense. Then I can do that. Got a little waddle on over here. Go, 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 go. Push it like that. And then we can just push it right in, that should work. And that'll be the moon. What other moon we get though, I'm not sure. I mean, maybe we should, really quickly. Get on top of there. There's nothing else up here, right? Doesn't look like it, but what a view we get up here. Nothing else around here, for sure. Weird. Okay, so maybe there really is only one moon. Oh, wait, okay, that's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. Get out of here. There we go, and throw one more time. Yeah. Okay, well that means that that's all we get. It's just one moon. I mean, beggars can't be choosers. I'm not trying to beg or, or choose. I'm just trying to make sure I'm getting everything. <laughs> I mean, maybe there is another moon around here and I'm just totally missing it. But for now, this is all I see, so this is all I'm getting. Blowing and sliding. Cool, we're almost at 30 moons in our inventory, I guess you could say now. I mean, now I get a you know, one last look at this, but I really don't see too much going on here. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Oh, yep, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Let's just get out of here before I cause more damage than I need to. So there's that. So lastly, really all I need to do is go over there. Where these last purple coins are, I'm still not really sure. I probably could have done this earlier. Yeah, I, I just totally missed out on it. Um, okay, that's not what I wanted to do either. There we go, that's a little bit better. Ugh. There. <laughs> so where's that gonna be? And then finally we need to get the nut, which is conveniently right over there anyways. Cool. It would be cool if maybe we beat the game, there'd be like a purple coin magnet or like a finder so we know where they are. Cause honestly, it can be quite tough to know where they are at times. Oh, I missed it. Oh, I missed it. Oh, oh I missed it. There you go. Yeah. Cool. So we gotta get over there. I can actually see it's shimmering right now. So let us hop, hop. Cool. And then, get this moon. Yay! That is moon shards in the snow. We now have 30 moons. So we've gotten the majority of this area completed. And I'm sure maybe there's still more stuff to do in Shivarian that we just haven't done simply because of the fact that, um, what's it called? We, uh, you know, the more stuff gets restored once we complete a certain event. Like maybe there's more to do with like the races. Like maybe we can complete more races to get um, more stuff. So let's do that there. Where is this gonna bring me now? Is this gonna be its own teleportation thing? Look at this, okay, maybe we'll find our last purple coins up here. Oh man, we just keep going up into the clouds. Is this gonna be Cloud Kingdom again? No, it's just up in the clouds, okay. Whoa. Oh, I love this. These areas are so much fun. So I could, uh, if I'm careful enough, I could get some decent coins here. But honestly, honestly I'm not too interested. Oh my, okay, maybe I'm interested in this because this is a lot of coins. Oh boy, oh, I almost messed that up. Wait, wait, I'm not done. Oh, I can't get those now. I did it wrong. Oh, well, I tried. Go, go, go. Yeah. Okay, just a couple more left to get. Um, I don't know if I'm in it or not. Okay, a little wind gust was a little confusing there. Oh my, oh my, oh my, oh, oh boy. Oh, there it is. Oh wait, is there more than one? Oh yes, there is more than one. It's so bright, it's hard to see. Holy cow. Um, yeah, go that way, I guess. Can I make this? Can I make this? It's gonna be close. Oh no. Oh, I made it! Hey! High altitude spinning. I know, it's so high altitude, I just, it's so bright. You just can't see anything, it's insane. As far as the eye can see. And probably then some. All right, now we just get the easy one, right? Go through all of this and then angle ourselves up just right, and then, boom. Spinning above the clouds. Cool. Okay, we were supposed to, for a second I thought I just killed myself. Nope, we're good. So that's all the moons I think I could possibly get in the, in the snow kingdom. Almost forgot what it was called. Oh no, you know what? Nuh-uh, not happening. <laughs> not happening, buddy. Very cool, very exciting, very interesting kingdom. I definitely wanted to deposit all of our moons and you know get ready to go to the next kingdom next episode. I spent the entire episode adventuring this. That that's a first. Well I guess since um what's it called? Since um Cascade Kingdom, really. The one I was saying kingdom was basically the same. 
Okay, so that's gonna be all the way up to 109, over 200, cool. 201, the Odyssey has powered up. And you can see there's another one of those uh, portrait areas in the background there that we can't quite get to right now. That's fine. So there is that. So if we, uh, now we can head up to the Seaside Kingdom. Let's chase down Bowser. Cool, so in the next episode of Super Mario Odyssey, you bet your butt where to go and adventure Seaside. Here we go. I mean, we're pretty used to this whole idea. And we did a really good job with Snow Kingdom last episode. We got 30 out of the 37 moons. And I'm sure if I really tried, I could get it even closer. It's just a matter of if I want to move on to new experiences. We have over 200 moons now. A lot of people were telling me in the comment section that there is 999 moons in total again. So that's pretty crazy. Uh, I don't know, we have a while to go, I guess. I'm guessing that maybe a lot of that will pick up some steam, some momentum, once we actually finish the main game. So if they're serving frost f or frost frosted cake at the wedding, are they? Not if we serve them a defeat first. Seeing as how that we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. All right, we know all about the caps jump. We've done it plenty of time. Um, let's read up on the Seaside Kingdom. I can't wait for this. There's a carbonated sea that's supposed to be quite nice. And it says here to to be sure we visit the four giant fountains. Carbonated sea sounds really cool. Like, that's a fun idea. So yeah, I'm excited to check that out. But it's, it's probably gonna be a bit of a contrast because last episode we adventured the very cold Snow Kingdom. Now we're at what looks to be the very warm and tropical Seaside Kingdom. Oh, it's so sparkly too. The glass is half empty, indeed it is. I mean, it looks like it's much more than half empty. What are you? You look like you're thirsty. All right, Um, what's on top of the fancy goblin? Well, I guess we'll find out. Are you a snail? Look at you, with the little uh, beret. I think it's called a beret. Bob Lane used to be a beautiful resort until that foul creature showed up. Just look at him, guzzling all of our treasured sparkle water. Won't you help us put a stop to him? Sure, so this isn't one of Bowser's goons then, it's just a guy. Oh well, there are Bowser footsteps. Save, save some more for us, you tentacle scoundrel. Tourists won't visit, wait, look, Bowser's footprint, which way did he, did he go? I'm not sure, you interrupted this poor lady. Tourists won't visit Bubba Lane as long as that sucker's creeping around. Oh, look at all the seagulls, oh, that's cool. The seawater here is fizzy as soda. Ah, it's so refreshing. Is it refreshing? I feel like that'd just be uncomfortable. Um, but yeah, we gotta go all the way over there. The glass is half empty. Oh no, we gotta do this stuff first. Ooh, cool, and there's uh, plenty of other stuff over here. Is that the cappy area over there, or the crazy cap? Huh, that's interesting. Or at least one half of it, that was a yellow. There's a purple one. Cool. All right, let's go ahead and talk to some other people. When all four fountains are working, it's quite a sight to behold. Okay, cool, and what about you? When the watches of the four fountains combine, they create sparkle water. This miraculous elixir brings happiness to any who imbibe it. Imbibe, interesting word. What kind of monster would desecrate our beloved fountains? I, I'm not sure. I guess this guy, way up there. He looks so cool though. So what in the world are those things over there? The little, they're the little bubbles. Oh, that's cute. Um, that button is the key to restoring our precious fountains. Cool, let's also take a look at the uh, brochure. We haven't done that. Uh, Seaside Kingdom, where the sea meets the sun, bubbling in the relaxing resort by the carbonated sea. Average temperature, 88 degrees Fahrenheit. That is incredibly different from last episode. Raise a glass, miraculous mixture, and nature's fire hoses. These unusual creatures collect seawater constantly. They use this water both to defend themselves and to propel themselves sometimes straight up. Cool. Over here we have a love nest for eels. Oh my. They look even bigger in person, that is not fun. Nature's hot tub, deep enough for a full body soak. Relaxing competition, the tan of a true beach volleyball enthusiast. And then finally, three keys to the kingdom. Gasp at the sight of all four fountains spraying into the glass tower. Refresh yourself with the fizzy delights of the Bubblanian seawater and play in the action-packed beach volleyball tournaments. Cool, I wanna play volleyball, that sounds like fun. So what do we do about this? It looks like Bowser's capped it up. We're gonna play this up the fountains. It wasn't messing around, you're telling me. Oh wow, so look at him going. Can I become you? Oh, look at that, hey, this is cool. Whoa, oh. Do I run out of water eventually? I'm sure I do, I gotta be careful. But we just, yeah, we just float around on the water. It's like flood, that is so cool. Like go up here, you don't move uh, horizontally very much when you do that fountain. Hmm. 
Oh, hey, that's an easy moon. Oh, I love the purple color. Cool. Yeah, the stone pillar seal. So what is that gonna do for us? This is our first moon here. Not too much action in that regards just yet, but that is going to break the seal, like we said. Cool, so will this get rid of the uh, little cap over there? You bet it will, whoa! Donk, oh, what a headache. Oh, he ain't happy. Oh, hey, try all your ones. I will never surrender to the delicious sparkle water. Oh my, whoa, holy cow. Uh, what in the world is this dude? Oh, he's mad now, three fountains left. Let's hop to it. What were those things he threw? I mean, I guess his little spike balls. I don't know where they are now. Oh, they're, they're bouncing around, okay. So where's the fountain? Yeah, the fountain right here just spits out. Interesting. So now, we need to get over there. So we'll try our best. Oh, yeah, nice catch, Mario. I guess nice throw is a better word for it, huh? So we can even go under the water. It looks like there's lots to find in this kingdom. We haven't found a single purple coin, but it looks like they're actually little seashells, which is pretty cool. Oh, we can jet forward. Ah, that makes sense, okay. I wonder how many they're gonna be. 100, maybe just 50? Hey, let me in. There we go. And then get this couple more coins for us. Okay, well, we're doing all right. Once again, I wanna try to find some purple coins, but how are we getting up here? Oh, we go inside, cool. Oh, here we go, here's some purple coins to start us off. 100 of them, so this is the larger kingdom of the tune. Oh, okay, I thought that, you know, this would like spiral upwards or something. Not quite. Then I wonder how we get up there. I mean, oh, here we go, here's some more. Got one, got two, got three. Good, good, good. Hmm, let's see, the tender of the lighthouse, you must go a bit farther ahead. Is this the lighthouse? I'm going to assume that it is. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Oh, okay, there's a little uh, a little cat peach. I don't really need it, but hey, extra coins are extra coins. So if we went back that way, we could get the golden coin cap thing, but over here, there's the purple coin one. So I'll keep going this way for now. Don't land on those, <laughs> that will hurt. Um, I'll keep going this way, try to grab some purple coins when I can, because you know they're here. They're quite easy to get, it seems, I hope. There we go, there's another one. And then this one. Cool, hello, you. To climb the lighthouse, you must first dive down into this underwater tunnel. I don't see how that's a lighthouse. I don't see where the light would emit from. The tunnel down here is quite long. Only a fish can make it all the way. Hmm, so I gotta become a fish. Where might there be a little cheap cheap around here? Oh, look at that, there is actually a um flagpole down here. So we will go and swim below, just like that. And try to get this and then get that cheap cheap. All right, everything's working out. The Ocean Trench West. Okay, so it looks like there's gonna be maybe more than one Ocean Trench. Oh, yeah, gotcha. Okay, so there's plenty to explore around here. I'm sure we'll get to it, but for now, my focus is primarily on this area. Wait, did I go past it? I, I did I? Oh, no, it's right here, okay. <laughs> it shouldn't be too bad, right? Can I jump? I can jump, all right. alley -oop. Ha! <laughs> okay, a lot of people criticize me because in Lake Kingdom, I didn't realize with that gigantic water pit, I could just use a little cheap sheep. Wait a minute. Okay, well, there you go. Underwater tunnel to the lighthouse. I guess I was just supposed to hop in. But you know what? I didn't want to make people upset because they got upset at me for just hopping in as Mario in Lake Kingdom. That's what I get for trying to please the people. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. So we just gotta be careful. There's lots of fishies around here that probably don't want me to be around. Okay, I don't like this already. Oh no. Oh gosh, they're huge. They are definitely bigger in person. It's a throwback to 64, that's for sure. And, oh man, they're back. I don't like them being back. I want them to go away and never return. I mean, I guess, really, if they want them to go away and never return, going the deep dark sea is a great place for them to be. Is this something? It was an air bubble. I'll keep that in mind. Maybe there's stuff in the seaweed. Whoa, okay, hold on. And I'm sure there might be a... Uh, Moon's in these little holes too. No, okay, not quite, not quite, not quite. Move it! <laughs> oh gosh. Um. All right, well there's some health here. I really haven't been making a ton of progress with finding moons, which is a little concerning. But I at least am getting some good purple coin action. Like how many moons have we got? 52, so not a huge amount, but still a fair amount. I'm not pressing the right button. Definitely worth, you know, keeping the lookout for him. <laughs> I mean, like, I have still, what, 51 more to go then? 
All right, let's let's see if I can't get through as the fish. Oh, I can't. Well, I tried. Hmm. Okay, yeah, now we're up here. What do you know? They were they weren't wrong. Let's get ourselves our second moon right there and hope that my voice doesn't die mid sentence. Cool. The lighthouse seal. So there's that. That one's gonna open up, and then what we got? Like two more, or maybe one more. Yeah, I don't know how many there are. We can get a good view from here, which is good. So uh, let's find out. Boom. So there's that one. Gonna land on his noggin again. Oh, that must hurt. Gonna need a Band-Aid. Excellent work, just two more fountains to go. Okay, I was right, there are two more. One over there, and then one way up there. So it looks like the path does cycle us through, so we should be able to you know, get from point A to point, e, point B very easily. Okay, I don't see anything else we can do from up here, so we're just gonna go. Oh wait, there we go. Oh boy. <laughs> Luckily I can go into the water without fear of uh, running into, you know, being frozenness. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? I don't know. But uh, let us get over here. I do see some purple coins just chilling. I definitely wanna get all the purple coins I possibly can. The seaweed's not being very nice to me. They're closing in on me. I did see some more sea or purple coins over there, but I think that I don't need to worry about them for right now. What I'd rather worry about is getting some air. They're all chasing me. It makes me very uncomfortable. Okay, got it, okay. Um, wait, wait, get out of here, jerks. <laughs> I have to get the last laugh in before I get out of here. Okay, now we're up here. Whoa, look at this place. Oh, we can walk go the water now. Hold on, I wanna become this. Ooh, what a view. So we gotta get that glass and then that glass. And then we could talk to you on the way there. You're just sort of chilling out. Um, all right, well, <laughs> this is crazy. Oh boy, oh boy. Hey you, can I talk to you? Oh, maybe I have to talk to the person. Ah, interesting. Welcome aboard. Oh, so we got the resort hat and the resort outfit, outfit, and then the sailor hat and the sailor suit. Okay, so usually the first one that shows up is the one we need first. We haven't actually seen a use for more than one outfit in a kingdom yet. So we'll buy this. We'll get our Monkey D. Luffy going on here. Resort hat. This hat is made for breathability, aiding in relaxation. Sure. And then we should have enough for the other clothing as well. Change now. Okay, and then resort outfit. The This outfit lets everyone know you take your relaxing seriously, which we do. And the next one is much more expensive. We'll need 45 shells to uh, get the sailor suit and outfit all ready. So that'll be it for now. I think we'll look pretty good. We'll look like, you know, we're on our vacay, which is green. You know, nothing like going somewhere nice and sunny during the, the winter season. Thought I heard the shimmering of a moon there for a moment. I probably did. Seeing how those things are everywhere, even though we haven't found many in today's episode. Let's go ahead and get you. Ooh, we should be able to get rid of some of the lava. That looks burning hot. Maybe we should spray water on it. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. <laughs> it's not very productive, but it works. Um, what about what is this thing here? Um, I'm not sure. It's just like a random pillar that just happens to be here for some reason. Oh no, we're not in water. I need to fill up. There we go. <laughs> I like that. It's cool. So can oh yeah, that's what I was hoping is that we could turn around and like butt attack it. And that's exactly what we can do. Cool. I really like these guys, these guys are fun. A lot of the capturable um, like teammates, or not teammates, what I'm talking about, enemies are really just fun to control. I really like it. Okay, so let us go here. Got a couple more, good. Even the water just hitting it actually activates the purple coin. Hmm. So where is our out moon for this one? Whoa! Oh, maybe it's under there. Okay, oh, well that was dumb of me. I thought I jumped. Okay. But there's water under there, it's not just lava. Well, I don't see any more of those bubble guys, but if I hop down here, ooh. Okay, well, now I can get, ow, my face. <laughs> One of these bubble guys, there you go. I do see the purple coins down there, but I can't worry about those just yet. There we go. And then, yeah, this is all water under here. Oh no, oh, come on, that's not fair. That's not fair, come on. Ah, oh, okay, I gotta fill up more of a spot. Okay, if that's what you want, game, then I guess I'll do it your way. I mean, can I just throw my hat? Like, if I throw my hat, no, it's not enough. You need the little bubble guys. Okay, well, I know where to get them now, so just walk over and deal with it. They are over here. It just takes a while. Honestly, like, it just, it takes, like, a good chunk of time just to do. Because even if I do it like this, I mean, I guess it's not too bad, but 
Still a little bit time consuming, especially since I'm eventually gonna run out of water here, like that. All right, deal with this if I can. You move so slowly in one direction if you try to move the other. There you go. Boom. So, oh yeah, there it is, I was right. Okay, at least my suspicions were confirmed. Here is our third purple moon and our beautiful relaxation outfit. <laughs> I love Mario and flip-flops. Just like, he's so acrobatic, you thought, think he would need like a very, you know, grounded type of shoe. Nope, he can do it in flip-flops. Okay, so there's that. It looks like all the lava disappeared, which is easy for me. Means I can get up here nice and fine. There we go. So let us, there you go. So there is a uh, three of four. His lava hairdo is getting crazier and crazier. Just one more fountain to go. Let's get that last one. He doesn't have anything to say this time. He's just getting used to it. So let me, uh, before I do anything else. Oh, perfect, perfect, amazing. Okay, so there's a couple more purple coins. We need 45 for our next shopping spree. So I'll try to, you know, get that many, like these over here. They're definitely worth going out of my way for. So, oh, there we go. We've gotten 27 out of 100 in total. Ooh, there's a little hat house in there. Should I go through that? Yeah, yeah, sure, why not? You know, it's right here. I don't wanna make my way all the way out here again an additional time if I don't need to, so might as well go in. And I wonder if I can go and ask the cheap cheap. Here, let's uh, become the cheap cheap. Go over here. Um, why, I can't, oh, okay, I can't stop being a cheap cheap unless I'm, that's sort of silly, don't you think? Okay, well, what can we do in here? Ooh, look at this area. Now, while, for some reason, I guess it's just maybe the color scheme. This reminds me a lot of 3D World for the Wii U. Very cool. Watch out, the lava's rising. I can tell. Um, oh boy, actually, it's really scary. Uh, okay, just gotta keep moving. Gotta keep moving. I just gotta be careful because there's probably going to be more than one uh, moon around here. And I hope I haven't missed it anywhere. Whoop, okay, okay. Whoa, look at this thing. Oh, there it is. There's our extra moon. Grab that, and that is stretch on the side path. It definitely is a bit of a side path, isn't it? Whoa, okay, I'm glad we made that. <laughs> oh gosh, this is scary. Come on, come on. There we go, we made it. Okay, that actually wasn't too bad. Hurry and stretch. So there's four moons for us, very good. Hat houses are always fun. And that'll be that area done, which means I can get on out of here and become you, yeah. We can at least swim around faster this way, which is good. Cause there's like lots of stuff around here. None of it I exactly need. A lot of it's just coins, but not the purple variety. Speaking of the purple variety, there's some over here. Cause the next one's way over there. So we have a bit of traveling to go, but I wanna make sure I'm you know traveling both on land and in sea. I love the, the, the sparkling noise it's making. You can hear all the fizz coming out of the water. That is so cool. That's just like a genuinely awesome idea. Okay, well, go across over here. and Still looking for those coins of purpleness. Not finding too many. Oh, here we go. They're just scattered throughout, of course. I mean, there's still purple coins we need to find in all sorts of kingdoms. I mean, we've only completed one set of purple coins for one kingdom, and that was Cascade Kingdom. Now, I'm sure that uh, we'll find plenty more soon enough, but I can only find so many in one go. Oh, look at the little pirate Goomba, so adorable. I tried to get the power mode in there, but alas, I am not fleet of foot and could not outrun the danger. Oh, I can get it for you. I mean, I might keep it though. So let's go ahead and get this checkpoint. I see some purple coins over here that I definitely want to get. All right. Now at the 36 out of 100, very cool. Oh wow, we could have looped around here pretty easily too. I mean, I wanted to do things the way we had to, but I wonder if there's any kind of Goomba Tower related thing. I just love how the Goombas will have hatware that relates to the area. For the most part, yeah, because the Goombas had a little Santa hats before. Maybe we have to travel up the path as a Goomba tower. That, that seems like something that would happen here. So let's try it. Oh gosh, this might be more difficult than it looks out, which it already looks quite difficult, so. Oh boy. Dodge it, Goombas, dodge it. Um, oh gosh, camera. I was trying to recenter it and I just ended up making it much worse. Oh gosh, whoa. Oh no. Yeah, look, there's a little Miss Goomba up there. Little Miss Goomba. Look what I got for you! Oh, hey, how you doing? Oh, you like it, huh? All right, thank you for the moon. Wow. Okay, so let us uh, get over here. Oh, she ran, she darted. 
Love by the seaside. I mean, we're more like by the danger side with how many there are around here. And, oh, she came back right away too. She's like a ninja, the way she dashes away like that. No wonder she's so elusive. So I could, I could still, I could keep going. I could keep going. Oh, <laughs> who needs to be Mario? I want to do the rest of Mario Odyssey as just one big Goomba stack. That's, this just sounds fun. Okay, this is where our journey ends though, Goomba friends. This isn't where I was supposed to go though, correct? I'm most positive it was, or maybe it was. Oh, hey, yeah, looped around, okay. Oh, oh yeah, that's right, they're still mad at me. <laughs> well, there we go, they just disappeared from existence. Awesome, the sea, the seal above the canyon, very, very cool. So we're seven moons into this adventure so far, I like it. And that'll be one last one to unlock it. Those, those Goombas are gone. Where they went, I will never know. I don't care too much. So there is some areas over there where then we didn't truly explore, but now this guy gonna get yet another cork to the head. Oh, that's a migraine waiting to happen, and he's down. Oof. He can't be happy. <laughs> no more! <laughs> it's so dramatic. Great, time to take that back that sparkle water. I will in a moment. Don't be so impatient. Okay, whoa! Oh, nice. Okay, we're getting better at platforming, I think. Okay, it was definitely worth going over here. Oh dear, how dreadful. Yeah, he's so mad now. I might have to go over there and deal with him in a moment. I think he's shooting at me. Um, yeah, he is. <laughs> Uh, okay, we'll save some adventure for later. I feel like there's a little platform over there. Could you bring me there? Or are you not going to? Horrors! No, you're not going to. Oh, oh, oh too, too scared to work. <laughs> okay, so let me get down here really quickly. I know the town's in danger, but I'll deal with that in a moment. Let me get across like this. I'm probably gonna guess that we're gonna maybe even land on this stuff. Okay, um, like let's try landing on this. Ah, oh, that doesn't do much, does it? Okay, that's fine. Ooh, we're good over there, then. I'm running out of water. Let me uh, plop down like that, and then head back up. Soar on over there. I'm just gonna try to extinguish all the lava on his head if I can. But he's moving. He's got the speed. Oh, he don't like it. Oh, he does not like it. And I got so lucky not landing on him there. Oh, wow, we can hold both buns at once. I'm such a dingus. I didn't really think about that. All right. Are we supposed to butt slam him right now? I have no clue if that's what we were supposed to do there or not. Um, He's moving, though. Um. Okay, well, I can try to catch up to him here because he just doesn't have lava on his head anymore. So maybe if I do catch up to him, I can just simply butt slam on him instead of landing on his head. But it's hard to do that because he moves so gosh darn quick. Is there something else I'm supposed to be doing? Maybe I just gotta cut him off. If I cut him off and try to be where he is before he gets there, then maybe I could butt slam him. He's, he's got some pretty good aim in them. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I almost got it. He's a quick one. I mean, he's pretty big, so that makes sense. He's a pretty quick swimmer. Oh, look at that. Okay, that was a free refill. Wait. Oh, wait, that doesn't do anything. Wait, then what are we doing? Hmm. If it ain't that, I'll... wait. Can I become him? Ow, ow, okay, okay, I get it, I get it, I get it. Can I become him now? Is that the idea I'm trying to go for here? Wow, wow, okay. Calm down, dude. But he doesn't have a hat now. Nope, that's not what I do. Weird, I don't get it. Oh, well, I, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I accidentally, the copy's giving me this look like, are you supposed to be doing something a little more important? I didn't mean to do that. Oh, hey, look, there's a moon right behind us, dude. Don't worry about that later. Supposed to be fighting this jerk. I just don't know how to beat him. So it actually does seem like my goal is to chase him around, because he stays still. If I go away from him, I try to go where he's gonna end up being anyways, he actually just stays in place. So I think my goal right now is just to chase him around and try to dodge everything he's throwing at me while doing that. So we'll give him my best shot. I haven't taken any damage this time around, which is good. Also, I see some cool uh, portrait pipes down there, so we definitely have a lot more to explore here in the, uh, the kingdom, which makes sense, because it's a 100 purple coin area. Usually these kind of areas are pretty huge. And we have over 50 moons, so lots of stuff happening there. But first I gotta focus on taking care of this jerk. Because now this is where he gets mad, he's like, I don't like it. And he starts shooting the little conch shells, which I just, I don't appreciate that either. Um, am I supposed to be chasing you? Oh, okay, now it's doing something again. Okay, cool, I'm glad. But it's also sort of confusing. Does the lava not really matter? There we go, nice. Okay. Huh. Weird. 
I figured he would get like lava back on his head and that would sort of determine it. Oh, is there purple coins in there? There were. All right, well, I'm not gonna get those now. I sort of have more important things going on. So try to keep that in mind. Okay, get over here, get over here, get over here. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna beat you up. No, wait, hold on. I gotta get a little bit ahead of you. I'm, I'm about to run out of water. Yep, oh gosh, this is bad. This is bad. Luckily, you get a full restore just by tapping it, which is pretty cool. Come on, come on, come on. Nice. Oh no, oh no, that's not quite it. Come on, a little bit more. A little bit more, he's trying to get away from me. Look at him, spin. He's a bit of a marvel now, isn't he? Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. I know he's low. Oh darn, he's a tough one though. He just really is good at getting away from you. Oh gosh, oh gosh, hold on, hold on. Oh gosh, I'm not prepared. I'm not prepared. Oh yeah, we got him. You're done for. Whoa, your head's exploding! Somebody get this guy a helmet! Oh no. Ew, that must have left a gooey mess. But hey, we got ourselves a beautifully sparkling fountain. And more importantly, a multi-moon, yay! <laughs> awesome, I love it. Oh, look at her shirt. Has like the little star, flower, and mushroom pattern. That's so cool, I love it. The glass is half full, not anymore, not anymore. Cool, so there's that done, which means we can do other things around here, which I would love to do. Because immediately we can go right behind the Odyssey and there's some stuff to find. There's like stuff everywhere in this in this kingdom. My goodness, what a pretty sun sunset. And it's so nice that the fountains and the sparkle water are back. But it doesn't seem like Bowser's in this kingdom anymore. Shall we head to the next? Do I even have enough? Probably? Um, doesn't really concern me right now. Oh, it's so romantic. I love it. Okay. It's like Isle Delfina. Oh, it would be so cool if there were piantas? Not piñatas, yeah, piantas. Um, it would be so cool if there were piantas around here. That would be like a cool little reference. I mean, so far it doesn't look like that's the case, but maybe that'll change and there will be some piantas around. So how do I get up to there? No, no, no. There. Hmm. Actually, I have no clue. <laughs> that was a headache and a half. Oh, you know what? I know how. I'm being a dingus. Get one of these little buddies right over here. Where you going? Where you go? You come back. There you go. Let us just uh, go up like this. Let ourselves up. Oh, wait. Can I? What in the world? Okay, there we go. That was really weird. I wasn't able to get any more altitude for a little bit. On the cliff overlooking the beach. There we go. Cool. See, I'm not quite done. We want to explore this area high and low as much as I can. Just because it's fun to do that. I think so, at least. Ooh, what's in here? Whole bunch of nothing, huh? Not quite. Oh, <laughs> okay. Hold on. It's difficult to wall jump this, but clearly it's possible. I mean, maybe it's not what I'm supposed to do? Oh gosh, no, I was doing so well. <laughs> because I have to sort of cheese it by a, uh... oh, come on. I was doing so good. Like, I don't know if I'm supposed to do it this way, but it works, so why not? Oh, Mario, Mario, what was that? Come on, dude. There we go. Okay, and then, yeah, I mean, I guess I could have, you know what, now that I think about it, I think I was supposed to do this with the little water scooter we left to get up here. Oh, you know what, then I'm gonna go get him. If he's still around, he is not. That is so silly of me. <laughs> okay, well, now I know how to do it. Lesson learned, right? Oh, well, there's one over here. A bit of a hop, skip, and a jump, but there's a bunch of stuff over here that I'll surely be exploring soon enough. What is that down there? Oh, it's another nun. So if I do find a place to put the nun, I'll have to keep that in mind. All right, throw that over there, and let us go. Is this a little, oh, I thought that was like a little a trailer. Not quite. It's like, are they shooting a film around here? Now we got like a little sign here that I'll read in a moment. I just wanted to go and do this really quick. And that's why we have a little water thing here to refilm. So let's go ahead and get that extra bit of coin, go like that, and go like that. See how easy that was? Ride the jet stream. Very easy. I made it way more difficult than I had to be. But you know what, sometimes that's just a zebra gamer way. Okay, so let's pop down here and head on out. Um, I wanna check out this sign for sure, and then there's definitely something under this little cave. Keep. Keep what? 
Well... It definitely says keep. I don't know what I'm keeping, but... I don't know, keep optimistic? What? No, but how I'm through that. <laughs> Hard to keep optimistic when stuff like that happens to me, you know what I'm saying? Okay, uh, uh, rude dude. That's you. You're a rude dude, poor attitude. I wanna get this uh, cheap cheap, see if we can't go under the water here. I mean, clearly we can, we just were. But I wanna go under that cave. Oh man, I almost got you. All right, I'm gonna sneak up on him. Gotcha. Now I just have to avoid all of the uh, little seaweed dudes that I'm just not a big fan of. I mean, who could be? They're little monsters. Ooh, what is under here then? Oh, for a second I was gonna say not much, but that might not be the case. Whoa! Oh, look at this! Okay, one, two, three, four. I guess uh, it's like one of those little um, chest puzzles, huh? Um, Why can't I beat you? There you go. How do I get the chest to come back? Oh, there they go. Uh, do we need to open them in a certain order? You bet. One, two, three, four. Just like in Super Mario 64. Cool. That was a fun one. That was treasure trap hidden in the inlet. That's what it's called, an inlet. Cool. There's nothing over here, not looking like it. So I gotta swim all the way back by myself, but that's no biggie. I still love the little sparkling noise it makes. That is just, oh, it's so cool. Okay, so Lenny of Snail's hanging out here, and yes, beach volleyball is back. Ooh, if you're looking for the beach house, it's just over there. Oh, hello, Talkatu. How you doing, buddy? What is the secret you are seeking? I know it, haha. -ha. I can't tell you, but I'll give you a, a clue. Fly through the narrow valley. It's hiding somewhere and no peeking. Probably another gliding thing. That sounds pretty cool. What is up there? Actually, I'm not sure. I bet you we can hop, yep, off the umbrellas. Oh, look at that, it's a rocket ship. Whoop, wait, no. Whoop, yep, ha <laughs> that is so cool. Let us go, I love these. These are always so much fun. This has to bring us somewhere cool, right? Ooh, look at this place, very cube-like. Oh, and we got the little, I don't know why I like that so much, but I just do, like the little effect it gives. Oh my. Um. That does clear out the smoke a little bit, making it easier to see, so I will accept that. Hmm, I'll have to keep that in mind. There probably is a good secret to find around here. Probably, maybe even like over here. Not quite. Like there could be a, oh, come on! I was trying to walk up to the edge. That one was a little silly. Ooh, okay, shouldn't be that hard. Just roll into a ball and get back over there. Whoa. <laughs> Not what I meant to do. So easy to make a mistake in this game. I see. Uh, I still love her outfit though. Like, I'm just so happy that like try out a new outfit every episode. Like that's really fun to me. There we go. Throw that out over there. And then whoop. Oh, I don't know this. Like it looks mysterious, right? As if there could be a hidden secret anywhere in these clouds. All right, let's get, you know what, I was supposed to do that. Yep, oh boy, you guys jumped over it too though, you're smart cookies. Uh, okay, one last one, got him. <laughs> oh gosh, I keep popping up, let me get out of here before there's too many. Hmm, I might wanna take my time here, really see what it clears out. A lot of stuff, that's for sure. Um, do that. Cause it looks like I'm supposed to go that way. So I wonder what is way over there. Hmm. Definitely something worthwhile, I'd imagine. Yes, because I'm expected to go this way. But what happens if I try to find a way over there? I'm not exactly sure where, how. Definitely not that way, though. I think I need to go back. You can sort of see something, something, like the, how the clouds dip over here. Oh, wait. Ha <laughs> ha, okay, I was right. I was correct, Mundo. Let's hop onto this platform then, and don't you dare fall off. Oh my, oh, okay. I thought that was just gonna be a never ending pit. Not the case, we got sunken treasure in the cloud scene. Cloud scene, oh, I like that. Interesting. Oh, I was stuck in the chest there. So I need to make my way back, so try to find it. There we go. Good, good, good. We're doing okay. Whoa, whoa, oh, Mario. That ain't no good. Let's get out of here, quickly. And then there should be one more. 
We got it. The triple jump right into it, waiting in the cloud scene. Cool. We're doing really good then. So there's two more moons for us. We have almost half of the purple coins, I think. 33 plus the 25 we found that we spent. Oh no, the, yeah, the 25 we found though. Or maybe it was just 20. I think that's some pretty good progress. Oh, there are four seeds to find. If only I had some flowers to water and take care of. That reminds me, we gotta go back to the uh, Sand Kingdom and see all those um flowers that bloomed. Because two of them bloomed, then we put the third seed in and we never checked it out again. So let me uh, go ahead and get this one because it's quite easy to get. Just pick it up. Then let's get out of here, swim, swim, swim. <laughs> I love this game. It is so much fun, but yeah, here's where the volleyball is. Oh, and look at this. This is probably where we can go into that door. Cool, and three more purple coins. So, there's one. I need to find three more somewhere, somehow, some way. For now, it's not my concern. Get on the court, I will in a moment. First, let's get this checkpoint. Beach house, nice. Hello. To fully enjoy the pleasures of Bublane, you must wear clothes you can t entirely relax in. You have achieved the perfect ensemble for relaxation. That's sort of objective, you know, like to me, those clothes wouldn't be very comfortable or relaxing. In my opinion, you know, I'd rather have, you know, some comfortable non-jean shorts. <laughs> Please enjoy yourself within. Okay, relax and enjoy. I mean, what if somebody is just totally way more comfortable in like a one-piece leather jacket? Uh, that's not a jacket. I don't know. Okay, I had to dance. Uh, sure. Um, oh, look at us! It's a little, another one of these little dancing rooms, just like in the Sand Kingdom. We're doing a bit of a hula. <laughs> I love it. Just taking a moment to soak it in. Cappy is not really into it though. He's like, are you, are you done? There we go! Easy purple moon. <laughs> okay, a relaxing dance. I love it. And what about you guys? You don't have much to say? You just like watching the dances? Sure. It's a weird relaxation room, no, nothing else in it. So let's try volleyball if we can, if they'll let us play. Uh, the sparkle water overflows much like the joy in my heart. <laughs> Hello. This is our beach volleyball court. Have you played? You might enjoy it. Yeah, you just touched the ball to return it. The, the, the volley continues until the ball hits the ground. Ooh. Can you volley the ball 15 times? I'll sure as heck try. So let's try to do it 15 times and Maybe that'll get us, um, oh, can I throw my hat to do stuff too? Let me test this now. There we go, so yeah, it does work that way. If we can do it 15 times, oh, speed up. Maybe we'll end up getting a moon for it. That'd be cool. Whoop, ha <laughs> Okay, I like this, I can dig it. It's like volleyball from uh, arms as well. I played that game. All right, there's six. What? Oh, whoa, <laughs> holy cow, I didn't mean to be so mean. But at the same time, it, you seem to not be, you know, problem. You don't have a problem with it. Okay, whoa. All right, I'm at 10. Gonna speed up again. Oh, okay, yeah, it's getting pretty quick now. Uh, oh, yep. And 13. Let's go for 14, maybe. Oh, okay, one more, one more, one more. Oh, no, darn it, I thought I was gonna go farther. Okay, we'll, we'll try it this time, they'll be fine. I love this so much, Joe. It really does just add a little bit of extra something something to the game when you have all these mini games. You know, this, the jumping rope. I thought that one wasn't gonna make it all the way over. Oh, I'm the worst. I am the worst. I shouldn't be having this much of an issue. But, um, oh my gosh, I love that, but I also sort of feel bad. Wait, there we go. So it's like, if I get like right under the ball and do that, jeez, like I feel like I'm being mean. Just tossing at the lady. She just wants a nice and enjoyable game of volleyball. I mean, she probably just gets paid to just do this. That actually sounds like the life. You know, just tossing people volleyballs. Okay, you ready? Yep, okay, we're getting close to it. Nice. Wait, whoa, that was close. Oh boy, 13. Don't mess this up now, Zebra. 14, just follow the shadow. What? Yeah, there we go. I don't care, just give me the moon. Oh geez, whoa, whoa, hold me off, hold me off, I can't. <laughs> I'm stuck. There we go. 15 beach volleyball champ. Cool. You're not gonna challenge me for anything more? Wait, <laughs> now live the dream. Try to volley it 100 times. Is that really something you have to do for a, a moon? Well, it ain't gonna be something I'm, do I'm doing right now. Okay, so what are we supposed to bring this stuff for? Certainly we can, oh, 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 ow. Probably this. 
Yes, you bet. Okay, I didn't quite do it correctly then. Oh, I'm gonna run out of time. Yep, yep, my time's done. Oh gosh, all out of time. Do that. Angle up correctly if I can. Excuse me, folding chairs. You're in my way. Gosh darn, that's really, really tough to do. Maybe I just have to do it from here. Yeah, maybe I'm being a bit silly with this. If I just angle up just right. And then let's go, whoa! Okay, come on, go, go, go. Don't miss any of them, please. Don't miss any of them. Yeah, we did it! Okay, cool. So there's that one. I love this area so much. Like usually I'm not the kind of relaxation beach kind of guy, but hey, in a video game, it's fun. Taking notes, ocean surface dash. So obviously there are a couple of these uh, portrait pipes down here. I don't know if they all lead to the same thing or what. It's weird that there is four of them, but maybe that is for a worthwhile reason. Oh, look at that. Bit of a maze, huh? Okay, it's a bit hard to keep up with what's going on here. I would sort of like to zoom out again if I can. Wait, can I get hit by you? I can't, because you're in a different dimension. Can I zoom out a bit more? No, you're not interested in doing that for me? Okay, well, I tried. Wait, is there more than, I'm sure there's more than oh, one moon to get here though. Oh, I can't go up this way. So this was not the correct way, but I just sort of want a good view of everything. Like really, that's what I'm trying to get here. But definitely, I think I want to go this way. So let's try that out. I do like the Beach Mario um, portrait suit. It looks pretty cool. Hmm. Okay, I need to knock that the correct way, just like that. Perfect, what is down there then? Um, if I duck, no. If I duck, oh. Ha ha, nice! You got a moon ocean bottom maze hidden room. Cool, that's all I wanted from there. It's just really difficult to do this as a, with the joystick. Like actually, I don't, it won't work. There it goes. Weird. It really is awkward with the joystick. I really wish they would just let us use the D-pad for that, but they just don't for some reason. So I need to go back to this one over here. I wish there was a way to swim a little bit quicker, because we don't swim, like we swim upwards pretty quickly as Mario, but we don't just swim straight very quickly. Hmm. I actually don't think I want to go down this way then. I think I need to go to one of these other two pipes. Fair enough, fair enough. We haven't, you know, adventured those ones too much. What is up there in the sky? Oh, another purple moon. I guess we'll have to ride one of the uh, dinosaurs. I forgot their names. Okay. Oh, but how do I do this? Oh, I think I see. Um, I need to first, yep, do that. And then just knock you down like that, maybe? Oh, gosh. Oh, I almost got hit. So, I think my expectation, oh, no, no, I could do this. Oh, don't fall off, please. Thank you. <laughs> I love the little pixelated sandals. I sort of look like Crocs, which is funny. Mario running around in Crocs is just a weird idea. All right, there's three more. Yeah, we're more than halfway for getting all the purple coins. I mean, there's still a lot more purple coins to find, but I'm glad we're making progress in one way or another. We almost have 2,000 coins as well, just normal yellow coins. There we go, I'm getting a little more used to that. It's still weird to me, but I'm getting there. So I couldn't have gone down here before without doing that properly. So there's another moon for us. That is the Ocean Bottom Maze treasure. But I definitely wanna go into that last area. I don't know if it's gonna have anything for us, but this one over here, I'm not really sure. We're gonna find out one way or another. I mean, is the it, is it yellow uh, dinosaur moving around all that much? It sort of looks like he is. It's hard to tell if he's getting closer or not. Here he is, slowly. So there isn't too much around here, just a bunch of coins, but hey, I need coins too. Wait, can I make my way back up? Oh, okay, I was about to freak out. I was like, am I stuck? <laughs> of course not, of course not. Um. Okay, yeah, you're getting closer and closer. I need you to go back, actually. Or is, oh, the purple moon is always above your head. Well, we haven't talked to you either way. Woo, welcome. Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you like that. It's just a matter of, uh, there you go. <laughs> Welcome aboard. We have fabulous new products for you. Okay, so we got the Seaside Kingdom Heart. Oh, look at that, they even got a new costumes here. Thank you. Cool. So we got Pirate Mario. That's really exciting, I like Pirate Mario. Yeah, shopping in Bubble Lane. Cool. Let's go ahead and buy the pirate hat, yar! And then the, the pirate suit. I'm gonna equip this right now, I think it'll be fun. 
Yep. And then the pirate outfit, whether plundering cargo or buying treasure, you're gonna need an extremely fancy coat. Was this the one you wanted? So I think getting this purple moon up here, I think I actually wanna change into the, the little bubble fish. All right then, so we, we're getting a bit of a change of outfit now with the pirate outfit, but I like it, it's fun. So I'm not having a problem with it. Yeah, oh, he's got a little eye patch too. That is cool. Ow, that is not cool. In my noggin like that, that's never fun. Um, hmm. Let me get across to here then and not go down here. Even though I'm glad to know that there is stuff down here. And oh gosh, it's evil seaweed guys again. I need one of the, uh, you know who, these things over here. Come on, get over here. Yeah, before I got hit by you, you jerk. Okay, so the purple moon should be super easy to get. Yeah, it is. Bonjour, Dory. Dory is his name. Awesome. So, now what? I mean, there's still plenty more to do. If you look over there, there is definitely some things to experience. All right, excuse me, sir. I have places to be, like under the water here for more coins of purple. Ow, my face. Uh, There we go, 57 out of 100 now. Oh no, he's gone. Should have thought about that a little bit, huh? <laughs> I mean, there definitely seems to be stuff around here, because none of it seems to be purple coin or moon related. I mean, oh yeah, we actually, I do see one. Okay, at least one purple coin down here. So where is a cheap cheap I can become? You're a cheap cheap I can become. I mean, maybe I should just get a cheap cheap and do like a whole tour down here because there just seems to be a lot. But there's also so much stuff on the surface as well. You know, under the sea and over the sea, there's so much things to see. <laughs> I couldn't think of anything else to say. Um, get the health. Even if I don't need it, it will give me Points, which sometimes can be more valuable than health. What do you know? Oh. Oh, look at that. Cool, underwater highway tunnel. Underwater highway, that's a cool idea. Well, now that cheap cheap's gone, so I better get another one before I run out of air. There definitely is more stuff around here. Yeah, I can tell how it's sort of like an underwater highway. It's sort of like this carved out specific section where we can travel. And they're just like, water as far as the eye can see. Very cool, as far as the eye can see. Get it? Uh, I made a funny. Was it not that funny? Ooh, this gets really deep over here. Look at this. This is deeper than the Lake Kingdom, which would make sense. An ocean is usually bigger than a lake and deeper than a tune. Hmm. Oh, there's another nut down here. What do you know? Oh, and one of you. Hello. So apparently with the one in Sand Kingdom, he did want to talk to me. It's just a matter of I wasn't standing in the right spot for it. So I'll have to go back. Greetings, traveler, to you and your hands as well. Can you answer my riddle? What is the name of this land? It is Bubble Lane. You are correct. Perhaps that wasn't much of a riddle. Anywho, proceed. Whoa, look at it down there. Before I do, just some extra coins. Okay, I have to make sure. I gotta remember though that the nut is here. As long as I know the location of it, it shouldn't be too bad to get it, you know? What is in here then? Oh, look at that. Pretty easy. Just another moon. The Sphinx's underwater vault. Cool. Let us keep swimming back, back this way. We're definitely not getting moons at the same frequency as we were last episode, but it is a bigger area and I think that has a lot to do with it. Either way, I don't know if I should get this nut just now because we still have so much more to explore and I'm bound to get distracted anyways, so. Maybe I should just keep heading this way. Especially since we could probably get more purple coins. Oh, look at that, you got one under your belly. You know what I mean, it's that scratch for you. There you go. Merci, Dory. Bonjour and more merci. I guess that the uh, the snails was supposed to have a French accent. I can't do French accents. If you watch my Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga playthrough, I'm sure you already know that. Okay, let's go through here. Oh, look at that, easy moon. Shh, it's a shortcut. A shortcut to where? Oh, I don't know. Oh, the anticipation. I guess to here. Hey, shortcut to some purple coins, I'll take them. Yeah, where exactly are we? I'm a little bit lost now. A bit turned around, huh? Okay. Um, hmm. Oh, there were definitely some purple coins in this one. Yep, yep. Okay, we're starting to get a little bit better at finding those, which is great. Oh, look at you. Interesting. Oh, there's more purple coins as well as well over there. I wanted to get the scarecrow, but the scarecrow can wait. Oh, there's definitely a moon in there. 
Oh, I love this area. I love the relaxing music under here as well. Like, I definitely need to, like, just find a playlist for the Super Mario Odyssey soundtrack and just jam out for a little while on my own time. Glass Palace Treasure Chest. Are we in a glass palace? Look at these guys. They're like our biggest fan. They're, they all really want our autograph, but they want it on our gravestro gravestone. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm getting so nervous I can't speak correctly. Oh, boy. Well, maybe we should either capture one of these guys to go back to the surface because we're running out of options to do either or. Okay, what does the sign say? Hello, um, no, I just wanna read it. Travel tip, quick swim. Need a burst of speed in the water? Press Z, O, and Y together to dart forward anytime you're in the water, really? Hey, look at that. Oh, I like that. It's it's not incredibly quick, but it is quicker. And so what about this stuff? This is probably just gonna be coins. But you gotta try, right? And then there's some more over here, but if that's the case, I might wanna go to the surface real quick. Just like that, then go back in. Cool, I like that. Oh, 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 hello. Oh, maybe if I destroy all these guys, I'll get another moon. Oh, that is easier said than done when they're surrounding me like this, stop it. They don't stop, <laughs> they never stop. Wow, okay, maybe they're just never ending bombardment of seaweed creatures. Did we ever get this? Oh, look at this, we never got this. Okay, let us get over here really quick. Get the glass palace, ooh, I like this. And then a heart, nothing crazy. I think it's the first time, well, no, that's, that's only the second time we've gotten something that wasn't a, um, what's it called out of that? A moon. What do you get to say? That lizard thing on the top of the lighthouse keeps saying he will fly all the way here. I shall believe it when I see it. Oh, wow, so he is here. Where is that? Lighthouse, here we go. I mean, there's still so much more underwater to explore as well and getting the nut, but just like I could do those things other times as well. I mean, I only have so many time, so much time this episode. So I figured we can do this, because this guy's always a lot of fun. Get some extra coins as well. Um, what do you have to say? That guy is obsessed with seeing someone fly from here to the to the glass palace. Everybody likes different stuff, I guess. Well, lucky for him, we got a scree -sc guy. Scree! This is so easy. You really want to see this? I could, I could do probably a little bit better. And I did it! Your flight was truly an amazing sight to behold. Please take this as a token of my gratitude. Oh. Hooray, easy moon, lighthouse leaper. Cool. So I think that's about all I have time to do today. That was our adventuring of the Seaside Kingdom. Really, really cool kingdom. We'll go over to the Odyssey to find out, get a little bit of a sneak peek at whatever we're gonna be exploring in the next episode, because I'm really looking forward to it. Here. No, oh, that's the wrong button. That just made me go slower. No, oh, I'm still going. Game. There you go. See how, how how hard was that? Not very hard at all. I also don't think I've gone into that pipe there. Unless I have. Ooh, spooky. Let's try this one really quickly. If this isn't anything crazy, then cool. If we go a couple minutes over, an hour, that's not too crazy. I mean, I know I had to cut some stuff out in today's episode, so it's probably a bit shorter for you than it is for me. The treasure hidden in this room is so cunningly hidden and your eyes will be of no use. You must feel the ground beneath you with exquisite care. Good luck, my friends. Okay. I can feel the vibration, okay. Well, not what I was looking for, I'll be honest. Um, oh, maybe over here. Oh, there it is, okay, there's another moon. Nice and easy, a rumble on the seaside floor. Cool, so, let us get out of here. And like I said, deposit all the moons into the Odyssey and find out which kingdom we're off to next. We needed three more to get to the next kingdom. We have much, much more than that. I'll be glad to see it. We definitely have like over 220, I think. Or maybe 220 exactly. No, 230, I was 10 under. The Odyssey has powered up. Cool. So what is this next kingdom gonna be? Ooh, ooh, that is beautiful. Look at all the pink. On to the Luncheon Kingdom. Bowser can't run forever. Wow, finally. So in the next episode, we're going into the very pastel colored Luncheon Kingdom. That sounds super exciting. I hope you guys are as excited as I am. Going. I don't know, oh, he's looking. What you looking for? No, 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 excuse me, puppy. Are you looking for something? <gasps> oh, you found something! Thank you. Oh, wasn't much, but hey. 
Look at you. You, you got anything more for me? Hey, wait, hold on. Oh, I wish I could become the puppy so badly. Hey, no, that's mine. Thank you. <laughs> he's the best. Wee, he's following me. Okay, I just want to play the play with him for the next episode or two. I don't even want to go on our adventure. Head off to another kingdom. Of course, where are we going now? Um, we're going to Luncheon Kingdom. I totally forgot. Okay, so after our vacation, we need a mighty big lunch, and we're gonna find one at the Luncheon Kingdom. Hooray! We probably should have changed our costume. We'll look like a pirate invader. That's okay. We'll figure it out. <laughs> so a lot of people have been asking me like how the pacing is going with this series. For right now, I think that whoa. It's beautiful. I think we're gonna be focusing on trying to just, you know, continue through the story, and then once we like finish off the main story, apparently a lot more stuff unlocks. So at that point, I'll go ahead and I will go and do stuff in detail. A lot of people said I need to do more stuff in New Donk City. I definitely will. So Bowser wants to make a toast using the sparkle water. Sounds like his wedding preparations are moving along. Seeing how as how we've got time to kill, let's review some useful skills. Dive. Oh, actually, I need to learn about this. Ever jump and realize you need a little more distance? Try this. Oh, no, that kind of dive. I thought they meant, like, the dive underwater. While in the air, press E, L, and Y to do a dive and fly like a little feather. Or no, a little fly a little farther. I don't know why. <laughs> well, there it is. We should read up on the Luncheon Kingdom next. It says here this country is famous for using a volcano to prepare a dish called the Stupendous Stew. Ooh, I like it. Of course, they're gonna have to have some, you know, catering at your wedding, so it makes sense that he's doing that. So interesting, Luncheon Kingdom Mount Volbono. Wow, this place is actually a lot smaller than I was thinking it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be a bit bigger. Oh, the Brutals are after some cooking. Yeah, there they are. They just don't stop, we beat them up, they keep going. Are those jelly beans on the floor too? What is that? Think, oh, it's tomatoes, my goodness. They're here, the Brutals. But there's already purple coins, of course, and they are tomatoes, as you can see. Oh, I love this music. Oh, this might be my favorite kingdom yet. This is so cool. What are these? Actually, don't they look sort of like jelly beans. They're sort of also just like beans. Haha, <laughs> I'm a Goomba now. Wow, this is so cool. Oh, how am I getting over there? Hmm. I don't quite know how to get those. We got like a bunch of salt or sugar or something, some kind of condiment. It's not, no, no, wait, well, that's seasoning. Well, sugar seasoning? Sugar is definitely not a condiment, but is it a seasoning? Oh, look at that, there's a moon up there. Now if I maybe plop off of these guys just real quick and uh, break this stuff, just to check it out, make sure there isn't anything too much I'm messing here. Looks like it's just a bunch of coins, but you never really know until you try to find out. And I can't like whisk away this, no, don't fall off, what are you guys doing? There you go. Interesting, and who are they? Look at these tomato guys. Okay, see you, Goombas. <laughs> Wait. Oh, I can't become you. Oh, that's sort of lame, but they're also really cool. So, I can't, like, get up there and with this, can I? I mean, I, I bet you if I put my mind to it, I can do anything I want. Um. Oh, oh, I almost did it. Ow. <laughs> okay, not quite. I tried, I tried. I don't think I'm gonna succeed. But hey, I'm glad I tried it. Look at this place. Oh, there's little Miss Goomba. Okay, well, I think I'm down at Goomba now. I was supposed to make my way across like this. Ah, that's stinky. I don't think I have enough Goombas to make it now, but I might. Hey, let's angle up. Big jump. Well, I really like this music, though. Is it sort of the most, I guess, like Mario style music? I like it. It feels like a jungle theme more than the actual jungle area did. Hey, oh, it's not enough. No, I hope he comes back. He is, okay, he's the one with the chef hat. Oh boy, oh no. Come on, Mr. Corn. Ah, okay, I gotta go all the way back though, that is so unfortunate. Oh, oh, I'm getting good at it though. I'm getting good at it, <laughs> sort of. Okay, so I'm actually going to do that, and then, yeah, there we go. Okay, then make her, really? You know what, we gotta stop being a pirate anyway, so while they're respawning, I'm gonna go change my costume. Okay, so now we just have to not mess this up. I have a feeling at some point we'll be able to come, become some kind of enemy that can move in this liquid, because I am so done with everything. I am so done with that, because there's purple coins over there, it seemed like there was a little cave on the other side as well. This is really tough, I need to just, I don't know, get my bearings a little bit, but we died, so everything's back. Become the stack first. I mean, maybe I can make this jump 
and I'm making this more complicated than it has to be. Like, that's definitely possible. Because I made it all the way over there with three Goombas. You think it wouldn't be that bad to just do it with four? Big jump! Oh, come on. Oh, no, I can just make it like that. Okay, then maybe I'm underestimating the Goomba power here. Um, I need to remember that if I press the L, or the, yeah, the L button, um, it will, oh boy. Oh gosh, the angle for this is not good. Come on. Uh, uh, okay, hi! Hello, how you doing? Ready for a moon? Yes, okay. Fantastic. Okay, for a second I thought I was gonna go somewhere annoying. Not quite though. So I can go ahead and get this. Yeah, lava above the lava. Lava love. So it does say we have one moon here, but that if you remember, that's actually from a previous episode where we, I think, yeah, the the, uh, the lake kingdom. When we were adventuring the lake kingdom, we found, I can't, I can't do this. Okay, um, when we were adventuring the lake kingdom, we found a painting that brought us here early and got us a moon we can only get through that painting. So it was a very interesting experience. Ooh, get out of here. Okay, I wanted to, uh, well, I don't want to destroy those guys, but. Okay, uh, <laughs> I'm starting to feel a little crowded. Oh, what's over there? Oh, there's something. Here, um, ha <laughs> ha, there we go. I get to use the platforming, and it has been a couple days since I've last played. I gotta be able to become the lava guys, right? <laughs> hey, look at that. Oh, here we go. I bet you can go over here now? Probably. I hope I don't run out of steam. Hey, there's a way through here. Yeah, that's why I went over. Cappy is so helpful sometimes, but also sometimes a little doopy. Okay, so I want to, and I'm guessing I'm gonna like extinguish, yeah, okay. Information gathered, but that's not it, is it? Because if we do that, we can, oh, 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 okay. I see you, I'm picking up what you're throwing down. Oh, okay, well, that wasn't exactly what I was thinking, but, ooh. Now, is there anything? Oh, ho, 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 look at me, oh, I'm the champ, what's up? Oh, that's actually really scary. Can I do it? Can I do it? Can I do it? Ready? Oh, oh yeah, that was easy. Ready? Got it. Cool. Luncheon Kingdom Timer Challenge 1. A bit of a challenge to get up here, but so was uh, everything else. So we need to get another Lava Dude and try to get around the there, which actually looks quite easy. I just need to grab one of you and then dash on over. Oh, this is such a fun area. Like, I really like this area so far. I definitely wanna see more of this. So let's go ahead and get that. I don't see any way we could, um. well, I bet there is. If we, uh... oh boy, oh. Yeah, what about down there? It doesn't actually look like there's any way over there, okay. So with that being said, if there's nothing of entrance, uh, uh, entrance, interest over here, and I could just become this guy and do some other stuff. How high can we jump? Oh, very high. Awesome, so this is where we would learn how to use this guy if we hadn't already, but, oh, they're just right here. Look at that bird, <laughs> I want meat. You'll get your own meat, buddy. Um, oh, oh, okay, we're already fighting them. I thought they were a little farther ahead. Hello? Wait, what happened to the tall dude's out? We've beaten him twice, he's just gone. Ha <laughs> ha, we stole the whole boatload of the place's stupendous stew for the boss's wedding. But I'm gonna head back up to Volcano to finish off that stew after I'm done with you. All right, big guy. Me and you, we're going for it. He's got quite the voice on him. I wish I could emulate it a bit better. Okay, yeah, he's the goopy guy. All right, this area sort of fits in then. Here, get out of here. Get out of here with your goop. I think he was actually one of the easiest brutals, to be honest. I mean, it's the second iteration. They seem to make it a little bit more difficult. Um, so far, this is basically the same now. I would say what makes this guy more difficult is that we have sort of a more constrained area before it was sort of larger and more circular. Here, it's hard to actually like sort of keep up with where he's going. Here, do that, because we can hit him before he even goops again, and then we can get up, and like, he's gonna do this again. But beyond that, after this is done, we just throw our hat at him and it's done. I mean, I just gotta make sure the goop doesn't hit me, which is still, you know, a very possible thing. Oh, all right. And then you're gonna land here, and I'm just gonna throw it, or I'm gonna, I'm gonna, okay. Oh, yeah, see, that was really easy, this guy. A piece of cake. <laughs> Which is great, because I'm sure we could find some cake here. Maybe not. It seems to actually be more like dinner food kind of stuff, but I just, I love the colors here. It's just, everything is so pastel and jelly. It's like, oh, it's perfect. It's so different. The Brutals are after some cooking, not anymore. They're gonna have to go to the dentist. Ooh, nobody likes a dentist. 
I mean, I'm sure the dentist himself is a great guy or gal, but I'm saying that like, going to the dentist, it's not fun, under the cheese rocks. Ooh, wow, look at this. Okay, this place is actually bigger than it looked. It was just, it looked like, I thought it was gonna be to scale a smaller area, but it's actually really big. Okay, so a lot of adventuring is a little lava thing. I think I already see a hat house and the moon rock that I still don't understand, but we could also, yeah, I really love doing that. That is so much fun. Okay, don't fall. Yeah, there's like salt everywhere up here. I mean, I hope that Mario doesn't have like a paper cut or a sore anywhere, because ooh, he's gonna be hurt. I mean, Mario was pretty covered head to toe. I mean, the only thing that only isn't like, you know, like covered in clothing is his face. So, as long as he doesn't get any salt in his eyes, that doesn't sound fun. I don't know if that hurts or not. Oh, look at that, easy. Piled on the salt, so it is salt, confirmed. That is so cool. It's interesting, I think if the salt would start to fall, you know? But it is pretty solid, it's sturdy salt. I don't know if that's a good thing or not. I guess salt does sort of get all sturdy and crusty if you leave it out in the air for a while. Oh, look at that, that's a sneaky one. I was right over here and I didn't even realize. Yeesh, lurking in the pillar of shadow. Cool. Yeah, it was right here. Oh, I can't like get over the lip of this. Ow, oh, I almost did down. Here. Yeah, you just can't do that very well. But if I do it off the pillar, maybe? That might be easier. Yeah, there we go, look at me! Platforming King! Oh, wow, okay, that one was a little little sketchy. But I guess that would that'd be another way to get over to here. But I found some alternative ways to do it. So we could, of course, adventure this whole sort of goop ocean. I feel like that's something we wanna save for a little bit later, at the least. There is, though, a hat house down here, we'll adventure this. I mean, I wanna get into this area and enjoy it as much as I can. Ooh, I love this. So, if we go like that, go like that, there are moon medallions everywhere. You know, I could probably, oh boy. Whoa, look at me, oh! Okay, forgot about that part. Oh, you know what, I do wanna go back though. So I might just wanna, this is so much fun. I just say, like, I've been having, like, so far Mario Odyssey has been, oh geez has been everything I've been wanting it to be. I mean, maybe I should stop marveling at it and learn how to play it well. Ah, oh, yeah, okay. Let's go ahead and get Yoon. And then maybe I should, oh boy, I almost didn't land on my hat there, that would've been bad. What I do like about this area is that this is an insta-kill goop. This is um, one hit goop. It's like lava in the way that it's like, you know, Mario flies away and he's like, ow, my boot, my butt. I don't know why I pronounce it like boot. <laughs> Cause it's not my boot. Okay, so there is that. That is going to be another moon. We haven't been finding too many purple coins, which has been worrying me. I think it's only a 50 coin per, uh, yeah, yeah, 50 purple coin area though. At this scene, magma swamp floating and sinking. Oh, you know what? There's probably another one. Oh, I should probably go back in. Cause I, I didn't even realize the fact that there could be another one. Let me go back in really quickly. But what could there be beyond that? Oh, I hear it. Oh, I hear it. Out, <laughs> my forehead. Okay, hold on, oh, perfect. Yeah, look at how easy that was. My lack of observational skills must cease now or I'm gonna miss a lot more moons. Corner of the magma swamp. Cool, okay, go like that. And then, oh, no, that was the wrong combination of buttons. Oh, okay, please Mario. I was talking about how I was a platforming king that still has to stay the case. Oh, oh gosh, a little too far, huh? <laughs> it's it's still funny when he's like, ah, da, 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 da. Okay, okay, really easy. Go like that. There we go, we're out of here. See you, lava area. Even though it's, it, what, would they, what did they call it? Magma lava, I don't know. Okay, so we ain't doing so well. We defeated the boss fight without taking a hit, but a bunch of purple goop, and that's too much for Marion. Okay, so I don't think we can go up these little colorful mountains, even though I'd love to, because they're so colorful. So I'll just fling up here. Oh, it's like the little uh, sign things, uh, the little um, traffic cones. Oh my, what's that smell? Delicious! I agree. Hello, oh no, you're not an obstacle. You have a hat on. Big welcome to Mount Bono, home of the hugest flavors anywhere. I'd show you around, but uh, things are kinda on fire right now. Oh, you're a fork, that is so cool. Hello, how are you? Whoa, -ho. Th that bird up there showed up out of nowhere and took over our stew pot. Just when we were making more of our special stupendous stew, too. Everyone was getting ready to dig in. No, oh, that's not good. Maybe I could put a stop to it. Our stew will be ruined. What's that darn bird doing up there? I'll take a look. 
rocks. Yeah, this is our next goal, most likely, or noun. Under the cheese rocks. Yeah, that is our goal for right now. Interesting. Okay, then. Let's pop out of here. Oh, look at these guys. And meat is on that pot, too. Just sitting there. The meat, the meat, the bird's gonna take it. No doubt about it. That bird will see the meat. Oh, my. Oh, look at you. So you want a little costume as well. This here's, this here's a place where chefs come dressed to cook. No matter how you slice it, you're not. Hey. I make a mean ravioli. <laughs> Actually, I have no idea what ravioli really is. Like, I mean, I guess it's... Oh, you know what? There's something in here. Look at that box. That box is begging to be broken. Yeah, easy moon. You're telling me, oh, hey, what are you doing up there? I'm glad I didn't break the other boxes to get up there. Uh, I wish the camera would work with me. Ooh. Haha, <laughs> awesome. Is this an ingredient too? I sure hope not, because I need it. Hello. You don't got nothing to say? Uh, am I slacking off? No way. Haha, <laughs> look at that! Now I'm up here with the cans. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to litter. This is why you don't litter, I might hit somebody. Oh, there's some purple coins up there. Let me grab these, just so I can see the counter to see how many purple coins we need. Oh, and there's some sneaking down here, too. Oh no, there is a hundred here. Okay, this area is a lot more expensive than I, I gave it credit for. Okay, so we can throw our hat on these little stems. I have to keep that in mind. Oh, look at those cans. Because somewhere here, there might be something worthwhile. Hmm, okay then. Let's grab those three, and then I see a little cat Mario. Good, good, good. And then what, do, what if we get back up here? I'm sure there is something. Uh, well there's a bunch of cans. I need to destroy these cans just out of pure curiosity. Ready? Huh. <laughs> I got them. Look at them all fly. Whoa, that is weird. The momentum they carry is just not normal. I mean, who knows? I mean, maybe this area doesn't follow the normal limitations of Mario physics. Oh, there's more health, which means easy coins from me. Oh, speaking of easy coins, there's a bunch hidden back here. And I like how the music fades out around here, too. Hmm. Yeah, I think that's about all I see around here. I mean, I could go and they... Oh, look at this. Is this one of those little rolling slots again? That are... Oh, hey, it is. What are you doing around here? And relocated? Play some slots, the Toast Arena game that's winning worldwide fame. It's 10 coins to play, what do you say? Of course. Power Moon can be won, try it, it's fun. Yay, slots away. Okay, so it goes right after the heart. Yep. Okay, could I hit more than one? I guess I could. Nice. No, yeah, I hit more than one. Oh, that's a bummer. Well, let me try that out here. Okay, so yeah, oh, I only get a coin. Luckily, it's only 10 coins, so I can mess up 10 more times and get a free prize, or a free go. Hey, slots of wine, okay. So it's the same thing where it's a, um, it's the same pattern. Nice, okay, now if I do that, I don't wanna do that the opposite direction because of how they change. Nice, and then Yoon. Oh gosh, the music gets all intense. Okay, there's five of them, which means I get myself a real moon. Luncheon Kingdom slots, cool. I didn't know that was gonna be like a consistent thing. Hello. Way to play. It'll be 10 more coins and we're out of power moons, okay? You still wanna play? No, thank you. Just had to make sure that. All right, that's fine. Stop by again sometime. Will do, maybe, I don't know. Um, Cool, that was so much fun, as always. So let's just go to the uh, crazy cap shops. I mean, I probably won't have enough purple coins to get too much, but maybe I could poke around a little bit more. I haven't been on this side. Um, no. There we go. There's still some purple coins out there in the ocean. There we go. Oh, here's Target to, hey buddy. What is the secret you are seeking? I know it, I know it, ha ha. I can't tell you, but I'll give you a clue. Climb up the cheese rocks. I think we were already planning on doing that. It's hiding somewhere and no peeking. Go find it, go find a skrkow. Okay. Now what about you? Hi. Hey, you found, if, if you find any turnips, plop them in my soup. Go, gold ones too, oh yeah, especially those goldies. Turnips. Now I'm guessing these aren't turnips because they just don't look all that, yeah, we just kick them around like crazy. I don't think he means these. Also, it'd be very difficult to kick them in like that. But hey, look at that, this pot's... Was that what I was supposed to do? I didn't actually think it was gonna be possible. What if these little... Whoa, hey, I found one! Gold turnips! Okay, so this is what we're doing. Just like Super Mario Zoom. Best game of all time. 
never really played. Okay, we just need one gold turnip in there. Or maybe we can get a moon for every gold turnip we find. Okay, this is just a normal tournament. Turnip. Come on. There we go. Okay, so there's a moon. Gold turnip recipe one. Yeah, what exactly does that mean? Maybe if we talk to him again, he'll give us a little bit more details. Okay, so yeah, he just wants more gold turnips. I guess the more we give him, the happier he'll be. It's just another normal one. But if I ever see any kind of sprouting from the ground like that, definitely throw Cappy at it. Okay, we gotta go to the Cap. Crazy Cap now. The Cap, Cap, Crazy Cap. Okay, what are we gonna find in here? First, let's talk to the Yellow Coin guy. I'm sure there will be some stuff. We got some new stuff in. So we got, ooh, cool, that's actually creepy. A uh, Lumpson Kingdom Power Moon, a power moon that was saved from the Mount Volbono Volcano. 100 coins, that's chump change. We got 1535, thanks pal, you're welcome. And then we have a clown suit. Shopping in Mount Volbono, cool. So we, we'll go ahead and buy that just so that you know we have more stuff. Welcome, welcome. Clown hat, the perfect hat for Pratt Falls, teeny cars, and wasting good pie. What is a Pratt Fall? I don't think I wanna know. Thanks, pal. And then we'll change later. I don't really want to wear that. We got a nice closet to change if we need it. Cool, and then a clown suit. Okay, I didn't read the description, but I'll do it afterwards. Thanks, pal. Maybe later. So what did that say? Um, roomy enough for all of your tumbling needs, colorful enough to be seen from space. I guess it would mix in pretty well with the colorfulness of here, but at the same time, I just don't like clowns that much. All right, hello. Welcome, welcome. We have, ooh, so much awesome stuff. We had the chef hat. Anyone wearing one of these makes many friends on Mount Volbono. Cool. Grab one of those, Mamma Mia. And then we'll change now because we want to use that to get into the room next to this. And then chef suit. Red scarves are a staple of fashion on Mount Volbono. Cool, and then we also got like a little painter's outfit because this area is just so wonderfully colorful. We need 45 in total, so we're gonna have to be back later for that. Okay, cool. Yeah, look at us, ready to the wine and dine. I mean, I guess we'll be preparing things for people who want to wine and dine. Us exactly may not be. Also, have I done this? Probably, looks like it. Okay, I can go in here. Hey, hey. So, and hey, hey, you've got the clothes and the hat. Go right on in. Will do, a chef's got a dress to impress, isn't that the truth? I mean, most people do. I try to dress to impress. Okay, so what is going on in here? First, I gotta turn around, make sure there's nothing sneaky. Hello. We've got this pot on a good simmer. Really brings out the, out the flavor. But you know what could be better? A little hotter, that doing. But I just can't get any more heat from that lava. I mean, it's, it's lava. Nothing worse than a so-so simmer. Hmm, can I just hop in? Ah, okay, that didn't work. Okay, that did not work. Um, hmm. Then there's probably something farther down I can do. Oh gosh, look at all these flaming tomatoes. I'm gonna have to be a bit careful because I don't want them to explode on me. Okay. Oh, oh, whoa, okay, that's exactly what I didn't want. Hmm, how am I expected to do that? Oh, maybe the little lava guys can, hmm, maybe that's the idea. Whoa, look at this. Can I like break this and make like an avalanche happen? I don't really understand what exactly I'm supposed to be doing. Head it out this way. Oh? I don't really understand. Um, because I think what, what happens here is maybe when these guys create lava, the little, um, what are their names? I don't know what they're called. Oh gosh, can end up riding inside of that. But what is my purpose once I get here? I don't really understand. So I'll try it one more time. I hear the shimmering of the moon, but I think it's just the obvious fact that we need to help them and they'll give us a moon. Hmm, yeah, it's really weird. Okay, so are these guys gonna get mad? You know, they're gonna get all roly-poly at us, but if we land on them, yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. Ah, oh, but it's tough, it's real tough. Okay, hold on, hold on, thank you. That is really, really tough. Okay, land right on you, and then you over here. Yeah, okay, I gotta make a big jump way over to this tomato. And that tomato, nice. Okay, then if I get up here, yes, and that's how I get these coins. But I'm not really looking for coins, I'm looking to get up here, um, which I can, and then I can just go in. But that's not what I'm supposed to do. I mean, maybe I can go through this pipe and there is something, and I'm just getting confused. I figured there was maybe something actionable I could do here. No, that was it. Huh. 
I don't really get that one. It's probably glaringly obvious and smacking me right in the face. I'll figure it out later. See that slab of meat? Sure you do, but that bird has it. Not yet, don't you know what he's waiting for? When he sees it though, that bird's gonna make off with our meat. I bet you anything he does. Oh, that's what animals do sometimes. They like meat. Me personally, not so much. But I, ooh. Let us uh, get up there and try to get some of those. Cause we need, tw what do we need, 45 down? Can we make our way up here? Ooh, we can. We can't quite fit through. On the other side though, it's looking like it's possible. Okay, so we gotta go just about everywhere if we want some uh, purple coins, cause they are just about everywhere. I'm sure we'll be going up this way on its own at some point. So I think we should go with the objective for now, which is down here, I believe, right? I thought it was, maybe I'm getting confused. Huh, yeah, I guess I'm wrong. Yeah, it was that, it was that way, okay. Where is this guy then? Wait, darn it, a little too quick. Ready, set, yeah, okay. Well, while we're over here, I can, I can, I can do that. <laughs> That's not what I meant to do. I pressed the wrong button, wait. Oh, come on. Yep, there you go. I wanted to get some purple coins because they're here, you know? Whoop! And what about over here? I don't think there's anything worthwhile, but it's always worth looking. Oh! Where's this going? Hmm. Not too much to be seen, if you ask me. But there's still something! Yikes. <laughs> I am not playing so well today. I don't know what's with me. I'm trying. Maybe I should uh, visit it some other time. You know, I'm looking fantastic with my chef suit. Maybe we just need to go get some stuff done. We could go that way. Oh, I just feel like maybe we are getting a little too much sidetracked and we can always explore it more once we finish the objective. So, yeah, I plan on doing that. Okay, that's not what I wanted. Get back up here. This goop looks so cool though. Like a lot of people, I mean, it's weird when I think back then. When the Switch was first releasing, and a lot of people were very confident that nothing on the Switch would really look all that great, or it looked very last gen, whatever that's really supposed to mean. Um, but now that the Switch is out, I mean, Mario Odyssey is one of the most beautiful games, graphically and artistically, that has come out this year. It's really, it shows you that at points, it's not really, you know, what you have, it's what you do with it. I mean, you can have the most powerful console in the world, but if you don't have, you know, developers that, you know, know how, know how to utilize that, it doesn't really matter. Um, okay, so we gotta do something here. Look at you guys, throwing your frying pans. Can I not become you? No, I, I, I surely can. There we go. <laughs> Look at their hair. This is our first time becoming these guys throwing frying pans. Try to throw in a, throw an attack. Shake and shake. Um, whoa! <laughs> Holy cow! I like that. So we can churn through this cheese. Cool. So how do we break this bad boy open? Surely there's a way. Okay, this guy's respawn, huh? Yeah, man. Maybe the answer is one under one of these cheese blocks. Whoa, he's going back. I would've got him <laughs> instantly. He didn't have a chance. Hmm. What can I do then? I will make my way up this cheese mountain and see. Maybe there is something. Uh. Yeah, I think I need to destroy this. Yep, there's the button. Okay. Uh, let's hop out of you and then pull the lever. Yep, that did it. Okay, so there's another event done. I wonder what that's gonna do for me. I am excited this area is so expensive. I thought it was gonna be another small area because we've been running into a lot of small areas and that's sort of been worrying me. Like I like both running into a lot of new areas and also having areas where we can really, you know, pun intended, sink our teeth into them. <laughs> I'm so funny. No, I'm not. Uh, But yeah, this is one of those areas that's larger and I really like it. So I see some purple coins here and there. Lots of tomato coins, a big pot on the volcano, dive in. So we gotta be up this guy. Oh, that pot looks so cool. This whole area is amazing, it's a marvel. Okay, so I think the idea is pretty clear with what we have to do here, and I can become Yoon. I think first I'd probably wanna do that. Get a good look at what's up here. Not too much, but maybe I could become Yoon. Oh, okay, not quite. Oi, stop. You jerk, hold on, leave me alone. <laughs> no, <laughs> leave me alone, get out of here. Ooh, ooh, I can just knock you off, see it. He's gonna come back at some point, I'm sure of it. But in the meantime, I won't worry about it. So if I could, oh, yeah. Okay, cool, that's an easy moon. A little bit of a jump I had to make. Don't land in the fire, Mario. Light the lantern on the small island, cool. Let's get you. 
and I know there are some purple coins up here, and I'm pretty positive the idea is we wanna hit the lava dudes, and then I just wanna hop off of you and wait for somebody else to show up. I know there's ones that pop up here, right? Somewhere around here. Um, maybe I wanna pop the, the tomato first. So you get over here, ready, set, whoa, okay, I gotta move. And then where are you? Uh, you're here, okay. I was waiting in the wrong spot, it looks. And these guys, like, they never disappear, which is great, because it takes me some time to get back over here. And, oh, no, that's stinky! You know what, I bet I could get it without him, if I can wall jump off of this. Oh, so close! Come on, come on, I know I can. Oh, hey, look at me! Platform and king! Okay, so, um, what happened to that lava? That lava flew for a while. Oh, that, I just, I didn't see it very well. Oh, no, oh, yeah, I forgot. Oh, gosh, I forgot. <laughs> Holy cow, this area is so much fun. Let us fling up here. Now that we're back on the you know the path we're supposed to go, and I guess it wouldn't be that bad to go into a hat house. Let's do it. Oh, there you go. Cool. This area is so much fun though, I'm not gonna be able to get over it. But I gotta keep my ears out for the, the one of two. There's always two moons in these areas. You gotta find the first one first. You don't wanna find the second one first, because that means you've gone too far. There we go. Ooh, yeah, how much, yep, I can already see it up there. So I don't even wanna worry about this guy. I just wanna do that. Then maybe distract you so that you're a little closer over to here. And then, can I reach you from here? I don't think so. Whoop, yeah, there we go. That's what I'm looking for, oh boy. And then once we get over here, it's easy. It is so easy. So there we go. Oh, I see some uh, purple coins over there. Crossing into the magma. See, so yeah, it is magma, it's not lava, it's not just goop. I don't know why it's magma. It doesn't really seem like something that's like magma-like. But you know what? Maybe I'm being too judgmental to magma. I forget what these little lava guys are even called down. I mean, I'm sure it'll tell us in the menu if I check that out. I haven't actually checked out the brochure for this area, which just feels like a crime. Okay, this is really scary, by the way. I need to be very careful. Ooh. I'm surprised that the purple coins are over here and the normal coins are over there. You'd think that they would have you risk more for the purple coins. But not this time. Oh boy, I'm scared. Think of all these coins while I'm here, because these are easy, these are easy coins. I like easy coins, they're the best kind of coins. There we go, and that is Magma Narrow Path. Yes it is. Okay, let's get out of here. See, I like the areas like that are easy. We only need two more moons, and we're actually good to move to the next kingdom. We'll definitely do a lot more than that. But let's check the brochure now while we have the chance. First off, uh, let's check this. Luncheon Kingdom, popular destination for the hungry. Mount Volvono, the bubbling berg that heats the meats. <laughs> the historic old town cooking with a volcano. Cheese as hard as a rock. This che The cheese in Mount Volbono is quite hard, likely because it is left near the lava and dries it out completely. The locals chisel it with hammers. You're welcome to join, interesting. Oh yeah, we've been out here. This is where the uh, floating sky one is for the uh, thing. Three, way, three keys to the kingdom. Sample the famous dish stupendous stew. It's what the locals eat. Gave the exotic ingredients like gigantic vegetables and rock hard cheeses. Marvel at the preserved architecture, the best kept secret in tourism. Wow, okay. Uh, personal, uh, per, Peronza Plaza? I guess that's maybe a type of cheese. A resting place for meat and it, um, look, a cooking carnival. Oh, cool. So there's 56 to find in total. That's actually quite a lot. Very cool. Let me uh, play as you, if I can. Oh, yeah, you better dodge. Because I'm a mean capturing machine. And I will steal you. I'll steal your heart. Okay, so let us actually maybe do this a bit differently. I could plop down from here. This guy is such a high jumper. He like he jumps higher than Mario, which is crazy to think about. Oh, oh hey, look at this. Oh my gosh. I do not want to get a turn up all the way back to town, at least not now. Later, later. I mean, we'll be doing all that in-depth stuff sooner or later. I like how even when he's in middle little hop like that, he can still jump. Like he just defies physics. Okay, what is, nothing's across there. And at least nothing that I've seen. Oh, we could have gotten up from there. I went the long way around, fun. Bunch of coins. I'm not done with you. If I can manage. There you go. <laughs> You're gonna let me start them frying pans at this dude. Cool. Nothing else around here I can miss, because I think I'm done with you then. I mean, maybe I could have gotten up here with him, but it's none of my concern. Ooh, here we go. The meat plateau. So, oh, look at this. We can. Oh no. We're gonna make him see it. 
We got a bit, <laughs> we're just a big piece of meat. That's really weird. We're something that's not living. Uh, oh no. Oh no, it's a trap. Ah! No, I'm not tasty, I promise. Oh, ew. <laughs> she, she with her, she just does not look very uh clear, clear of mind right now. It's like she's got other things going on in her noggin. So I could just like stop being the meat and fall to my doom right now. Interesting. Okay, no, let me free. Let me free. Ha, ah, there I go. Oh gosh, she dropped us in the stew. It's like she's making her own kind of stew. Like maybe that's all she's looking for. Hmm. Oh, and that's gonna be the multi moon? Wait, so I'm the bad guy here. <laughs> I'm the bad guy. I'm like that Taurus that ends up ruining everything for everybody else. Is that what's going on right now? Because I'm just gonna get a multi moon for nothing. Unless I'm, you know, not clear on what's actually gonna happen here. Um, wait, hold on. Boom! We we are not the good guy in this situation. They were like, please don't do it. Oh, Mario's gonna do it. Big pot on the volcano, dive in. We just did a bad thing. Or not, I don't know, maybe there's more here. She seems happy. Um. Oh, you know what, I think they were more worried that she was gonna fly away with it, oh gosh, no. Hold on, Mario! Oh boy. Whoa, whoa, what's happening? Oh gosh, it's gonna erupt! Whoa! This is awful. Is this whoa? <laughs> really what we wanted? I don't think so. Why are we really flies through the air a lot in this game? Climb up the cascading magma. So this isn't done. Usually it's it's done once you get a multi moon, but here this this area is still kicking. That's really cool. Yowie, blast it all the way back here? That is one angry volcano. And the volcano is still erupting. It is so beautiful though. Oh my gosh, this area is perfect. So, what is that over there? It looks like a cannon. Oh, everybody's gonna be so mad at us. Oh no, with that kind of heat, stupendous stew will be ruined. We've gotta stop that crazy boil, but no way can anyone get up there. Our stew is doomed. Doomed soon. Oh no. The, ba the blast tore apart everything. Now I can't get to the plaza. Yeah, we just destroyed these people's town. I mean, yeah, I know the bird technically did it, but like, we sort of, we, we initiated all that. We're awful. Okay, become you, and let's get over there. So this looks like a cannon. I feel like if I hop into this, I might be able to get launched somewhere a bit closer to our destination. Uh, looks like it. Yay, oh gosh. Okay, um, honestly, not all that far. Okay, sir, you leave me alone. Hey, hey, get up all on my face. I don't want that. Um, yeah, let's get that stuff. Get a big, bit, bit of extra health I didn't actually need, but you know what, I do need the coin, so. One thing for another, ooh, look at that. Oh yeah, and back here's the town, right? Oh hey, small world after on. Can't believe I didn't realize that. Okay, <laughs> not much I have to do over here. Maybe this was closed off before. I don't I don't imagine that it wasn't. Uh, That cave over there is our only way back to the peak. Yep, that's why I'm going over then. So here's a little portrait area. Ooh, this is so cool. And there's some tomatoes. Oh gosh, classic hammer bros. Okay, you know what, I'm gonna get up here. I'm gonna avoid your existence. There has to be something more. There almost always is. I mean, maybe I missed it. Oh, okay, you know what? If I'm gonna be invincible, I'm gonna take you out. <laughs> I guess there isn't. I guess that's it. Unless I can like, mm, not quite. Okay, the only thing I'm gonna try really quickly then is, yes, okay, and then go up here. Nah, okay, I have to try, I have to try. Very odd, there usually is a hidden area for each portrait, but I guess not this time. Oh, wait, okay, I didn't realize there was gonna be purple coins. Um, let me just, oh wow, I can't believe I didn't get that one. There you go. There we go, okay, I don't even need it. I just don't like it, because it's so easy to fall. And then this is another heart. I don't exactly need it, but I'll gladly take it. Let's go into here. So what is gonna go on with this cave? Oh my, so we got lots of lava bubbles, lots of purple coins, and these things, for one reason or another. And we can't go up like the actual like lava or magma fall over here, right? No, we can't. For whatever reason. Oh, there's like little things falling. That might not be easy. I mean, we do jump quite high, so it isn't that big of like a risk, but oh boy. And they just sort of create themselves here. Yep. All right, I'm just trying to get a good view of everything then. 
Oh boy. So we could go down like a little, little bit at a time, or I can super jump or mess up my super jump. Uh, am I doomed down here now? I don't think so. I just need to find this one. No, I need to wait for that to lower again, I think. Because it does lower, right? Yes, it does. Hmm. Get across to here. Oh, look at this. No! Okay, I just barely made it. Oh, and this is the event. Really? That wasn't too much. Okay, another event done here in the Launching Kingdom. Yeah, climb up the cascading magma. I love it. So that's actually enough so that we can skedaddle to the next area. I don't want to skedaddle just yet, but it's good to know we can. Okie doke. Cockatiel showdown. So now we're gonna take care of this big old bird. Okay, you know what? As long as everything ends up okay at the end, that's all I want. Because this area is great. I wanted to say that way. Um, bunch of rocks everywhere. I mean, I, I don't know if that was what I was supposed to do. You know what? If I uh, knock this rock towards you, oh, I thought you were gonna eat it. I want you to eat it so I can become you and give you one more thing I, I don't need to become anymore. Darn it. Okay, you know what? Okay, I made it. <laughs> Probably not the uh, most advanced way to do it, but it's the way I did it, which doesn't mean that mean it's a great way. No, it does not. Now, are any of these rocks special? I don't think they are. We do need to find some lava guys eventually. Oh gosh. I just don't wanna deal with these guys, to be honest with you. I need some health, big time. Oh gosh, dodge that. Where is this, where is this going, by the way? Um, oh, I see. I need to get across it there, okay. Yeah, okay, just barely making that one. I need to, like, I'm trying to long jump into it, but it's a little weird. Careful of those flipping platformers up above. I'll try my best. What is over here, though? Oh, gosh. Ooh, there's something. Whoa, okay, I sort of made it. <laughs> Not the most elegant once again, but hey! We get a bunch of health for it, so I ain't complaining. What about up here? It looks like there's something. Okay, um. Uh, I bet you I could get up there. I mean, I just like sort of challenging myself like this. Oh, if I did that right. Okay, I'm positive there's more than one way up there. It's just fun to mess with that kind of stuff. But this game is so much fun to platform with, it's just insane. Ooh. Oh gosh, I mean, I, I, I related to it a lot because I've talked about it before. And my favorite platformer and one of my favorite games of all time, if not my most favorite game of all time, is a game I grew up with called Jack and Daxter. And the thing that was really fun about that was the fact that um, it had a really good control set where you could really combo things up that if you were good with the controls, you could do things a normal player would not be able to do. And that's sort of the same thing with Mario Odyssey. You can actually do a lot of really cool stuff. So we're more than halfway there with the um, the purple coins. If we get three more, we can get the other costume, which is you know what I want at the end of the day. That's stinky. I mean, that was all me. Once again, if I was good with the controls, I would have been able to do it, no problem. But I mean, I guess you could say that with any game. <laughs> But I probably could have skipped some stuff, which is what's different, and that's what's really cool. So let us uh, get across to here and get up there. And I am sort of still used to like other Mario logic, like Super Mario 64. I can always expect to pick up coins and that to restore my health. Oh my. Um, what is up there? Oh, there is something up there. I mean, it looks like I have you know other options when it comes to getting across to there though. Whoa! Just barely dodged that one. There we go. Get up here. Cool. And, oh yeah, there's some little lava dudes here. But I wanted to plop down here if I can. I mean, actually, it doesn't look like there's too much over there, so maybe I should ignore it for now. That's fine, that's fine. What is up here, though? Oh, you know what, I see. If I was still a lava dude, I could get up there. And... Okay, I should be able to do that. First, let's like triple jump up here. Yep, there we go. Yeah, what is up here? What is the deal with this place? Ooh, okay. Ooh, amazing jump, thank you. Wow, so we just skipped a good chunk of stuff then. And that's actually gonna be much easier for this. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Whoa, whoa, okay, cool. So yeah, that was just a little bit of an extra. Once again, perfect time to start talking about the controls and how you can skip stuff if you're really good. I mean, the problem is that I don't want to skip stuff because this game is so gosh darn fun, I want to wreath in as much of it as possible. But you know what? It's still cool. So look at us heading up here already. 
Oh, and we're a little lava thing. So we should be able to swim into this hot stew. No problem. Huh? Oh, you are creepy. You creep me out with your wibbly wobbly eyes. So we need to dash through all this. You know, make some room for us. Oh my, you are throwing stuff all over the place. What do I do against you? Hmm. You have plenty of ingredients to toss at me. I don't think I wanna hit these spiky things. I think that's gonna hurt me. Uh, for an obvious reason. Oh, I can climb up that, can I? Oh, come on. Come on. And then land on your head. Oh, tremendous. Very cool. The problem is that if I get hit, don't I stop becoming a lava front thing and then I'll be a bit on my own? I don't see what I could do if I stop becoming the lava guy. But I guess at that point, it's just game over. Okay, come at me. I wanna see the best you got. This is so weird. So weird. Come on, move over here, move over here. I'm just trying to dodge and weave, dodge and weave. Oh gosh, you spitting your goop at me. Oh, it's all wiggly now, huh? Oh gosh. Okay, so I, I don't stop becoming a lava thing. There's hit number two, just like that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. One more time and we're good. Oh, I can do like, I can flip my controller and I make like a little, little jump. I like that. It's like if we do a little motion control thing, it's like, whoa, 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 whoa. Ah, okay, cool. So, let us keep making our way this way. I, I did get hit one, so I'd love to pick up that health, but I don't think we're really in a position to. And, I mean, I guess I could be. Let's get over here. Oh, whoa, I almost got hit again for it, which wouldn't have been good. What in the world? Oh gosh, it's like so weirdly slow motion. But, um, whoa, I can't see. That's actually really weird. I gotta do it from like this angle. That is so weird. That is so weird. I can't see it very well. Okay, come on. Oh, no, no, come on, that is so stinky. I don't like this one. It's the angle's weird. I can't see if I'm above it or below it. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, no, camera. I didn't mean to reset of the camera there. Okay, well luckily she like doesn't stop. I was worried that like, oh, there she goes. That is stinky. Oh, I really don't like that one. Okay, well we gotta do something about this. I mean, I just gotta do it better. That's just really tough. Look, I'm getting rid of all these chunks in the in the stone. I mean, I, don't, I wouldn't want to eat this, to be honest, if Mario was swimming around in it. I mean, like, no offense to Mario, I'm sure he's like, you know, a big fan of hygiene, but when you're going on a big adventure, you're running around constantly, he's gotta get me sweating at least a little bit, you know? Might not be healthy. Come on. There we go. A little bit more. A tiny bit more. Come on. Yeah, okay, we got you, you stinky bird. Oh gosh, don't fall in the soup. Nobody wants bird soup. I mean, at least I don't. Okay, well, I'm not eating this dish. Oh, yeah, she's just in the soup now. Beak talons and all, that is a little awful. I mean, she was just trying to make a meal. She didn't want to be the meal. Okay, another multi-moon. Is this our first kingdom with more than one multi-moon? Might just be. Cockatiel showdown. I guess we win. It's a cockatiel soup instead of Mario soup. So yeah, we're actually, we're, we could be done with Luncheon Kingdom. I wanna keep with the same strategy we've had in the last couple episodes, where, yeah, we uh, keep exploring the area until we're done with today's episode, which isn't too much longer. All right then, let's get after Bowser, later, later. Ooh, this area really opens up. I've already explored this stuff, but if there's more, then great. Oh gosh, that's not what I wanted. There we go. Uh, we can make our way to the next kingdom now. I know, I know, that's next episode. Don't worry about it now. No need to look so far ahead. See, there really isn't too much in this area that I see immediately that we have to do. I think that we might be good to um, maybe get somewhere else, like teleport over. Ooh, look at all this Goomba Tower stuff. There has to be something worthwhile with this, right? I'd imagine. I mean, just think about how high we can make this Goomba Tower. That just sounds like fun. I mean, it's not necessary though. So I don't wanna waste our time. Ow, rude. Okay, move it, move it, move it. See, I need to make my way over to there. I just need to butt slam so I'm on the ground. Yep, there you go. Hooray! Okay, so we'll go over here, we'll explore stuff as a lava thing, and we'll definitely find at least some more purple coins. If not, we might even find um, some other stuff as well. Okay, so where are you gonna plop out at? Here, yeah, okay, good timing. So if I get over to here, we can go into this house and at least get this done. Yep. Let's go. Now just gotta remember there are two purple, not two purple, two moons to find here. I love the music. It is relaxing as I drink my tea. 
Nothing going on here. Okay, good, good, good. Let's plop up here. And it looked like there was actually something on the side of the mountain there. Might have just been like a weird reflection though. Maybe, ooh. Okay, so there's like, oh, I like that. Okay, so depending on how and where we throw our hat, different things will happen. So I definitely want to see if I can't, you know, see. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter. Yeah, it doesn't really matter too much. Okay, so I could do that, and then, whoa, look at that, that is so cool. So I just sort of have to let it, <laughs> I just have to take it by the reins. Okay, there you go. Whoa, look at that, wait. Oh, okay, so first off, grab this. Fork flick into the summit. That is a, a very weird tongue twister. Um, There we go, and then launch yourselves over here. Yeah, nice. Ha-ha! <laughs> Fork flicking detour. Cool. Let's uh get back over here. Oh boy. No! No, wait, wait, hold on. Oh, look at that. Oh no, I thought that was a purple coin, but look at me, saving the day. Awesome. Get up here and throw that there. And then get up that and throw it like that. And then get up here and get the heck out of here. <laughs> Ow. Okay, cool. That was a fun area. I really like that one. That one only took a couple minutes, too. So what else around here? I'm sure that we could probably find a couple more purple coins to sit about. I mean, we do have the, the moon rock here that I still have no idea what that's about, but I swear that there used to be purple coins around here. And I don't see them anymore, but what is this little chunk in the floor? Oh, nothing. Hmm. I'm sure one of these chunks might have something worthwhile. Oh, there we go. There are some easy purple coins. Coins of purple. We do have enough for that costume if I do want to roll on down there. But not quite yet. We'll definitely need that, do that within the next couple minutes, but I just wanna explore this other stuff first. Hmm. Yeah, let me just, what would happen if I just destroy all of this? I'm sure something worthwhile, right? Maybe not, oh, this one's different. No, nope. <laughs> it doesn't do anything different, it just looks different. Okay, yeah, this probably will not get me anything. But I'm just curious, I gotta answer my curiosities now, don't I? Okay, ready? Yeah. Okay, so we're at 54. I don't see too much more in this area, which is weird. I feel like it was way more detailed before, but maybe my memory's just messing with me. So who, where can we go? We could go to the uh, Peronza Plaza. That sounds like fun. And we'll get those two costume pieces, because they looked cool. They were little artsy costume pieces. I really like that. Because of course, being a chef is like being an artiste. Hello, oh yeah, that's right, you said you wanted to come here. No way, no way, we've already met at the Sand Kingdom, Metro Kingdom, and the Cascade Kingdom. You hop all over the place, don't you? Here, have a gift. This guy saved up a lot for his, his vacation. A tourist in the Luncheon Kingdom, where's he gonna go next? I'd love to know. What could top this place? I mean, tip top, sky high, and maybe above and beyond. Whoa, you sure you're up for this? Because I know a place. We'll head out as soon as I grab some stew. Above and beyond. Maybe there's like a sky, oh, a Cloud Kingdom. I don't think we can go back to the Cloud Kingdom, actually. That's sort of weird. You know, like we fought Bowser at the Cloud Kingdom, but that probably is what he means. Hey, look at that! I caught you. Cool. But there's that. We got a moon cone hopping in the, at the volcano. You gotta be careful hopping around at a volcano. You might just hop right in. Okay, so how are all the townsfolk now? Our stupendous stew turned out fine, and there's lots of it, so we're going to throw a celebration soon. Don't miss our cooking carnival. It's a big eat and greet party that will bring in visitors from all over. I mean, I hope there's more than just the stew. Personally, I don't think I'd be a fan. Got to be our best, uh, or gonna be our best fest ever. So where do we start decorating? I love our carnival. So glad we got to go ahead with it. I love how he's just chopping stuff up that's just on the floor here. Cool. One of these little stems must have a moon in it. Just which one? I'm always trying to do that. I think the Joy-Con just doesn't work with me sometimes. Maybe I need to get a Pro Controller. They're just so expensive. Um. I'm doing, trying to do the side jump, and he just ends up turning around normally. It's sort of weird. Uh, the fest's gonna be our big chance to strut our stuff. Cool, I hope you enjoy it. Let us get into here and see what else is going on. I mean, I know what's going on, not too much. Welcome, welcome. We can get the painter's cap. Is it e really, or is it even really painting if you're not wearing one of these? No, it's not. There's our cap. And we're gonna equip that right now because it'll just look so fancy, I love it. All right, yeah, yeah, you wear the painter's cap. You're worth it. Oh, thank you for the confidence boost. Painter outfit, just the outfit you would expect to see on a painter. Pre 
pre-stains for your convenience. I mean, okay. Okay, so putting that on now. Good stuff, I'm glad I'm still worth it. All right, I'll come back anytime whenever I need more stuff and I have more purple coins. I definitely won't, pro I probably won't buy the rest of it until I have all the purple coins, but you never know. Okay, very cool, lots of fun. Uh, the first is gonna be, yep, you got, so I've already gotten this one, right? Like, if I throw this, like this won't be another gold one, or it might be, but I think I'll just get the same uh, moon I've already gotten for it, so it's not really worth it. Hmm. Okay, well there's not a huge ton I can do at this very exact moment, but I'll um look from up here and take a good sightseeing of everything. I'm, yeah, there's definitely more we could probably do over there. I don't think we even got that one. Hmm, okay, you know what? How about we do that one last moon right uh, here. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not a very good cameraman. Uh, we'll go over there and we'll get that one done and that'll be today's episode. Sounds like fun to me. Hopefully it sounds like fun to you. Get it, nice. So where is this? Maybe th this might launch me too far. But sure, I'll try it. I wanna try new things. Whoa, yeah, that's a bit too far, but hey, I get some easy purple coins for it, so I will take it. And do that, and that, and that. Yeah, there's a lot of them, actually, pretty cool. So how in the world am I getting up there? I'm sure there's actually quite an easy way to do it. Um, or not. Hmm. Oh, okay, hey, hey, Stern. Stern, you're being rude. I don't appreciate it. All right, so let me go like that, and then, yeah, look at me. Okay, so I need to become the cheese thrower, maybe, and then maybe there's like a door. I mean, maybe even not. Um, nope, that's not what I wanted. Okay, so let me try to throw, uh, find a uh, frying pan thrower like you over here, and then, Let's just throw this like that, and then throw it again, and we're out of here, see ya. I'm gonna throw some stuff at all you guys, but not gonna worry about it too much. See, so let's get up there, because we certainly had not done this before. I mean, we might even just be able to hop out of him and make it easier, but there is a hat house in here, okay. Okay, then I gotta do the hat house, too. <laughs> There's so much to do. Let me do the hat house, or, oh no, wait. Hold on. There we, wait, there we go. Okay, so I bet you I could, Hop up like that, hop up like that. Yeah, okay, that's probably not the way I was supposed to do it, but it's the way I did it atop the jutting crag. I don't know what a crag is, but I guess this is a crag. I'm gonna guess that, yep, this is another golden turnip. Oh, there's so much to do in this area. See a turnip. I will finish things off by doing this hat house, and then we're definitely done for today's episode. I had a lot of fun, though. It's been a fun, fun episode. Okay, so this looks like there are multi moons everywhere. I might want to do it so that I get all the, well, not multi moons, but, um, What's it called? You know, moon medallions. That's why I like on. I was trying to see maybe I should just, you know, get the ones that I can get without destroying the cheese, but that would seem to be only one of them. Okay, there's an easy one. Climb the cheese rocks. And then, wow, we have gotten 30 moons in today's episode? Pretty crazy, pretty crazy, if we get this next one. And that seems like a great place to end it off then. 30 moons in episode would be pretty fun. Okay, so wow, if we throw this and it lands on one of the moon medallions, that counts. Um. It's just a matter of, where are the rest of them? We need to find three more. Wait, but there's one over there, probably. Okay, so become you, and then start throwing this stuff like crazy all over the place. I bet you there's one in here. Let me land on some solid ground. And then also get rid of you guys, because you guys are sort of jerks. Hmm, whoa, okay, don't land on that. Oh yeah, okay, so here's one. There's three, where are we gonna find the other two? I mean, I'm gonna just hope that they're sitting around. Here is four. Now where's number five? It's gotta be around. I'd imagine, on that platform, maybe it's, oh, maybe it's hiding here. Uh, I'm having a hard time throwing it over there. Not looking like it. Okay, where's this fifth one? Maybe it's over here. Could be anywhere. Yeah, I'm actually not sure right now, this is, Oh no, wait, maybe here? Hmm. Bit of a mystery. Oh, there it is, hiding right down here. There we go, I got it, I got it. That was a tricky one, I was looking out for that one for a little while. Okay, so, what we can do is we can just hop out of you, and then 
Get on over here with our nice painter suit and get excavate and search the cheese rocks. Very cool, so we can get out of this hat house. Hey, so where are we heading? I, I really wanna find out. We're filling up another sale, so I guess it really is going to be like a fully circular sale, but then is it really a sale? I mean, then it's just a balloon. The Odyssey is powered up. I guess they never, have they ever even called it a sale? Maybe they've always been honest with the idea that it's not a sale and it's more of a balloon. Okay, cool, either way, the Odyssey is powered up. We are good to go to the next kingdom, which will be, it's a total mystery to me, to you as well, it shall be. Ooh, I'm so excited. Now we can head to Bowser's kingdom. Wait a second, oh, that can't be, really, already? Holy cow, are we like at the end of the game? No way, Bowser's kingdom. That is so cool, but at the same time, so bizarre. Are we actually like almost at the, like the ready to beat Bowser? I mean, I guess our sale is almost fully filled. That might make sense. I'm surprised. I'm a little blown away. Could we be facing Bowser and finishing him off today? Okay. <laughs> I mean, hey, the sooner the better, that guy's a jerk, but I was expecting maybe a couple more kingdoms. Since he took the time to steal the stupendous stew, I imagine what he's surfing at the, I, I imagine that's what he's serving at the reception. Seeing as how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. Travel tip dive gym. We just learned this one last time. Okay, there we go. Now back to our investigation. Next up we have, whoa, the Bowser in Bowser's kingdom. Is that Bowser? I've got a bad feeling about this. So we knew about Bowser's kingdom, but he didn't know didn't really piece together it was Bowser. Whoa, are we shaking? Why? Oh gosh, what's happening? Oh, are they intercepting us? Intercepting us? Okay, what in the, wait. What? What in the world? It's a real dragon. Where did this come from? You're gonna tell me this has been in the Mario universe the entire time? Hold on, you, let's see if I survive this plumber boy. What is happening? You can't just drop this on me. Oh my gosh, what? We're going down. Oh no, not again. Are we gonna land on the, the in the jungle again? Who are you? Why isn't that guy the main protagonist of this game? Like, holy cow. How much, how big is Bowser's wallet to hire a guy like that? I'm like flabbergasted right now. What in the world? Ruined Kingdom crumbled in. Are we in Dark Souls now? <laughs> what did you know it? The Odyssey is broken again. Eesh, what is this thing made out of, paper mache? To fix it, we must collect more power moons. There's no purple coins here. This is not a kingdom we wanna be in. Coin, this, <laughs> I am not dressed for the occasion. I look, I'm a happy little painter. I can't go in, so I'm stuck in this costume. Okay, maybe I should've changed before. What in the? Are we sure we didn't land in Dark Souls? <laughs> Did you know gaming? Dark Souls and Mario are in the same universe. Oh, look at this, ooh. Ooh, what is, is this gonna be our first moon? Yes, it is. In the ancient treasure chest. Well, I wonder, are there going to be more than three moons here? Because if there are th more than three moons, that means that there is a way to return here. Unlike the Cloud Kingdom, where there was no way to return, at least not yet. Maybe at some point there'll be a more explorable moon, or not moon, does that mean Cloud Kingdom, right? Yeah, Cloud Kingdom. I don't know, I just have so many you know, terms in my head. Purple Coin Kingdom, Moon Kingdom, wow. We're not traveling anything, we're just flying. Uh-oh. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, I have a really bad, oh no. What the heck is this thing? I mean, I guess it's a dragon. But I, I don't understand. No, oh, move, run. This is not what I was expecting when I thought I was gonna have a happy Mario adventure. A giant evil realistic dragon. Look at this thing, it's insane. It's like. I have been here the entirety of the universe. Oh, um, are you sleepy? You going in for a nap? Can I, I and I can't throw anything on his head because he's got that crown. Oh, oh, he's taking a nap. You okay, buddy? Oh, he's being brainwashed. Look at this. Oh, oh, okay. Boom. It worked. Oh gosh, oh, that just made him mad. Oh, it's back. 
Yeah, he's got stuff like crammed on his noggin. That must not be comfy. It's like the lion with the splinter in his stone. Not in my kingdom. Okay, wait a minute. Okay, hold on. I like the scratch marks, that's so cool. This is probably one of the coolest boss fights in Mario history, and I haven't even gone halfway through it yet. Wait, this is amazing. I mean, so far it's actually not too difficult. I just don't have to, I just have to not miss all the time. There we go, get rid of that, get rid of this, get rid of that, and then just throw this. There you go, butt slam! Yeah, we can do this! I sure hope so, mama mia! Oh my gosh, and it gets worse every time. He's like, you're making it worse for me, buddy. So I wonder, maybe this guy's like really nice, you know? Like maybe he's like cousins with Shenron. Like maybe he's just a splendid guy. Maybe he's like the Gandalf of Mario. I mean, I don't see how. I mean, he might not be a wizard, but I just think like he's like has a deep lumbering voice and he's seen rather pleasant. Who knows? Or maybe he is just a monster and knows no better but to destroy whatever's in his path. But the ruin, like I need to know the backstory for this place. The ruined kingdom, we beat him. That moon in the background is so ominous. And you're down for the count. Holy cow. And we get a multi-moon for that. So we could have missed that moon originally, which means by concept, couldn't we come back here? Okay. Look at that. The dragon is defeated. Okay. Somebody get me an Excalibur. <laughs> Battle with the Lord of Lightning. Okay. Interesting. Why have we never seen him before? I want him to be a Mario Kart character. Oh, I want him to be the next Mario Kart. <laughs> that would be fantastic. Yeah. yeah. So it's all in the day's work for an artiste. Wait, look at that. There is a him toad here. Hold on. Let's brochure this place up. Ruined kingdom. Stark land long past its glory days. Crumbled him. A grim reminder of past conflicts. High stakes reaching up for the heavens. Buried treasures. You'll see glowing spots scattered around the ground. Engage in some amateur archeology span by giving them a hearty stomp. This area is so small. Ruined kingdoms. Are there clues to what happened? Are there clues to what happened here? The Great Altarn. Doesn't it look like a creature of some kind? Yes, it does. Uh, are those claw marks? There's got to be a logical explanation, right? Three keys to the kingdom. Visit the vast crumbling tower. Still standing, watch over the area. Uh, investigating the deep coal-like marks in the stone. Admire the durable construction techniques of a once proud kingdom. Crazy cap. And there's actually five to find. Wowee. Should I try to find those? Excellent. We've got all the power moons we need. Oh wow, yeah, look at that. Oh, it's another one of those moon rocks. I think that might be the key to whatever else we can find here. No. Having trouble finding power moons? I can help you with 50 coins. What do you want to buy a hint, Sharon? Thank you, I marked down your maps to take a look. No, there is another one over there. Can we just adventure that area now that there's not the risk of a giant dragon trying to eat us alive? I'd imagine so. Yeah, I guess there really isn't a way to redo boss fights in this game. Whoa. Whoa, what is happening? He's just chilling, that is so creepy. That is like the creepiest thing. He just chilling, he's just like, you know, I'm just gonna sit here for a while. Oh, I got the worst migraine right now. Oh, I'm so sorry, I don't mean to hurt you like that. Look at this dude. This is the scariest thing. And we can just walk on him. Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> Yikes, that's a long way down. We could live on him. He's crazy huge. Oh, and I'm way back here. <laughs> That's not what I wanted. All right, I'm gonna ignore you this time. We're just gonna get over here and go into this rocket ship. I mean, is this gonna be like a happy and cheery thing we're going to? <laughs> Cause that'd be funny. Oh, no, it's not. Look at this, wow. Okay, so a little button that cannot be pressed right now. And then this, oh, makes it pressable. What do you know? Uh. Oh, I see. So it stops the platform in a specific spot. So that, ooh, interesting. I like that. So before I even do that though, I might wanna, oh wait, we never also changed out of our uh, painter's costume, but you know what? I like it. So there's nothing over here. I just had to make sure, ow, that hurt. That was unnecessary damage right there. 
Hmm, okay, I'm already on my last hit. I gotta be careful, run across it. Cool. All right, so that is an endless pit. I'm not just, uh, I'm just trying to make sure. Okay. Oh, more, wow, this is a bit of a puzzle, ain't it? Nah, I don't know if that's exactly what I wanted. Uh, let me try that again. Let's uh, slam that. And then, mm, okay, that'll work. It's gonna be difficult, but. Oh, yeah, look at that, okay, cool. It gives you coins, I guess, to identify that that's the right choice. Okay, I need to, I definitely wanna get up there, you see that? I think that might be something. So if I, uh, I can just hop up easy, okay. Oh my. Wait, why would I do this? Yo, what is the benefit of that? Why would I wanna hop down there like that? Weird. I feel like there, there's something more than it's letting on. Okay, get up like that. And, ooh, we're up here now. What is over this way? Wow, okay. This is a little bit weird. Hmm. I think maybe I could plop down from, like if we get to the top of the tower, maybe I could plop down from there. And, or maybe, oh, I think I see, I think I understand. Wait, oh, you're back. Okay, Mr. Koopa. But I need to hit you like that and follow you. Whoa, look at this. Okay, this might be, yep, exactly what I was looking for. Now I can go down here. Ah, I'm sure that if we get to the top of this tower, we could also do something up there. and just like plop down from there, but I think this is more what we were supposed to, this is more the idea. So I need to be like, no, well, that'll work. That might not work, I might have to reset that. We're still on our last hit here, I gotta be very careful. Gosh darn it, okay, you know what? It is tough to time. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Okay. One, two, three, four, one, two, three. Oh, I, I pressed it with my big nose. Okay. Didn't realize I could just bump into it. Thought I had to throw the hat, which adds a bit of delay, which makes it more difficult. Yeah. Roulette tower stopped. Interesting. See, there's actually a good number of moons around here. And I mean, okay, not a good number compared to other kingdoms, but it's explorable. I wasn't expecting that. I thought maybe it would just be that boss fight and that's it. That is, I'm just still blown away by that giant stinking dragon. That's just crazy to me. Um, okay, so I think what I wanna do here actually is do that. Can I jump up here? I can't quite make that jump. Hmm, uh, I'm trying to find health. Be honest with you! I mean, I got the moon, so I'm back on full health, actually. So maybe I shouldn't worry about it. I can't get up there like that. But there are certainly things up there. I mean, I can just do this then. Oh, mine. One, two, three, one, two, three, one. No, okay, see, that's why I don't like doing that one. Uh, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. Nope, okay, I hit my nose on it again. I mean, it worked, so I'm not gonna complain. It's just funny. It's just sort of comical. So I could get a, once again, I don't know why they give you the op op opportunity to reset like that. Or like go backwards, but they do. Okay, I don't think there was any way to get up any of those areas. But usually there's only two moons for this kind of stuff anyway, so I think we found it. There is another yellow moon. You got a moon, roulette tower, climbed. Cool. What a creepy place this is. We're out of here. So beyond that, what can I find? I mean, I'm sure there's something. This dude is just chilling. You wanna open your mouth? Maybe we can go inside this. Wait, I could. So tired. Oh, that's it? Oh man, I wanted to have like a real conversation with you. Like, I feel like the amount of, I just, I need to know more about him. How old is he? Maybe he's like thousands of years old. I mean, how old is Mario supposed to be? I feel like they've confirmed he's like 30 something. And I would ima imagine Bowser's all that much older, maybe like 40 or 50 or something, you know? Peach would probably be the same age as Mario, maybe slightly younger. So like this guy must have so much information on what this world is, you know? Mario is, like the Mario world, you can't deny, it's quite the enigma at times. I would love to hear more. You know, I can't find any more hints for this kingdom. Like really, yeah, we have one more to find, and that's probably whatever this moon rock has to do, which I'm pretty sure we won't figure that out until after the game's done. So, yeah. Unless there's just some obvious secret with him that I'm just totally missing. Either way, we have five out of the three moons that we need. So very, very cool. Oh wait, there's a, wait, why is there a, button on top of the Odyssey. Oh, it's a symbol that looks like a button, you see that? I mean, maybe I've just been dealing with the button so much, but I might wanna run up there and check that out. 
The Odyssey is repaired. Again. <laughs> cool. Oh, oh, we're just going. Okay, I just dropped my <laughs> I dropped my Joy-Cons out of excitement. Um, oh yeah, I don't get to change my outfit. I'm just permanently an artist. See you, Dragon. That is insane. Like, I, I have so many questions, and I'm sure that's exactly why they will. Because now they can have, like a, like, a Dark Souls art style game and still say it's, like, in the Mario universe. Like, what if Waluigi is from that kingdom? Like, you don't know, you know? <laughs> oh my gosh. Like, obviously, I'm going a little wild with it. Well, that was certainly a doozy of an interruption, but I'm glad we got the ship fixed. Seeing as how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills, travel steps, side summer sun. Turn quickly in the opposite direction and jump to do a side somersault. You'll use all of your momentum from running it to jump backwards high into the air. Well, there it is. Next, let's look at the Bowser's kingdom. Hmm, architecture, statues, Bowser's castle. Wait, he's got his own castle? Man, we gotta help those two. Okay, things are looking a lot less ominous now, which I love. I'm like so stressed out now that I was insane. Bowser's kingdom, Bowser's castle. Wow, it's actually enjoyably colorful. This is different. I mean, have we, we've, we've been to Bowser's kingdom before. Infiltrate Bowser's castle. I love the influences. It's definitely different than normal. I mean, I don't wanna, you know, say something I don't know if it's true, this is at the showdown, but it seems like it has a lot of a Chinese sort of, I guess maybe like, I wanna, no, samurai is Japanese. But it has like a lot of a, Maybe it's more Japanese than it feels Chinese. I'm not really sure. I'm not incredibly versed in that culture, but no matter what it is, it's awesome. I love it. Oh, that is ominous. It just opened the door. Come on in, Mario. But I love it. It's a very traditional kind of wedding. It's like, you know, not the American kind, which is what I'm mostly used to. What is up here? There's surely something. Purple coins. Whoa, look at those. Those are cool. I mean, I don't know what they're called. I mean, maybe they are just coins, but. <laughs> Uh, I'm not really sure too much what these kind of coins are called. Uh, but we got four of them. That's all I see. Ooh, there are some other coins here. Is there anything I could do with a, a Goomba stack? I love the music. Dude, this area is so cool so far. Um, oh, there is something truly over here. Um, oh, okay, it's a 10 Goomba stack. Holy cow, so I think if I wanna do that, I should start from the top. And also, I should stop being an artist. I wanna go and turn into normal Mario before we do anything more. Um, so let's get across to there. Come on, Mario, roll around. I wonder, is there gonna be a... Oh, I wonder if there's gonna be a Cap Kingdom around here. Not a Cap Kingdom, a Cap store. Whoa, okay, I was, I was switching, uh, flipping my controller around. It was uh, freaking out on me. Um, so we just need to do that and do that. Cool. So now we're back to being in our normal dreads, exactly what I wanted. Now we can truly adventure this. I just, I just like doing that, you know? It, it works for me. Okay, so let's get across to here. Uh, the doors have to reopen, that's fine. So let us go ahead and just start working on this. Because if we, we gotta use our height as an advantage. There we go. So we need 10 of them. And it looks like there's exactly 10, ow. Sort of messed up that one. It is, it sort of gets like floatier to jump, but harder to control. No, did we just destroy him? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, no, we got him. What's a whittle waddle, whittle waddle, whittle waddle, whittle waddle. And got it. That is so cool. And the moons are red. This deep, ominous red. Yeah, stack up above the wall. So, since I don't need you guys no more, I will. Oh, okay, leave you be, leave you be, leave you be, leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> like, what were you gonna do, Mario? What were you gonna do? Nothing, nothing. Get out of here. Goodbye. Once again, we're just launching into the air. Whoa. Okay, third courtyard, front. Look at you. Oh, you guys are so cute. Oh, that's so cute. Poke em. <laughs> I love on guard. <laughs> These guys are my favorite. Oh, look at that. Um, So I can poke and then launch. Oh, that is so cool. I love these guys. Oh, that is so, so cool. Let's get over here and get some purple coins and an easy peasy moon down there. I'll have to make sure to grab that. Let's actually take a look at the brochure. Bowser's kingdom, well def defended castle floating among the glowing clouds. Bowser's castle, the castle that walled off the sky. Beautiful tile work, terrifying gatekeepers, mallets big enough to climb on. Ooh, that's a hint. Um, architectural. Our architecture as lovely as the scenery, the whole thing. 
all along the walls, there are these holes. These holes were meant to allow defenders to shoot at invaders, but nowadays you're more likely to find a demon or snake coming out than an arrow. Wow. Statues guard the court. Statues are not, they are certainly imposing. Has Bowser always had this kingdom? But where rolling ordinance? Impressive fortifications and oasis of calm. These statues called Jizo stand in a row. Oh, we could definitely become those. It's like the uh, statue Tanuki Marion. Three keys to the kingdom dart past the silent and lethal staircase ogres. Avoiding, avoid being distracted by the ominous yet brightly glowing clouds. Survive the various traps designed to end your trip early. So cool. And how many? We have 45 moons to find, 100 purple coins. Very crazy. So. Let us get a couple more. Now we're up to eight. Oh, there, yeah, there's something down here. I already noticed that. I don't know why it surprised me so. But yeah, we could plop down here and get this. Behind the big wall. Cool. No, no, wait. No, wait. No, wait. No, wait. Darn it. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Whoa! Okay, well, lesson learned. Be careful where I walk. Probably should have learned that on the first level. Okay, so let's uh, become you. I love their little hats too, like these guys. They're a charm. I love them. So we could just like, wah, wah. This is so much fun, I love it. So let's go ahead and get Yoon. Does Bowser even know we can become other things? Like I haven't really thought about it too much. Like, maybe he just hasn't been paying much attention to us and doesn't even realize that we can consume other things. There we go. And we are flying, yeah, the, the moons are, not the moons, the clouds. I call everything moons now. The clouds are distracting. But you know what, that's a good thing. They're awesome. So uh, I need to dodge you guys, but I want whatever is in here, and ow. Okay, you know what? You guys are mean. I'm not inviting you to my wedding, that's for sure. Oh wow, okay, I'm supposed to dodge him now. Go, 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 go. Let's do that, so I can just, oh, that was a good move. Good move indeed. So there is another red moon for us. We have found two so far, and we're about to find a third. Cool, taking notes between spinies. Oh yeah. I always forget, it's like, why, what does he mean take notes? Because they're musical notes, does he, bro? It's not that hard to figure out. Whoa, it's one of these big dudes, okay. Whoa, whoa. I feel like they have something on their head. Like, let me try to maybe, yeah, he's gonna slam, and we're gonna jam, ready? Boom! Hey, we got him, he's like, no! Hey, that's how we get him, cool. Let's go ahead and get this one. That is a first event moon in Bowser's kingdom. This is so intense. Infiltrate Bowser's castle. So cool. Okay. Wow. So this is gonna open up. And then the doors open as well. And I already see a lot of stuff ominously waiting for us. Smart bombing. I'm gonna guess it's gonna be quite the gauntlet to actually get to Bowser down. I'm sure he's prepared for it this time. I mean, he seems more prepared to you know, defeat us than ever, because he's always been one step ahead of us. Okay, so let us um, get over to here. Apparently we're avoiding some bombs, but before I do any of that, I wanna try to get up there. I should be able to if I like, one, two, three. Yep, look at how easy that was for me. Then, ooh, oh, there must be like one of those birds around here then. There definitely has to be. Yep, there you are. Okay. And then what is up here? Anything really? I mean, this is the area I've been to before, so this is really this the other side of that wall. Oh, look at that. One of these has a hole. Just gonna probably be a worm in here? Or not. What if I poke my little nose in there? Um, no, no, hold on. Oh, hey, look at that! Oh, that's so cool! Pretty smart, pretty smart. Poking your nose in the plaster wall. Cool. So let me get across to here. I love these guys. These might be my one of my favorite transformations so far. They're really cool. Okay, so let us, um, yeah, we're gonna get over there. That might be really challenging, but I'm up for the challenge. Oh my. Oh. Yes, that's good. Oh boy. Oh, no, 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 okay, at least I got him. That is so weird. Like, the, the direction how it works is really odd. Okay, 1,843. So now we're way back here, that's not a big deal. But we got everything over on that side. I'm just gonna check all these golden sort of, what are they, one, two, three, four, five, six, hexagons, right? Um, yeah, let's get across from all of this, because I don't need to deal with it no more. But I need to get on this side, which this side is definitely easier to get up to. I don't know what's gonna be up here too much. 
if there's gonna be anything worthwhile. I'm sure there is, because there's clearly platforms to get up here. Oh my gosh. Not what I meant to do. Not at all. Okay, should be easy enough just to run over here and get them. So we're seeing, seeing, you know, some purple coins. We're not having too much of a problem getting them. I think we've gotten, like so far, everything in this game that we have passed, we have gotten. We haven't run into anything we just can't quite do yet. So that's pretty cool. Well, let's go across to here. Oh, look at all these purple coins. Okay, first get the checkpoint for sure. If we die, we can respawn here at the second courtyard. So we have one more courtyard after this, and then maybe we'll be at the castle? So a lot, a lot more challenges. Ooh, what if I take care of like all the torches? Okay, I'll try to keep that in mind. Like maybe that's something. Um, there we go. There we go. That's all the torches I see for right now, but if I find more, I'll take those out too. So yeah, oh, look at that, they're moon medallion. So grab that. We might want to try to, ooh, ooh that must have hurt. Can these guys maybe, uh... no, they can't. So how do I get these bombs maybe to move? Oh, like that, oh, ho, ho, that was cool. So let's, ooh, nice. I bet you there are some moon medallions hidden away in these boxes, so we wanna try to make this as accurate as possible. All right, let's try to hit this one next to it. There you go. That did not have a moon medallion in it, but it could've. You know, that's the thing, that's the idea. Boom. Oh, a little off for that left one. Boom. Also a little off. Come on. Yeah, perfect, cool. And what about other places around here? There's another moon medallion. Oh, you know what, let me try to break these. That looks like it could be something. Like, I wouldn't imagine these are just here for coins. You know, that seems a little silly. Boom. Oh, a little off. Oh, there was a heart in there. I need to line up, like, just right. Wait, oh, no. <laughs> was not ready. Got it. Yeah, that's it. So that was just a heart, but that's fine. No hearts are good. So let's uh, get rid of you, and you, and you. Oh, ow, that hurt. Oh, oh, here we go, three more. I love this little bird guy. He's so much fun, and he's so cute. Like, that's a great combo to have. It would be really cool if there is a crazy cap around here. Um, so first off, let's get rid of this torch, and then I will grab that, and then become Yoon, because it's definitely worthwhile to be Yoon. Oh, wow, okay, so I can't climb up that. This dark, you know, black iron. And just our beaks aren't strong enough, unfortunately. We can try our best, but it might not get us much results. So I need to just go to the edge of this and Yep, just do that. And then recapture you. So so far so good. I don't once again I don't see anything that we can really miss around here. And, oh, that's not really what I wanted. <laughs> I wish we could fly. We don't actually use our wings at all for being a bird, that's quite interesting. You know, it's not the first bird that's like that, but um uh, Usually, you know, if they're not for wings or like for flippers or something, there's nothing down there, right? Doesn't look like it to me. Oh, boing. Should we get up here or will we just hit our noggins? Yeah, we'll just hit our noggins. That's unfortunate. Hmm. Oh, yeah, get that out of here. I don't wanna deal with it, do you? Ooh, what is, whoa, whoa, no, I wasn't close enough to the wall. Oh, darn. Uh, that's really tough. It's just really easy to get away from the wall. Maybe I should be getting up there first. You might be able to see. Clearly it's trying to you know, lead me this way as well. So maybe I'm uh, going a little bit off the uh, mark for now. Let's try over here. Oh, okay, we're doing pretty good. Yeah, what is gonna be over here? I'm sure something worthwhile. Um, Immediately I'm not seeing too much, just some couple coins, but down here we got some purple coins. Okay, oh, that is so tough. Especially since like, whoa. Oh. Like once you like extend the nose, you have to wait a second before you can re-extend it, so you just sort of have to hope you do it right. Hmm, and there's still more ways over here. Oh, there's not as much of a lip to this roof. So we could actually just hop up like that. Ooh, and there wasn't another moon medallion up here, so that was totally worth it. There's four out of five. Okay. And unfortunately, yep, all the torches came back. I feel like that is something I wanna try, but at the same time, is it really worth it? I mean, it might be but it would also be a huge waste of time if it doesn't actually end with anything. So, this is where I was out trying to go before. That's sort of rude that the bomb can fall down there. Okay, go across like that, go across like that. Nice, that was really good. So we need to angle ourselves up just right. Nice. Good, okay, that was really good. So we are really churning through. Let us get back up here, and then behind here we find ourselves a secret little moon. This is treasure inside the turret. The turret? What turret are we talking about here? All right, so it looks like I have to leave my little birdie friend here. Oh my, whoa, where are we going? Way over here, okay. 
Yeah, what do I have to do to get the moon here? I need to find all the medallions, of course. So where's the next one? Yeah, probably up there. What I should do is also check all these boxes because you never know, there might be, yeah, look at that one right there. Boom. Uh, boom. That is our final moon medallion. Cool, cool, cool. But there might be purple coins in these. Like, I really don't know what else there could be, but it's definitely probably worth searching. So let us uh, do that. Um, no. Let us do this. Okay, there's one. There is another. Good, good, good. And then grab that. Cool. Grab this. And then that one. And then lastly, these two. Obviously, it's not doing too much for us, but you know what? It's actually sort of fun, so I don't mind. There we go. Then what about up here? Now, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get up here normally. Like, as you can see, there doesn't seem to be an area except for the back of it. Ooh, hoo, hoo. what is gonna be up here then? I'm, I'm really curious. Might just be a moon, might be a purple, a couple purple coins, but no matter what, I'm happy to have them. Okay, so that definitely looks like everything over here, unless there's like, no, nope, there's not, okay. So let's go ahead and get this purple coin, and that's another event done. This area is so much fun so far. Real challenge, but smart bombing. Cool. The red ones look like they're like cherry, like it looks really tasty. Maybe I'm just hungry. I'm always hungry. Uh, ooh. We got, I don't know. I'm just like amazed by everything. The cloud colors are just so nice. Big brutal battle, ooh, now that is something that, ooh, about. look at those statues. Bowser straight modeling. Like if he, if he ever wants to stop being a tyrannical, I guess like a dictator, I mean, he is sort of just a bad guy all around. If ever he wants to give up that day, that kind of lifestyle, I mean, I think he should become a model. I think he would tear up the model scene. I mean, would he be plus size? I mean, I guess it depends on who he's modeling to. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let us get off that tangent and get some purple coins and an easy moon. Look at this bad boy over here. Just chilling out, I'll gladly grab you from the side above the castle gate. And that really looks to be everything for this uh, this courtyard, so I'm gonna go ahead and head out of here. Flying on over this way. Whoa, hey, look at that, I was right there, there's a cap kingdom. I'm not a, why do I always call it a cap kingdom? It is a cap store, a crazy cap. Oh, hey, there's humans here. That's sort of weird. Welcome. So let's go ahead and get our Bowser's Kingdom heart, um, moon. Thanks. Why are the humans here? Why can't I? You know, I want to meet Bowser. Shopping at Bowser's Castle. I mean, Bowser might be a bad guy to Mario and Peach and stuff, but beyond that, he seems like a pretty nice dad. Uh, samurai helmet. Ooh, look at all this! Okay, so definitely gonna get the samurai helmet. The samurai wore helmets that were functional and fancy. I got those little coins on the top of it. All right, you're welcome. So we'll go ahead and change that now. The samurai helmet is really gonna work on you. I'd say, so samurai armor, the samurai basically walked around wearing works of art. Is what you wanted? Yep. Thanks. Okay, so we'll equip that. We don't have enough to buy the rest of this stuff. Oh, look at this Bowser Kingdom sticker. Cool little, uh, I guess, like cards. I hope we see you again. I'm sure you will. Okay, so cool, look at us. So let's get out of here. So yeah, we're a samurai now. And then let us walk around this area. I'm sure there's more. Oh, oh, hello. Oh yeah, look at that, right on the other side. You wanna get a look-see on what's going on inside? You gotta be dressed for battle, friend. That armor, you look like a samurai. Well, step right in, right this way. Cool. Humans are working with Bowser though? Typical humans. <laughs> okay, well, um, and that's sort of the thing. You know, I've talked about it before, but if there's humans in the Mario world, there has to be zebras, right? Oh, look at this! Oh, that is so cool! Okay. Ooh, this is so cool! Wait, I wanna break these, um, just in case. Okay, this one has some stuff. And if there is a potential of being a zebra, then that means maybe there's a potential of me meeting Mario or Bowser. You know, they're both cool dudes. Okay, uh, let's wait for that. Or Luigi. I'd, I'd, I'd hang out with Walu or not Waluigi. <laughs> I would not hang out with Waluigi. I think he'd just steal my stuff. Uh, but if I would hang out with Luigi, this is so interesting, I love this. I'm going on the weirdest tangents today, then. Probably shouldn't have done that yet. Um, I probably could have picked up some of the notes with that. Okay, so do that, oh my. Get a couple of those. This is our first time doing like a little music note thing in the portrait mode, or the, whatever this is called. I call it a portrait, because it sort of looks like it, right? Yeah, taking notes in the folding screen. Cool. Is that it? Now there's gonna be another one. Cool. 
So what we gotta do here is we gotta land on you and push you. And then we gotta lower this enough so that it breaks the blocks. Ooh. Okay, that's actually really tough. That's actually really tough. Okay, there we go. Getting it a little bit lower. If we could get it inside of there. And, okay, that's, why am I having such a hard time with this? Maybe I should land on it? Oh, that's, that's also tough. There we go. Okay, that's enough for me to get in there. There we go, okay. Scene of crossing the poison swamp. Yeah, that is quite the scene. Cool. There's two more moons for us. It looks like that's all we can do in this area. Um, should we switch back to normal Mario then? You know what, yeah. Because I feel like if we're gonna be facing Bowser, we're gonna have some like cool final cutscenes. I wanna do them as basic Mario because I just think that looks cool. And hey, look at that. Some easy purple coins in here as well. 42. I need 45 in total to uh, get the next thing I want. Hmm. Oh, look at this. Okay, hold on. We got these little statue guys and we can become these ones because they don't have a hat on. <laughs> he does look like a Tanuki Mario, I love that. And what if we put you here? Yeah, okay, that worked. Cool, so there's one more on top of the little rock. And then what about over here? You can see there's a bit of a statue, or not a statue, what am I talking about? A bit of a, uh, like an indentation. Jizo all in a row. Can I just butt stomp this? I can't, but what if I did become another Jizo? Can I become these guys? I can't. Their hats are on there nice and tight. <laughs> this is so much fun. Now let's uh, stomp, stomp on over here. Yeah, look at that, whoa. And there's basically another row of G's out. All right, and yeah, okay. That's a pretty easy one. Oh, it's going over there. And got it. Underground G zone. Cool, so let me go back and switch to normal Mario now. I think that would be a little bit more interesting. Okay, let's uh, do that and get on into here. It's been one heck of an episode though, I'll tell you that much. We still haven't reached the first courtyard though, the last, yeah, the last courtyard basically. Let us get over it. And I figured that maybe we'll do like a showcase of every single costume once we have every single costume. I mean, maybe we want to like select it, hop out, and then go back in. I'm not sure. But at least, if, you know, show them all up. I think that would be fun. But okay, let us keep on going on because I think we found just about everything in this area. It's quite the expansive area, but at the same time not, because it's small. Uh, let us, uh, I mean, I, I won't call it expansive, but it's well used. Oh, this one's, is this one just a moon sitting here? It's not, okay. Then let me explore a little bit. Ooh, this place is crazy. What can I do with you? I'm sure there's something we can do with you. Wait, it is glowing. Maybe I could just stomp these areas out, I can. Then I'm sure around here there will be a moon again. Maybe. Not yet, but maybe soon. I love the little noise it makes, like dun da 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 dun dun What is this then? Maybe if I hang out with it, it'll give me things, not quite. There's surely something I can do with this guy. What is over there? I'm not sure. Maybe I need to be a portrait. Hmm, cool. Let's get back over there. I love all the flags too. This area is so wonderful. But there's surely something I can do with it. Maybe I can go on the other side. Maybe there's just something to you know, break like before. Because there's obviously more over here that wants me to go this way. But he's having a very cool wedding. Like if it wasn't for the fact that it's a like a forced arranged marriage. Oh, hey, yeah, you guys have nothing on me. Sorry, <laughs> you tried, you failed. Oh, look at this. I can't go through that one. Why not? Hmm, what activates a portrait? I'm not really sure. I was hoping there'd be more to do with this thing. Well, unfortunately, it doesn't seem to be the case. Unless breaking them all will get something done for me. Oh, hey, there's more health. Cool, up to six health. So I'll just get over here. Okay, I've done them all. I'm gonna keep as this guy. Or maybe not. It does take a while to get from point A to point B with this. So I'm just gonna leave him. I, I know where to find you then. So uh, don't call me, I'll call you, basically. Ooh, what is this? Oh, hey, that's how we get over here. Fancy, look at how far we're going. That is so crazy. Hmm, okay, these guys are a little scary though. Hmm, okay, don't hurt me, please. Thank you. And then I can destroy you, because I just think that's a good idea. You guys are monsters. 
And I don't know if one of them's gonna have a moon or maybe I get a moon for, probably, I'll probably get a moon and I'll land on that little pedestal. But can you destroy these blocks soon? Or not? Actually, yeah, I'm gonna see if I can't get you to destroy these. I mean, maybe that's not worthwhile. But I'll just try to get them to like destroy a couple. What? Okay, I just barely got out of there, jeez. Like, yeah, that's sort of the thing. Would I get something if I get him to destroy all these blocks? I feel like that would take way too much time. That'd be a bit of a tedious moon. But it's definitely possible. Yeah, just get rid of you, though. I'm not gonna worry about it. It'd be cool to become one of those guys. I mean, maybe I can. Like, maybe I'm missing something here. Maybe when they uh, slam down like this. No, it does not look like I become them. Okay, wait, I can't get up. I can't get up. Oh, boy. All right, well, now I'm up here. And... Oh, wait, no. Ha <laughs> ha, no. Wait, ha <laughs> ha. Gotcha. Oh, that's all of them beaten, and that didn't, okay. Just took a second. Gotta be a little more patient, Zebra. So let us get over there, and got it. That is exterminate the ogres. Really weird that they're ogres. I think they'd be a bit more green. So let us get out of here, and an adventure maybe the other side? Like, I'm sure the other building might have something of interest. It'd be weird if it did not. So that guy's just chilling out there. I find that interesting. Oh, well, I missed, okay. My platforming skills are not interesting because only good things are interesting, right? I guess bad things can be interesting, but my platforming skills are not interesting. All right. Oh, look at that! Okay, that was some pretty skillful platforming now. There's 45 out of 100. We're almost halfway there with finding all the purple coins. Before I go any further, get the checkpoint. Main courtyard entrance. So we can't just waltz on in, or can we? Oh no, I forgot the two last brutals. Hi. <laughs> the boss wasn't kidding when he said you two were persistent. But I owe it to the family. Tell all the brutals to come at you with everything I got. Okay, is it just you? I guess so. I figured that maybe, oh, you know, we probably have to take you out and then go on that platform and do the same thing to his little sister. I mean, I guess we are a family, you know? All right, boom. Well, I'm not too worried about you. I wonder how this happens. Is it determined that you know I face this guy here at the end, or could it have been any brutal and it just depends on the order I do it, or maybe just random happenstance? I am not playing well, by the way. There we go. Let's get rid of some of these, huh? I mean, am I supposed to be getting rid of them? Sure, why not? Um, whoa, that's a lot of hats, buddy. <laughs> Ouch. You would really like Team Fortress too. Okay, come on, come on. Oh gosh, what in the world is he doing? Okay, he's break dancing. He's a dancing bunny. Come on, come on, come on. There we go, that's what I'm looking for. Does he, oh, he takes three hits now, he just doesn't take uh, the tune. Okay, Um. oh, oh, okay, they're everywhere. Do I, I, I really don't know how this works. Do I have to get rid of all of them? Like maybe eventually, I know he'd come back, but I think that if I destroy them all, he'll just, or maybe I have to find the hat he's in, I'm not really sure how that works, either way. Oh gosh, oh gosh, move it, move it, move it. Ow, that, that was painful. Um, let me be careful. Come on, get out of here. Good, good, good. And then maybe I could do a bit of that. Oh, that did not work out at all. I'm taking all sorts of damage. I gotta get, destroy him. Don't run, don't run, you coward, you coward. Uh, got him. Jeez, I couldn't have gotten any closer. <laughs> You're done for. See ya. Okay, oh, whoa. Is that gonna be an extra moon for me? It's not. Can I get a refill anywhere? Um, because I would like a health refill. There is at least one extra health. I guess it's supposed to be a bit of a gauntlet, huh? I mean, what if I go back to the checkpoint? I bet that would give me some extra health, right? No, it doesn't. Interesting. Okay, so let's go ahead and do this one. Oh my. And they're flying back in. Now it's just her. Hi. You're gonna say anything? Yep. The wedding's almost the here. I was gonna say there. <laughs> the boss is getting ready to keep up ahead. In the keep up ahead. I can't read. But you two can scram, because you're definitely not invited. Okay, she's the last brutal we have to fight. Let's do it. Oh my, she, I feel like she's gonna be like one of the most difficult here. I mean, we only have two hits to deal with her. I mean, we went from six health to one with the other guy. I feel like I was a bit foolish with, oh yeah, I remember now. We gotta knock these back at her. That is tough to do. But now that I'm a little caught up, because we, we never faced her a second time, did we? I mean, I guess we faced all the Brutals a second time, and that's it, and now that we faced her. Okay, so I actually, oh, I gotta get over there. Don't land in the lava, thank you. Okay, so pick up these coins. I guess actually maybe it might be a bit foolish to try to get coins when I only have two health. I need to conserve it as much as I can. 
So I just need to dodge those, which shouldn't be too big of a deal. I probably could should have gone to those boxes over there. I probably could have gotten my third health. Okay, so, ow, oh, that was dumb of me. That was really dumb. Well, there goes my hit. I mean, I really didn't need to take it that way, but I did. Okay, so, that's not gonna do too much. So I could, you know, probably knock these over if it wasn't for the fact that she throws them so far, or I can wait for her to do the little swing attack like this. Oh, oh my. Ooh, whoa, the splash damage got me? Really, okay. I thought I was far enough away, but maybe not. Well, I get to try it again. Do I have to do both of them again? I do not, okay. Well, that's something. Let's try this again. <laughs> I'll skip it. Okie doke. Let's fly, face her and hopefully do it correctly this time. Whoa. If I get closer to you, you'll throw them not as far, right? That might be helpful. Oh yeah, that's basically the case. Boom! Oh, I didn't! Oh, that is the biggest bunch of malarkey I've ever seen. Okay, you know what? Do your slam. Yeah, how's it feel? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Land on your head? You're not quite dead? I mean, I don't wanna kill you. I just want you, I just want you to stop. I just want you to stop being mean to me. Okay, well, she's all over the place. I need to be careful because of the lava. But as long as I know just not to do anything silly, I should be fine. She's really barricading herself in the lava. It'll eventually disappear. Basically, it's just like, it's just better to dodge. So, I'm gonna try to dodge. All right, she's throwing that stuff everywhere. Come on, come on, whoa, okay, I forgot that. Oh, come on, I'm the worst of all time. It's not this difficult. It's just me being bad at the game. There we go, hit it. Just gotta do that one more time, and we're good. There we go. I could use some extra health. And like some extra health popped up with the other dude, but not for you. Oh, oh, I didn't know I could do that. Okay, that ends it the early. Oh, okay, um. Okay, and then just took, I threw my hat. What are you talking about? Okay, I have a better start now. I hit her basically right away without taking any damage, but now I know that if I hit this, that's gonna make things a bit quicker now. So what I need to do is get like really close to her and hopefully she'll lob them very close to her as well. Like that, and then, wait, oh, I couldn't, oh man, you just don't get the chance to hit those. Yeah, I don't think you can really possibly do that. I mean, I'm gonna try one more time. And then, oh yes, that's what I wanted. Cause then I like, I don't even have to, what are you doing, where are you going? Calm down, there you go. See, then I don't even actually have to deal with her doing all of the things she does. So she's gonna pop one somewhere. She's gonna move really quickly this time, though, it's a problem. There we go, got her, though. Just need her to throw one more bomb that I can actually hit back. So I was waiting out some things. I actually didn't need to wait out. So technically, I made it more difficult for myself than I had to be. Um, oh, I'm trying to hit that back to her. And it ain't working out too well. No, that's, they just, hmm. Okay, well, that's fine, because as long as she does this, um, and then I can get over there. Nice, ow, that hit, that hit me? You stinker, you're going down. You're going down, lady. Or not. She runs around pretty quickly. I mean, I guess she is larger than Mario. She has longer legs, so she can get away pretty quickly. But you're down for the count this time. Awesome. <laughs> and another statue gotten. Cool. And that is probably the last red moon until we go to Bowser's kingdom. Okay, another event cleared. Big brutal battle. Okay, that's what I said. I thought I said bio brutal. I'm like, bio brutal? Did I miss something there? They aren't like mutants now. <laughs> oh my. So the bridge opens, or the, the bridge extends, and the door opens to show showdown at Bowser's Castle. Oh my. Intense. Might exactly be what's going on here. We are in the final castle. You better be watching the previous episode. We finally reached the main courtyard. I hope you've been watching the previous episodes. It's been a day or two since I last recorded, but before we go in there, should I adventure around or should we worry about that later? I think we should adventure around a little bit. I mean, I'm just worried that a cutscene's about to trigger, so I'm just gonna be a bit careful here if I can. And as I'm, because I'm worried that we're about to start the final boss battle as soon as I go through there. So I just wanna grab whatever I can that might be easier just like that. Um, I don't see that on the other side though, so maybe we'll actually have the chance to explore here. I mean, I fully won on beating Bowser's booty butt today. That is quite the fun tongue twister. Yeah, okay, we got a little bit more. The main courtyard. Cool. So, I think the best way to explore around here would be to get one of these adorable birds that we found in the last episode. Like I said, if you didn't check out the previous episode, contextually, this one's not gonna make too much sense for you. You don't know what we've been doing in this awesome area. I hear a moon shimmering. Maybe it's in that little moon rock. 
but I still don't understand too much. Oh, here's a couple more purple coins, cool. Um, Already halfway there now, cool. But this area has been one of my favorites in terms of gameplay, in terms of like what you can find around here. Oh wow, there's spikes here. I guess that's sort of a sign that you can't go too much farther. But is it really? Because it clearly looks like I can climb this building if I can make it over there. How am I doing that? Hold on, oh no, oh come on. There's a little bit of a weird depth perception there, but I think we could do that. If I could get all the way over there, we have almost 2,000 coins. This is the most coins I've ever had for sure. Would that be worthwhile? Is there anything really over there? You know what we should probably do to find out is we should uh, probably go see the telescope there. But before we do that, we can clearly do something here. So we might as well get that done. Oh, oh. Oh, hey, if I do a little spin, I get like in a little extra bit. Let me, can I, uh... wow, okay, that's cool. That could actually lead to some good possibilities. Can I get up here with this? I can, so I might just wanna take that opportunity. I mean, there is a bit of a thingamajig here. Oh gosh, yeah, let me go. A little railing, and I think that maybe the electrocution thing takes me that way. So I don't really need to worry about traveling that section, but I can uh, get up here. I mean, I could have gotten up here with Mario, as the thing, but I figured that there might be worth something worthwhile that the bird can do around here. So like obviously, maybe that's just what I do to get my way back. But once again, another one of these. Could I make that jump? No, no, I can't. <laughs> I tried, I sort of freaked out and realized how far of a distance it really is. Okay, so we'll just go up one more time, hit that electric thing, see what it does, make sure that all it does is um, bring Mario back over here. I, it gives me a chance to you know warm up a little bit because I haven't. Um, I can get up here, right? I mean, maybe not like this, but I, I can from over there. So let me give that a shot. All right, the music here is so gosh darn cool. I love it. All right. There we go, get over here. But I'm glad we're getting a lot of purple coins. I mean, we already got the samurai out for, for this area, so I don't think we'll have too many more um, costume contextual moons to get, but you never know. Uh, let's go ahead and do that. Yeah, this just brings us back for whatever reason. Or not. Oh, oh, okay, I was wrong! Look at that! That is a cool moon that is found behind the bars. I thought I heard the shimmering of a moon around here. So let me, um, if I can, um, I'm pressing the wrong button. Oh, I'm so dead. Wait, maybe I'm not. Oh, darn it, I tried, I tried. But yeah, I definitely wasn't getting over there. <laughs> I had to give it my best shot, right? Okay, we lost a lot of coins, but I need to do one more thing. Obviously, you might have seen that there were some purple coins there. I'm getting a little turned around. I'm just gonna make sure I get those if I can. I mean, I guess the best way would be to try to find a way up here. I think that's easy enough. I think all I need to do is I need to... Um, no, that's not what I wanted. Maybe I could throw my hat and then long jump. Yep, just like that, get up here. And then up here, there were some purple coins. So we'll do that and then we'll start formally exploring the rest of the area. I know I've been spending a lot on this little rooftop, but Hey, that's the, the you know the idea with this game, right? I mean, we'll be doing more exploring if we defeat Bowser in today's episode, because a lot of you have told me that the game opens a lot, up a lot more and you get to do a lot more once you beat Bowser. So, if we can beat Bowser, that is. Let's let's keep our fourth wall intact, huh? Um, yeah, let's do this. So, whoa, we're way up here. So I still don't know what's going on with this wall and the wall adjacent, not adjacent, um, but parallel to it. But there is some other stuff going on. We gotta make our way all up this platforming. I don't see too many hidden things, but I'm sure there are plenty of hidden things throughout. We got another uh, ogre over here. I see some question blocks at the least. We got some purple coins up there. Three more, another three up there. Another three, four over there. So that's right there, that's like what? 10 more purple coins, getting us up to like 60 something. I and mean, I think we just keep going up to the top when probably something important happens. So before we do any of that, let's explore around here. Oh my, can I become these cute little fishies? Ooh, look at this, it's so beautiful down here. I love these, what are these, koi? A sunken treasure in the moat. Yeah, I think they're koi fish, that is very, very cool. I like it a lot. Oh, and some purple coins I might have actually totally missed. Okay, so that gets us up to uh, 57. So now I'm not in the, oh yeah, yeah, okay. So if I get to 10 coins I was talking about, I would end up getting 16 total. So I wasn't wrong. My math wasn't off. For a second I thought it was for some reason. I just beat up rocks, because you know why not. 
these rocks are so tough in this game. I don't understand. You know what? Goodbye, rock. Hey, go film in a go film a movie and then wrestle somewhere, Mr. Rock. And that joke was not very well sold. <laughs> okay, we're going down here. Um. There's nothing down here. Okay, so I think this is this area we would go to to find, oh yeah, there's a moon on the other side. But uh, we already did that moon on the other side. The fish are so cool though. Like I gotta say, Bowser's got some great taste. So I didn't need to become the bird here. So I guess the, the, the challenge here is platforming. I mean, I wonder if we could do the little spin jump to get over there. But uh, I'm not gonna worry about it too much. Big jump! He does jump, he has like a little bit of a good jump here. Boom, nice. Okay, so we're gonna get up here, we can get rid of these punks as well. Nice, we can just hit all three of them at once. So let me get up here then. Looks like there's just more than one way to do that. Okay, hold on. Uh, I can't really do too much with it though. But once we're up here, it seems as though uh, we could, could have just gotten another bird, which I'm gonna need. Oh no, 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 I'm fine, I'm still a bird. So I can't break these. Ah, okay, hold on. Oh, let's angle up and shoot. Oh, angle up a little bit better this time and shoot. Okay, we got an extra heart, which is good, it's something. Boom. Oh, we got more, we got more, don't we? Okay, oh, they shoot out pretty quick too. Oh gosh. No, oh gosh, I feel like I almost fell there. Ooh, here we go. Uh, lower myself a little bit. There we go, perfect, perfect. So, whoa, I sprung the wrong way, no! Oh, that is so weird. Still gotta get used to that again. Ah, Mario. One more time, I just gotta get one more purple coin there. I definitely wanna get all the purple coins I can, because they're sort of a pain in the butt to get, but I'll be right back. Oh, oh, where's a pipe? Oh, look at this, okay. No, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Mario, help me out here. <laughs> okay, one way or another, I guess you helped me out. There was a moon there, I gotta go get that. Okay, there we go, that was much better. Oh gosh, oh gosh, that's so weird. But I did it, I did it. Okay, so we can go ahead and pick up that moon. That is hidden corridor under the floor. Bit of a rhyme too, cool. Do I leave my little bird pal? I do, but there's one right here, so it ain't that big of a deal. So, wait, oh gosh, no wait, yeah, become me. I become you, you become me, we become best friends. I don't think I missed too much more than that. I also realized I can wiggle my controller and that also does that extra jump. That is a bit easier, but I don't see how they couldn't map that to a button, you know? It's one of those kind of silly things. There we go, oh wait, oh gosh, it's so weird. There we go. Got it. it. Just takes a little bit of getting used to. Maybe I should have taken this checkpoint first, but then we wouldn't have found that moon. So you know what? It was a win-win. It's a purple coin and a moon. Okay, so I need you to definitely slam this because it's sparkly. You know what that means. Hey, yep, hit there. Nice, and where is that gonna go? Somewhere safer, sort of. <laughs> okay, so maybe we should get rid of this dude now. He's, you know, being a bit of a jerk. He's slamming around, he's jamming around. All right, you're gonna hit me? No, you're not. Okay, so let's get up here and then Wait, butt slam? Oh, I missed, are you kidding me? Can't believe I missed that. Uh, what if you tried poking the yellowish mark on his forehead? Oh, oh, I wanna try that. Wait, become the bird. Interesting, I never thought about doing that. I mean, I noticed the yellow, yellowish mark on his forehead, but I just figured, you know, it was just sort of a sign that he could just be cracked, you know? Uh, whoa, okay, I mean, it's sort of the same difference, but worth doing. Let's get some extra coins out of it. So, you get this one inside a block in the castle. We're getting a lot of moons here, almost 20 now. Okay, so I don't see too much around here, but of course we wanna be able to check for some purple coins and the like. Definitely actually seems like there's something over here. Oh, hey, look at that! Captain Toad, how you doing, buddy? I was talking along these rooftops for so long, I got lost, oh, walking. But I found this power moon, so it's not all that bad. Cool, cool, cool. Good to see you, Captain Toad, 20 power moons. Good stuff, so let's go ahead and become you again. And I don't see too much else hanging out around here, so glad we found that. Wasn't too much of a challenge, to be honest, but hey, they all, they, they, all, they can't all be. So we, we haven't found Captain Toad everywhere yet. He's still missing in a couple spots, but uh, for now, he's not here anymore. Well, I mean, he is here, but we found his location here. So now we get to go up this, this does not look fun. I don't know why, but this reminds me of Little Big Planet. I mean, this whole area sort of reminds me of the Chinese area from Little Big Planet, but, uh, this part specifically, this sort of this treacherous wall with a whole bunch of weird little platform stuff is a bit scary and reminiscent of Little Big Planet, you know? Okay, there we go. So let's get across to here. I guess they do give you little rest areas if you want them or need them. So I could go across like that, but I guess I could have also um, just 
plop down from upwards. So we should, yep, we have three more over here. So go ahead and grab those. Look at me making this work, awesome. Whoop, I'm getting used to it. It's still really tough, but I am definitely getting used to it. So let's go ahead and jab that. Um, we gotta climb a bit farther, I've noticed. I wanted that, well, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to sort of hit that little spot there. It looked like it could be something. Um, but his little buddy's coming back, so we should be fine. Oh, here we go, here we go. There's a little mark on the floor, on the wall. So another one of these. I don't know if this is gonna be a moon. Probably with how out of the way it is. We'll find out. Jab! Oh, just coins, okay. Well, it was worth doing. What happens if I do it again? Do I get extra coins? Uh, nothing, okay. <laughs> Had to try, I'm sure I've missed plenty of those. So I wanted to try to get as good of a look as I can. There are purple coins there, and, and that's all I can see from here, so I'm gonna assume that's all there is. I probably shouldn't do it any kind of assuming, but let's try to get across to here, up to here. Wait, what? Let go, you little bird. What was that about? Ugh, okay. Back to 2,001 coins. Okay, let's get across to there. Beat you up. I'm sorry, bird, you're so adorable, but I need your powers. All right, so let me not move from this platform, but like unleash myself off of it. So there are some platforms, not platforms, but like I guess walls, that aren't moving here. The problem is where do I wanna be at this point? Like I could get across to here. Is that worthwhile? Is there something over here I'm missing? Oh, um, no, there's no, okay. This doesn't look like it to me. What is going on up here? There's clearly something. Whoa, okay, there's a bunch of flags. This is setting off a red flag for me, I can tell you that much. Um, whoa, ho, ho. look at it up here. There's plenty of stuff to adventure. All these like spiked areas. I mean, I, it's clearly supposed to be like a no birds allowed kind of thing. There's not too much going on over here though. Um, okay. Maybe the other side will be more fruitful. Or maybe this is all just, you know, me avoiding the real situation. Maybe we can explore this later. Maybe we should just travel forward. Oh my gosh, is that ominous or what? Beneath the keep. Hello, anybody home? Oh wait, hey, I see a little uh, cat peach. It would give me health if it wasn't for the fact that I had max health, cool. Well, for right now, if I could increase my max, my health count to 30, that'd be good. Or not 30, what am I talking about? Six, how'd I get six and 30 mixed up? I don't even know. Um, no, how do you do that? No, not like that. What? Is this not? No, this is definitely one you can poke into. Oh, no? There we go. So that was coins. But what about this one? That's clearly something though. There we go. Hey, that one was the moon. And that is poking your nose by the great gate. Cool, sorry, see ya. <laughs> Get those. I don't see anything else around here, but I'm glad I got that moon. Let us go up these big ominous steps and electrocute ourselves somewhere else. How electrifying. Oh, hey, here he is, Bowser, buddy, how you doing? Um, do you mind if I join? Uh, ooh. So are we interrupting the wedding right now? Has it really happened yet? This doesn't feel like a wedding. Oh no. Huh? Oh, here it is, the cake and everything. Oh boy, this isn't good. You're too late. <laughs> We're off to our wedding ceremony on the moon. On the moon? <laughs> wow, okay, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe we aren't facing that. Come on, hop on, hop on. Yeah, you did it. Oh. You might need a trip to the dentist after a face punch like that one. They're really going to the moon, what do you know? Whoa, 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 did they crash into it? Um, whoa! What is this? It's a transformer. Hey, hi. <laughs> okay, so I guess we're gonna keep ourselves a little bit busy with whatever in the world this thing is. It's the brutal bot, that's what I'm gonna call it. Hey, fireworks, cool. Wow, this thing's huge. All right, let's take on the Brutal Bond. Um, how am I doing this? Well, I could, that does, oh, okay, that was a mistake. Oh, I gotta be the little birdie bird, of course, of course. Obvious, obvious answer. Oh, wait, okay, watch out, gotta be careful. There we go, ooh, I'm taking out your leg, that'll teach you. So if we hit this, we should get some health back. Okay, ready? Oh, and then, 
Try to be a bit better with my aiming. Ooh, I already got past the first layer. Ooh, under all that stone is just some woodwork. That seems a little silly. Oh, you know what? I'm supposed to use you to get up. Let's not be silly here. Um, oh, no wait. Oh gosh, please don't get up. Please don't get up. I know I only have a limited amount of time here, I'm sure. So let's do that and there we go. We got you. Whoa, all right. Cool. Where's my bird friend? I need another one of those. Okay, come on, come on. We can do this. Whoa. I somehow made metal come back. They got golden toes too. Cool. <laughs> okay, so we need to dodge him as much as we can. Or them? Dodge them, I guess. Um, there you are. I need you. But we gotta get out of here quickly, quickly. <laughs> whittle waddle away. Oh no. It'll be okay as long as we whittle waddle away. So I'm guessing the way we knock this thing over will determine who we actually hit. Um, like if we knock this left leg over again, it might not really be what we want. Um, come on now. Throw another one my way. Yep, that's good. You're falling. Okay, there is another one on top of there, but the problem is that we never took out this leg. Or maybe, you know, that's just how it's supposed to be by design. Boom, there we go. Just like that, cool. I wonder if I could have just pecked it and kept beating a bird, I'm not really sure. But I think things are working out how they are. So we've already, two brutals down, rainbow legs, okay. How did they get star powers into the legs only? I don't know, maybe each leg got its own star. I have no idea what I'm talking about. <laughs> okay, this thing is ridiculous, but I love it. Okay, we're moving, we're grooving. Oh gosh, come on, come on. Don't do it. Ooh, you almost got me there, but you slowed down. Your star power ran out. Okay, what are those? Um, can I hit them away? I can. Oh my, am I supposed to hit these things into your legs? No, that didn't do much at all. I love them, they're like little firework things. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Come on, one more. Shoot me that bird. Thank you. And then I'm gonna try to move to a spot where I can do that and miss. No, I got it, just barely. Oh my, more of these, really? Can I just, yes I can. Okay, it doesn't do any damage, but at least gets out of my way, because it definitely will do damage to me. Um, just shoot some more bombs, will you? All right, boom, boom, nice. Okay, I'm getting that leg. Oh, you falling? You are, okay, it's a little bit different this time. He's taking a knee. Oh wait, hold on. <laughs> it is definitely still difficult. Oh, this little platform's now. Oh, she's freaking out, she's like, I don't know what to do. Peck, 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 peck. Come on, yeah, okay, so you can still do it as a bird. We can do this, I hope so. Oh, we can just climb back up it now. No, no we can't, okay. Maybe if we were quick enough, we could. Cut this boss fight a little short, huh? Ow, that hurt. There should be a rock somewhere. Yes, there's one over here. Come on, move it, move it, move it. Whittle waddle away, ah, oh, he's quick. He's quicker than ever before. Got it, got it. So we're taking care of the last brutal here that's in the ship. Got it, and down you go once more. Whoa, face planted. Okay, whoa, okay, I didn't do that quite well enough. I need to get up here. Oh. There you go. Oh, there we go, we got it! Ha! <laughs> so all the Brutals defeated once more. You darn, I don't even know what to call it. Leg block. Block with legs is out of here. To make one last grand firework. Hey, we might meet them on the moon with how, they, how far they flew up. Ha <laughs> that's cool! I hope that doesn't mean that we actually killed them though. <laughs> we got a multi-moon though. Very, very cool. But this means that our journey's not done. We're not yet facing Bowser because we're not on the moon. This guy needs the flashiest wedding of all time and where else and not even on this planet. Okay, the journey continues with a multi-moon showdown at Bowser's castle. Okay then, what a surprise. I really wasn't expecting that to be how it was. Um, I thought that you know this would be the final battle. Yeah. Okay, we were one step away and Bowser flew off to the moon. But we can chase after him in the Odyssey. Just throw me on that globe, you really think so? You really think we can make it to the to the moon on this thing? It doesn't seem space ready, but we got over 20 moons now to add to our total of 266, making it... Oh, 200 and... 90, wow, almost 300 then. Oh, it's so glowy too. So what does this mean? I guess it's a, full, the cell is fully completed. The Odyssey is complete. Cool, it's a balloon now instead of a sound. 
So now we, wow, we can just go up to the moon. Holy cow, this is gonna be so much fun, won't it? Also, what is with that mushroom on the planet there? And Bowser's not getting away. We'll chase him all the way to the moon kingdom. Come on, let's save those two. Oh, the moon kingdom, he has a castle on the moon? Man, that is insane. Well, we're about to go check it out. Oh, this is awesome. Look at the view, Mario. I mean, I, I think you should get inside before the atmosphere gets too thin and you just sort of faint and fall. But hey, look at us! We are, I don't know, we're dapper. We're ready for the wedding. All dressed up in white. Very cool. Ooh, we're just going up and up. Nowhere but up. But now he's in the wedding outfit. Does this mean he's going to attempt marrying Peach? Or maybe it's just to be formal. You know, it is Peach's wedding too if he fails, so he doesn't want to not dress for the occasion. Um, wow, look at that. We're just, we're going to the moon. Oddly enough, not the first time Mario has gone to the moon. Super Mario Land 2. Pretty cool game. Moon Kingdom, Honey Loon Ridge. So it doesn't seem to be as much of an open world game. It seems to be like a straight shot too. Well, not straight shot. You got like a little left, a little right. Bowser's Moon Wedding. Oh, it's like a church almost. Like a maybe a cathedral, I don't know. Well, don't you look dapper. That's what I said. He always takes a word out of my mouth. Those two must be over there. No time dilly-dally. No, no time to dilly-dally, let's go. Okay, so we could, I mean, no time to dilly-dally, but we can breathe on the moon. Okay, Mario, see this is, okay, somebody did argue with me that maybe Mario is still a human. Definitely possible, but a human can't breathe on the moon, unless, you know, you guys are telling me something I don't know. Oh, oh, ooh. So we got low gravity going on here, this is so cool. Okay, yeah, I see how this works. This is actually really challenging, um, because it's just so, Wibbly wobbly. I don't know what the best camera angle is, but I think I'm trying to find it. Um, wait. Oh, okay. No, I fell back down to the bottom. Not what I wanted. Um, oh, but they're actually like yellowish, but not the same yellowish we're used to. Oh, that is weird. Come on, how do I get this? Um, like that. Okay, I cannot do this for the life of me. You know, it might be easier just to get on the Odyssey. If I can climb the sail of the Odyssey. Gosh, that is so weird. One more time, one more time. Ooh, ooh, yes. Ooh, ooh, yes, okay, and get it. Hooray, our first moon on the moon, shining above the moon. We're getting moons on the moon, guys, this is just weird. So can I climb this? Oh, I can knock it around, but I can't quite climb it. Well, if I could find a way, ooh, over here. Oh, well that didn't quite work. Goodbye. Oh gosh, that is creepy. Will we find aliens on the moon? That'd be fun, that'd be interesting. I mean, we've been on space before. I mean, really, we've played the entirety of Super Mario Galaxy on this channel. Do you feel light on your feet? Yes, we do. Um, and of course, we were able to walk on the moon. I mean, I mean, I don't know if we ever ever went to the moon in Mario Galaxy. I mean, maybe we went to a moon, but I don't think the moon, you know? But we were able to breathe in space. But now that there's, oh, oh, there's star bits. What was I just talking about? Super Mario Galaxy, we got some star bits. That is so cool. Don't know what this is about. You know, what if I, didn't do too much, okay. Then what about these rocks, huh? These low gravity rocks, huh? Either these have anything that doesn't look like it. Ooh, they fall quite the distance. There's more star bit, ro or star bit coins over there. And so that means that there's going to be a Cappy store. Look at that guy. It's like a space octopus. A space octopus? No, uh, octospace? I don't know. <laughs> oh, there's some. Let's kick this stuff around. Because if this stuff gets taken out in one hit, that's much easier. So let me try to, I was gonna say triple jump. Might not even need it. Nope, I don't, hold on. Got it, got it. Six out of 50, so it's definitely not the most expansive area. Um, Let me, uh, once again, it looks like you know you can do that, but it doesn't really do anything. These craters in the moon are so cool though. Oh, it's another one of these moon rocks, but it's all b busted up. Weird. Um. Oh, hey, look at you. Okay, so let's get those, then talk to Yoon. Oh, mine. Okay, so wouldn't it be smarter to not do it this way? Of of course. Okay, it might be easier to get up top there just because it'd be a bit safer if I'm using my noggin. Um, but it might take up more time, so we'll try it. Oh, I get 
way back here though, that's stinky. I mean, the problem is I might not be able to get up very easily, so let me just long jump, because that really is what it seems like it's trying to tell me to do. It's like, hey, long jump, because you can long jump super far, and the jumps aren't that hard. All right, Moon Kingdom Timer Challenge 1. Very cool, I'm sure there'll be more than one, which will be great. I'm glad I didn't die there either. Oh, look at that, there's a portrait over there. I didn't see the pipe for, oh, it's right there. Oh, should I explore that? Yeah, you know what, let's do that. Um, Let me get way back over there. <laughs> okay, oh gosh, don't land in the wrong way, but look at this area. Once again, more of these moon rocks. Here, they are very commonplace here, what do you know? Moon rocks on the moon. I was not expecting to actually go to the moon. I mean, no matter how many times I've said the word moon, it actually never sort of came across my brain. Weird. Um, I think I've even accidentally said moon kingdom a couple times. <laughs> I'm not the smartest zebra, but I am indeed a zebra along the cliff face. Okay, so let us uh charge over there. Oh, we did it. And we got some more uh, bits for it. But I imagine that there's probably more. Usually they don't just leave one moon um, like what happens if we fall? Is this like to our doom? Yes, it is, okay. <laughs> I had the check, but it does look like there might be something there. I might wanna try it one more time. Because it looked like there was like a gap in the spacing with that. That could definitely allure to the idea that there's more to that meets the eye. Oh gosh, can we save ourselves? Yes, I can, look at me, platforming king. I don't know, like how this looks, it's definitely odd. But I'm more focusing, I guess the whole area is like that. Hmm, then I'm not really sure. Maybe we could just skedaddle. Maybe I'll be able to find something later. Once again, we are sure to re-explore basically the entire game after we're done the main game. It's just a matter of if I have to re-explore it anyways after I beat the game, I might as well beat the main game, you know? Okay, let me get back to somewhere more interesting. Okay, so we're back over here. I don't see too much going on just yet, but I can get across like that. Good, good, good. Oh wow, so there's Yoon. And are you just, are you a boss fight? Are you just a normal enemy? Seems as though you're just a normal enemy. I can get a couple of those. I mean, really, yet you've yet to attack me. Okay, there you go. Boom, ooh, that must have hurt. And you give us a bunch of coins. Oh, look at that's a little rabbit. Oh, you're gonna be a pain in the tuchus to get, aren't you? Here, let us get over to here, and then, oh yeah, you are gonna be nothing but difficult. Why didn't, why didn't this happen on any of the galaxy levels? Everything was always normally gravitized. You know? I mean, I guess, you know, this moon has a different atmosphere than the moons we adventured in Galaxy then. Well, not atmosphere, but gravity. I don't know why I think that has to do with atmosphere. There we go, we got you! Just barely, but we did get you. So there's another moon for us. That's our third one called Hopping on the Moon. Actually, it's our fourth. Hmm. Okay, let's kick these two. I'm sure, they won't have too much for us, but you never know. I mean, that one's holding on. This is the first one that's taking more than one hit to actually destroy, so that actually, Leads me to believe that it might be a little bit more. Oh gosh, don't fall. Oh, okay, just more coins. Okay. <laughs> Usually it does glow, so I should, you know, probably take that into consideration. We can get way up here though. Oh, that is so awesome. Ooh, and there's a sign. What is this sign? Travel tip, dive. Ever jump and realize you need just a little more distance? Try this. While in the air, press the O and then Y to do a dive and fly a little farther. Don't worry, I already know all about it. But apparently learning those signs, that actually counts towards completion. I know there was like a little menu that showed all that off, so I'm glad to have that found. Well, wow, looking up at our own planet just takes my breath away. Whoa, I didn't even realize that. That is so cool. Oh my gosh, I love this game more than I can ever explain. So let us, uh... okay, well, well, we'll skip it, we'll skip it. It's really hard to do hat jumps, I guess. Um, We can hit this, once again, see what it does. Oh! Oh, no. okay, here we go, we found one, finally. Hit it, and then, I don't wanna hit it too much is the problem. But you know, if we hit it off a wall like that and then hit it somewhere where there's a lot of land, that would be good. Okay, it's flying over there now. <laughs> it's taking quite the beating, but not enough. Oh gosh, come back, come back. Up oh, there it goes, finally, geez. That was a tough rock, but within it, we got a rolling rock on the moon. Moon. <laughs> rolling rock on the moon, moon. So we got a couple purple coins over here on top of these creepy pillars. I should be able to just get across like that. Maybe I need a little bit more oomph. Maybe I should try that dive move they told me about. Ooh. Ooh, we could get across it there. Let me first. Oh, wait, there we go, I almost did the wrong thing. 
I wanna go ahead and get this checkpoint for some obvious reasons. There's just so much more left to explore, I love it. Uh, let us get across to here. Long jump, and then, yes, there we go. That's what I wanted to see, more action like that. I don't think I was supposed to do it that way. I think I was supposed to use the speed up. Yeah, I totally was. Look at me, finding alternative ways and some more purple star bits, okay. There we go. So I can go ahead and do it this way, just to show that this is the intended way. Cool, and I could do that to make that jump over there. We'll do that in a moment. So can I still do a triple jump? Yes, I can. So it looks like there's actually two ways to get across. I could do this super jump, and that'll probably actually land me up there maybe, I don't know. But I could also just roll down here and do that. That'd be fun. Um, what's going on around here? Oh, there's you. Um, I could throw this at you. Ha, catch. Will that land on you? No, I'm not that good of a throw. Didn't we see some rocks like this back on on the planet? Yes, we did. I still don't know much about them. Ready? Gotcha. Cool. This is so weird. Like, it's such a barren area. Oh, look, Bowser. Oh, no, those aren't Bowser's steps. Those are all little mini craters. Okay, I thought it was like, Bowser's been walking around here as well. But it's interesting how barren of an area this is, but how beautiful it is still. Usually that, you know, barren leads to boring. But not here, oh my, look at that. Oh gosh, oh, hold on, hold on. Oh, oh we got it, nice, first try and everything. So let's go ahead and get that. Ready? Long jump right on into it. Taking notes on the moon's surface. You got a moon, cool. So let's get back over there and try not to fall off because I just wanted to peek on the other side. Okay, nothing much, nothing much, had to check though. Wait, yeah, once again, these craters add like, on the corner of my eye, they sort of look like Bowser's feet. I'm trying to look, is that an alcove or just a dip? I think it's just a dip in the rock. Okay. Because if I can get into like a little cave, that'd be cool. And what about this rock? Probably nothing. Oh, maybe not? I mean, I think it's just gonna be extra coins. Usually it'll get shiny by now. So I don't know what to do with that weird rock still. Nothing different. I wonder, could I? Oh, this might've been a mistake, or not. There we go, I made it, no problem. Then what would be the perk of doing it that way? I don't really see any. I mean, maybe if we would have done it that way, we would find out. But uh, first, before we do anything else, um, let me try to get over to this guy if I can. Oh, boom, gotcha. Oh wow, we don't even, okay, we do need it, but <laughs> we almost didn't. Cool, we are more than halfway of getting all the purple coins, though, which is really exciting. If I could do that in today's episode, that'd be fun. And there is a little bit of a shininess in this crater over here. Boom. Okay, it was just some hearts. Oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> there we go. So, let us uh, get over this way and just keep looking. Oh, hey, look, it's our buddy. Let us uh, go talk to him for sure. What is he doing on the moon? I don't know, whatever he wants, he's a sphinx. Uh, hi. Greetings, traveler, enter your hat as well. Can you answer my riddle? Should you really be answering questions right now? No. Oh, yes, oh, bearer of correct answers. There are so many other things you could be doing with your time. Do what you must, I am done. What does that mean, are you gonna move? Wait, what? Wait, what? Did I do it wrong? Should I call him stingy? <laughs> I probably should have called him stingy. Um. Do you, did I just mess that up? I don't know. Maybe it's it's trying to tell me that I gotta come back after we beat Bowser, because you know that's more important with our time right now. Because the wedding could be happening right now. <laughs> I'm out here just having some fun times. Watch out the hole back. Wait, wait. The hole back there is real deep. All right. Well, let's go find out for ourselves. Oh, whoa. Ah! That is creepy, so we might actually have a lot more traveling. Oh, of course. There has to be a molten core. Bowser wouldn't have liked it if there wasn't a molten core. The underground moon cavern. So I'm gonna guess that's gonna bring us back up to the top, but it's good to know we have that option. Weird, the gravity feels normal in here. And that's for sure. And, um, well, let's get going. Let's see what we can find. Um, I'm definitely trying to keep my eyes out for any kind of secret. I did see some purple coins, yep, way in the distance. How maybe could I change the um gravity back to you know, fun. <laughs> I mean, this gravity's fun too. I like all the wedding hats. Ow, get out of here. 
Can I become you guys then? I can, look at me! Oh hey, we am flying around! This is so much fun, I've always wanted to play some dry bones, but I can't fly any higher. Like I'm trying to and it won't let me, so the flying area is sort of restrained. Gotta be careful here too, because I don't really have much of a means of attacking. So I'm just trying to dodge around. Oh gosh, wrong button, wrong button. Dang it, that was weird. Oh wait, oh what's on Bowser's head over here? Looks like it might have been a good thing that I got taken out. How can I get that? Um, okay, now that I've taken care of the fire, it should be quite easy if I wasn't bad at the game. Just backflip and then throw it. Oh, whoa, where are we? We're just inching it this way? <laughs> hey, look at that, easy moon. Does that one have one? It does not. Cool though, it made it look like Bowser had a little hat on. Okay, so get that under the Bowser statue. Cool. I don't see anything else going on here, so I'll go ahead and try to reclaim one of these dry bones. Maybe I should immediately go backwards. Like, I wanted to explore the area more. It can be a little bit difficult to fly and change the camera, but I'm working on it. Okay, so I don't see too much over, wait. This looks like it could be a little cave area. No, it's not. Okay, why do I keep pressing that button? I honestly am not trying to, I promise. Um, get you. Let's, uh, okay, I can press the A button, which might be easier than pressing the B button for me for whatever reason. And just, you know, playing games with hooves can be a bit of a challenge at times. So if I fix the camera a little bit, uh, it's just really hard to fix the camera while moving around like this. Oh, and we have tanks as well. I just need to find a way to get up there. Or maybe I don't even need to. I can become a tank, and then I can take care of the other tanks, because they're gonna be a pain in the butt, surely. So let's get rid of you. Uh, did I get rid of you? I don't think I did, because the lava's in the way. Get out of here, you stinky lava. There we go. And then turn around and shoot them. There we go, and then this last one. Uh, got it. Now, I don't see any others around here, but it's, of course, worth looking, worth checking, worth ensuring. And this, you know, like, we could walk on these little side platforms. That is something that would give us any benefits, so I'm not going to. Oh, wait, get that out of here. I see this tank shooting at me from far away. Okay, we gotta move, we gotta move, we gotta move. Oh, look at this, we're gonna get some extra health for being a tank. There we go, we got rid of him. Get rid of you too. These guys always come back though, it's a big pain in the booty. So you get get out of here. Hmm, okay, good. We got ourselves up to six health. We're not gonna lose any right now either. Okay, so if I wanna get across to here, I wanna become a dry bones, but then I'm gonna have to be a tank again. Hmm, whoa, 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 I forgot we had to fly. We actually have to fly the thing. Maybe then I want to destroy you two. Or not, thanks. Get out of my way, you're such a jerk. Just angle myself up so that I can destroy it. There we go. Now I need to re-become you. I mean, I bet I can make this jump without you. But you know what? I'm not in the mood. <laughs> That's totally it. Okay, so get across to here. I don't see too much more. Oh, where is there a key? Maybe in this ominous pit of despair and doom? You bet there is. Look at this. Okay, pick that up, and we're good to get that. What do you know? Cool, I almost missed that one. This is so intense, I love it. So they couldn't avoid having a final lava area, <laughs> even if we're not at Bowser's Castle. I mean, ooh, there wasn't any lava at Bowser's Castle. Now that I think about it, it was just ominous pits. But I mean, it was still like lava-like in the area, I guess, I don't know. It just felt like a Bowser area, you know? Hmm. So we can get some extra health here. I will gladly take it. I will butt slam onto this. And now we got some uh, hammer bros, which aren't fun to deal with, but we shall deal with them nonetheless. Uh, let's grab you. And then try to get rid of you if we can. Okay, not quite yet. There we go. Hmm, can we, uh, this is our first time being a hammer bro? I think so. We've only been the frying pan bros and the fire bros. I don't think we've been a normal hammer bro yet. I'm trying to destroy as many rocks as I can. You never know what kind of secrets might be hidden below them. And same thing with coins, I want coins. Cool. Okay, so we got all that. I don't see too much else over here, so I'm gonna press the big old button. Oh, do I have to not be uh, this guy? Do that. Okay, well, then I'm gonna re-become him for now. Maybe I shouldn't, maybe I should leave him here. Because we can become one of these fancy jungle wigglers. He's been all over the place, hasn't he? Picking up all kinds of enemies. They don't even see what they wanna be here, they're just like, have to be here through the obligation. They didn't want to be rude to him because they don't want him to attack his, their kingdom. Um. Okay, so I have to do that. Ooh, wiggle on over here. This is so much fun. We gotta be quick, we gotta be quick. Oh wait, wait, yeah, okay, I got it. Oh gosh, dodge you, if I can. Oh, quickly, okay, good. 
So there's some more purple coins. We have 35 out of the 50, so 15 more is what we need. This one has a fancy bow tie. Uh, why is that? Oh, well, I guess all of the ones that um, have Bowser's head have a fancy bow tie. I gotta pay attention to those then, because we can throw our hat on them. I mean, they usually only give us coins, but I'm sure one of them will give us a moon, because that's just how this game is. I don't see too much more, except for some extra help. Sounds good to me. I don't see, yeah, anything here. So I'm gonna go. Oh, hey, Bullet Bill, can I become you? Holy cow, you are done for other Bullet Bills. I'm gonna get you. Boom, we just charged through them. So is a Bullet Bill stronger than a Bullet Bill, apparently? That doesn't make any sense. They're both fragile and strong. <laughs> so we can accelerate. Now, we only probably only have a limited time with this guy. Okay, that was a mistake. Yes, that was a mistake. Um, well, luckily, I can waste all my extra health. Fun. Oh gosh, come on, Mario, get up there. Jeez, dude, what was that about? Um, so I don't see too much else going on around here. So maybe we should just charge through everything. I don't know if I can charge through these rocks or not. Oh, I can't. How was I supposed to know? I don't know, but we got a hidden little moon. Anyways, um, worth it. Around the barrier wall, that is now a couple more moons. I think we have 10 now. Looks like it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, we need one more. Oh, almost messed it up. So we could charge back this way. Oh my, I'm a little nervous about this. Come on, no! Wait, 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 Gosh darn it. No, I can survive this. I can survive this. Mario, why'd you bounce off again? <laughs> Mario, you're so silly. I love the little jingle they play. That's a lot of fun. So I actually, if I'm quick enough, I can just, whoa, 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 no wait, I needed more time. I needed more time. Ugh. I guess that was sort of silly of me, but I could have almost gotten them. But they play a little jingle. It's actually easier to just steam through it as like one bullet bill. So I'm just gonna do that. So we're just gonna not do that. Uh, we're just gonna become you. Wait, no, nope. okay, we gotta wait for another one. Actually quite easy to take out as a normal enemy. But I'm not worried about that. All right, um, so we're accelerating, we're charging through all of this. I mean, what I wanna do is, I guess get these three, but I gotta be careful, because this could end at any moment, it's about to end. Oh, hey, it's a Moai. Cool, cool. So let's become you, oh, you're afraid of me, don't worry, buddy. I'm nice, wait. Aren't you supposed to reveal hidden platforms? I don't see no hidden platforms. Oh, we gotta hit the button first, you dingus. There you go. Um, So there's some there. There's nothing behind us, it looks like. Okay, I forgot. I've got the whole idea that it's invisible and it got me scared. Um, Stop pressing the wrong button. I gotta go back. No, come on. That's not what I wanted. Oh, I gotta go through all that again. Okay, it's easy this time. It's just easy. Ready? Do that, and then move, 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 move. Like that around this corner, then move, 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 move. Like that. Okay, go, 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 go. Ready? See it. No, oh, gosh. Oh, I'm so sorry. You didn't mean anything wrong. I know. Oh, I'm awful. I didn't mean to. I just got scared. I mean, I, I think I would have died if I didn't do that. Everything here is so blocky. Maybe we're in Minecraft Kingdom. Okay, hey, Chuck. How you doing? I can be Chuck. Look at me. I'm charging. Oh, boom. That's just so much fun. Oh, I love him. Got him. Got him. Oh, just keep charging. Yeah, that's it. It's like a bullet bill, but on the ground. There you go. And then get this stuff. I mean, oh, is it respawning? It might be. Um, wait, hold on. Get these last two, and for whatever reason, it's just satisfying to get them. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, that is so much fun. Can he jump? He can't, so we're all done with you now. Sorry, Mr. Chuck. Oh, oh, okay, I see. I could probably get through that if I platformed well enough, but I don't have to, so I won't. Okay, Chuck, hold on, hold on, I'm not ready. Um, well, I guess I'm ready. If I charge, um, like that, wait. It's inverted controls when you're charging us. <laughs> Sorry, Chuck. Um, which I don't like. Oh, oh, wait. Darn it. <laughs> I made my way through. It's not exactly how I wanted to. All right. There you go. But it's inverted controls while you're charging. I'm not a big fan of that. I don't know why they do it that way. I mean, I think it is. It definitely, yeah, it's inverted controls when you're charging. And like nothing tells you that. So you just have to, I mean, I guess that's why you have the little area to practice it at first, but it's still a little jarring. Um, There you go. Let's get up here. 
Whoa, where are we going? Whoa, hey, it's Ern! Haven't seen you in a little while. This is the Cascade Kingdom. What are you up to nowadays? Um, still the same, huh? All right. Hmm, do you remember me? You were ever so rude to me back in the Cascade Kingdom. In fact, you were quite rude to all of my darling Brutals, which is why we're all here now. Wait, again? Now, I do believe it's lunchtime for my newly powered up chain Chompykins. Oh my, so she like the mother of the Brutals? Mama Brutal? I think that's the IPN. Okay, so we need to be careful. Um, I need to take care of all of their hats if I can. Okay, you know what, this is a little too close for comfort, I gotta say, I do enjoy <laughs> knocking into your own mama. Okay, wind up, wind up, yeah, don't you dare. You're gonna hit your own little baby? Just because I'm <laughs> consuming them? Uh, what's it called, capturing them? Oh my, don't throw them. Oh, poor thing. This poor thing does not get treated well by their mama. I don't like it. Oh, 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 that's much better. Okay, I did a lot quicker this time. You ain't getting me, you ain't getting me, you ain't getting me. Little water away, come on. Oh, she's getting tired, boom! One more time, just like that, I know, I know. Now let's get some uh, coins, if I can, maybe this is a bit of a mistake. Maybe an odd time to focus on coins, I got one health remaining. But I, I went into this with only two health. Um, one, two, three, what? Oh, she had more, he had more than three hats that time. Didn't even realize. Okay, so now we're properly going into the boss fight with full health, hopefully I can do it, we can skip this. I can only hope, right? Oh my, so go like that, go like this, go like that, go like this, go like that, get him! Thank you, thank you, that could have been bad. Don't hit me, you're rude. You're rude dude with a poor attitude, I don't like it, gotcha. See, the first phase is super easy, but it gets really tough after that. Okay, so if I stay far enough away, she can not reach me with this, her chain doesn't let it go as far as she needs it to. So she's gonna charge at me though, and I can throw a hat at it, maybe preemptively. I, he changed his mind though, which is a problem. Go ahead and throw it, not far enough. There we go! Oh my gosh, it almost didn't work. Okay, so so far, two things in, and we haven't gotten hit. I love how the song gets like a little Chain Chomp remix. I'm probably talking over it, but it's, it's very subtle anyways. You might not be able to hear it. Um, okay, so now it has five hats, which is crazy. Um, I just need to hit it like that, and then maybe hit it an initial time, and then make sure when it's at its destination, or when it's on its way maybe even. Hold on. Oh, there we go, I finally got hit. That's fine, that's fine, because we can become him, and then just run. She is so mad. That is not good for your blood pressure, lady. Oh boy. Come on, come on. Gotcha. Okay. <laughs> One more time, you're out for the count. Okay. So Mama Brutal defeated, which means we can get a bunch of free coins, and I guess move up the building. I'm really not sure. Uh, hopefully everything works out as we do this. Come on, rolling, 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 rolling. And then, uh, got that. Let's see if I can't get any extra health here because I do not wanna know what we're up against, but we're gonna find out. Let's go. Oh, I'm excited but nervous at the same time. Oh. Oh. Ominous, look at this. We got a bunch of coins. We're in front of the church, the bell's ringing. Things are about to get happening here. I was gonna say, it didn't seem like Bowser's Castle was very prepared for a wedding, and it's because it was never planned to be there. At least he's a little bit not self-centered, and the fact that he doesn't wanna have his wedding at his own home. Wait, what's down there? Nothing, okay. Um, Let's go ahead and get the checkpoint. Ever after hill. We're going, we're going. I just, I guess, yeah, we'll just head right on in. Um, Let's put a stop to whatever Bowser might be doing in here. Because I don't like it, no matter what it is. Because he's never doing anything good. Whoa, wedding hall. This place is like eerily white. I hear the shimmering of a moon. I'm not exactly, oh, it's up there. I don't think I can get that right now. Seems a little too far high up. Hello? Anybody home? Stop the wedding! We're here to object. Uh, no! Wait, she's smiling. <laughs> what is she smiling for? Everybody's here. Wait, what? What is going on in this place? I don't know. Um, I was forced to attend this ceremony. I was dragged away from cooking for this? I wish I could go home now. Um, awful, awful, awful. You came to save her, that's sweet. Just in time. Um, can I talk to the rest of you? No, mostly you don't have too much to say, huh? Um. 
interesting. Okay, yeah, let's put it at this. She's like, no, yes, no, yes. Awkward. This is so awkward. Hi. Oh, Tiara. No, oh gosh, oh gosh, that's really creepy. <laughs> oh no. Uh, let's stop this creep. What's so funny, buddy? Um, whoa. Whoa, no, 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 come on. This was, oh, save me, Cappy! You got it, no, wait. Ah, oh, well, we tried. <laughs> Yikes. We can wall jump up in that. Oh, no. Wait, what is this? Hey, Bowser, you came down too, huh? Maybe secret we were getting married. No, okay. <laughs> What'd be a secret? Actually, Mario, I was here to marry you. Guahaha, crashing the wedding, Mario. That's tacky, even for you. Also, your outfit isn't halfway fancy enough for the occasion. Not that it matters, since you weren't invited. I thought we were pretty fancy. So now it's time for you to make like a bouquet and get thrown out. Oh my. Oh. Goodbye. Get ready, Mario. Oh no, he's got his punchy punch hat. What are you up to, dude? Here's your apple ever after! Oh gosh, hold on. Nope, no thank you. I'm gonna put that on now. He's like, no, my hat! It's a designer. Okay, whoop. Yep. Whoop. Okay, come on, let's get him. Oh yeah, we gotta dodge some mini planets that he creates out of the palm of his hand. Come on, go, go, go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. He's gonna do his tail swing. I know it. Whoop. Wait, okay, that was a little off. I still gotta get used to that animation. Okay, so now that I know, he's gonna wiggle his fiery tail, his, his booty, it's sizzling, and then, oh, don't. Okay, punch him, punch him, punch him. And then, ready, sizzling tail jump. Yeah, get him, get him, get him. Into the spiked wand. That'll teach you. Can we become you? We still can't become you. Don't know what that's, uh, maybe it's just the power of his really cool comb over. Oh my, whoa, okay, was barely ready for that one. Um, geez, he's so quick. You'd think there would be some like, you know, wave to it, but it just, it's straight up. Okay, um, okay, so that's the real hat right there. And so we need to, oh, get some free health. Ooh, okay, look, get the health. And then my hat, no, he's like trying to use the power of the force. He's like, oh, I wanna drag it over here. I've seen Star Wars. All right, so now he's back over here. Oh, this is intense, whoa, flaming shells. Cool, this is pretty intense so far. Great way to start off the episode. I just found a double wag. What are you, a dog? Come on, chasing his own town. Want me to get you a chew toy? That would be my wedding gift. That's so mean. I mean, I mean a bit too mean. I know he's awful, but at the same time, I just like how nobody wants to be at his wedding. You'd think it'd be full of his own lackeys. Oh, did I? Oh, did I stop too soon? I was trying to prepare for his his tail wag. I guess I messed up. Okay, I don't think I want to punch these. I just want to punch him. Come on, come on, come on. Then when he starts shielding. Apparently this is Smash Bros. Gosh darn it, I'm the worst ever. Like really, I am. I might have to redo this boss battle at this rate because I only have one health left, so I'm probably gonna die. Come on, get over there and just punch him. All right, so he's gonna shield, tag well, tag well, and then, or tag well? No. That, what, what, what is it? It's a tail wag. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. You know what, I have a flabbergasted brain after the crazy couple episodes we've had. Oh gosh, come on. So uh, he's going over there, he's gonna throw his hat again. I really don't wanna get hit, but I might. This is how I got hit last time, so I got hit by one of these, I think. Um, get rid of that one, get rid of this one. Oh, that one has the health, I need it! I got it, cool. I hit it with the hat, cool. So you're not gonna... I gotta be careful, because he's never on the first platform, you know? I, I can't hit him until he starts throwing these things. Come on, come on. Get him, get him, get him. Okay, come on, he's gonna start shielding. And then, oh, one more. Oh, come on. You stink, like you smell bad. You are you gotta go get some, like some deodorant. Come on, ready. Maybe you smell like burning, burning Bowser. What's for dinner? I guess it's Bowser. Oh, come on. There you go. Worst Mario player of all time right here. All right, I'm about to hit him for the second time right there. It's getting, it's going a little bit better this time. I'll be honest, but it's still a bit of a challenge. This right here, this fire stuff is definitely the most challenging thing. 
It's just like, no matter how many times I try to dodge it, I always get hit at least once because of how he whips around really weirdly. Okay, I think I'm hiding in a better spot this time then. Okay, that, that worked out pretty well. And then these hats can be pretty tough. But all I need to do is hit the right one. Typically I would try to hit, you know, whatever one I would think would have a heart in it. You're a stinker. You're a, you're a big butt stinker. There you go, at least I got the health back. Throw all those again. And then I just need to hit the one that's gonna actually gonna put a stop to the rest of them. Come on, yes, okay. Because once you hit that one, all the other ones disappear. So don't charge at him right away because he's just gonna jump away anyway. So one, two, three, and then dodge. That if I can, and then that, and then ready. Okay, he's gonna. Oh, 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 okay, I'm much better at it now. Much better. There we go. Wait, no, no, he's not done. I wasn't. What? Okay. Oh, I was gonna readjust how I was holding the controller because I thought that was gonna do it. All right, well, that was a bit of a trick now, wasn't it? Okay, gotta be ready. Gotta be ready. He's gonna shield up, and then he's gonna. Wait. Whoa, that was weird. I like, I don't even know what happened there. I feel like the game's cheating me out right now because I jumped and nothing happened. Okay, um, get across to here and try this one more stinking time. And I just gotta wait for him to waggle. Okay, hit him. Come on, oh no, he has another shield. That's really weird. Okay, now this time for real. Yeah, okay, see ya. Ooh, we knocked him out of his clothes. That's like putting another level and knocking his socks off. We saved you, maybe. Um, whoa, the wedding ring broke. Wow, what do you know? Um, so I guess that means no ma marriage for Bowser. We saved you. Oh, or what if there's like a choose your own adventure? Ah, oh gosh, she just got squished. Oh no, she didn't, okay, good. <laughs> she just gets squished by a moon rock, the end. Um, I thought that maybe we could just choose Bowser instead. Me or Bowser, who's it gonna be? What is happening? The moon is collapsing, huh? Peach. Peach, no! I've never heard Mario say Peach. That is so weird. I've never heard that. I feel like he, he said princess before. But never Peach, wow. We aren't quite done, are we? We're okay. Ow. Oh. Are those two all right? Okay, we gotta get out of here quick. I don't think there's gonna be any like bonus collectibles to find around here. We just gotta go. Whoa, what are we gonna do? I become Bowser! Oh, the comb over! It really was a comb over, wasn't it? It was probably the wedding garments, but no. I'm gonna say it was a comb over. This is so weird. We finally get to see things through his eyes. Oh no! Wow, this is so weird, I love it. All the memories? Do we really get to see all of his memories? Jeez. Yep, it's me, Mario. Not Bowser. That is so weird! That is so weird! <laughs> Let's go! We are Bowser! Oh wow, we run like a little bit of a dingus. This is so cool! Why haven't they made a game where we can play as Bowser like this just the entire time? We need to hurry and get out of here! I'll try, but I also want to find like moons and stuff. Um, maybe there won't be any though. Um, what are we doing? How do we, are we did I miss something here? Uh, maybe we could, uh, I know the place is falling apart, but where do I go? <laughs> oh no, I can just break this, can I? Oh wow, he's stronger than I thought. Holy cow, Bowser's got some muscles. Wow, okay, yeah, this is all falling apart. I do not want to stand in there for very long. Okay. Oh wow, he can throw fireballs if I wiggle the controller too. And Bowser is the coolest. I want Bowser as a dad sometimes. I'm, 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 I'm uh, jealous of Bowser Jr. Ow. I mean, I know he can be a jerk sometimes, but he's never seemed to be a bad dad. Um, okay. Uh, there we go. Good, good, good. Oh, can he do a triple jump? <laughs> I can. Well, I mean, I guess it's more Mario. I just love his little, oh, <laughs> he's having a good time because it's Mario deep down in there. Oh my, wait, what are we doing here? Wait a minute. No way, <laughs> no way. Look at this, now this is a visual I never thought I'd see. This game is just, it goes above and beyond to be so gosh darn cool. This is the coolest. Okay, go across like that, oh, it's falling. We gotta be careful here, moving, moving. Um, jeez. Like, what if they did make a game where you could play Bowser like this? I know there's like Bowser Inside Story from Mario and Luigi, but I think that's a bit different. Wouldn't you agree? 
Oh, there you go. I'm up here now. Wait, what am I doing? Um, oh, I just jumped. Done. Being a dingus. There we go. We made it. Start breaking this stuff up, dude. This is a lot of fun, though. Like, I wouldn't mind seeing this maybe a little bit more fleshed out. Because he's just, he plays so much differently than Mario does. All right, breaking everything. Doesn't, like, there definitely doesn't seem to be any kind of, like, hidden moon around here, which makes sense, because it seems like a very scripted area. I don't even know if we'll be able to return to this place. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, come on. Whoa, 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 come on, keep slicing, and Dyson, get out of here, nice. I think we did it. Or maybe the moon just exploded. What is this, Sonic the Hedgehog? <laughs> I see the outside, we're almost there. This definitely feels like Sonic music. This is crazy weird. Um, what? Oh, there's music, like there's actual lyrics. I, I, I'm gonna have to talk over it because I don't want copyright problems, but. Oh, that's so cool, I thought there was only gonna be one lyric song. This is so weird. Honestly, it reminds me of like Little Big Planet with the, how that the song is. Okay, keep moving, keep moving. I think we're doing the right thing. Bashing open this moon rock for whatever reason. This is so weird. If you told me Mario Odyssey was a game like 10 years ago and that we, the game would end with playing its Bowser beating up the moon, like I'd be like, you're, you're full of malarkey, buddy. Stop talking to me, who are you? <laughs> but um, this is so cool. I love this song. I definitely need to listen to this song later. Oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, so we did it. It's falling apart, quick game to the middle. Go, 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 go. Oh, can we hop out? Oh, we can't, that'd <laughs> be so funny. See ya, you're on your own. What is this thing? We're about to break the, the big moon rock. Um, maybe every secret of this this universe's world are inside. Oh, hey. Um. Oh. Oh, hey, because Tiara. Wow, that is so cool. We're moving. Am I pressing the right button? Um, I think so. Whoa. I hope everybody else got on off the moon okay, but that's not none of our concern, I guess. That is so weird. I guess Tiara has that kind of property too. Oh, wait, we're still on the moon? Okay, but we gotta get out soon because the moon ain't doing so great. Ooh, yikes. Oh, did we land on Bowser's little horn there? I don't think so. And graceful, like always. So, now what? Oh, what do you know, we did it. Aw, brother and sister back together. <laughs> Wonderful. Amazing. That is so cool, I'm getting chills right now. Wait, um. Oh no, is he going? Oh! Oh, what a slobber knock. <laughs> He's like, come on, please, please. No! <laughs> They're both offering their flowers in marriage. Is this really happening right now? What is she gonna say? Ooh, you both got denied. She is out of here. You guys get nothing. <laughs> Sometimes your best friend is your worst enemy. Let's go, they're gonna leave without us. We better hurry up. Wait, are they really leaving without us? Hold on, wait for us. <laughs> Come back, we don't wanna be stuck here. Run, Mario. Hold on, but oh. Wow. We did it, we beat the game, Super Mario Odyssey, what an ending.